Solang looked at the Qiling in front of him, and after some thoughts, he said, From now on, you will be called Xiao Pao. Gun. Small cannon. Qiling yelled happily, his voice rushing into the sky, even Solang's ears were itchy. Hiss. It seems Xiao Pao has a bad habit that is hard to change. Solang took a helpless deep breath and exhaled a long breath, before the Jixian cannon was also retracted into the storage space. Next moment. Solang moved to the battlefield where Qian Zihao had fallen. The battlefield at this time has become a huge sinkhole. This Tiankang occupies an area of tens of thousands of miles and is hundreds of miles deep. The bottom is full of glazed rocks and fiery red flowing magma. In addition, the power of terrifying rules surrounds the Tian King. Once a warrior below the martial arts level stepped into it, he would die immediately. Can't pollute the environment. The corner of Sol Lang's mouth twitched slightly, while humming a little song, he calmed the power of the rules in the battlefield. In the end, he sent an avatar to make them fill up the Tian King and try to erase the traces of battle, so as not to be guessed by the people who were killed by the Tian Lu. Let the clones do the dirty work. Solang moved back into the sea of sky. Li Xianyang was also sent back by him at the same time. I have to say that this special clone of Li Xianyang is really useful. Master. Li Xianyang looked at Solang with excitement on his face. After following Solang, he returned to the martial god level in a short time, and he also continuously mastered the power of rules. The five basic rules of heaven and earth have already comprehended the fire system of the gold system and the water system of the thunder system. The rules of the thunder system were never mastered by Li Xian Yang. In addition to the strength of cultivation base and rules, what made Li Xian Yang even more excited was that Sol Lang actually took out an immortal weapon that he had never seen before. The power of this immortal weapon is so great that it can kill the immortal in an instant. Well. Don't look at me with so bright eyes, it's annoying. Solang rolled his eyes, and immediately ordered, Go, and let everyone in the sea of sky come out. Yes. Li Xianyang nodded immediately. Then he broke into the sea of sky and informed everyone, Yao Qi Yan Fa, the Lord orders you all to come out, and everyone must come out. When everyone heard the command, they couldn't help their expressions, revealing surprise. Solang let them out, no longer guarding the sea of sky, first of all, it means that the threat of slaughter tower has been lifted. Secondly. The last time Solang asked them all to come out, after that, the sea of sky was promoted to a fairy weapon. This time it was the same command. Does that mean that the sea of sky is about to evolve again? With excitement and excitement, Yao Kai Yan Fa and others evacuated the sea of sky with the rest of the guards. Master Xian Yang. Dare to ask the person in the slaughter tower, is it already cleaned up by the Lord? Where is the Wuxian in slaughter tower? Did you escape? After Yao Kai Yan Fa came out, he quietly asked Li Xian Yang. The others also looked at Li Xian Yang curiously. When Solang beheaded Zhu Qi and the others, Yao Kai Yan Fa and Wu Sheng looked in their eyes. But what happened later? Yao Kai Yan Fa and other Wu Sheng didn't know at all. Especially the death of Qian Zihao, only Sol Lang and Li Xian Yang know about it. Escape. Qian Zihao District, a robbery Wuxian, can he escape in front of our lord? Li Xian Yang sneered at Yao Kai Yan Fa's question, our lord not only killed him, but before killing him, he even played him a lot. Ah. Qian Zihao is really dead. The Lord can play and torture a martial immortal, it's too powerful. God, I don't know what trump cards the Master holds, even Wuxian can kill. Having the Lord's blessing is really a blessing for me to wait for the three lives and three generations to cultivate. Before I was worried about Tushin Lu's revenge, which is really ridiculous. Who said no? Including Yao Kai Yan Fa and others. The warrior of the Quasi Immortal level is already a superpower that is beyond sight. The Wuxian level is already a strong man standing on the upper level of the Kanglin Continent Pyramid. A martial immortal can destroy countless holy forces with just one hand. 
but such a powerful warrior was so vulnerable in front of his patriarch Shang Solang. All at once gave everyone a reassurance. Everyone's fear of Tushinlu gradually disappeared, and their worries about the future completely disappeared. They know that as long as they follow the Lord, the future is bright. Among them, Baiolin and others of the Baiyu clan are the most so. They were very fortunate that they had joined Solang's subordinates, and seemed to have seen the scene where the Baiyu tribe was moving towards prosperity under Solang's leadership. At this time, Yao Kai Yanfa and hundreds of martial sages, led by Li Xian Yang, came to Solang. Chu Xiaobei, Ji Rugzhu, and Murong Xianxian had already stood beside Solang with the spirit Xiaohe of the Sea of Sky. Looking at the figure of Solang next to him, Chu Xiaobei's eyes were filled with disbelief and shock. She knows some details about Solang. This time, Chu Xiaobei thought that Solang could scare Qian Zihao away as the best outcome. She never expected that Solang could kill Qian Zihao. This man is so mysterious. Chu Xiaobei's eyes turned Kaubo, mystery is fascinating, bah, what am I thinking? Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian had another reaction, with joyful smiles on their faces, but they were not surprised. In their eyes, it is okay for Solang to do incredible things. Servant wait, see the Lord. Li Xianyang brought Yao Kai Yanfa and other Wu Shang Chi to kneel to salute. Nearly 600 martial sages all knelt down, and Solang looked down. Get up. Stand aside. I want to raise the level of the sea of sky. Solang waved his hand faintly, a trace of irreversible majesty appeared on his face. However, in the next moment, there was a voice that made Solang's majesty freeze on his face. Jiji. Mama Mama. Chi Ling Xiaohe flew over from Chu Xiaobei's three daughters, landed directly on Solang's shoulder, and yelled non-stop. Let Chu Xiaobei teach him how to call me after a while. Solang rolled his eyes secretly, then caught Xiao Hai in his hand, and said in a serious voice, Xiao Hai, go back to the body. Although he felt Solang's solemn emotions, Xiao Hai still did not stop shouting. However, it entered the sea of sky very obediently. Immediately after, Solang waved his big hand and closed the sea of sky. The mask that covered a large area of land disappeared. However, at the moment Qian Zihao has just died, no matter how fast the people who kill Tianlu, it is impossible to make trouble in this gap. System, evolve the sea of sky. Solang ordered. Ding. Consumes the fairy level material Zixiao Yinyang Xianya 5, Extreme Sage Xian Luo 10, Arctic Wang Dust Stone 10, Wu Ying Yu 10. Xiaoying Wuxiankan asterisk 20. Saint level refining materials, Soul of Wushan 10, Sunshai Chunyan 60, Mingzhen Sacred Jade 30, Heart of Stars and Moon 60, Shocking Amethyst asterisk 200, The Sea of Sky has evolved successfully. Inside the storage space, a large amount of materials disappeared out of thin air, and the Sea of Sky instantly rose to a small rank. At this time, the Sea of Sky was already the second tribulation immortal tool. Its defensive power has become stronger, and with the combination of the Kang Kong Phantom and the Immortal Array, it has been able to completely defend the attack of the Four Tribulations Martial Immortal. Go with. After the evolution of the Sea of Sky was completed, So Lang whispered and threw it out with a big wave. Ma 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 ma. Xiao Hai let out an excited cry, and then unfolded the defensive mask. The Sky Sea that was promoted to the Second Tribulation Immortal Tool is not only more powerful, but also covers a larger area. Sure enough, the Sea of Sky has been promoted. I don't know what method the Lord used to be able to instantly promote the Immortal Weapons rank. This method is too bad. The Lord has many methods against the Sky. If you are surprised every time, be careful not to close your mouth from ear to ear. If the concubine can close her mouth from ear to ear for the Lord, that would be an honor. I think you still want to close your legs for the Lord. Okay, don't think about it. All the martial sages looked at the new sky and sea, and they couldn't help but talk, 
and the excitement in their hearts was hard to add. At this time, the defense of the Sea of Sky is completely stabilized. Ma 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 ma! Xiao Hai whispered and flew towards Sol Lang. Go to Chu Ziobe. Sol Lang twitched his mouth, waved Xiao Hai to Chu Ziobe. Xiao Hai and Chu Ziobe, Ji Ruxiu and Xian Xian were already very familiar, but didn't resist, and gradually calmed down. Well, what's next? Sol Lang looked at the large amount of materials in the storage space, and after thinking about it, he found a problem. At this time, his strength is getting bigger and bigger. But there is still no real headquarters, or building. If there is a better headquarters, it can better unite people. Decided. Promote you to a fairy. As Sol Lang rolled his eyes, a treasure suddenly appeared in his hand. This treasure is a white jade fairy palace, contributed by Li Xian Yang, it is a quasi-immortal artifact. It's useless to put it in the storage space anyway. Sol Lang planned to promote it to a fairy weapon and take it out as the headquarters. At that time, there will be an additional fairy tool, which can greatly improve the self-confidence of the subordinates. Seeing that Sol Lang took out the fairy palace, everyone looked over curiously. Among them, Li Xianyang looked intently, with a look of excitement, at this juncture, the Lord took out the immortal palace, afraid that he would also be promoted. This immortal palace has followed Li Xianyang for hundreds of thousands of years, and he is naturally happy to see it promoted. System, evolve the White Jade Fairy Palace. Here, Sol Lang directly issued the order. Ding! Consumes the fairy level materials I and me I Shen Jun Ten the Pure Sun Ice Lotus Root 10, the Positive Certain Spirit Fairy Soil Asterisk 10. Consumption of Saint Level Materials, Wushan Soul 3, Tianxia Condensed Hawaii 50, Yin Yang Magical Jade 60, 100 Turns Being Jing 200. The White Jade Fairy Palace has evolved into a primary fairy. A dazzling light covered the fairy palace in Sol Lang's hands. When the light disappeared, the fairy palace had changed a lot. The former fairy palace was like carved from white jade, but it was relatively simple when it was full of fairy spirit. But at this time, the white jade immortal palace has become magnificent and looks quite majestic. The peculiar breath of the immortal weapon exudes a trace, and all the martial sages who are pressing down are on the ground, it is difficult to get up. Heaven, it's another fairy. The Lord has refined another fairy artifact. The Lord is so powerful the fairy tools can be refined at hand. Yeokai Yanfa and others were surprised. Li Xianyang also flushed red with a face, the Lord has indeed promoted him to a real fairy palace, Baiu Immortal Palace, you also got the opportunity given by the Lord, great. Sol Lang actually refined another fairy tool. In such a short period of time, he has refined two fairy artifacts. Chu Xiaobei looked at the White Jade Immortal Palace in Sol Lang's hand, and couldn't help showing horror, we Swanyu Immortal Clan also only have two immortal artifacts. It took countless years to accumulate. Brother Sol Lang is too good. I really admire Brother Sol Lang. Ji Rukxiu and Murong Xianxian looked at each other and smiled, their eyes full of admiration and enthusiasm. At this time, a crystal steamed bun appeared on the White Jade Fairy Palace, ER, that is, the spirit of the device. Isn't it a minor mental retardation again? Sol Lang looked at the newly appearing spirit, feeling a little uncomfortable in his heart. However, Sol Lang soon discovered that he was worrying too much. This instrument spirit was very quiet, looked around curiously, did not speak, and then returned to the body. She looks like a shy little girl. Call. Sol Lang breathed a sigh of relief, it's good to be quiet, good to be quiet, I will give birth to a daughter in the future. Soon. He then released the fairy palace and landed above the sea of sky. The body of the fairy palace also suddenly expanded, turning into a super palace covering the sky and the sun. The difference between immortal implements and quasi-immortal implements is just so big. When the White Jade Immortal Palace was still a quasi-immortal tool, it was at most a cave mansion, 
but now it has become a palace group. After the fairy palace opened, it immediately activated its own functions. The first is defense, illusion and other functions similar to the Sky Sea, which can guarantee the safety of the fairy palace to a certain extent. Secondly, it is the very abnormal ability to gather spirits. Compared with the White Jade Immortal Palace, the Sea of Sky can only be said to be an amateur. At this moment, most of the aura gathered by the Sea of Sky was absorbed by the White Jade Immortal Palace and condensed into a river of spirits circling the Immortal Palace. The water of Linghi is very thick, almost like lead and mercury, close to solid. In addition, the White Jade Immortal Palace also has the function of evolving and filtering aura, which can remove the impurity energy mixed in it. This is very useful for the training of martial artists. After this White Jade Immortal Palace is my cave mansion. So Lang smiled faintly, I will divide an area, as our headquarters, everyone can move around freely in this area. Yes. The martial sages were so excited that they kowtow one after another. So Lang smiled faintly, and then said, the fairy will not be refined for the time being. Next, I will refine a handy weapon for each of you. This statement came out. Everyone was pleasantly surprised. It is an honor for the Lord to personally refine weapons for them. And there is nothing more exciting than those newly promoted martial sages. They have just been promoted to martial arts, and most of them are middle and high level artifacts in their hands. The use of medium and high level artifacts in the realm of martial saint is like an ordinary person looking for a rotten bamboo pole as a weapon, basically, it is not suitable. And so Lang, can refining immortal artifacts, wouldn't it be easier to refining holy artifacts? Just now. So Lang waved his hand. Those who want to refine weapons should line up and come one by one. As soon as he finished speaking, hundreds of Wu Shengs immediately rushed up to line up with Yeo Kai Yan Fa, Chiri Muzhu, and others. But at this moment, I am the first. A pleasant voice sounded, it turned out to be Chu Ziobe. As soon as she stood up, Yeo Kai Yan Fa and others who had been ready to move immediately stopped. Just kidding, this is the maid of the Lord, the woman who waits for the bed. It is not an exaggeration to say that it is the heroine. Well, that's what Yeo Kai Yan Fa and the others thought. So Lang, my frozen cloud fantasy Sky Ling can't keep up with me. I want a quasi immortal weapon, you have to refine it for me. Chu Ziobe stared at So Lang with beautiful eyes, and he felt a sense of coquetry. I will be angry if you don't satisfy me. Haha, <laughs> a small matter. So Lang smiled faintly, give me your Bunyun Huan Tai Anling. No, here it is. Chu Ziobe smiled and handed Bin Jiun Huan Tian Ling to So Lang. Originally, when he was hunted down, Bin Jiun Huan Tian Ling had been damaged but it was later repaired by Sol Lang and evolved into a seven-star hallow. But at this time Chu Ziobe's true combat power was already at the quasi-celestial level. The sacred artifact of the seven-star level is indeed not good enough. System, Evolution Frozen Cloud Magic Sky Ling Sol Lang held Frozen Cloud Fantasy Sky Ling in his hand and gave the order. Ding! Consuming Holy Materials Frozen Cloud Magic Sky Ling has evolved into a quasi-immortal weapon. Now, I'm satisfied now. The corner of Sol Lang's mouth twitched slightly and handed Bin Jiun Huan Tian Ling to Chu Ziobe. Satisfied, satisfied. Of course satisfied, he he. Chu Ziobe took Bin Jiun Huan Tian Ling, happy as a little girl. It's good to be satisfied, good. So Lang laughed and turned to look at Yeo Kai Yan Fa and the others, why are you still in a daze, line up. Ah. Right, right, line up. Quickly grab the position, quickly, quickly. You stepped on me. Who? Who is pushing my ass? Five or six hundred Wu Sheng rushed to line up. However, although there are many people, they are in order. After all, in front of Sol Lang, they didn't dare to make a mess, isn't that too late to clean up? Not long. The Wu Shengs took a good picture of the team, 
and looked at Solang aloft one by one. At the top is Yeo Kai Yan Fa. Among the many martial sages of the four clans, Yeo Kai Yan Fa was the first to surrender to Solang, and he actively surrendered, with high qualifications. Afterwards, there were veteran martial sages of Huang Fuqin and Chai Rumazu. Finally, the newly promoted martial sages. Yan Fa. What kind of weapon do you want? So Lang looked at Yeo Kai Yan Fa, who was kneeling on the ground with his head to the ground, and asked with a smile. Return to the Lord. The servant has a sacred tool, and it can be regarded as a handy hand. So I want to ask the Lord to help me improve this sacred artifact. With that, Yao Qi Yan Fa took out his holy artifact from the martial sage realm, and gave it to Solang with both hands. Ken. Solang nodded and took this sacred artifact. Although Yeo Kai Yan Fa is a six-star martial sage, his sacred artifacts are only two-star primary sacred artifacts. It can be seen that the sacred artifacts are very cherished among the martial arts. Not every martial sage can have a holy artifact and not every martial sage can have a holy artifact that is satisfactory. But this is not a problem at all in front of Solang. The system retains the current characteristics of this sacred instrument and evolves it into a high-level sacred instrument. Solang gave an order, and the sacred artifact in his hand flashed with brilliance, and he was promoted from the primary sacred artifact to the advanced sacred artifact. No, here you are. Solang threw the sacred artifacts to Yeo Kai Yan Fa, and in the grateful thanks from Yeo Kai Yan Fa, he said to the people behind, Next. Master. Pray for the Lord to elevate the sacred artifacts to the ultimate level that I can use. Huang Fuqin stepped forward, then handed his holy artifact with excitement. His holy artifact was also presented by Solang, but it did not reach the limit he could control. So Huang Fuqin wanted to upgrade his holy artifact. Okay, next one. With a single finger from So Lang, Huang Fuqin's sacred artifact was promoted successfully. Immediately after. It is Chiri Muzhu and others, and the five or six hundred Zin and Wushan. They stepped forward one by one, kneeling down respectfully, offering their weapons with both hands and asking So Lang for promotion. Or they could take out a lot of materials and beg Solang to refine them into swords, spears, swords, halberds and mace. These martial sages were also honest and did not regard Solang's generous gift as a good opportunity to take advantage. As long as they can get the materials, they will do it themselves. Many martial sages even finished all the refining materials by themselves, only Solang moved his fingers to refine them into weapons. And in the process, Solang has the function of material reduction, but he also earned a lot of material. Time passed slowly. In a blink of an eye, all martial sages have their own holy artifacts. In other words, Solang refined and refined five or six hundred holy artifacts. Speaking of this number will definitely surprise even ordinary immortals. You know, even the martial sage of the immortal clan. Not everyone can have sacred artifacts. In many cases, a sacred object is passed down from generation to generation and is extremely cherished. At this moment, every martial artist is holding his own sacred artifact, as rare as holding a peerless beauty. That hand, it's a non-stop rubbing. Even some guys are drooling. Li Xian Yang obeyed. So Lang's faint voice suddenly spread throughout the audience. Whether everyone was rubbing the sacred vessel, drooling, or whispering, they all put aside their things and looked at So Lang seriously. Here. Li Xian Yang bent forward, his expression serious and respectful. Order people to guard the sea of sky. So Lang said faintly, also, arrange enough manpower to put down the eyeliner to guard against the spies in the slaughter tower. Yes. Li Xian Yang knelt down to take the order and he went down to select personnel from the Noonan Martial Saints. Huang Fuqin. So Lang waved his hand again. Here. Huang Fu knelt on the ground with a red face. He has only one star Wushan cultivation base, but at this time he has such a status, everything is given by So Lang. 
therefore, Huang Fuqin completely worshipped So Lang as a god. Every time So Lang talked to him, he would be extremely honored and extremely excited. You go back with Biolin and the others and establish an exchange system in the Bayou Saint clan. So Lang smiled and said, after the work is completed, you can go back to the Wind Spirit race to take a look. Servant. Huang Fuqin immediately took the lead. Next. Under the arrangement of Li Xian Yang, Yeo Kai Yan Fa and others, the martial sages went to guard the Sea of the Sky, or went to major cities to guard. Other Wu Sheng was arranged to patrol around. Although So Lang has the treasure hunt flying flying sly as a spy, it is impossible for him to focus all his energy on this at any time. Subordinates, just let them move, otherwise everything will be done by themselves. What is the use of subordinates? After all the martial sages left. So Lang turned and looked at the three of Chu Ziobei. I recently realized a magical trick. So Lang twitched the corner of his mouth and smiled, Do you want to watch? Yes I do. Brother So Lang, what kind of do you understand? Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian immediately became curious. Humph. I know the curiosity of deceiving Aunt Liang. Chu Xiaobei rolled his eyes and snorted. But in fact, she herself was a little curious, of course, she would not say it. Go. Let's go inside the fairy palace. I believe it will surprise you. So Lang smiled, waved his hand, wrapped Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian with his spiritual power, and flew towards the fairy palace. This guy doesn't care about me. Chu Xiaobei was treated differently, and felt a little upset. Although she knew that she didn't need So Lang to carry flying at all, she was unhappy, just unhappy. However, Chu Xiaobei followed up after being upset. She wanted to see what So Lang had to do beyond common sense. Not long. The four So Lang entered the fairy palace. Although this fairy palace was huge, it was all under So Lang's control. Where there is a room, where there is a training room, etc., all know well. The spiritual energy in the fairy palace is very strong, and the place near the Linghi is even stronger almost giving people a sense of suffocation. At this time, So Lang took the three daughters to the pavilion closest to Ling He. The aura here is almost stronger than the best practice room of our fairy clan. Chu Xiaobei squinted his eyes slightly, carefully experiencing the rich spiritual energy around him, and his face was intoxicated and enjoyable. Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian can better understand the richness of aura here. Because just standing here, without running the exercises, you can feel countless spiritual energy digging into your body. So Lang, what on earth do you want to show us the unskilled? Chu Xiaobei looked at So Lang and asked, could this be the Linghe River? Of course not. How can Linghe be considered a jerk? With a mysterious smile on his face, So Lang beckoned to Ji Rugzhu, little boy, come to me. Um. What is Brother So Lang doing? Ji Rugzhu blushed and ran to So Lang, pinched the corner of his clothes and asked. You'll find out later. So Lang clicked the corner of his mouth and placed his right hand on Ji Rugzhu's heavenly spirit. Brother So Lang is doing this to me. Ji Rugzhu's face was hot, and her heart became a little nervous. At this time, cultivation base initiation. So Lang's heart moved and activated the 10th system function. Ding! The cultivation base is initiated, the goal is determined, and the cultivation base is started. The system gave a feedback prompt, and immediately So Lang found that in the mysterious black space, the little cultivation base that the white cultivator had just saved began to gradually disappear. On Ji Rugzhu's side, he felt a powerful invisible force appearing in his dantian out of thin air and quickly transformed his rich spiritual power. As soon as these spiritual powers appeared, they were directly digested and became part of her cultivation base. That feeling is a bit like eating a delicious food that melts in your mouth. Brother So Lang. I, I feel like I'm full. Ah, a lot, a lot of aura. Ji Rugzhu opened her small mouth slightly, her eyes gleaming brightly. 
Don't talk, be good. Solang comforted Ji Rukju softly. Ji Rukju's cultivation base is rising rapidly, which requires her to concentrate and not be distracted. Hmm. Ji Rukju nodded obediently, then closed her eyes. What the are you doing? Chu Xiaobei and Murong Xianxian looked at each other with doubts on their faces. But after a breath, they got the answer. Boom! An invisible wave suddenly appeared. This! This is a breakthrough volatility. Rukju has broken through from the intermediate general level to the advanced general level. Chu Xiaobei and Murong Xianxian immediately noticed Ji Rukju's changes. But the changes in Ji Rukju's body are still not over. Her breath is still rising. After a few more breaths, Ji Rukju once again experienced a breakthrough wave. Breakthrough again. Rukju has broken through from the senior general level to the pinnacle general level. Murong Xianxian covered her mouth and exclaimed, but before she put down her hand, Ji Rukju sent another wave of breakthrough. The quasi military commander level. So Lang said that the fascinating knowledge, is it a means to forcibly elevate the realm of martial artists? But most of these methods are facilitating, harmful and unhelpful. He can't do this. Could it be that this method will not cause harm to low-level warriors? If that's the case, then the genius Solang comprehended is too terrifying. Heaven, broke through again, this time directly broke through to the rank of martial commander. It hasn't stopped, it's still breaking through. Intermediate Martial Commander Senior Martial Commander Peak Martial Commander Still on the rise, King Wu Senior King Wu Emperor Wu Level Chu Xiaobei and Murong Xianxian looked at Ji Rukju, whose aura became stronger and stronger, and felt extremely shocked in their hearts. In just a dozen breaths, so Lang actually raised Ji Rukju's cultivation base from the general level to the martial emperor level. Three realms have been improved. Which level is Emperor Wu? It's almost as I expected. So Lang looked at Ji Rukju, who exuded the breath of King Wu, and nodded slightly. Although he just broke through soon. But cleaning up the battlefield, evolving weapons and refining weapons for the martial sages, all spent a lot of time. Add up to an hour. With the cultivation speed of more than 20 million times his perfect level. Cultivating for an hour is equivalent to an ordinary warrior with no lack of aptitude who has practiced for more than 2,500 years without any auxiliary means. At present, the efficiency of cultivation base empowerment is 20%, which is equivalent to 500 years of accumulation of perfect genius. Such a long period of time is long enough for a Wuxian martial artist to break through to the martial emperor level. Therefore, So Lang had expected this result. At this time, So Lang gently retracted his hand. But Ji Rukju still closed her eyes, still immersed in the skyrocketing cultivation base. So Lang didn't bother her. The cultivation realm suddenly increased to three big realms, even if there were no side effects. Ji Rukju would need time to take a good look. So Lang. Chu Xiaobei shouted with a little surprise, You, what means did you use against Rukju? There will be no serious consequences, right? Although he knew that So Lang would not use sequelae lifting methods on Ji Rukju. But Chu Xiaobei and Murong Xianxian were still a little worried. After all, it was an exaggeration to raise three great realms at once. You can rest assured. So Lang smiled faintly, the only side effect is probably that it is not easy to control one's strength in a short period of time, it is easy to crush a cup, sit on a broken chair and so on. So we can rest assured. Chu Xiaobei and Murong Xianxian nodded one after another, their hearts relaxed a lot. Correct. Chu Xiaobei suddenly asked again, So Lang, what method did you use? It's a means of empowerment. I can instill my cultivation skills into others without any side effects. You also know that my cultivation speed is super fast, and my cultivation base will soon be on the verge of a breakthrough, so I plan to improve Rukju's cultivation base first. She is too weak to help her. 
So Lang smiled faintly and looked at Mirong Xian Xian, Xian Xian, wait for me to improve you too. Okay. Brother So Lang is so good. Mirong Xian Xian looked at Ji Rugxiu's arrogance, of course she envied her. At this time, she got So Lang's promise, and she was immediately very happy. Then you give me a boost. Chu Xiaobe suddenly grabbed So Lang's arm, stared at a pair of big eyes, and said viciously. What? I will give you a boost, you are already an eight-star martial saint. So Lang said silently, the little bit of cultivation that I have accumulated is not enough to stuff your teeth. Do not. I want it. Chu Xiaobe stomped her feet violently. If it weren't for the fairy-like ground under her feet, she might have been stepped out of a big hole. This strange girl. Good, good, give you to you. So Lang rolled his eyes speechlessly. He guessed that Chu Xiaobei should be too curious to experience it. However, Chu Xiaobei wanted to experience the truth, but it was not the only reason. She still wants the same treatment as Ruxiu Xian Xian. She didn't even realize that she had unknowingly placed herself in the position of a weak woman who needs care and protection. Well, maybe So Lang is too strong and too fierce? Next. So Lang stayed with the three women on the pavilion for another hour. Ji Rugxiu still closed her eyes, and So Lang once again accumulated a lot of cultivation skills. But when the cultivation base was about to be empowered, So Lang Cha suddenly discovered a problem. Uh, that, my can only be used twice a day. So Lang smiled wryly, it has been used up once before, but now there is only one left. As he said, he looked at Mirong Xian Xian and Chu Xiaobei. Then give it to Xian Xian. Chu Xiaobei nodded generously, Xian Xian needs more than me. It is good. So Lang smiled. He originally thought that Chu Xiaobei would be willful once, but he did not expect that she would directly give this opportunity to Mirong Xian Xian. This is great. Thank you sister. Mirong Xian Xian thanked him very gratefully. Immediately, So Lang also gave Murong Xian Xian a cultivation base initiation, and he also raised his cultivation level to the Wuhuang level. Then Murong Xian Xian closed his eyes and was familiar with the skyrocketing power. Just let them retreat here. Chu Xiaobei smiled, no one dares to come here to disturb them anyway. Okay. It just happens that I want to ask you something. So Lang nodded and placed a formation between his hands to protect Ruxiu and Slim. What's up? Chu Xiaobei asked strangely. Say while walking. So Lang patted Chu Xiaobei on the shoulder and walked in a random direction. Chu Xiaobei glanced at her shoulder, then followed So Lang behind him. The two wandered around in the fairy palace. Go ahead, what do you want to ask? Chu Xiaobei walked beside So Lang, the two were very close. I want to ask, do you miss home? So Lang smiled faintly, well, it's the Swanyu immortal clan, are you planning to go back? Are you trying to push me away? Chu Xiaobei trembled, I can't go back to the Swanyu fairy clan. No no. Don't be so excited. So Lang was a little stunned. He didn't expect Chu Xiaobei's reaction to be so big. Humph. Do you know why I was hunted alone? Chu Xiaobei asked and replied, Because I escaped from the Swanyu Fairy Clan. What? Escape from the Swanyu Fairy Clan? Isn't that your clan? So Lang asked in surprise, Moreover, you have an unparalleled qualification, no one in a trillion, you should be the treasure of the Swanyu Immortal Clan. Chu Xiaobei's eyes were blank, as if lost in memory, the reason why I escaped from the Swanyu Immortal Clan is because of my extraordinary aptitude. Tell me more carefully. So Lang raised his brows and said. Unparalleled qualifications. Almost the highest level of cultivation qualification currently known. Who doesn't want to have an unparalleled qualification? Everyone wants to have it. Chu Xiaobei smiled bitterly and I have the unparalleled qualifications, to some extent, it is a crime. Have a crime. 
So Lang frowned slightly, how is it possible, aren't you born into a fairy clan? What about the fairy? Chu Ziobe shook his head and said, although I was born in the fairy clan, do you know how big the fairy clan is? How many factions are there? After a pause, before So Lang could speak, Chu Ziobe continued. The line I was born into is the weakest line in the fairy clan, and my father's generation made a big mistake, which is almost irreparable. Our line has the smallest number and the lowest status, and is looked down upon by the entire Swanyu immortal clan. My birth has filled our veins with hope. All the elders have used cultivation resources on me. In addition, the elders were afraid that I would die halfway, so I concealed the fact of my unparalleled qualifications and told me not to leave a safe place. So Lang sighed, you need to be so careful. It seems that you are indeed guilty of crimes. In the world, the human heart is the most terrifying. Chu Ziobei stretched out his hands helplessly, in this way, I can cultivate to the level of the great sage, and have the mysterious ice magic sky silk. But my cultivation speed is still too fast. With our resources, it is simply not enough to support me with such a fast cultivation speed. So, my aptitude was guessed and confirmed. And then? So Lang asked. I was quite happy at first. Chu Ziobe said, I thought I would be valued by the clan and gave me more resources, but I never expected that what was waiting for me was a huge trap. The person laying the trap is the patriarch of Swanyuxian clan, Swanyuxian. But I know that he is not behind the scenes. It is a stronger force that really wants to take my qualifications. If my guess is correct, it should be the emperor, and it is also the emperor of our Swanyuxian clan the Loyu Emperor. Loyu Emperor Clan. Emperor Clan is hitting your attention. So Lang took a breath, Hi, I'm really curious about how you escaped. The reason why I know that Wuxian Swanyu is not behind the scenes is because, I can escape, he let me go. Swanyu Wuxian was persecuted, and the other Wuxians in the clan were warned not to interfere in this matter. And the one who can intimidate an immortal clan is probably only the Emperor clan. Chu Ziobe said, and I am afraid that only the Emperor has the heaven-defying means to seize the transfer cultivation qualifications. That's it. So Lang smiled slightly, it seems that your Swanyu patriarch still has some conscience. On the one hand, there is the of blood. On the other hand, it's probably because of the extraordinary aptitude has another name that is, the posture of becoming an emperor. It is almost impossible for the fairy clan to become an emperor, and I am the only hope for the Swanyu Xian clan to become an emperor. Chu Ziobe said, Swanyu Yuxian couldn't bear me, the only emperor of the Swanyu Xian clan for tens of millions of years, to make wedding dresses for others, so I chose to let me go. Xian Yu Yuxian let you go. So Lang said, then he, and the entire profound jade immortal clan, I'm afraid they will have to bear pressure from the emperor. Of course there is pressure. But the emperor Loya will not make a direct shot. The seizure of qualifications is a crooked way, and this matter cannot be made public. And our Swanya fairy clan is also a subordinate force of Loyu emperor clan in name. Therefore, the Loyu emperor clan will not directly take action. The black hand behind the scenes will use other means to force us Swanyu immortal clan to submit. This is also the reason Xian Yu Wuxian dared to gamble Xian Yuxian clan will not directly face the disaster of extinction. As long as you carry it this time and save me, with my presence as an emperor, the emperor clan will not dare to go too far. Because no one knows whether I can really become an emperor in the future. If I really become an emperor, it will be a disaster for their Loyu Emperor clan. Chu Ziobe took a deep breath and said, However, the premise is that they can't catch me, and my existence has been known by the Lut and Lu. I don't know if there is any contact between Lanchen Lu and Loyu Emperor clan, and will tell Loyu Emperor clan where I am. To be honest, I am very worried and scared, So Lang. Is Loyu Emperor clan? It sounds more terrifying than Slaughter Tower. However, 
as long as I am given a certain amount of time, the power of the Emperor is nothing. After all, Emperor Wu is only a realm on the path of martial arts, and he is not an invincible existence in the world. So Lang smiled and looked at Chu Xiaobei, you are alone now, and the Swanyu immortal clan can't go back. Just stay by my side and I will protect you. If an unsuspecting person saw this scene, their eyes would fall out. A junior marshal dared to speak up, saying that the power of the emperor was nothing, and he wanted to protect a martial sage with quasi-immortal combat power. But in the eyes of Chu Xiaobei, So Lang really has this ability. His potential is really terrifying, and his growth rate is even more terrifying. It is precisely because of this that Chu Xiaobe gradually became dependent on So Lang. Originally, I was entangled whether or not to leave everyone. But you said you want to protect me, then I won't leave, he he. Chu Xiaobe laughed, her beautiful eyes like two beautiful meniscus. Hmm, I still need you to bring Xiaohe. So Lang smiled and nodded, by the way, you should be able to use the fairy weapon now, give me your frozen cloud fantasy Skyling, and I will help you promote to the fairy weapon. In addition, the immortal soul pill I gave you was taken earlier, and strive to break through to the realm of Wuxian as soon as possible. Now that he knows there are enemies suspected of imperial clan. Of course, So Lang would not take it lightly, planning to use all the existing resources to improve combat power. Chu Xiaobei was originally a quasi-celestial combat power. Equip her with good weapons and let her break through to the realm of Wuxian as soon as possible. This is very important for So Lang's promotion. Therefore, in addition to weapons and pill, he has another plan. Really, you are so kind to me. Chu Xiaobei's eyes shone slightly, and immediately handed Bin Jiun Huan Tianling to So Lang. Bin Jiun Huan Tianling had just been promoted once, reaching the quasi immortal level, and at this time it ushered in another promotion. This time I encountered some trouble when I was promoted to Frozen Cloud Fantasy Sky Ling. Some fairy level materials are not in So Lang's storage space. After all, it is a fairy level material, there is not much on the entire Kanglin continent. So it is normal to lack one or two. But this couldn't help So Lang at all. If there is no material, then synthesize it. According to the required properties of the fairy level materials, using holy level materials with similar properties, there is a high chance of synthesizing them. After spending a little time, So Lang found out the missing materials, and also obtained some immortal level materials that were temporarily useless. After some operations, Bin Jiun Huan Tianling was successfully evolved into a fairy weapon by So Lang, giving birth to a device spirit. This spirit is exactly the same as the spirits of Xiaohe Xiaopeo and Xian Gong, and it looks like a crystal bun. So Lang muttered in his heart, looking noisy, it doesn't have the fairy weapons that I have evolved, but the spirits are all like this, right? At this time, Bin Jiun Huan Tianling's spirits actually flew up to Chu Xiaobei obediently, babbling in his mouth, but he could probably hear the words Chu Xiaobei. So Lang, it knows my name. Chu Xiaobei was excited holding the spirit of Huan Tianling with curiosity and affection on his face. Probably because it has been with you for a long time, that's why. So Lang smiled, after all, when it was still a sacred weapon, although it did not have a spirit, it still has aura. Hmm, that should be it. Chu Xiaobei covered her mouth and giggled. So Lang had never seen her so happy and excited before, smiled, and said, How do you feel about this frozen cloud fantasy Skyling? Has it reached your control limit? Well, it's almost there. Bing Yun Huan Tianling was promoted to an immortal weapon. I also need to consume a huge amount of spiritual energy to activate it. Chu Xiaobei felt the power of Huan Tianling and hesitated. In that case, I will promote it next time. The corner of So Lang's mouth raised vigorously and smiled, Come here today, you hurry up to practice, you have the qualifications to become an emperor and you want to become a female emperor. Well, I must become the empress. 
Chu Zio Bei's expression condensed, very serious and solemn. Immortal soul pill is enough for you now. I'll give you some more pills for cultivation and body forging. Soul Lang took out three bottles of pills and handed them to Chu Zio Bei. These three bottles of medicine are all three kinds of elixir of three tribulations, which are three types of cultivation, body forging, and breaking realm. Each bottle contains a full ten. Then I will accept it. Chu Ziobei didn't say any words of thanks, and sometimes everything was silent. Correct. I still owe you an initiation. Solang patted Chu Ziobei on the head, you practice first. I will save the cultivation base, and the storage will surprise you. I just want to experience it, don't give me all your cultivation skills. Chu Ziobe wrinkled Kyung's nose in shame, just your Valkyrie level cultivation base, be careful to be sucked dry by me. Haha. <laughs> I look forward to the day when you squeeze me out. Solang laughed, and immediately turned and flew away. Hey, it really doesn't change sexuality. Pervert, pervert. Chu Ziobei glared beautifully, whispered a few words in a low voice, but did not pursue Sol Lang. Here. After Sol Lang and Chu Ziobei separated, they went to find Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xian Xian. But both women are still consolidating their cultivation. Sol Lang was inconvenient to interrupt, so he randomly found a retreat room and began to retreat. Others retreat for cultivation. Solang is not the case, he was for a plan that was a bit nasty before. The basis for the implementation of this plan is the huge number of Wu Sheng. The martial artist of the martial sage level has mastered the power of the rules and is a relatively advanced martial art realm. Starting from Wu Sheng, to Wu Xian, Wu Di level. In fact, they are all practicing the power of rules. Therefore, if there is a way to concentrate the power of martial saint, to a certain extent, it can be transformed into a qualitative change. Sol Lang's plan is to refine a super powerful weapon, gather the power of many martial sages, and form a terrifying martial arts power, even. Emperor Wu. Warrior is composed of countless cells. The Sea of the Sky, and even the Jixian Cannon, are composed of many parts. There is a lot in common between the two. If the parts in Wushan are used as cells, it may be possible to create an unprecedented powerful humanoid weapon. Sol Lang thought silently, and immediately took out a large number of forging classics and many corpses of warriors. He wants to study the mystery of the martial artist's body. It doesn't need to be too deep, just understand the more detailed structure of the martial artist's body. Time passed slowly. Two hours passed in a blink of an eye. A system prompt came. Ding. The wood rules have been understood, do you accept it? Receive. Sol Lang gave the order and immediately felt that he had mastered the rules of the wood system. Of course, this is only a rough wood rule, including the previously understood golden water and fire thunder, they have not understood the deeper derivative rules. Take wood rules for example. In fact, the wood system also has the rules of life and death. But Solang gains the power to rule at this time, which can only greatly increase his spiritual power reserve and vitality. The rest of the abilities derived from the rules of the wood system cannot be mastered. To break through from Wu Sheng to Wu Xian, you need to comprehend more complete rules, which contains the basic rules such as the five elements. These rules form the framework of the inner boundary and then fill the inner boundary with the substances in the universe as flesh and blood. Derivative rules are rules that most martial sages cannot understand, because they are too obscure and not easy to manifest. Most Wuxians broke through to the realm of Wuxian after comprehending the basic rules. In this way, the inner boundary is relatively crude and fragile, and it is not easy to form a real-life world, which hinders the subsequent cultivation and development. But even to understand the basic rules, it is already very difficult. It is no longer easy to understand the basic rules and form the lowest level inner frame. No one knows how many martial sages can't even perfect the power of the basic rules, and in the end they can't break through to the martial arts. So it's not that those Wuxians don't want to, 
but they don't have time and energy to spend on it. Super weapon is very important. Solang must ensure that the servants who control the super weapon will never have any wrong intentions. The soul's heart and fire are sealed in the ghost Swanya banner, and of course, you can feel the emotion of the servant. But how can one put the soul's heart into the sea of consciousness to observe more accurately? The soul of the soul and Swanya banner can be transferred. Solang murmured, and immediately took out the Yinhun Swanya banner, and used the secret method to take out the tens of thousands of souls in it and put it into the sea of knowledge. At this moment, in Solang's sea of consciousness, under that round of Huido level spiritual aura, there were densely packed souls and phantoms. Each one is a powerful martial saint. A lot of mixed mood swings came, if it was an ordinary martial sage, long time ago, let alone practice, it would be good not to go crazy. But Solang possesses the secret of soul seed heart, and his passive ability can deal with these mixed emotions. Let Solang not be affected at all. From now on, as long as the servants are subdued, all souls can be put into the sea of knowledge. Although this secret method is only a holy rank, it is estimated that it will not be a problem to continue to use it, even if it is effective for Wuxian's soul. Solang pondered silently, and then issued an instruction, system, call up my attribute panel. Solang. Human. Turbidity. Elementary Valkyrie. Four Star Wushan. One Star Wushan. Two Star Wushan. One Star Wushan. Realm of Bright Moon. Boundless Heart Sutra, Sacred Scroll of Water and Mars, Nine Stars and Purple Rainbow Fantasy Book, Black Flame True Sage, Founding Book, Water Mirror Thousand Red True Book, Secret of Soul Seed Heart. Kongsu Mingjian 2, Wu Shen Shen Body Ju, Nine Color Jade Cicada Sutra, Shen Luo Wangziang Ju, Secret Method of Extinguishing Heaven with Blood Flame. One Key Practice Function, One Key Martial Arts Function, Clone Dispatch Function, One Key Treasure Hunt Function, One Key Alchemy Function, One Key Refining Function, One Key Refining Array Function, One Key Synthesis Function, One Key Empowerment Function, One Key Decomposition Function. The Attack Realm increased by two stars, and the Physical State Realm increased by one star. In the Martial Arts stage, every star is a huge gap. It is already very good to have such a rise in combat power. The corners of Solang's mouth raised slightly, obviously in a very happy mood. Next, it's time to choose exercises again. Solang focused his attention on the storage space. After beheading Qian Zihao and others, he seized a lot of exercises. You must know that those who were killed were all great sages and quasi sages, and everyone had also practiced at least three holy level exercises and a large number of god level exercises. In addition, he also obtained a fairy level exercise from Qian Zihao, called Huanhai Palangzian Ju. In addition to the previous exercises, So Lang already possessed 830 god level exercises, 186 holy level exercises, and 4 immortal level exercises. Among them, it's not even Chu Xiaobei's Bing Yuxian Yuan Zhen Lu. Of course, Chu Xiaobei's, isn't that So Lang's? Sooner or later. System, perform Gongfa synthesis. Solang took a deep breath, and then succeeded again and again. 830 kinds of natural god level exercises are combined into 83 composite holy level exercises. 186 kinds of natural holy level exercises are collectively called 18 composite immortal level exercises. At this moment, Solang has a total of 22 kinds of exercises at the immortal level alone. Tisk Tut. The average immortal clan is just an immortal level technique to support the facade. My 22 immortal level techniques, I'm afraid only the emperor has it. Solang smiled blankly, it's a pity, now it takes too much time to practice the immortal level exercises, otherwise I must practice all the immortal level exercises. Next. Solang selected five sacred sword arts. They are Sacred Sword of Heavenly Fire and Refreshing Wind, Recording of the Burning Sword Sword, 
sword formation of fierce demon god universe, light cloud pointing star sword art, Xian Guang Chang Hong sword picture. Two days later, there are five holy level exercises again. The corner of Sol Lang's mouth twitched and a smile appeared. Immediately afterwards, his gaze fell on the ghost Swanya banner in his hand. This thing is completely useless. And even if you want to use it in the future, it can be refined directly, and you can save half of the materials. Sol Lang pondered for a while and ordered, System, disassemble this sacred artifact. Ding! Decompose the elementary sacred tool, the ghost Swanya banner 1, and you will get the soul of Wushan 2. The system prompt came, and a sacred artifact became material in this way. I don't know if those martial sages who don't have a sacred weapon will feel distressed to twitch when they see this scene. At the same time, So Lang listened to the system prompt, his eyes lit up suddenly. Lying down. This sacred weapon actually decomposed into the soul of martial saint. Who did this, dare to use two copies of the soul of martial saint to refine the sacred artifacts? He only needs the soul of Valkyrie to refine the sacred artifacts, and the soul of Wushan is used to promote the immortal artifacts. Sol Lang only did it once to refine the sacred artifact with the soul of Wu Sheng, to refine the flying sacred artifact Xiao Bai for Chu Xiaobe. And that time only a piece of Wushan soul was used. I'm making a big slot. I don't know if the other sacred artifacts are also like this. Sol Lang's eyes lighted up and immediately took out a hundred and four sacred artifacts from the storage space. These ninety sacrificial artifacts all come from the martial sages of the Tuan Tian Tower. These guys are all at the level of Great Sage and Kui Sai Xiang, and each has at least one sacred artifact, and many people have two. I have to say that they are really fat, and Sol Lang's mouth is greasy. System, disassemble all these sacred artifacts for me. Sol Lang took a deep breath and shouted with glowing eyes. Ding! Decompose the high-level sacred artifacts, Toyo Kongsu Pagoda 1, and you will get the soul of Wushan 8, the fairy-level materials, the holy-level materials, the god-level materials, the soul of the Wushan asterisk 23. Ding! Decompose the middle-level sacred instrument Lyo Kai Swan Robe 1, and you will get the soul of Wushan 5, Fairy level materials. Ding. Decompose the primary sacred weapon flying snake chain armor 1, you will get the soul of Wushan 3, holy material. Soon, all the sacred artifacts were broken down by Sol Lang. Sol Lang got a total of 563 copies of the soul of Wu Sheng, and more of the soul of Wu Shen, with 2,300 copies. In addition, there are some fairy level materials and a lot of holy level materials. Tian Li, I don't know who did it, but to use immortal level materials to refine the sacred artifacts is completely violent. And the most important thing is, the materials used in these sacred artifacts are really too much. A holy artifact uses the soul of martial arts and immortal level materials, and the holy level materials are added to it like no money. I don't know which waste refiner did it, it's not human. Sol Lang rolled his eyes, expressing extreme contempt for those saint-level refining masters with low refining attainments. Poor those saint-level refining masters, not to mention that their own work has been broken down, and their refining skills have been severely despised. I don't know if they know if they will vomit blood with anger. He <laughs> he. With these materials, the progress of my super weapon project can be greatly accelerated. Sol Lang licked his lips excitedly then took out a lot of ingredients and began to refine the cells. The so-called cells are parts. Sol Lang wanted to refine countless cells to form a humanoid weapon. This humanoid weapon has dantian, meridians, bones, muscles, and even the sea of consciousness. What the warrior has, it has it. And its size, perhaps will stand upright. Just when Sol Lang was refining the super humanoid weapon, in the distant headquarters of Tuan Tian Tower, Yin Shaoyuxian and the three of them were sitting in a secret room, frowning, their faces sinking like water. Except for hidden killing Wuxian, the other three are all Wuxian. Fixu Wuxian, 
1 Tribulation Wuxian, Tengkian Wuxian, 2 Tribulations Wuxian, Daiking Wuxian, 3 Tribulations Wuxian. Among them, Wuxian Fixu was a man with long sleeves and fluttering, as light as nothing, but this man looked very damn, and his temperament was cold, like a poisonous snake. Wuxian Tengkian, with knotted muscles, is a muscular man like Chiri Azu, but he has long hair soaring to the sky, and he is domineering. Junking Wuxian, expressionless, without the slightest emotional fluctuation in his eyes, just like a puppet. Three days ago, the news that Jian Zihao and Zhu Qi died of a total of 87 people was known by Lu Tianlu. After all, it is a quasi emperor level killer organization, and there are not only many things like Mingpai, but also more lofty. After getting the news, everyone in Tuan Tian Tower was furious. Since the ancient wars, the Slaughter Sky Tower has never suffered such a heavy loss. A generation of Wuxian Qian Zihao. There are also more than 20 quasi immortals and more than 60 great sages, which are the mainstay of the Tower of the Sky. These powers can be taken out at will, and they can crush any holy race, and ordinary immortals must be vigilant when they see it. But it was such a powerful force that it was unclear that it was in the hands of an unknown little figure like So Lang, and died in this small place of Yeokai clan. At that time, Wuxian Tengtian was about to take people to the Yeokai clan to find So Lang's trouble, but he was immediately stopped by the other three. Qian Zihao died so fast that he didn't even send out the help message, it was as if he was killed by a spike. To be able to kill a Wuxian of one tribulation in a second, the last time it takes a Wuxian of two tribulations can do it. Moreover, Yin Sha and others cannot rule out whether it was only the second tribulation martial immortal who killed Qian Zihao, in case it was the third tribulation's martial immortal, or even the fourth tribulation's martial immortal. Even if the opponent has the five tribulations martial immortal, isn't he going to die? Therefore, after the initial anger, Wuxian Tengtian and others calmed down and began investigating the death of Qian Zihao. They sent a large number of inconspicuous manpower into the Yeokai area to investigate the truth. Although So Lang also ordered the strict prevention of the infiltration of the Tuan Tian Tower, the Tuan Tian Tower was after all a quasi emperor level killer organization. They are professional. The manpower sent by So Lang was far short of this. Therefore, it took three days for Tuan Tian Tower, not only to restore the cause of the death of many Wusheng, but also to find the battlefield where Qian Zihao died. Although So Lang dispatched a clone to clean up the battlefield, the intelligence experts from Tuan Tian Lu still couldn't help it. From that battlefield, they inferred that Qian Zihao was killed by an attack at the level of the Second Tribulation Martial Immortal. Moreover, it was also found out that it was some kind of weapon that killed Qian Zihao not Wuxian. Because they did not find the unique aura of Wuxian from the remaining fighting aura, but only the pure heaven and earth aura. You must know that every warrior has its own unique aura, which is contained in the bloodline and spiritual energy and even the spiritual power, which is difficult to conceal. In front of the Li Tianlu, there was nothing to hide. But the attack that killed Qian Zihao didn't have the unique breath of warriors. This means that this attack is a direct conversion of heaven and earth aura, or an attack that uses spirit jade to urge it to perform. In this case, most of them are using some kind of weapon. And the need for such a method to kill Qian Zihao does not mean that the person who does it does not have the strength to fight Qian Zihao. After are some inferences. Yin Sha, Fixu, Teng Tian, and Duan Qing thought that So Lang did not have a master of martial arts, but possessed another powerful fairy weapon. Because So Lang originally had the deeds of refining the sea of the sky, it would be easy to understand if he possessed a fairy artifact. I have to say that the information system of the slaughter tower is indeed powerful. Within a short period of time, an incident was analyzed close to the facts. This son So Lang is really amazing. He actually refined a kind of immortal weapon that can be activated only by the martial sage and can also kill the martial immortal. It is unprecedented. Yin Sha Wuxian said with emotion, if this kind of talent is brought into the control of Tuan Lu, 
our strength will definitely advance by leaps and bounds. What's the use of saying these now? Fixu Yuxian said coldly, Qian Zihao was killed by Sou Lang. We already have an antagonism between us. He must pay the price of blood. Fixu is right. The Kanglin continent has never lacked genius, nor has it lacked strange people and strangers. We have offended and killed us, but even if Sou Lang is useful, he must be killed. Otherwise, wouldn't it be someone who has the ability to scratch our beards and touch our buttocks? In that case, where is our majesty and face in slaughter tower? Teng Tian Wuxian's complexion turned red, his eyes burst out with a strong killing intent, and the surrounding space was slightly distorted because of his anger. So Lang, must die. Wuxian Duanqing also spoke, and his voice was also indifferent and ruthless, like an ice stone. But news just came from the Emperor's forbidden area, let us all support it. Hidden killer Wuxian had a look and hesitated, it can be seen that they are under a lot of pressure in the first seat, and the situation is not optimistic. The Emperor's forbidden land is related to the hope of the first Emperor. Should we put aside the things here first? The Emperor's forbidden area is a forbidden area formed by the head of a ninth rank Wudi who died in the Battle of the Mainland in the ancient times. In addition, there are five forbidden areas, which are formed by the arms, legs, and torso of Emperor Wudi nine turns. The Emperor Wudi of nine revolutions was the most powerful Emperor Wudi in the Kanglin continent for thousands of years. When that was the case, Kanglin continent and Jingtian continent went to war, and the ninth rank Wudi of both sides died together. Since then, the nine ranked martial emperor has never appeared on the Kanglin continent. After the death of the nine revolutionary Wudi, he used secret methods to divide his corpse and the universe of life that he had conceived into five parts, forming five forbidden areas. He left the forbidden key to future generations to compete. As long as you get the forbidden key, you can enter the forbidden area to explore the opportunities. And these five forbidden lands are covered by the power of a special avenue, and Emperor Wu is not allowed to enter. Once Emperor Wu forcefully breaks through, the forbidden area will self-destruct, and the separated life universe and Emperor Wu inheritance will also be wiped out. In addition, the death of Emperor Wudi of Nine Revolutions was tragic and praised by others, so those who survived all uphold the will of Emperor Wudi of Nine Revolutions, not only restrained themselves from competing for the chance to become an emperor, but also ordered their own people not to participate. The imperial forces are not allowed to participate in the exploration of the forbidden land of Emperor Wudi of the Ninth Revolution. Once someone violates it, it will immediately be targeted. Closer to home the five forbidden areas left by Emperor Wu of the Ninth Revolution can be accessed by anyone below Emperor Wu. The forbidden area is extremely dangerous, even if Wuxian breaks in, there will be life concerns. However, these five forbidden areas also represent the inheritance of Emperor Wudi of the Ninth Revolution, and represent the chance of becoming Emperor. In addition, these five forbidden lands have had the opportunity of becoming emperor from the four forbidden lands to be taken away, thus creating the four martial emperors in the world today. At this time, the six inheritances left by the ninth rank emperor were left with the emperor's head and emperor body. The competition has become more intense. Therefore, once the forbidden key appears, it will cause a storm and a huge wave, and countless forces will take action to seize the key. Not long ago, the Emperor's Forbidden Land key appeared, and countless people died for it, and even the fairy clan was destroyed. In the end, there were only two forces competing for the Forbidden Land key. One was the Quasi Emperor Organization, Tuantian Lu, and the other was the Quasi Emperor Force, the Yanjai Immortal Clan. In order to compete for the key to the Emperor's Forbidden Land, the strength of the two sides has been fighting for many years and almost all of their strength has been involved in it. It is precisely because of this that there are only three or two big cats and kittens in the headquarter of Tuan Tian Tower, because the real main force is participating in the competition for the Forbidden Key. In addition, because too much effort has been devoted, if any third-party forces join in, 
they will be expelled by the joint efforts of Tushinlu and Yanjai immortal clan. Therefore, even if the other forces covet the emperor's forbidden land, they can only find another opportunity. By this time, the battle between Lanshinlu and Yanjai immortal clan had reached its peak, and the masters of both sides made all the shots, and it was time to decide the victory or defeat. Secretly, I don't know how many forces are staring at Tuantianlu and Yanjai immortal clan. Many of them were secretly instructed by certain imperial forces. For the emperor's forbidden land, the Kanglan continent at this time can be described as undercurrents. It is precisely because of this that the hidden killer Wuxian proposed to support the main force first, and wait until the dust settles on the forbidden land of the emperor, and then come to Solang's trouble. However, some people think otherwise. It's just a Wushan level force, what's to be afraid of? That Solang's offensive immortal weapon is only at the second tribulation martial immortal level. I'm afraid it would be hard to kill me. Wuxian Tengtian sneered. What's more, there are four of us, and there are adults who are not in love. Can Solang stop this? GGG. Teng Tian is right. Solang, to put it bluntly, is a waste that relies on external forces. As long as his fairy tools don't work, it's our fish meat. Wuxu Fixu also showed sarcasm and murderous intent. The four of us will kill him together. It will never take much time. Yes, well said. Teng Tian laughed loudly, let's kill the Solang stray first, and then support the first ones, otherwise my heart is always unhappy, it's like a throat. Having said this, he stood up abruptly, his eyes bursting with terrifying murderous intent. If it weren't for the martial arts all around, just this murderous aura could kill a large group of people. Both adults think we can kill Solang first. Yin killing Wuxian groaned and looked at Wuxian Duanqing, what does Master Duanqing mean? Half a day, kill So Lang. There was not a trace of fluctuation in the expression of severing love, and there was not a trace of emotion in the voice. Then go now. Tang Tian couldn't wait to say, by the way, with your subordinates, you can form a thousand sage slaughter immortal formations, and add another Wuxian level combat power. Well. For a quick decision, take your subordinates. Wuxu Fixu smiled like a snake, I can't help but see Solang's dying struggle. Go. A short word popped out of Wuxian Duanqing's mouth and got up and walked outside the secret room. Not long. A total of 200 Great Sage level Great Sage level slaughter tower killers were summoned. They stood under the four great martial immortals, including the hidden killer with serious faces and bowed heads. Set off. Following the order of the Wuxian Duanqing, the four great martial arts and the two hundred martial arts sages slammed into the Yeokai saints aggressively. And on this occasion, Solang has refined thousands of cell parts for super-humanoid weapons. After beheading Qian Zihao and others, and decomposing more than one hundred sacred artifacts, so Lang now has more than 600 copies of the soul of the martial god, and nearly 3,000 copies of the soul of the martial god. Using the soul of the of war, you can make immortal tools, and the soul of the of war can make holy tools. Therefore, So Lang refines all very important parts into the immortal level. However, all of these immortal artifacts only used a martial sage soul, and like the fairy level meteorite thunder, a complete artifact spirit has not yet been born. In the plan, the parts of the Danchen meridians and muscles and bones of the Sea of Consciousness are all of the immortal level. There are more than 200 bone parts alone. Solang predicted that the number of fairy artifact parts to be refined should reach more than 900. In addition, there are tens of thousands of holy parts, and there are countless god-level parts. From the current materials, to complete the super-humanoid weapon plan, there is still a lot of material shortage. I don't know what the is Lu doing, for three days, for three whole days, they haven't come to beat me. So Lang put down a holy part in his hand and sighed slightly. At this time, another system prompt came. Ding! The spiritual rules have been understood, do you accept it? It's another rule, good news. 
the corner of Sol Lang's mouth was very happy. The spiritual rules can be understood after completing the training of the soul secrets. At that time, Sol Lang immediately designated to comprehend this rule. In less than four hours, the power of the rules is at hand, although it is only the most superficial spiritual rules. System, accept the spiritual rules. Sol Lang moved in his heart and gave instructions. In the next moment, he felt the power of strange rules appearing in the sea of consciousness out of thin air. This mysterious power instantly increased Sol Lang's mental strength by more than ten times, and it also produced various magical effects. At this time, Sol Lang's spiritual perception range had reached a vast range of hundreds of millions of miles. In addition, his spiritual defense ability has been elevated to an extremely terrifying level. Unless you practice a special technique, unless you use your spiritual treasure to fight, it's not as good as using two-handed devices to fight clothes. But now that Sol Lang is within 10,000 miles, even if he fights with a spiritual imperial item, he is no less inferior to holding the Yushan sword with his own hands. Lying down, this is equivalent to increasing my close attack range to thousands of miles. Sol Lang's eyes brightened with excitement, not bad, not bad, this rule is really good. Immediately after, he specified the next rule yin rule. Yin rules are the former of yin and yang rules. This rule involves a wide range, even with life, spirit, and soul. And Sol Lang chose this rule, one is to cooperate with Nine Stars Purple Rainbow Fantasy Book and Shen Luo Wang Ziang Ju, and the other is to prepare for the practice of Nine Revolving Immortal Sun True Ju. Ding! Yin rules have begun to comprehend. With this rule, my combat power will definitely increase. Sol Lang hooked his mouth and gave a dark compliment, then let go of his mental power and felt the range of mental detection. Sure enough, everything within hundreds of millions of miles is well understood. Sol Lang happily put away his mental power perception, and then used the perception sharing function to share the avatars and various treasure hunting flying flying gliders. I haven't come to trouble me for three days. According to the virtues of Tushinlu, it shouldn't be. What the are they doing? Sol Lang muttered, generally looking at the shared avatar perception. At this time, the range of his mental perception has reached hundreds of millions of miles. The mental perceptions of the 23 clones and 23 clone incarnations also reached hundreds of millions of miles. Plus there are more than 20 million treasure hunting flying flying gliders. Sol Lang already knows the whole Yeokai tribe's situation well. Observed for a while. Sol Lang, who had not found the problem, planned to continue refining the parts of the super humanoid weapon. But at this moment, his expression suddenly changed. Because, through the perception of a clone on the edge of the Yeokai clan, he found a large group of uninvited guests. Although these people have done very tight concealment, the means are superb. But they have too many hands, and they are acting together, and they are murderous, and they can't help but show their feet. What's more, Sol Lang also comprehended the rules of the spirit, and his sensing power was greatly improved. He immediately observed a clue, inferring that there are a lot of people, and the cultivation base is very high. The other side. Under the leadership of the four great martial immortals including Duan Qing, the 200 Slaughter Heavenly Killers entered the Yeokai area. About the information about the Yeokai tribe, you must have understood it very clearly. Now everyone is scattered and lurking near the target city, so you must not be stunned. We must first destroy most of the Yeokai cities, so that they can taste what grief is. Wuxu Fixu's voice was cold, like a poisonous snake whistling a letter. Yes. Numerous martial sages immediately took their orders, and then secretly dispersed. Figzu Wuxian, Yin Shat and the others looked at each other and rushed towards the direction of Yeokai Holy City. Okay. These guys seem to be separated. Sol Lang immediately perceives the movements of the Lanchen Lu and others. There were four great Wuxians who helped to cover up their breath before, and Sol Lang was still very unclear about it. But now those martial saints separated, 
and Sol Lang immediately noticed the specific whereabouts of the two. No way, Sol Lang has mental rules, and his mental detection ability is really amazing. The same as Wu Sheng. Fighting strength, even those Wu Sheng of the Great Sage Quasi Immortal level, it is difficult to escape Sol Lang's detection. According to the direction these guys are heading, it should be the cities of the Yaokai tribe. There was a hint of joy in Sol Lang's eyes, okay, the fat sheep of Slaughter Tower, I finally wait for you to come. Of course, Sol Lang was careless on the surface, but very cautious in his heart. Li Tianlu is a quasi emperor level force, why would Sol Lang look down upon them stupidly? All the guys observed are at the level of Martial Saint. But they will definitely come to Wuxian, maybe more than one. I can't see through their whereabouts for the time being, I can only wait for them to expose themselves. While thinking about it, So Lang took out Jace Yen Cannon and Tai Chi Meteor Thunder. Just in case. First, promote the Jixian Artillery. Well, the Celestial Meteorite Thunder God can also be promoted as a whole card. While applying perception sharing to monitor the people in Tuan Tian Tower, Sol Lang gave evolutionary instructions to the system. Ding! Consumes the fairy level material, glazed light blood Kun Jade 3, the extremely cold dry immortal soil 10, the red rainbow mysterious magic stone 20, holy material, the soul of Wushan 36, the holy frost rock 100, explosive blue crystal 120. The Jixian cannon evolved into an intermediate fairy weapon. Ding! Consumption of the fairy level material overlords crystal burst essence 3, heavenly flame stone 6, holy material, Wushan soul 4, heavenly purple thunderwood 30. Tai Chi meteorite god thunder evolved successfully. Two system prompts came that the Jixian cannon successfully evolved into an intermediate immortal weapon, possessing the power of the four tribulations martial immortal. Of course, a single shot consumes more funds. Sol Lang didn't know how much spirit jade it would take to fight such a shot. In addition, the Taiji meteorite god Thunder evolved successfully, and its level was raised from the first tribulation Wuxian to the second tribulation Wuxian. But this self-explosive fairy weapon is more powerful than the Jianxian cannon. When it was still the one tribulation immortal tool, the Taiji meteorite god Thunder could kill the three tribulations Wuxian and severely wound the four tribulations Wuxian. At this time, the Divine Thunder rose to a level, and its power also increased by another level, even if the Wuxian of the Five Tribulations was in the center of the explosion, he would be seriously injured. It's so strong this fairy weapon. It's just a bit of a prodigal, it's gone as soon as it explodes. Sol Lang cautiously put the Second Tribulation Immortal Tool Taiji Meteorite Thunder into the storage space. This guy felt terrified when he held it himself. By the way, I thought it was very powerful at the time, and I also refined two more immortal level Tai Chi Meteorite Thunder. Do you want to promote both of them? Seeing the other two immortal level Meteorite Thunders in the storage space, Sol Lang hesitated and decided to temporarily place them. The super humanoid weapon plan consumes too much material. Every piece of Martial Saint Soul is extremely precious, so save a bit of use. Two fairy artifacts have evolved. Sol Lang immediately notified Yeo Kai Yan Fa and the others that an enemy had come to kill Tian Lu, and asked them to take a strict defense. Yeo Kai Yan Fa and others received the order, and one by one said that even if they threw their heads and shed blood, they would never let the people of Tuan Tian Lu break through the holy city of Yeo Kai. Immediately after, Sol Lang dispatched Li Xian Yang to his side. Knock on the Lord. Li Xianyang looked very excited. In the last three days, because of Sol Lang's restraint of his realm, he has not broken his realm either. But in these three days, they have been constantly comprehending the rules, so far they have comprehended a total of 13 new rules. Among them are his coveted spiritual rules. Spiritual rules are one of the most mysterious and difficult to understand. Li Xianyang specializes in spiritual power, and has not fully understood the spiritual rules in his previous life. This is also one of the shackles that he didn't break from Zuxian to Wuxian. 
but he never expected that after he followed Sol Lang, he would get something he could not get for millions of years in such a short time. It's so dreamy. Li Xian Yang. There are people coming from the Slushan Tower again, this time about 200 people. Sol Lang said indifferently, I will send you to intercept and kill those people now. Don't play with the cat like the last time. You will kill you when you see it. The people from Tushinlu are here again. It seems that they are really not hurt by the Lord. Don't worry, the Lord, I will definitely kill them all. Li Xian Yang patted his chest and promised. Go. So Lang smiled slightly, waved his big hand, and dispatched Li Xian Yang. Although the Yeokai tribe is only a holy tribe, the area is also extremely broad. Even a martial sage of the Great Sage level cannot cross the entire Yeokai tribe area in a short time. At this moment, those Great Sages and the Quasi Immortals who had split up on the edge of the Yeokai tribe and lurked forward only travelled a tenth of the distance. Even the city that was recently used as a target is still far away. Blood 18, the strong under the command of Broken Feeling, the warrior of the Quasi Immortal level. His goal is the nearest Yeokai city. I'm waiting for the Slaughter Tower assassin's best at stealth assassination. The Yeokai area is barren and remote, and there are no people everywhere. If Solang's servant hadn't prepared in advance, he would definitely not be able to find out where I was. When most of the people are lurking, they can take action together and let the Yeokai tribe lose half their lives. A sage in a mere trivial area, dare to oppose Artushinlu, and dare to kill the martial immortal of Artushinlu, it's really funny. After erasing you, I will go to the Emperor's Forbidden Area to support the main force. If the first seat succeeds in obtaining the Forbidden Area key, then I might also be able to go in and find a chance to become a fairy. Shueshiba moved forward while thinking about the future. As for the Yeokai Saint clan, in his opinion, it was just a small praying mantis, and it was about to be crushed into mud. Quickly. Shueshiba found that within the range of his mental power, there were already human beings. The first is very small towns, even villages, where most of them are warriors with very low qualifications, and their cultivation is very shallow. In these villages, you can even see children who have no signs of practicing. This innocent look, I really want to destroy it. There was a strong cruelty and ferociousness on Sushiba's face, it is a pity that I can't do it for the time being. When I do it, I must kill more cute little things, ggg. At this time, Shueshiba suddenly found a cloud of phantom in the direction he was heading. What is this? When Sushiba's face was puzzled, he saw that group of phantoms instantly condensed into a human form. He is, Li. Li Xian Yang. Shueshiba saw the face of the figure clearly, and was shocked. They did a good job in the intelligence work of Tushinlu, and Solang and most of the people around him had information. As a servant who followed Solang for a long time, Li Xian Yang was, of course, the end-pointing figure of Tuantianlu. Therefore, when I saw Li Xian Yang, I recognized Li Xian Yang instantly. Next moment. Shue Shishi felt the coldness on the palm of his hand and behind his back, and he was obviously immersed in cold sweat. Because according to intelligence, all the Quasi Zion Yu saints under Qian Zihao's command were killed by Li Xian Yang. The Quasi Immortal under Qian Zihao's command is not much weaker than his blood 18. Li Xian Yang, why is he here? Could it be that Sol Lang has noticed that I am waiting? No. How is this possible? Our latent skills are so superb, unless we master special rules, only Wuxian can see through. But even if someone under Solang has mastered the special rules, how many people can there be? Only a few people at most. How can a few people monitor the entire Yeokai area and accurately capture the traces of me? Perhaps, he just happened to meet me, he can't even confirm my identity. In an instant, a lot of thoughts flashed through Shue Shishi's heart, and a trace of luck occurred. And at this moment, he suddenly saw Li Xianyang's mouth showing a murderous intent. Not good. 
Shueshiba's heart tightened, and he quickly revealed his figure, and bowed his hand to Li Xianyang in front of him, friends in front, I want to cross the Yaokai area and go to other places. I wonder why you blocked my way. Ha 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 ha. The Quasi Immortal of Tushinlu, your acting skills are good, but it is a pity that my patriarch has already understood everything. Li Xianyang sneered, the Lord orders me not to waste time, so please die. Next moment. A horrible round of scorching sun reflected in Shue Shishi's eyes, stabbing him with severe pain. Do not. The roar of blood 18 before his death was filled with strong disbelief and a sense of despair. Immediately, he was attacked by Li Xianyang's spirit to break the sea of consciousness and died. Ding! You get the soul of high-level martial arts one, the guide of space one, the middle-level sacred weapon and bone-eroding holy spear asterisk one, the best spirit jade 856,236. Perfect plunder trigger, everything in Blood 18 has become Solang's trophy. It was at the moment of Blood 18's death. Among the four people including Wuxian hidden killer who went to the holy city of Yeokai, Wuxian Duanqing's complexion changed. Someone under my command has died. It's a quasi-immortal, Blood 18, death instantly. It is estimated that he died in Li Xianyang's hands. Duanqing Wuxian has no expression on his face, and there is no mood swing in his voice. He took out something similar to a life card from the inner world of Wuxian, like a ring, which was broken into two halves at this time. One died so soon. Didn't they let them hide? How could they be intercepted? Wuxian Tengtian said in disbelief, could Solang's choreography be able to see their whereabouts? Perhaps just a coincidence. Wuxian Fixu said disdainfully, with the energy of the little saint level power like Sol Lang, the quasi immortal who can see through the hidden traces with all his strength? Impossible. Flying. The people who looked down on Sol Lang are dead. Yin Sha Wuxian glanced at Fixu Wuxian, very dissatisfied with this guy's arrogance. Cut. Fixu Wuxian looked at Yin killing Wuxian contemptuously, you are too courageous. Are you afraid of Qian Zihao's death? As soon as this remark came out, a smell of gunpowder suddenly appeared between the two. Shut up! The voice of Wan Qing Wuxian came, and Wuxu Fixu and Wuxian Yin Sha suddenly reduced their breath. Immediately after, Wuxian Duanqing took out seven more broken rings, a rare trace of anger appeared on his face. This is, seven more dead. Wuxian Tengtian opened his mouth, and then looked at his Wuxian inner boundary with feeling, and found that three of his subordinates were also dead. This. Without waiting for Tengtian Wuxian to swear, hidden killing Wuxian also took out some cracked life cards. Including a Fixu Wuxian with contempt, but also a gloomy look, apparently someone under his command has died. It may be a coincidence that one died, but after so many deaths, it must be Solang and the others who can discover the traces of our subordinates. Let everyone no longer cover their whereabouts, fly with all their strength, attack the nearest martial arts gathering point, and kill all the martial arts in sight. An icy voice came from Wuxian Duanqing, and Yin Sha Wuxian and others nodded. They are the killers of Tuantianlu, and when they are angry, they will immediately set off a sea of blood. Next moment. The orders of the four martial arts were passed to the hands of all the surviving assassins. Don't hide your whereabouts anymore, just kill. Although I don't know why the boss suddenly changed his mind, I like this command. Kill kill kill. Kill everything in the Yaokai tribe area. More than 170 quasi-celestial martial sages showed their figures, carrying terrifying power, and they killed the nearest martial artist. In an instant, the Great Sage attack was covered, and tens of millions of creatures died instantly. And this number is rising rapidly every second. 10 million, 30 million, 70 million, 100 million. Countless creatures, including children who have not cultivated, have been taken away by murderous killers. All of this naturally fell into Sol Lang's eyes. Hateful. This group of dogs is so crazy. 
Solang frowned, his eyes gradually covered with bloodshot eyes, and his intense anger instantly filled his heart. At the same time, Solang also knew that he had underestimated the killing nature of the Slaughter Tower Warriors. I thought that although these Slaughter of the Sky Warriors were killers, they would not slaughter the innocent and weak, or even all the creatures in front of the mass destruction. Unexpectedly, they are so inhumane. Damn it, careless. Li Xian Yang, speed it up. Quickly, quickly, you must quickly kill all the Slaughter Tower assassins. Yao Qi Yan Fa, you pass the message, order everyone to go to the nearest city immediately, and take away those who dare to disobey. While giving orders, So Lang used clone dispatch and clone replacement to shuttle between the cities of the Yaokai tribe. Every time he arrives at a city, So Lang conveniently uses his one thought formation ability to set up a celestial phantom united fairy formation in the local area. This formation mage So Lang currently has the strongest immortal formation, and its defensive power has reached the level of the second tribulation martial immortal. And its coverage is very wide often while guarding a city, it can also cover the surrounding smaller towns and villages. In this way, most of the warriors and creatures are protected, and the loss will be minimized. Time passed by. Almost every second, a large number of innocent creatures died in the hands of the Slaughter Tower martial artist. Almost every second, Li Xian Yang was able to kill a crazy quasi-celestial martial sage in the Slaughter Tower. Almost every second, so Lang was able to leave the Azure Phantom United Immortal Formation in a city. In a short period of time, Li Xian Yang once again beheaded dozens of people, and So Lang also arranged a whole number of ten sets of the Sky Phantom United Fairy Formation. Yao Kai Yan Fa also sent many warriors to move people from small towns and villages to the guardianship of the Fairy Formation. In this way, the loss of the Yao Kai tribe was immediately contained. The remaining more than a hundred quasi-immortal martial sages killed them, and found that they had killed fewer and fewer people, and even many villages were empty. Immediately afterwards, another martial saint of the Lanchen Tower inadvertently attacked the barrier of the Blue Sky Phantom united with the Immortal Formation, and was directly wiped out by the counter-attack ability of the Immortal Formation. The quasi-celestial martial sages who sensed something was wrong immediately sent a message to Yin Sha and other Wuxians. Master Hidden Kill, many villages and towns I encountered were empty, and the Yaokai people have already reacted. Master Figzu, I just met the immortal formation laid by the Yaokai tribe, they actually set up an immortal formation in a small city, my god, I almost ran into it. Master Teng Tian, many of my companions can no longer be contacted. They may have been unpredictable. Ah, that is. Li Xian Yang, no. Sir Duan Qing, I have already met the fifth immortal formation. So Lang really has an extremely senior immortal formation refiner. Ah. Li Xian Yang. Li Xian Yang has appeared, ah. The four of Duan Qing, Hidden Kill, Teng Tian, and Figzu kept receiving messages from their subordinates. There was a lot of information at the beginning, and then it became less and less. This means that there are fewer and fewer surviving warriors under their command. The four great slaughter heaven tower Wuxian was bleeding in their hearts. Although his subordinates killed countless creatures of the Yaokai tribe. But all of his subordinates were great saint level and quasician level powerhouses, but so many died at this time, and they were completely destroyed after a few breaths. A total of 200 great sages, quasi celestial powerhouses, just died like that. What is the origin of So Lang, who is the son of a bitch? Wuxian Tengtian opened his eyes violently, in the information we have, the Yaokai tribe doesn't have so many immortal formations. In just three days, even an extremely senior immortal level formation refining master cannot refine even one immortal formation. Hidden killing Wuxian took a cold breath, and just what my subordinates encountered, there are already more than ten immortal formations, what is the method used? And that Li Xian Yang. Obviously, I killed one of my subordinates before, just took a breath, and killed another of my subordinates. The distance between the two sides is so huge, 
how could he cross over instantly? Fixu Wuxian's face was somber as the bottom of a pot, could it be that it was not Li Xianyang who killed our subordinates, but an ancient immortal level expert who understood the rules of space to the limit? The so-called ancient immortal level powerhouses are the martial immortals above the seven calamities, each of whom has lived for countless years, so they are called ancient immortals. We still underestimate Sol Lang. This guy has too many methods, too mysterious. But so far, he has only shot our subordinates, not us. It can be seen that the ancient immortal in Figzu's mouth probably does not exist. Solang may not be sure to fight us head on, or even our whereabouts may not be clear. Wuxian Duanqing's eyes narrowed into a thin slit, cold light, now we have two choices, one is to leave quietly, and the other is to test Solang, and then decide whether to fight with him head on. As soon as these words came out, the three people including Yin Sha looked at each other. Leaving quietly, this is too awkward. Tengkian Wuxian said, Sir Duanqing, you have said that there is a very small probability that there will be an ancient immortal around Solang, why don't we try? To be honest, everyone has the idea of Tengkian Wuxian. They are all people who have lived for millions of years, and they just ran away with their tails in between. So, who is going? Fixu Wuxian has a cold tone, like a poisonous snake. As soon as this problem came up, Tengkian stopped talking. Solang possesses incredible means, and has an immortal weapon beside him, and there may be ancient immortals around him. Those who go to temptation will take great risks. For Qian Zihao's lesson, all four hesitated. There was a moment of silence. Only together. Betting on all our strength. Once Solang is strong outside, we will directly kill him, and once it is overwhelming, we can also work together and retreat. Wuxian Duanqing's voice was indifferent and said, In my opinion, although Solang has a lot of methods, it is impossible to kill us when the four of us retreat with all their strength. In that case, let's go together. Wuxian Tengkian nodded, then looked at Figzu and Hidden Killer, You two, don't lose the chain at the critical moment. I have the same brotherhood as Yin Kill, you are too worried. Wuxu Figzu smiled and he was so disgusted as to kill him. Our subordinates are dead. Even if it's a trial, you can't just leave it alone, you have to make Solang pay a certain price. Xianqing Wuxian said, Go, look for a city without the protection of the immortal formation, and kill the world. At this point, Wuxian Duanqing finally showed strong mood swings, shame, anger, and killing intent intertwined, such as the tsunami of the end making him look hideous. Kill. The other three yelled in a low voice, and immediately unfolded their mental power, and began to look for a city without the protection of the fairy formation. On this occasion, Solang has just finished setting up a blue sky phantom united fairy formation in a small city. Master. Fortunately, the servant has already beheaded all the enemies. Li Xianyang knelt on one knee, his whole face pale and crumbling, and Chi Chiao even showed signs of bleeding. Obviously, the continuous use of mental attacks in a short period of time to kill the Kui Saixian and the great saint level martial artist, so that Li Xianyang also suffered a serious backlash. You know, mental attacks are rarely used in the battle of warriors of the same level, because the attacking party will suffer a lot. Therefore, even if Li Xianyang's mental strength far exceeds that of the other quasi-celestial beings, he still has spiritual rules because of Solang, and after beheading 200 people, he has become weak. Good job. Take these pills to heal your wounds and recover sooner. Solang smiled comfortedly, then took out the immortal soul pill and some healing pill, and handed it to Li Xianyang. Thank the Lord for the generous gift. Li Xianyang immediately knelt and kowtow, and respectfully accepted the medicine. Well, you go. Solang nodded, the martial immortal of Slaughter Tower hasn't appeared yet, I can't put down my guard yet. Master. Li Xianyang looked enthusiastic, but if you need it, please call your servant immediately. The servant will be broken to pieces and serve the Lord. 
You go to heal immediately now, which is the best service to me. Solang laughed, hurry up, don't delay my arrangement of the fairy formation. Yes. Li Xianyang took the order and left immediately. Before leaving, he couldn't help but look at the Blue Sky Phantom United Immortal Formation just arranged by Sol Lang. The Lord is really amazing. You can arrange an immortal formation in an instant. This is impossible even for an Emperor level formation refiner. Improvement, formation, alchemy, the speed of cultivation is against the sky, the comprehension of the exercise technique is against the sky, and the comprehension of the rules is completely unreasonable. My lord will one day be invincible. With excitement, Li Xianyang returned to Ling He, the sea fairy palace in the sky, and began to heal his injuries. I don't know how many people from the martial fairy of the slaughter tower have arrived, and what choices they will make after all the martial artists under their command die. So Lang thought silently, and immediately replaced it with a clone, came to the next city, and continued to arrange the fairy formation. By this time, he had arranged a whole number of hundreds of immortal formations. Every city with a little value is equipped with immortal formations, and important cities are equipped with two or three layers of immortal formations. And the materials used are like mountains and seas, countless. But now is not the time to feel distressed about the materials. If the formation is not arranged, a large number of creatures will be exposed to extremely terrible danger. Moreover, even though a lot of materials were used, killing 200 Great Saint level and Kui Saixian level warriors, the harvest completely overwhelmed the expenses, and Solang's storage space had more materials. What's more, when needed, these fairy formations can finally be decomposed and recycled, and even a little material will not be wasted at all. When arranging the fairy formation, Solang was also using perception sharing to monitor the entire Yaokai area. But because the realm was too different, and the martial immortals of the Tuantian Tower were professional killers, Sol Lang still did not find the whereabouts of the martial immortal of Tuantian Tower. This made Sol Lang more vigilant. He knew that Slaughter Tower would never stop there. A terrible revenge is brewing. At the same time, a certain corner of the Yaokai area, Duanqing Wuxian and the others hovered in the air, with an ugly look and at the same time a strong incredible color. We have spanned most of the Yaokai clan, and every place we go, there must be an immortal formation for protection. Teng Tian Wuxian's voice trembled slightly, so far, we have seen 396 immortal formations. Those cities that are slightly more important have two or even three fairy formations. Oh my god, this is really a dream. So Lang this has arranged so many immortal formations. Wuxu Fixu's expression was cold and stiff, even ordinary cities are guarded by immortal formations. My clan only has five immortal formations. Cunning, too cunning. Although I can break through that fairy formation, I can only slaughter a city that is not important at all. Yin Sha Wuxian took a deep breath and said, once our whereabouts are exposed, so Lang possesses that unpredictable displacement method, which will definitely be able to bite us. No solution anymore. We can only find a city to destroy it, anyway, this does not prevent us from testing So Lang, at least it can't make him pay a serious enough price. A rare look of helplessness appeared on Wuxian Duanqing's face. He didn't know this emotion for tens of thousands of years. Fixu Wuxian said, Maybe we move faster and can escape before Solang arrives, so that we can destroy more cities. That makes sense. In that case, start with the city in front of you. Wuxi and Tengtian looked at the other three and asked. That's it. Nodded in love, we make a shot together, and immediately retreat after one blow, and head to the next city. It is good. Hiddenly kill Wuxian, Tengtian Wuxian. Fixu Wuxian nodded together. Then, do it. With an order from Duanqing Wuxian, everyone suddenly burst into a terrifying Wuxian power. The four of them shot together, and the force of the powerful rules fell on the earth, and the world changed in an instant, as if the end of the world had come. You finally did it. In a certain city, 
So Lang stared at him, and instantly used clone dispatch and clone replacement. In an instant, So Lang appeared in the city that was set as the target by the broken love and others. As soon as it appeared, the entire field of vision was occupied by the Wuxian level attack that destroyed the world. Already launched an attack. So Lang's heart was raised instantly. Next moment. Kang Kong phantoms united the immortal array shattered like an eggshell, and the power of infinite rules vented like a city. Space cracks continue to appear, and the entire city is like a fishing boat in a storm, which may be torn and swallowed at any time. One thought formation. So Lang's heart moved, and in an instant, layers of new azure phantoms combined with the immortal formations appeared, blocking the terrorist attack that teared the first formation. But the attack of the four great martial immortals of Tuan Tian Tower was too powerful. Especially Duanqing Wuxian, he is the Wuxian of three tribulations, with unparalleled power. However, the Kang Kong Phantom Alliance Immortal Array was only at the second calamity level, possessing a certain degree of defense at the three calamity immortal level, but it was impossible to stop it in front of Duanqing Wuxian. Therefore, the four combined forces not only completely tore the first layer of the Sky Phantom United Fairy Formation. It also smashed two sets of Solang's newly arranged Fairy Formation. In the end, the remaining power fell to the third set of Fairy Formations before being blocked. And all this only happened in a blink of an eye. If Solang hadn't appeared in time, the city would have been annihilated. At this time, the warriors in the city reacted and realized that there were strong men attacking the city, destroying the world and killing everyone. But this catastrophe was resolved by young Master Su in an instant. It turns out I was about to die under this mighty attack. It was young Master Su who saved us. Oh my god, if Master Su hadn't arrived in time, we would have died. Who are those miscellaneous people who can perform such terrifying moves? but young Master Su is much better than them. It seems that many layers of immortal formations were set up in an instant. Countless thoughts flashed through the minds of the warriors in the city. Simultaneously. Seeing Sol Lang suddenly appearing below and the large number of immortal formations that appeared out of thin air, Yin Sha and others were all dumbfounded, dumbfounded, and even Duanqing Wuxian was about to stare out. Oh my god! Is this dreaming or falling into an illusion? As soon as So Lang appeared, he set up so many fairy formations around him out of thin air. This is too exaggerated. This is so fake. The four of Wuxi and Duanqing had never felt this way full of doubts about this world and their own lives. In this world, how can such a formation be arranged? It doesn't make sense at all. The four of Wuxi and Duanqing tried to convince themselves with various speculations. For example, So Lang used the formation, and So Lang had arranged a multi-layer formation long ago, but they couldn't believe it from the bottom of their hearts. Those formations were really arranged out of thin air. Sir Duanqing. Yin Killing screamed tremblingly. The three of Wuxi and Duanqing recovered from the shock. So Lang's methods are too weird. We can't destroy this city. Hurry up and implement the plan you made before and move on to the next goal. Wuxi and Duanqing immediately shouted, and immediately concealed his figure without any hesitation. Go ahead, then So Lang can't break my hidden ability. Hidden kill, Figzu and Teng Tian also moved quickly, and disappeared in place in the next moment. The four of Duanqing are Wuxian, their speed is really too fast. From when their attack was blocked by So Lang, to when they left, there was not even a second. The warriors of the Yeokai tribe in the city were still immersed in the attack that destroyed the world and the mysterious and unpredictable methods of So Lang. So Lang also didn't expect this group of people to flee immediately without a single blow, and couldn't help being taken aback. But he also recovered within 10 milliseconds. Can't let them escape. So Lang took a deep breath his eyes full of chill. These guys, but ordered the Quasi Zion Wu Sage to slaughter countless innocent creatures. Furthermore, the four martial immortals themselves are extremely powerful, although they were blocked by So Lang just now, they are still too threatening. If they shot the next city. 
as long as their attack is faster and stronger, So Lang will not be able to arrive in time and can only watch the city be destroyed. After all, it takes time to dispatch a clone and swallow a clone. Although it is rare, it is very deadly in the battle of the martial arts level. It's too late to say, then fast. So Lang immediately moved. He didn't go forward to chase after him, because he couldn't find the traces of the four martial immortals in Lanshan Tower. Even if he did, he couldn't catch up at all. But So Lang has his own way. Duanqing Wuxian once again conducted a long series of analyses and laid out a plan for So Lang. He was also a little proud of this strategy, thinking that So Lang would definitely be fooled. Yin Sha, Fixu, and Tang Tian heard the analysis of Wuxian Duanqing and felt wonderful, and immediately nodded to express their temporary storage. Next, it's the turn of the selection. Who on earth should make that cicada first? At the same time, So Lang was floating in the city, frowning slightly. Because he really couldn't find the trace of Wuxian Wanqing and others. No way. Although the four martial immortals in the Lanshan Tower were already trapped by the formation. However, the Kang Kong Phantom Alliance Immortal Array is mainly used for defense, and its auxiliary functions such as detection ability are too weak. Which formation are they in? Should you wait for them to show up? Forget it, these guys don't know when they will come out yet. And after all, it is Wuxian, and it also comes from the Zun Emperor organization. Ye Chengmeng has many dreams. So Lang frowned, dispelling the thought of waiting for the four people in the Tuan Tian Tower to show up. Since I am not waiting for them to come out, then I will take the initiative to find it. So Lang thought, and soon had a plan. And this plan is very interesting, like a classic computer game minesweeper. A radius of 100 million li is the minefield, and the Kang Kong Phantom Alliance Immortal Array is a grid, and the four hidden killing building Wuxians hidden in countless grids are thunder. The Kang Kong Idolan United Immortal Array has a function called self-destruct. As long as this function is activated, the formation can be automatically destroyed, exerting a powerful attack power. This is equivalent to opening the grid. And the four martial immortals of Yin Shalu absolutely cannot continue to hide in the power of self-destructive formation. In this way, four people must be found. Maybe not only can we find four people, we can also blow them up. Haha. <laughs> Playing the four martial arts as a game is really exciting. I don't know how long your four thunders can hide. I hope my luck will not be so bad. I hit thunders all at once. The corner of So Lang's mouth twitched, revealing a smile that Zhizu was holding. Next moment. Self-destruct. When So Lang thought, the formations where the hidden killers were before they disappeared were directly destroyed. The reason for choosing this place is naturally because this place has the greatest chance of thunder. Boom. There was a huge sound, and the three adjacent sky phantoms united the immortal array and exploded directly. The power of terror spread, and its power has completely surpassed the level of the second tribulation martial immortal, reaching the level of the third tribulation martial immortal. Falling on the other immortal formations, the nearest immortal formation could not bear it immediately, and it was broken one after another. To put it a bit taller, it's like the Dano effect. One fairy formation exploded one after another, and dozens of combined fairy formations exploded in an instant. In addition to preventing the explosion of the fairy formations that guard the city and protect many creatures, So Lang did not prevent the remaining fairy formations from destroying themselves. In this way, the array of self-destruction continued to spread to the surroundings, forming a terrifying arc of explosion. Above this explosive arc, there are fairy formations exploding at all times. The array that So Lang arranged was being destroyed at an extremely fast speed. But he is not satisfied with the status quo. Why Minesweeper, how can you just click? It takes a few more clicks to find the four mines faster. So Lang smiled, his heart moved, and all directions in the sky, the south, the north, and the west, and the underground, instantly turned on the fairy array self-destruction mode. One array after another exploded, 
and its power shook so much that the world was shaking. And on this occasion, in a certain blue sky phantom united immortal formation, the four martial immortals of the slant Tianlo have just selected the first person to do it. Then, it's up to Teng Tian to show up first and act as a cicada. Don't worry, we will kill him before So Lang kills you. Duan Qing Wuxian said faintly, and soon he was about to hide his body. But at this moment, his expression suddenly changed and he felt a strong vibration. Yin Sha, Fixu, and Tang Tian also changed their faces. The world is shaking. I even felt strong spatial fluctuations, as if the space was about to be torn apart. What happened? Could it be that Sol Lang's little is doing a ghost? The four looked at each other and couldn't help gritting their teeth and taking a breath. You must know that they are now trapped in the fairy formation, and at the same time they are also protected in the fairy formation. Moreover, there is more than one fairy formation. They are surrounded by a large number of fairy formations. Even so, they all felt a strong shock. So, what happened outside these fairy formations? Sir Duan Qing. Wuxian Teng Tian looked at Wuxian Duan Qing, does our plan continue? Carry on. Of course, Wuxian Duan Qing is not reconciled to his own tricks. And this is the only way for Yin Sulang, no matter what happens outside, it must continue to be executed. It is good. Wuxian Teng Tian nodded, then please hide, I will do it. Hurry up. Duan Qing Wuxian let out a low voice, first hiding his body. Fixu and Hidden Kill also immediately became invisible. The vibration between heaven and earth became more and more obvious. Wuxian Teng Tian took a deep breath, condensing a group of violent rules in his hand, and he was about to launch an attack in the next moment. But at this moment, suddenly his pupils shrank, and in his pinched pupils, a scene of destruction was reflected. I saw where the heaven and the earth met, the immortal formations continued to explode. The power of rules is raging, the space is torn, the aura is disordered, and even the light is distorting. At this time, Sol Lang destroyed all the fairy formations by himself. Immortal Tang Tian Wu was stunned, like a goose pinched around his neck, with his mouth wide open but unable to make a sound. Duan Qing, Fixu and Yin Sha Wuxian who had hidden their bodies were also dumbfounded, and even their eyes fell out. Those formations, are exploding. The immortal array arranged by Sol Lang has a self-destruct function. Sol Lang. Sol Lang actually caused countless immortal formations to destroy themselves. This is an immortal formation that has spent countless resources to deploy. He is willing to destroy it all. My god, this guy is a lunatic. The four great martial immortals of Lanshan Tower were dumbfounded by Sol Lang's operation. How much material is needed to set up a fairy formation? Countless. Among them, the most valuable fairy level materials are hard to come by. An ordinary immortal clan also has an immortal formation guarding the lair. But Sol Lang can not only arrange so many immortal formations, but he is also willing to destroy himself. This is crazy. But they didn't know that Sol Lang possessed the magical skill of one-click decomposition. Even if the fairy formation destroys itself, Sol Lang can recover a lot of materials from it. Of course, some materials disappeared in ashes, and Sol Lang was unable to recycle them, so there were still losses. But Sol Lang was not too distressed. As long as four Wuxians are killed, any loss can be paid back. Not only can you make money back, but you can also earn a wave of blood. Closer to home. Just as the four great martial immortals of the Lanshan Tower were so shocked that they lost their voices, the self-destructive formation in the distance was getting closer. In the field of vision of the four, the exploding fairy array formed an arc, enveloping themselves in all directions. The power of the explosion is like a wall of fire. After the next blink, the overwhelming power of destruction has come before everyone. Cancel the plan, resist with all my strength. Duan Qing Wuxian revealed his figure and took out a fairy artifact from the inner boundary of Wuxian. Yin Sha and Fixu Wuxian also appeared immediately, 
and the exercises in the body were instantly overloaded. Tenkyun Yuxian was the first one to prepare for defense. He even used a secret technique to greatly increase his combat power. The next moment. The formations where the four great martial immortals were in burst open, and the power of endless rules poured down, and the space where they passed was torn apart, like a doomsday scene. At this moment. I don't know how many immortal formations blew themselves. Although the power of these immortal formations blew out a lot, some of them still gathered, like a snowball, becoming more and more terrifying. After the formation of Duanqing and others was broken, they felt that the attack they had to face was more terrifying than they had imagined. In a rush, the four great martial gods showed horror and took out all their whole cards. What? Jusian Disintegration Dafa The Secret Technique of Slowing the Body Weight Chengkian Immortal Body, Kai The Seven Secrets of Love Joy, Worry, Thought, Sorrow, Fear, Anger, Shock. Face Yen Ji Yu and Ji, kill me. The four great martial immortals in the Lanshan Tower roared frantically. I saw the light flashing on the four of them, the power of rules surged, and the whole cards were revealed one after another. Teng Yen was bloody, and his skin was like a melting candle, turning into cellular pus and splashing around. The heart of Fixu Yuxian sent a red light, which contained a huge life force which seemed infinite and inexhaustible. Hidden Killing Wuxian uses secret techniques to instantly transform his body into jade, full of immortality, just like flying immortals outside the sky. Suddenly countless emotions erupted on the paralyzed and moodless face of Wuxian Duanqing Wuxian, as if the emotions accumulated over millions of years were released in an instant. The four great martial immortals in Luncheon Tower unexpectedly displayed a power far exceeding their original level in an instant. The next millisecond. The power of countless arrays to self-destruct is like the doomsday tsunami that drowned all four of them. But the four great martial immortals such as Duanqing are like giant peaks in a mudslide, and they are not moving. However, the power of the arrays self-detonation almost reached the level of the four tribulations Wuxian and it continued uninterrupted. Although the four Wuxian blocked them, they couldn't breathe a breath. Oh, Lei has swept out. So you are here, and the four of you are together. So Lang sensed the position of the four martial immortals in the Lanshan Tower, and couldn't help but tick the corner of his mouth, preventing the remaining formation from destroying itself. Then, with a thought, he came to the vicinity of the four. At the same time, what? Duanqing roared in anger, you can't go on like this, try another heart and rush out. Fight. Tengkian Wuxian and the three others once again squeezed their own power, worked together, and exerted the power of the four tribulations Wuxian, and finally broke through the horror power of the formation to explode. An invisible ruin appeared in front of him. Not only the earth, but the sky has become ruins. Numerous spatial cracks are densely populated, a large amount of grey and white space is overflowing, and the light is twisted into an unnatural shape, passing through the gaps of the inverted mountains and rivers. Rao was the battlefield where the four great martial arts had seen the battle of the mainland, and couldn't help feeling palpitations. However, even with the horror in their hearts, the footsteps of the four lovers never stopped. They don't want to be shrouded in Solang's formation. However, at this moment, more than a dozen immortal formations appeared in front of them again. This. These formations again. We are trapped again, So Lang, he has already determined our position. The four martial immortals of the Liantian Lu immediately burst into Canthus, and their facial muscles twitched. Among them, Teng Tian Wuxian was so angry that his body was soaked in blood because of Zhu Xian's disintegration of Dafa. Sir Duanqing. Yin Sha and Figzu looked at Wuxi and Duanqing. While our secret technique time is still there, fight it. We can work together to exert the power of the Four Tribulations Martial Immortal, and So Lang may not dare to stop it. Duanqing Wuxi and gritted his teeth, you hold on again, we rush out. Until now. The four of them had only the heart to escape. There's no way, after using the secret technique 
the side effects soon came up, and his own combat power plummeted, and he would definitely become So Lang's flesh and blood, and he could be killed by others. Don't talk nonsense, I can't hold it anymore. Wuxian Tengtian roared, and the internal organs and bones were even visible on the torso. Flush! Duanqing yelled in a low voice, and horrible mood swings erupted all over his body, which was obviously pushing the seven secrets of Duanqing to the limit. Fixu Wuxian and Yin Sha Wuxian also immediately overdrawn their vitality, exploding with the might of the second tribulation Wuxian, and blasted towards the formation. Boom boom boom! Continuous explosions sounded, and the formation that besieged Duanqing 4 was ruddy and shattered. Another round of horrible self-destructive prestige came, and the four people of broken love can only clenched their teeth with secret techniques. Fortunately, only a dozen formations exploded this time, and the explosive power came and went quickly. The four of them blocked this wave of attacks, and seeing that there was no more formation to stop them, they suddenly felt happy after the disaster. Go! So Lang's choppy should not be able to arrange a formation, take this opportunity and go. In the future, I will definitely come back to slaughter all the creatures of the Yaokai tribe. Countless thoughts of hatred flashed through the four people's minds. And all of this actually happened within one millisecond, and the figures of the four Wuxians did not stand still at all. That is when the thoughts of the four people were circulating. Suddenly, the four martial immortals tightened and their hairs stood up, feeling a terrible death crisis coming. Fire! A loud roar came from above his head. The four martial immortals, Duan Qing, Hidden Kill, Teng Tian, and Figzu, instinctively looked over their heads, and saw a golden glow carrying the horrible rules and torrents that were suppressed severely. It's an attack of the Three Tribulations Martial Immortal level. Wan Qing Wuxian analyzed the power of the Golden Glow for the first time, and his pupils couldn't help but shrink. The three of Wuxian Tengtian and others were also cold. They had just used the secret technique to burst once, and at this time their combat strength had already fallen back, and they were about to fall into a weak state. The Three Tribulations Martial Immortal's attack above his head can certainly be stopped but it also means that the four of his own were retained by So Lang. Once retained, the next is a stormy attack. As the thoughts of the four martial immortals were circulating, So Lang's attack had already fallen from the sky. Duanqing and others can't think about it anymore, they can only gather in one place and defend together. They can only work together, otherwise, except for Duanqing Wuxian, Yin Sha Fixu and Teng Tian will not be able to stop them. Boom! A violent explosion sounded. Duanqing and other four martial immortals sank suddenly, their expressions extremely ugly. The huge energy tide turned into a circular air wave, swept out, and instantly aggravated the damage to the surrounding battlefield. A large number of space cracks were torn again, and space holes were formed, just like the entrance to the abyss, and like the devil's throat. Originally, the four great martial arts all mastered the means of tearing apart space to shuttle. But in this case, the turbulent flow in the space cracks, if the space rules are not mastered, even if Wuxian breaks in, 99% of them will be crushed, and there will be no place to be buried. And how can space rules be so easy to master? Not to mention. Another golden light fell from the sky. And this golden light is obviously dozens of times stronger than the first. This time it was an attack of the four tribulations martial immortal level. Obviously the first three tribulations martial immortal attack was So Lang's temptation. As soon as he discovered that Wan Qing and the others were stronger than three tribulations, he immediately used the fourth tribulations martial immortal to attack. In this situation, there is no way for the Duan Qing four to break into the void of space. Block. Duanqing Wuxian roared, and his emotional strength soared. Juice Yen disintegration dafa, shattering secret technique. Teng Yen Wuxian uttered a hysterical roar and used the advanced secret technique of Chuexian disintegration. This is his desperate trump card, once it is used, even if he survives, he may eventually fall into the realm of Wuxian. 
Hidden Killing Wuxian and Figzu Wuxian are also doing their best, wishing to drain every trace of spiritual power in the body. After another outbreak, no one of the four great martial arts performed except the strongest attack of their lives. Hidden Killing Wuxian burst out with grey rules, turning into countless small daggers, flying out like a swarm of locusts. Wuxian Tengtian almost melted, and he pulled out his spine directly, and there were secret lines in the bones. The whole body of Figzu Wuxian burst into red light, as if it turned into a sunset, and when the air of the remnant was lingering, it carried terrifying power. Duanqing Wuxian displayed the seven secrets of Duanqing, attached to the fairy halberd in his hand, and constantly waved it, displaying a series of terrifying rules of blade light. The four torrents soared into the sky, each of which was higher than the realm of its owner. Next moment. The four tribulations Wuxian attack launched by the Jianxian Great Artillery and the attack performed by the four people including Xuanjing blasted together. Boom! First, a dazzling light shone through the sky and the earth, and then a loud noise that shook the world came. The space was shattered, the power of chaotic rules exploded everywhere, and the mountains and rivers hanging upside down had completely melted. The heaven and the earth are colorful, and countless rules are entangled violently, even if the immortal is touched, he will die. At the top of the battlefield sky, the clouds are scattered. It can be seen that Sol Langduan was sitting on the platform of the Jiaxian Cannon, with a large number of top-grade spiritual jade, even low-grade immortal jade suspended by him. There are countless empty shells of spirit jade fairy jade that have been exhausted, turning into dust, flying into the air. In the two attacks just now, the first time consumed a full ten million of the best spirit jade, and the second time was even more terrifying, consuming three hundred million of the best spirit jade. This Nima is too prodigal. Solang felt that he had some toothache, and couldn't help taking a breath. However, the system prompt did not sound, which meant that none of the four Wuxian Duanqing had died. So, the cannon can't stop. Fire me! Solang shouted and issued an order, use the power of the Three Tribulations Martial Immortal. The reason for using the power of the Three Tribulations Martial Immortal was because Solang felt that the aura of the hidden killing of the Four was rapidly weakening. Obviously, even if the Four Tribulations Martial Immortal attack did not directly destroy them, it caused terrible damage to them. At this level, using the power of the Four Tribulations Martial Immortal would be a bit wasteful. After all, 300 million at a time, 300 million. How many 300 million can a man have? What's more, So Lang did this not just to save Ling Yu, but to arrange a trap by the way. Following So Lang's order. Above him, a huge dragon shook his head, shook his head, and opened his teeth and claws. A loud roar that shattered the mountains and rivers continued to roar from the mouth of the dragon's blood basin. Fire! 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 Every roar represents an attack by the Jianxian cannon. The dragon mouth of the Jiaxian cannon is almost like an automatic machine gun. It roars and fires, and ejects golden cannonballs. These golds ran one after another, almost in a string. Lie noisy, you don't want to shout every time you attack. Has this feature become your mantra? Solang looked up at the Jiaxian cannon, his face was covered in black lines and even the corners of his mouth were twitching. But Jianxian artillery was like a little deaf and blind, turning a deaf ear to Sol Lang's complaints. Amount. Maybe it's also because it's not very intelligent, so it's silly. Helpless. You grow up quickly. Sol Lang sighed, lowered his head and looked down at the broken ground below. I saw Duanqing Wuxian and others gathered together propped up a layer of mask with their whole body strength, and constantly resisted the attack of Jianxian cannon. But their masks were twisting again and again, as if they were about to be torn in the next moment. Tisk tut! With such a thin film, you still want to block my treacherous cannon. Solang shook his head disdainfully, and then sprinkled ten million superb spirit jade again. Fire! The Jixian cannon let out another loud roar, 
and sprayed a powerful attack of 10 million superb spirit jade. So far, the Jixian cannon has fired more than a dozen cannons, consuming more than 100 million top-grade spirit jade. And Duanqing Wuxian and the others could hardly hold it anymore. Damn it! Why is this kid's fairy weapon constantly attacking? His cultivation level is so low, even with an immortal weapon, it is impossible to beat us like this. We are Wuxian, Wuxian. The warrior at the top of the pyramid on the continent. Ah, I can't hold it anymore. The hearts of the four were incredible and terrified. Hurry up and display the inner bounds of Wuxian. Wuxian Duanqing suddenly roared, a rare trace of despair appeared in his voice. Use the Wuxian inner realm. Fixu Wuxian, Tengtian Wuxian, and Yin Sha Wuxian's complexion changed greatly. Wuxian's inner boundary is very strong, but it is also Wuxian's most deadly weakness. Once it is displayed, it means to completely abandon it and start a real desperate mode. And in this kind of battle, there is almost always death. Even if he wins, his own cultivation base will explode and I don't know how much, and even instantly fall into the martial wonderland, and there is no possibility of getting up again. But the four knew that there was no way. Teng Tian Tian Teng Tian Wuxian was the first to display the inner boundary of Wuxian. The side effects of his secret technique are the most terrifying. If he hesitates, he will not even have the opportunity to use the inner world of Wuxian. I saw a side of Wuxian's inner boundary emerge from Teng Tian Wuxian's expression. A large amount of suspended land can be seen inside, but there is no sign of life, and it is completely dead. Duanqing Wuxian, Yin Sha Wuxian, and Fixu Wuxian also immediately opened up the inner boundary of Wuxian. The four Wuxians all used the final hole cards. The Sifang Wuxian inner boundary stands tall in the world, even squeezing out the surrounding space holes, forming a relatively stable world. As soon as the quartet Wuxian's inner boundary came out, they immediately struck each other with the cannonballs fired by the Jianxian artillery. At this moment, Solang is very happy. There is no way, this time a total of 200 Great Sage level and Kui Saixian level warriors have been killed, as well as a total of 4 immortal level warriors. It also includes an extremely powerful martial immortal of the Three Tribulations. Just a Great Sage level Kui Saixian level warrior, there are millions of superb spirit jade. And Wuxian's net worth is more than a thousand times that of Zhengxian. Among the martial arts, Every high calamity represents countless years of living longer, and the difference in wealth is ten times a hundred times. Ha 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 ha. Although the use of the Jianxian cannon consumed a whole 700 million yuan of the best spirit jade, it was all earned back. Come on, let me see, how good spirit jade I have earned this time. Solang's face was filled with excitement that could not be concealed, the system, quickly deposit all the spiritual jade and celestial jade obtained into the balance. Ding! All spirit jade and fairy jade have been deposited in the system. Wow! In the mysterious black space, a long string of numbers appeared behind the unit of extreme spirit jade. Solang counted and found that there were 12 digits in total. In other words, the number of the best spirit jade has reached hundreds of billions. Specifically, it is 108.99 billion of the best spirit jade. Ding! Given that the current balance is too large, the currency unit has been changed to the lower grade fairy jade. Appears again as the system prompts. The unit of the balance is changed to the lower grade Xianyu, and the number after it has also become a tens digit. In other words, I currently own nearly 1.1 billion low grade immortal jade. Tisk tusk. I can be considered rich, and I don't know how far the system functions can be upgraded. Solang licked his lips with excitement, and immediately focused on the system function. There are a total of 10 functions that have been activated. Among them, one key alchemy, one key refining, one refining array and one decomposition function can no longer be upgraded. At present, there are only level 24 one key training function, Level 24 One Key Martial Arts Function, Level 23 Clone Dispatch Function, 
and level 23 one key treasure hunting function. And, the 10th abnormal function recently activated, the 2 level 1 key empowerment function. All of these 5 functions need to consume 1 billion superb spirit jade to continue upgrading. All upgrades are 5 billion superb spirit jade. This was a huge sum of money that was completely unattainable to Solang, who had only had 700 million top quality jade before. But now, this money is just a fraction to Solang. After all, 5 billion top grade spiritual jade is just 50 million low grade fairy jade. Solang has more than 1 billion. This time I upgrade, I am afraid that the first 4 functions can be upgraded to level 25. I don't know what kind of bonus new functions can be obtained. Solang licked his lips with excitement, first, let's practice with one key, the system, press the one key show to level 25. Ding! Consumes 10 million lower grade immortal jade, the one key training function is increased to level 25, and the training speed is increased to 44,695,552 times the basic speed. Ding! Congratulations on upgrading the one key training function to level 25. You have obtained the new bonus function Absolute Gift. Unparalleled quality, the basic training speed will be increased by 100 times the current one. Messages appeared in Solang's mind, and Solang who looked directly at him was dumbfounded. My fork, unparalleled qualification. Isn't this the capital of Emperor Chu Xiaobei's possession? It directly increased my basic cultivation speed by a hundred times, so abnormal. I'm arrogant, the more the system functions to the rear, the more perverted and unreasonable. One hundred times, one hundred times, that is to say, my current cultivation speed is equivalent to 446-955-5200 times the basic cultivation speed of the infinite grade genius. This Nima more than 4.4 billion times. Solang stared at his eyes and turned his attention to the cultivation villain in the mysterious space. At this time, the cultivator is golden all over, because he has reached a breakthrough. And now, the cultivator has accumulated three full days of cultivation. Almost every hour, he can accumulate the cultivation base of a junior Valkyrie to break through to an intermediate Valkyrie. At this moment, the speed of this accumulation has become faster, and 36 seconds can accumulate one by one from the primary Valkyrie to the intermediate Valkyrie. Properties Panel Solang Human Turbidity Elementary Valkyrie Five Star Wushan Samsung Wushan Four Star Wushan Samsung Wushan Realm of Bright Moon The Infinite Heart Sutra 10,000 laws into one, unnamed. One key practice function, one key martial arts function, clone dispatch function, one key treasure hunt function, one key alchemy function, one key refining function, one key refining array function, one key synthesis function, one key empowerment function, one key decomposition function. The four dimensional attributes have been comprehensively improved, and the attack state has reached the five star level. Although this integrated unnamed exercise is still a holy level exercise, it is far more powerful than ordinary holy level exercises. Even if this technique has not reached the immortal level, it is estimated that it is only one step away. Solang looked at the panel of his subordinates with a slight smile on his face, still very satisfied. In the martial saint stage, every star is a huge gap, almost comparable to the great realm before the martial god. At this time, the four-dimensional attributes have been fully improved, which is already a very good harvest. Moreover, this exercise is also a continuous fusion of new exercises, and one day it will become the most powerful exercise in the world. I don't have a name for now. Let's avoid the name not worthy of the level of the practice, hee <laughs> hee. While smiling, Solang asked, System. How long will it take to finish the exercises I am currently practicing? Ding! Master, the five exercises you have practiced can reach the founding level in just one day. One day. You can master the holy level exercises in one day, and practice to the level of the founder, 
and it's still five at once. Oh no, it's six books now, gggg. The corner of Solang's mouth raised slightly, and he couldn't help showing an excited smile. There is still a vacancy for the exercises. Well, do you want to practice a fairy level technique? Forget it, I don't know how long it will take for the immortal level exercises to be completed. It's the holy level exercises. While thinking about it, Solang began to choose exercises again. Originally, Solang had enough holy level skills, and now he has killed 200 slaughter towers Zungxian and Wushan, and a total of 4 Wuxian. Although many of these martial sages have practiced the same technique. But Solang still obtained 1,600 new god level exercises and 232 new holy level exercises. There are a total of 8 fairy level exercises, which are divided into 4 exercises and 4 secret techniques, including the various secret techniques that were finally performed by the 4 people such as Du and Qing. These 8 exercises and secret techniques are all natural exercises and can be used for synthesis. They are the great method of disintegrating the immortal, Cheng Tian immortal body, the secret technique of red heart shedding weight and regeneration, the seven secrets of broken love, the jackdaw breaks and killing the immortal Jew, the treasure scroll of immortality, Cheng Tian Xian record, shining Ying Ding Tian Xian Jew. Among them, So Lang is not very interested in the seven secrets of love. From Wan Qing Wuxian, it can be seen that practicing this secret technique is as emotional as a facial paralysis. This is detrimental to the image and is a huge shortcoming. In addition, the rest of the immortal level exercises and secret techniques So Lang are very interested. Tisk Tut. I have too many exercises. So Lang licked his lips, chose a holy level exercise called Tian Tao Lingshu and put it in the sixth practice villain, and began to practice. This exercise focuses on improving vitality and spiritual power reserves, which Solang chose to make up for his shortcomings. Immediately after, Solang's gaze fell on those newly acquired techniques again. Synthesize again and again. Solang thought, the system combines the god level exercises with the holy level exercises. Ding! After the synthesis is completed, you will get the immortal level technique Kang Lang Xiao Ao Xian Dian. Ding. The synthesis is complete, you get. Ding. After the synthesis is completed, you will obtain the holy level technique Brahma Han Mi I Hegemony. Ding. The synthesis is complete, you get. Soon, the newly obtained exercises were combined to a level of 10 to 1. In the end, 160 synthetic saint level exercises and 23 synthetic immortal level exercises were obtained. By the way, the number of non-synthetic fairy level exercises is enough. So Lang's eyes lit up, now I can completely synthesize an emperor level exercise technique. Immortal level exercises are already extremely rare on the Kanglin continent. Regardless of the many immortal level exercises on So Lang, there are only 55 kinds of immortal level exercises. But in the outside world, any immortal level exercise can become the town clan exercise of a large immortal clan. A Wuxian who has lived for millions of years has only one or two copies. This shows how rare the immortal level exercises are, and the emperor level exercises are even more rare. In the Kanglin continent today, the total number of emperor level exercises in the entire continent is only a dozen. These emperor level exercises are basically in the hands of Emperor Wu, and they are the foundation of their lives. It can be said that each emperor level exercise technique represents an emperor level powerhouse overlooking the entire continent. Once an emperor level exercise is born, the entire continent will be a storm. The fierce battle is definitely more terrifying than the chance of becoming an emperor in the Forbidden Land of the Emperor. After all, the Emperor's Forbidden Land, the Mingmian God Race cannot participate, but the birth of an Emperor level exercise technique is enough to make Emperor Wu come and beat his blood. At this moment, So Lang was about to synthesize an Emperor level technique. From a total of more than 60 immortal level exercises, natural exercises were selected. 
The first is the eight immortal level exercises of the four people including Duanqing Wuxian. Then there are the nine turns of the immortal sun true art from Li Xian Yang, the elusive sea breaking wave immortal art from Qian Zihao, and the sacred book of reincarnation immortal pupil from Cai Liao. Finally, there is a book called Praying for Immortals, but it is not a practice, but a classic. The seven secrets of broken love are eliminated directly. So, just use the remaining ten immortal level techniques to synthesize it. So Lang thought silently, and even gave a synthesis order. Ding! After the synthesis is completed, you will get the Emperor level exercise Emperor Heart Samsara. Inside the storage space, a dark disc suddenly appeared. This disc is very small, with only the palm of the hand, covered with golden lines like annual rings. At first glance, only a dozen golden patterns can be seen, but a closer look reveals that the golden patterns are so densely packed that even if they are mentally observant, they are completely unclear. As for this reincarnation of the Emperor's heart, So Lang could only feel extremely obscure, and he was dizzy at first glance. Fuck, it's an emperor level technique, I'm also an intermediate martial artist anyway, so I can't even look at it. So Lang was speechless, and his heart was extremely excited, because this awesome emperor level exercise technique belongs to him. Moreover, when the one click martial arts function is upgraded in the future, you can practice it in minutes. Big baby. If Emperor Wu saw it, I'm afraid he would take it away at all costs. So Lang's eyes gleamed slightly, then tut tut, hide it. The successful method actually took a few minutes. So Lang once again focused on system functions. After upgrading a training function and a one key martial arts function, his fairy jade cost less than a fraction. Now, after the balance, it is shown that there are more than 1 billion 63 million left in the lower grade jade. There are so many low grade immortal jade. So Lang licked his lips excitedly, the system, upgrade me to level 25 with the clone dispatch function. Ding! Consumes 10 million lower grade jade, the clone dispatch function is upgraded to level 24, the number of clones is plus 1, and the current number of clones is 24. Ding! Consume 100 million lower grade jade, the clone dispatch function is upgraded to level 25, the number of clones is plus 1 and the current number of clones is 25. Ding! Congratulations on upgrading the clone dispatch function to level 25, and you have obtained the new bonus function cool down. Cool down drops, after the clone's death, the cooling time is shortened from 24 hours to 1 hour. Is the new feature a cooling drop? Reducing the cooling time by 24 times is also a great ability. The cooldown of the clone is only 1 hour, which means that the cooldown of my swallowing clone is shortened to one hour. Haha, <laughs> in this way, I will be able to repeatedly use the swallowing clone in a short time and maintain the strongest combat power state. So Lang is very satisfied with the new bonus feature of cooldown. Next. It's the one-click treasure hunt. I wonder what kind of surprise this feature will bring me. Could it be? Forget it, don't guess the system has upgraded the one-click treasure hunting function to level 25. Ding! Consumption of 10 million lower grade jade, the one-click treasure hunting function has been upgraded to level 24, and the number of treasure hunting flying flying gliders has increased to 44,695,552. Ding! Consumption of 100 million lower grade jade, the one-click treasure hunting function has been upgraded to level 25, and the number of treasure hunting flying flying gliders has increased to 89,391,104. Ding! Congratulations on upgrading the one-click treasure hunting function to level 25. You have obtained new bonus functions, the Golden Body of the Immortal and Indiana Jones. The Golden Body of the Immortal, the treasure hunting flying flying drifters damage immunity level is raised to the Wuxian level, and it is immune to the Wuxian level and below. Indiana Jones, the treasure hunt flying glider's ability to search for and collect treasures has been greatly increased, and can ignore the barriers of formations. 
the injury free level has been raised to the fairy level. Does this mean that my treasure hunt flying flying glider can do whatever he wants on the territory of the fairy clan? Solang grinned at the corner of his mouth, revealing a wicked smile, furthermore, the fairy clan's treasure hunt flying flying gliders can still ignore the barriers of the formation, once they are sent out, I am afraid that even the immortal clan's nest will be emptied. The one-click treasure hunt function is getting more and more perverted. There are too many to say, you can't kill you, you can only watch your treasures. Just ask if you are angry, ha 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 ha. Of course, So Lang knew that the treasure hunt flying gliders had shortcomings. That is the Valkyrie, Martial Saint Realm, Wuxian Inner Realm, Emperor Woody's Life Universe, and other similar alien spaces. Treasure hunting flying flying gliders cannot enter. Once the opponent hides the treasure in the body space, the treasure hunting flying 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 will be impossible. Hey, since the of war, no storage ring is needed. So Lang sighed, my treasure hunting flying flying glider can only go out to jungle, and can only weak creatures when he goes to other people's turf, and disgusts others by the way. I don't know when I can break this restriction. With a trace of regret. Solang continued to upgrade system functions, and now there are still a lot of fairy jade left. System, upgrade the one key empowerment function to level 4 for me. Ding. Consumption of 10 million lower grade jade, the one key empowerment function has been upgraded to level 3, the current empowerment efficiency has been increased to 30%, and the number of initiations per day has been increased to 3. Ding. Consumption of 100 million lower grade jade, the one key empowerment function has been upgraded to 4, the current empowerment efficiency has been increased to 40%, and the number of initiations per day has been increased to 4. After the system prompt ended, So Lang nodded slightly. The increase in empowerment efficiency to 40% is already close to half, which is pretty good. The balance is more than 620 million, and it can't be upgraded. So Lang looked at the balance, the corner of his mouth twitched again. The system function is upgraded to advanced level, the ability is getting more and more abnormal, but the funds consumed are getting more and more scary. For the next upgrade, every system function needs a full 1 billion inferior jade. This number, even an ordinary fairy clan can't bear it. It can be said that every system function is a super gold swallowing beast, and it is still the kind that is missing. Next time you raise enough money, you will upgrade the one key empowerment function first. I don't know if this function reaches level 5, what terrifying ability can it have? While thinking about it, So Lang took out 300 pieces of sacred artifacts, as well as the face Yen Ming Yu and Halberd that he had seized from the hand of Wuxian Junking. These weapons are all obtained by killing the martial artist of Slaughter Heaven Tower. Take it out at this time. Naturally it is the old rule all decomposition. Including that fairy artifact, it must be broken down. System, decompose these sacred artifacts. So Lang ordered. Ding. Decompose the high level sacred tool, Qing Shen Qianjijian 1, and you will get the soul of Wushan 8, fairy level materials, holy level materials, divine level materials, the soul of Valkyries asterisk 23. Ding. Decompose the intermediate sacred tool Xian Feng Tianwen Knife 1, and you will get the soul of Martial Saint 5, immortal level materials, holy level materials. Ding. Decompose the elementary sacred tool, Cloud Piercing and Wind Sword 1, and you will get the soul of Martial Saint 3, holy material. A series of system prompts sounded, and the 300 sacred artifacts were all broken down into raw materials. And Solang also obtained more than 1,600 copies of the Soul of the Martial God, and more than 7,300 copies of the Soul of the Martial God, plus hundreds of previous immortal level materials and countless saint level materials and materials. These sacred artifacts, even if they are treasures that have been circulated for thousands of years. I don't know how many warriors have spent much effort and financial resources to create it. If anyone knew that Solang had destroyed more than 300 sacred artifacts in an instant, 
he would probably curse and violently curse the heavenly objects on the spot. However, for So Lang, the decomposing of these sacred artifacts was to give them a new life. Soon, their raw materials will be refined by So Lang into a part of superhumanoid weapons. The dismantling of the sacred objects is complete, it's your turn. So Lang looked down, and the dragon head of the Jixian cannon opened its big mouth and firmly bit a weapon similar to Fang Tian's painted halberd, making it immobile. But this is the immortal weapon face Yen Ji Yuan Ji. Except for special circumstances, all fairy artifacts basically have artifact spirits. Face Yen Ji Yuan Ji is no exception. Moreover, it has existed for a long time, and its spirit is relatively mature. At this time, its spirit was very angry, and was struggling constantly, trying to escape. But it is only a one-tribulation immortal weapon, and the Jixian cannon is a four-tribulation immortal weapon. It's strange that it can run away. Loyalty is okay. It's a pity you followed the wrong master, then, bye. So Lang ticked the corner of his mouth and gave the order to disassemble the face Yen Ji Yuan Ji. Ding! Decompose the elementary fairy weapon face Yen Ji Yuan Ji 1, you will get the soul of Wuxian 2, the soul of Wushan asterisk 86, fairy level materials, holy level materials, Shenzhen grade material. The materials consumed in refining this immortal artifact were too much. The system prompt sounded for a long, long time, at least tens of thousands of materials were mentioned. And the quantity of each of these tens of thousands of materials is huge. So Lang felt his heart beat faster when he looked at it. The material of this fairy artifact alone is enough for me to refine dozens of fairy artifacts. I don't know who made the immortal weapon. It's a stupid man with a lot of money. Hey, you can't say that to them. After all, they can't imagine that there is such an unreasonable refiner like me in the world. With a smug smile on So Lang's face, he was in a great mood. Next. So Lang left the battlefield directly. It was not that he had never thought of tidying up the battlefield, he was really helpless. Because the battlefield is too tragic, there are space holes, cracks, and rules turbulence everywhere. As soon as So Lang entered, he was afraid that it would trigger the death substitution. The only way is to let nature heal by itself. Fortunately, the world's healing ability on the Kanglin continent is very powerful. No, after so many wars on the continent, it's all fine. Leave the battlefield. So Lang did not return to the holy city of Yeokai. Because within a hundred million li, there are still a large number of Kang Kong Phantom Alliance Immortal Array that have not been removed. These immortal formations are refined with a lot of materials, so you can't just keep them. After spending a little time, So Lang disassembled most of the immortal formations, and left the immortal formations that guarded the great city. In this way, the Yeokai tribe has a full 13 cities with immortal formations guarding it. For ordinary immortal tribes, this is completely generous. After decomposing and recovering the fairy formation, so Lang sent a message to Chu Ziobei, and then returned to the fairy palace in the Sea of Sky. Because the previous ravages of the Killing Sky Tower killers destroyed a lot of places and killed a lot of creatures, Yeokai Yanfa and other servants were taking people out to deal with things at this time. After the war, there were a lot of complicated things, which reflected the role of Yeokai Yanfa and the others. In the fairy palace, the first thing So Lang saw was Ji Rukju and Murong Xian Xian. Because Chu Ziobei took the pill given by So Lang to Blue Star to practice, it will take a while to come back. Two beauties, look pretty. So Lang looked at the two sisters, one big and one small in front of him, with the corners of his mouth slightly raised, showing a gentle smile. At this time, both of them are Wuzun, and their cultivation base has been consolidated a lot. Brother So Lang, are you okay? I heard Li Xian Yang say that a lot of quasi immortals and martial sages from Slaughter Sky Tower came outside. While Ji Rukju said eagerly, she circled So Lang several times, looking for a wound on So Lang's body. However, So Lang didn't lose a single hair, 
of course she couldn't find any wounds. But she was still worried and went to untie So Lang's clothes to see if there were any wounds. Don't look for it. Mirong Xianxian smiled dumbly, Brother So Lang is definitely not injured. Isn't it just some quasi immortals, I killed them all. Not only that, I also killed four real Wuxians. So Lang rubbed Ji Rugzhu's head with a smile, only to feel that the hair was smooth and soft, very comfortable. Just not hurt. Ji Rugzhu breathed a sigh of relief and patted his chest, making waves a little. If you don't pay attention, the little girl has grown so big. So Lang glanced, a hint of playfulness was outlined at the corner of his mouth. Ji Rugzhu didn't know So Lang's thoughts, with a lovely smile on her face. I'm only 13 years old, and I will grow taller and bigger in a few years. Yet. Ji Rugzhu bounced happily, bringing another wave of waves. He <laughs> he. Seeing this, So Lang couldn't help but smile again. Hey, big pervert, dead pervert. A cold snort came from a distance, and soon the streamer Chu Ziobe had turned flying over and fell in front of the three So Lang. Chu Ziobe was watching the scene just now, so he was looking at So Lang with contempt. However, there seems to be a little concern in the contempt. Dead pervert, I received news before that there is another person in the slaughter tower. Looking at So Lang up and down, Chu Ziobe hesitated and said, You, did you send them all? It's more than just passing it. So Lang laughed, all killed. 200 martial sages and 4 martial sages. Really? Chu Ziobe froze there like thunder, his face full of disbelief. Those are 4 Wuxians, and they are definitely stronger than Qian Zihao. The combined force of 4 powerful martial arts is not as simple as 2 plus 2, and the comprehensive threat is simply exploding. But this combination was all killed by So Lang. This guy is at the level of Valkyrie. Of course it's true. So Lang curled his lips, I am a man who can create miracles at hand. It's nothing to kill a few Wuxians. I will kill Woody in the future. Chu Ziobe was speechless. She really didn't know what to say about So Lang's abnormality. Paused. Chu Ziobe took a breath, since you are okay, then I will return to Blue Star to practice, and I will soon break through to the Nine Star level. Wow, Sister Ziobe is about to break through to the Nine Star Martial Arts, so amazing! Ji Rugzhu exclaimed excitedly. Mirong Xianxian also said with emotion, Yes, Sister Ziobe may soon become a Wuxian. Oh, it's just so-so, as for the achievement of Wuxian, it's still early. Chu Ziobe was very happy after receiving the praise from Rugzhu and Slim. It won't take long for you to become Wuxian. So Lang's voice came from the side, his tone very serious. What? Chu Ziobe was stunned, but even with the pill that Blue Star and you gave me, I won't be able to become a Wuxian in a short time. Didn't I tell you before that it will give you a surprise? So Lang smiled faintly. You mean, cultivation base initiation? Chu Ziobe hesitated and asked, however, although you have a lot of combat power, you are only at the level of the Valkyrie in your true realm. Give me all your cultivation bases, isn't it useful? Haha, <laughs> I am indeed a good Valkyrie level. However, when I inject my cultivation base into your body, you will know how much I have accumulated over the past few days of suffering. The corners of So Lang's mouth rose slightly. Amount. Only a few days, not many. Chu Ziobe looked at So Lang's faint smile and asked hesitantly. The reason he hesitated was not because So Lang was so capable of creating miracles. All incredible things can happen to him. Only a few days. That was three full days. How unbearable it is for me, a man who is four times a day. A wicked smile appeared on So Lang's face, I can't live it anymore, I'm gushing out. Dead, dead pervert. Brother So Lang is really bad, haha. I didn't expect Brother So Lang to have such a bad side, but I really like it. Seeing So Lang's evil smile, Chu Ziobe's three daughters reacted differently, but they all blushed invariably. 
Bring it on. Let you feel carefully how much stock I have in stock. So Lang chuckled, stepped forward to hold Chu Xiaobei's wrist, and walked to the small room not far away. You you you, you let me go. Chu Xiaobei screamed with blushing face and gently twisted his body. In fact, she also knew that So Lang was only joking, but she felt very ashamed. Coco. Sister Xiaobei has such a cute time too. Standing in place, Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian covered their small mouths and let out a sweet laugh like a silver bell. Ah, you two come too. So Lang suddenly turned his head and raised his brows, revealing an evil smile. Wow. One is not enough, I want three more. Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxiu looked at each other and smiled, joking with So Lang with their reddish faces. Tisk tisk. Someday we will do it together. So Lang smiled dumbly, beckoned immediately, and continued to lead Chu Xiaobei to the room. Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian also hurriedly followed. Quickly. In the room, there are three lone men and three women, and four of them share a room. The atmosphere is slightly warm. Of course, what the four of us have to do is very healthy and not dirty at all. Rugzhu, you should come first. So Lang's eyes turned around Rugzhu and Xiangxian's body, and finally fell on Rugzhu's body. Anyway, with so many cultivation bases accumulated, Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian are in the bottom of their realm, and I'm afraid they will fill up a little bit, so it is better to upgrade them again. It is good. Rugzhu nodded obediently. Of course Murong Xianxian and Chu Xiaobei had no objection. Soon. So Lang put his hand on Ji Rugzhu's smooth forehead, and then used the function of cultivating base and empowering. After the one key empowerment was raised to level 4, the installation efficiency increased to 40%. Therefore, So Lang was very careful, for fear of accidentally exerting too much force and causing Ji Rugzhu to be injured. This time the indoctrination was very fast. It took more than 10 seconds. However, Ji Rugzhu's cultivation level instantly reached the level of Quasi God to the elementary Wuzun. Moreover, the cultivation base consumed during the indoctrination has not been replenished faster than So Lang himself. After all, he can now accumulate the cultivation base of the junior Valkyrie to break through to the intermediate Valkyrie in 36 seconds. If it weren't for Ji Rugzhu's guide to condense the space, it would be okay for So Lang to directly break through to the Quasi Sage level. Well, Ji Rugzhu accepted the cultivation base that So Lang instilled and the whole person was filled with a sense of fullness, and even his surroundings were filled with powerful energy aura. She closed her eyes tightly and was trying to get acquainted with the powerful force. The last time I was familiar with power was only three days ago, and now I am familiar with power again. All this is just like a dream. Immediately after. Xian Xian, it's your turn. So Lang looked at Murong Xian Xian with a gentle smile. Hmm. Murong Xianxian nodded and closed his eyes. After consuming the number of inoculations once again, So Lang raised Murong Xianxian's cultivation to the realm of Quasi God. Then Murong Xianxian also fell into a state of familiar power. Would you like to give them a space guide? So Lang touched his chin, muttering hesitantly. If you don't give the two girls the space guide, they must spend a long time to condense the space guide to become the of war. But if they give them space, they are afraid that it will affect their future martial arts. You can give it to them. Chu Xiaobei on the side suddenly spoke. What? So Lang's face was surprised, will it be affected by others' space? The lead to the space left by the general Valkyrie will of course have an impact. But most of the space guides left by Wu Sheng are complete and the probability of causing an impact is very small. And if it is Wuxian's space guide, it will definitely not cause any impact. After all, Wuxian's inner world can basically be said to be an independent world, and the space guide is perfect. Chu Xiaobei rolled his eyes and said, Didn't you kill Wuxian? There must be a Wuxian level space guide. Will the space guide left by Wuxian have an impact? That's how it is. 
So Lang suddenly realized, and immediately took out two copies of the space guide left by Wuxian from the storage space. Pack it in the best box and put it in front of Ji Rukju and Murong Xian Xian. When taking the lead of space, So Lang also noticed a few strange crystals regular fairy crystals. This was also obtained by killing Wuxian, but So Lang didn't have time to check it. Xiaobei, do you know the rules of Xian Jing? As So Lang asked, he took out a regular fairy crystal, that's it. Rules fairy crystal. Chu Xiaobei opened her mouth slightly, his face was horrified, you actually have a regular fairy crystal. Well, what's the use? So Lang nodded, looking like it was no big deal. The rule fairy crystal, this is a treasure that can help the quasi fairy to become a fairy quickly. Chu Xiaobei took a breath, under normal circumstances, if a quasi immortal has a regular immortal crystal, the probability of becoming a martial immortal will be greatly increased. Basically, a regular fairy crystal represents a future Wuxian. But the rule immortal crystal is very rare, just like the spirit of Wuxian, it must be Wuxian condensed by himself, and the power is extremely low. Even dozens of martial immortals may not necessarily condense a regular immortal crystal. I'm going, it turns out this thing is so rare. So Lang smiled, one piece represents a future Wuxian, what a dear, Xiaobei, do you want? Give it to me? I don't want it. The rule immortal crystal can indeed make the quasi immortal become a martial immortal, but it will leave an extremely powerful shackle. With this layer of shackles, it is absolutely impossible to break through to Emperor Wu level. Although becoming an emperor is an extremely difficult thing, it is hardly a disadvantage for Zhengzian, but for me, it is different. Chu Xiaobei squeezed her fist solemnly, I, Chu Xiaobei, I want to be the empress. Good good, ambitious. So Lang laughed, then I will leave these rules to others. Okay. Well, is it my turn next? Chu Xiaobei nodded, and a pair of beautiful eyes rolled around Rukju Hexiangzian's body like hamsters. Chu Xiaobei was also hard to resist the temptation to improve his realm in a short time. The journey of martial arts is extremely difficult, and it can quickly improve the realm without side effects. This is a choice that every martial artist will not refuse. Hmm, it's your turn. It didn't cost them much cultivation at all to improve their two levels. The corner of So Lang's mouth raised slightly, most of my inventory is still going to be used on you. Necrosis. Chu Xiaobei gritted her teeth and gave So Lang a vicious look. Okay. So Lang smiled faintly, close your eyes, I'm here. Chu Xiaobei trembled her eyelashes and closed her eyes, even though she felt a warm hand covering her forehead. An inexplicable sense of security followed. Chu Xiaobei's heart suddenly became calm and calm, and there was no wave in the ancient well. Cultivation Base Initiation So Lang thought, and immediately used the system functions. Immediately after, a large amount of cultivation base began to be quickly instilled into Chu Xiaobei's body, directly becoming Chu Xiaobei's own cultivation base. So Lang saved up his cultivation base for three days. After the one key practice reaches level 25, even more than a few tens of seconds can accumulate the cultivation base of a small realm of war god. So far, he has stored the cultivation base equivalent to hundreds of thousands of years of cultivation of the ordinary Valkyrie. Even if these cultivation bases were instilled into Chu Xiaobei's body with an efficiency of 40%, there were more than 200,000 years of cultivation bases. Although the speed of Wusheng's accumulation of cultivation base is far lower than that of Wusheng, it is also a huge amount of cultivation base. In addition, Chu Xiaobei himself was about to break through the Nine Star Martial Arts. Therefore, after receiving the support of this cultivation base, Chu Xiaobei's energy in his body skyrocketed, reaching the breaking point of Juxing Wusheng within minutes. Immediately after, a wave of powerful breakthrough fluctuations spread from her body. After a short time, Chu Xiaobei successfully broke through to the nine-star martial arts level. At this time, 
there was still a part of the cultivator in Solang's mysterious black space that was golden. Solang simply instilled it all into Chu Xiaobei's body. The inculcation of this part of the cultivation level allowed Chu Xiaobei's realm to be quickly and stably consolidated. But, Chu Xiaobei still did not open his eyes, and was still in a state of cultivation. The gap between the 8-star martial sage and the 9-star martial sage is also terrifying, so she also needs to be as familiar with the new power as are Yu Shui Xian Xian. So Lang glanced at Chu Xiaobei's attribute panel, and found that her various abilities had reached the Kui Sai Xian and level. This level is much stronger than Cai Liao and Zhu Qi. Immediately after, So Lang himself closed his eyes, quietly waiting for the system prompt. Yes, he has to break through. After tens of seconds. Ding. The sea of repair is full, do you break through? No breakthrough for now. Solang intends to hold back a wave. But this time it didn't last long, only five or six minutes, a song's time. System. Give me a breakthrough, a breakthrough. Solang took a deep breath and gave the order directly. Next moment. The terrifying liquid spiritual power appeared out of thin air in Solang, while respecting the flesh and blood, while converging towards the Danchen. The pubic area at this time has become the space of the of war, an independent space. Nourished by a lot of spiritual energy, the Valkyrie space began to expand rapidly, and the Valkyrie domain became more and more powerful. Solang's body continuously experienced breakthrough fluctuations. Elementary Valkyrie, Intermediate Valkyrie, Advanced Valkyrie, Peak Valkyrie, Quasi Sage. Five small realms, four levels, like a broken bamboo, all break through instantly. Solang's cultivation realm reached the Quasi Sage level in an instant. But Solang was not satisfied. His goal is to reach the real Martial Saint level. Time continued to elapse, ten minutes passed and finally there was another system prompt. Can you break through to a one-star martial saint in just ten minutes? My current cultivation speed is really abnormal. So Lang thought in his heart, and then refused this breakthrough. Now the time required to break through is very short, enough for one break. Time to shuttle. Three hours passed. And So Lang has 4.4 billion times the basic training speed of an indispensable martial artist. This is equivalent to the Immaculate Level Quasi Sages who have practiced for a full 1.8 million years without any auxiliary means. About there. So Lang thought, System, give me a breakthrough. As he gave instructions, first of all endless auras appeared in the meridians. Afterwards, a terrifying attraction radiated from So Lang, and he began to absorb the spiritual energy of the surrounding world. So Lang didn't even think about it and immediately rushed out of the room and came into the spirit river that was constantly rotating around the fairy palace. Boom! The Linghi River poured into the earth like a waterfall, rushing into So Lang's body frantically. The huge momentum and movement spread, and the warriors in the entire Yaokai Holy City saw this spectacular spectacle. Gosh, someone is absorbing Linghi. Who is that, with good eyesight, take a look, who is so awesome? It's Su Gongzi, it's Su Gongzi, Su Gongzi is making a breakthrough. As expected of young Master Su, the breakthrough scenes are different from me and other mediocre people. Most of the warriors in the holy city of Yeokai looked up at the fairy palace, talking and exclaiming. At the same time, Li Xiang Yang also looked at his body in shock. He found that a strange and indescribable ability emerged in his body which was frantically raising his cultivation level. Master, how come the master has begun to break through again? Obviously, the Lord has just crossed the four realms, breaking through to the Quasi Sage realm, this is not over yet. Hey, the Martial Sage level is now, I am back to the Martial Sage level, and I haven't stopped yet, the second star Martial Sage is now. A and D. Still not stopping. Li Xianyang knew that So Lang's cultivation speed was against the sky, but he didn't expect to be able to go against the sky to such an extent. At this moment, 
he was already shaking with excitement. Solang sighed. The entire Ling he continued to revolve around Solang, forming a huge spiritual liquid vortex, and the spiritual energy poured into Solang's body frantically. Fortunately, the immortal palace plus the sea of sky, the spirit gathering effect is exploding, enough to support Solang's devouring. In this way, Solang's cultivation realm rushed all the way, rushing from Quasi Sage to Six Star Martial Sage level in just a few minutes. Directly across six small realms. And it is still the six small realms of Wushan level. We must know that a small realm of Wushan level is almost equivalent to the sum of all the great realms before Wushan. But even so, Solang broke through six small realms. Plus the state of breakthrough before. Solang broke through a total of ten small realms today. Such a speed is absolutely unprecedented, and there is no one to come after. Call. In the Ling He, Solang let out a long sigh of relief. Immediately, his spiritual power looked inward and fell on the martial saint realm in the Danshan. It is still a chicken structure, divided into the innermost Wushan space and the outer chaotic space. The area of Wushan space is much larger than that of Wushan space. What Solang possessed at this time was the six-star martial saint space, whose size was already equivalent to a large province on the Blue Star. And in the ancient times of Blue Star, it was a country. The outer chaotic space is also very huge, and there is a thick platinum energy flowing inside. This is the result of Solang's unnamed technique. Once the martial saint realm is launched, the combat power can be increased. In addition to the golden energy, the chaotic space is also full of lightning grid-like substances of various colors. These are the rules of heaven and earth that Solang has understood. Comprehending the rules and perfecting the rules can form the basic framework of Wuxian inner realm, which is a very important infrastructure project. The skeleton of the basic rules of the five elements has been completed. The derived subsidiary rules are almost understood. By the way, the yin-yang rules, the yin system rules have also been understood and can be accepted. While thinking about it, So Lang accepted the yin system rules and immediately put on the dark rules. Dark rules and yin rules have something in common, and they can be regarded as one of the basic rules of the world. At present, for me, time is not a problem with the rules of comprehension, but the type of exercises practiced has become a limitation of the rules of my comprehension. Practice a lot of different kinds of exercises, especially the space system and the time system. You must find these two exercises. While thinking about it, Solang opened his property panel. Solang. Human. Turbidity. Six Star Wushan. Quasi Sense Plus. Quasi Sense Plus. Quasi Sense Plus. Quasi Sense Plus. Realm of Bright Moon. The Infinite Heart Sutra, 10,000 Laws into One, Unnamed. One Key Practice Function, One Key Martial Arts Function, Clone Dispatch Function, One Key Treasure Hunt Function, One Key Alchemy Function, One Key Mixer Function, One Key Refining Array Function, One Key Synthesis Function, One Key Initiation Function, one key decomposition function. Has all aspects reached the quasi-celestial end level? It's a pity that I haven't reached the immortal level. From this it can be seen that the gap between the holy level and the immortal level is really terrifying. Solang closed the attribute panel and immediately checked his mental power. In the vast and boundless sea of knowledge, the round of Huihu that represents spiritual power has become more and more rounded. The potholes on its surface have basically disappeared completely. Master. In the past few days, we have established an exchange system from the Bayou clan. At the same time, the holy races around the Bayou tribe have also discovered the existence of the immortal formation, so they are very jealous of the Bayou tribe, and even fear it. Therefore, several holy races gave the Kalchikam tribe a gift and the Kalchikam tribe took it very seriously and sent someone over. And the attitude of the Kalchikam tribe is rather bad, they covet the celestial phantom celestial formation. The direct blood of the immortal tribe is sent to ask for it. 
The above is the message sent by Huang Fuken in the Jade Card of Solang's transmission. The Kaiushan tribe, coveting the fairy formations I have laid. Why does this sound a bit like a laugh, the formation I arranged casually made an immortal jealous, haha. <laughs> the corner of Solang's mouth twitched, causing Huang Fuken, Bai Yulin and others to stabilize the Colchisians, and then received the Jade Card for communication. Solang had already predicted the reaction of the Kalchikam tribe, so it was not surprising. Immediately after. With a thought, Solang sent Li Xianyang out. The Wuxian of the Colosseum clan would definitely not go to the Baiyu clan to investigate in person, so sending a Li Xianyang to it was completely enough. And with Li Xianyang, even if the martial immortal of the Kalchikam clan descends, he will have the power to fight. After all, the Chu Xian clan is a Xinan Xian clan, and Wu Xian is not strong either. With Li Xianyang's current combat power, he might be able to kill him. After sending out Li Xianyang, So Lang found a room in the fairy palace and continued to refine the parts of the super humanoid weapon. Simultaneously, he is also preparing for the next attack on Slaughter Tower. However, so Lang didn't know that he had basically killed the power of Tuantianlu staying in the headquarters. But the main force of Tuantianlu was fighting for the key to the Emperor's Forbidden Land at this time, and could not spare the power to target the Yeokai tribe. After slaying many quasi immortals and martial sages in the Slaughter Tower, and decomposing hundreds of sacred artifacts, So Lang already had a large amount of materials at this time. These materials have been able to initially refine the main structure of super-humanoid weapons. In the room, the cauldron was red with flames. Pieces of material were put into the furnace by Solang, and gradually refined into various parts. There are many parts that can be done by the system, saving a lot of time. One and a half hours later, Solang then refined a total of 30 parts of the ferry. Just then, the system prompt sounded again. Ding! The sea of repair is full, do you break through? No breakthrough for now. So Lang put aside the matter of cultivation level and concentrated on refining super humanoid weapons. An afternoon passed in a blink of an eye. So Lang once again refined hundreds of fairy artifact parts. The densely packed fairy level parts lay on the ground. If a martial arts immortal sees it, it will probably flow out. But Solang didn't feel anything at all when he looked at these fairy artifacts. It's as if these things are just ordinary objects. At the same time, in one afternoon, Solang's cultivation base once again accumulated a huge amount. No way. The cultivation speed of 4.4 billion times is really terrifying. One hour is equivalent to 500,000 years of meditation for others. It's so perverted that the world is trembling. Taking a look at the golden cultivator, So Lang decided to continue to store it. But at this moment, amidst the sea of knowledge, Li Xianyang's soul was filled with anger. Okay. What happened to make Li Xianyang angry? So Lang's expression changed and he immediately used the system's ability to share Li Xianyang's perception. On this occasion, Baiyu tribe area, Holy Nest, outside the fairy formation. There are two figures floating in the sky, magnificent, overlooking the earth, looking like the best in the world. These two people, a man and a woman, exuded a celestial aura, and they were the two great martial arts of the Kaihushan family. Behind him, there was a young man who was seriously injured and dying. Obviously, this seriously injured and dying young man is a direct blood of the Kalchikam tribe. I thought that this guy was domineering and arrogant, but Li Xianyang took care of it. In the fairy formation, headed by Li Xianyang, Huang Fuken, Bai Yulin, and others stood behind, staring at the two martial arts outside the formation with indignation. Bai Yulin here. Your Bai clan has been attached to my Kalchikam clan for countless years, and now you dare to betray and join other forces. Not only that, you actually tried to kill the blood of my clan immortal clan. You have to know that our Kaihushan family has two great martial immortals, but they are not comparable to the little quasi-immortal in front of you. Now, 
you surrender immediately and hand over the immortal formations obediently, we may still spare your lives. A rare opportunity, I hope you take it well, I will give you ten breaths of time to consider. In the sky, a martial immortal of the Kalchikam tribe stood high above, with an indifferent expression. The other Wuxian half squinted his eyes, looking like he was defiant. After speaking, these two Wuxians burst into extremely powerful auras. In this breath, countless creatures crawled on the ground, and even the strength to escape was taken away. A large number of Bayou clan warriors couldn't bear the oppression of Wuxian, and they burst into death. Looking at the people who died outside the immortal formation, Bai Yulin and other martial sages were utterly distraught. Fantasy reign. Bai Yulin yelled, You dignified Wuxian, you even attacked innocent creatures, do you still need a face? Humph. Noisy. Huangyu Wuxian showed displeasure, yelled violently, and covered it with a powerful spiritual force, immediately beheading countless creatures. But at this moment, Li Xianyang erupted with terrifying Wuxian level mental power, which directly fell on Huangyu Wuxian. The battle between Wuxians was so swift, and the mental attack was invisible and innocent, arriving instantly. In an instant, Wuxian Huangyu felt a strong sense of crisis coming. Who? He didn't even think about it, and instantly regained his mental power and fully defended. It's just a matter of time. Huangyu Wuxian formed a mental defense, which happened to strike against the mental attack that appeared out of thin air. Immediately after, Huangyu Wuxian only felt dizzy and couldn't help but spit out a mouthful of blood, his face changed drastically. Wuxian level mental attack. There is a martial immortal in the Bayou clan. Wuxian Huangyu and Wuxian Dingbo, who was half squinting next to him, were shocked. You really have no bottom line. Just use the aura to oppress the weak creatures, but even attack them with mental power. Li Xianyang's eyes were full of anger, you two martial celestial beings of the Kaihushan tribe have good names, but they are filthy. Little Quasi Celestial Rank, what qualifications do you have to talk to us? Which fairy level deist is hiding in the dark, why not come out for a comment? The two martial immortals of the Qiushui tribe looked at Li Xianyang, their faces showed disdain. Because of the combination of the celestial phantom and the fairy formation, Wuxian Huangyu and Wuxian Dingbo didn't realize that the mental attack just broke out from Li Xianyang. They thought there was another martial immortal hiding in secret to protect the Baihu tribe. Therefore, at this time, the two Wuxians were secretly alert. Fantasy Yu Wuxian Dingbo Wuxian Li Xianyang sneered, Do you know what kind of power is standing behind the Baihu clan? What kind of power? On this vast land, only my Kalchikam is the strongest. What power can there be behind you is nothing more than a guts who hide their heads and show their tails. Huangyu Wuxian and Dingbo Wuxian's eyes turned like a mouse, and there was a trace of fear hidden in their eyes. Judging from the intensity of the mental attack just now, the Wuxian who is hiding in the dark may be a little higher than their realm. But. The two still had no plans to shrink. First of all, a three tribulations immortal array is too rare. After they were promoted from the saint clan to the immortal clan, they spent countless time and financial resources, and after many generations of hard work, they built an immortal formation. At this time, this fairy formation of the Bayou saint clan was like a treasure at hand, so I didn't want to give up. Moreover, the opponents Wuxian did not appear for a long time, and only attacked with mental power, which made people have to wonder if the Wuxian was physically sick or not. What's so scary about a wounded Wuxian? The one who should be afraid, should be the Wuxian on the opposite side. Huangyu Wuxian and Dingbo Wuxian exchanged glances, and became more sure of their guesses. The opponent's Wuxian must have fleeing here, and was seriously injured, wanting to recover with the resources of the Baihu clan. I have to say that the brain supplement abilities of these two martial arts are really powerful. It's a pity that they couldn't think of it anymore. The Wuxian in the speculation was the Kuei Sisian headed by the opposing team. But they are not to blame. 
who would have thought that a quasi-immortal could possess the spiritual power of the sunshine level? No one would believe it. Dingbo Wuxian, Huanya Wuxian. You are simply arrogant. I tell you, the strongest person in this area is my patriarch. Just now, my lord killed four martial immortals in Luncheon Lu. If you two don't want to die, and genocide, you should leave as soon as possible, otherwise it won't be unpredictable. Li Xianyang looked cold and his eyes were full of murderous intent. At this time, he really wanted to kill the other two martial arts, but the other party also practiced a spiritual exercise, which was still defensive, so Li Xianyang couldn't kill them. Your lord! Is that the Wuxian hiding in the dark? Kill the four martial immortals in the slaughter tower? You can really blow. What kind of organization is Tushin Lu? That is a world-class killer organization, quasi-imperialist force. He also killed the Wuxian in the slaughter tower, it just made me laugh. Ha ha ha. Dingbo Wuxian and Huanya Wuxian listened to Li Xianyang's words, but didn't take them to heart at all, instead they showed mockery on their faces. Well, in fact, it's probably the same reaction as the others. The slaughter tower is really too strong, basically only the slaughter tower can kill others, no one else can kill the heavenly tower martial artist. At this moment, the two sides are in a stalemate. Dingbo Wuxian and Huanya Wuxian of the Kalchikam clan were unable to break through the sky magical fairy array. And Li Xianyang couldn't kill two Wuxians either. However, the two martial gods of the Kalchikam clan had another choice that had no bottom line. Hurry up and hand over the formation. Otherwise, we will kill all the creatures of the Bayu tribe, so that no grass will grow in your Bayu region, and no chickens or dogs will stay. Huanya Wuxian's face was cold, don't think I'm joking, and give you five more breaths. After five breaths, you will be at your own risk. You. You dare. Bai Yulin's old face flushed red, if you dare to do it, you will definitely get cramped and skinned by our master. It is better to die. Ha 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 ha. I haven't come out yet, I'm afraid I have already given up on you. Now that the time for five breaths has come, I would like to ask you one last sentence, will you pay or not? Dingbo Wuxian squinted his eyes, and there was a dangerous light in the gap. You are really wishful thinking. Li Xianyang cursed angrily, and felt a little self-blaming. Thanks to the Lord's blessing, he can be promoted to this level, but the first task after promotion is difficult to complete, and he really has the expectations of the Lord. Haha, <laughs> very good, you made a choice that utterly frustrated life. Huanya Wuxian said with a murderous expression, I will perfect you and kill all the creatures of the Bayu clan. Talking. Wuxian Huanya raised a hand, and the torrent of terrifying rules began to condense. Dingbo Wuxian stayed quietly, watching out for the Wuxian in the dark. Uh, in other words, fighting against the air. However, Li Xianyang wanted to laugh but couldn't laugh. Damn it, you must never fail the Lord's expectations. Even if you die, you will never compromise. Fight. Li Xianyang took a deep breath grabbed a handful of pills and stuffed it into his mouth, and began to gather the power of rules all over his body. Dingbo Wuxian did not notice the pill that Li Xianyang swallowed, otherwise they should have dropped their jaws again. A mere quasi-immortal, dare to stop me. Huanya Wuxian sneered, and immediately after that, he was about to perform the horror fairy technique. But at this moment, Li Xianyang's breath suddenly soared. I saw that his cultivation realm started to rise crazily from the six-star martial sage, and in an instant he broke through to the nine-star martial sage level. Such a huge change immediately stunned Bai Yulin and others. Suddenly break through from a six-star martial sage to a nine-star martial sage? Moreover, the aura on his body is constantly skyrocketing, and it feels like he has broken through the sky and reached another level, immortal level. This is too exaggerated right? I, the Lord broke through again. This time it is three holy small realms. 
my true combat power has already broken through the martial arts level in all aspects. The Lord is really amazing. In just one day, he broke through so many realms. Li Xianyang himself was also taken aback, and immediately became ecstatic. At the same time, Dingbo Wuxian and Huangya Wuxian outside the array also discovered Li Xianyang's strangeness. He has made a breakthrough. I seem to feel the breakthrough volatility. Could it be that he is the martial immortal, he used the method of seizing the house and wants to live another life? Yes, 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 that is, that Wuxian is about to die. He chose to rebirth, and with the help of the Baiyu clan's cultivation, he took out an immortal formation plate and arranged an immortal formation. At this moment, he suddenly regained his combat power. He must have used some secret technique and whole cards. So, everything is perfectly explained. As the brain supplement duo communicated, they showed excitement. A Wuxian who has been reborn from the house and has not yet returned to the top. What a precious prey is this. Once killed, I don't know how terrible the income can be. Thinking of this, the eyes of Dingbo and Huanyu suddenly turned red, and the color of greed rose. Find a way to lead him out of the fairy formation. Dingbo Wuxian said, otherwise we can't kill him. Haha, <laughs> just use the trillion creatures of the Baiyu tribe as a threat. Huanyu Wuxian sneered, and said loudly to Li Xianyang. I have given you two opportunities, none of you cherish it, don't blame me now. Talking. Wuxian Huangyu and Wuxian Dingbo flew away, condensing powerful regular spells in their hands, and in the next moment they will kill countless creatures along the way. Master Xian Yang. When Bai Yulin and others saw this scene, they were suddenly very anxious. The trillions of creatures are weak, but they are the roots of the Baiyu clan. Rest assured. I will not let the Lord down and make the Baiyu tribe difficult. Li Xianyang nodded solemnly, and immediately moved his figure, flew out of the fairy formation, and chased Dingbo and Huangyu. In fact, Li Xianyang also knew the plans of Dingbo Wuxian and Huangyu Wuxian. It is nothing more than to lead him out of the fairy formation, thereby beheading him. But Li Xianyang was not afraid. On the one hand, it was because at this time his own strength had reached the immortal level, on the other hand, Li Xianyang was full of fanatical worship and trust in Solang who stood behind him. He knew that there was a master standing behind him, and he would never watch him be killed. By the means of the Lord, I am immortal. Li Xianyang was full of fighting spirit, and fiercely killed the brain to supplement the duo. He got it. Haha. <laughs> I don't know where his self-confidence came from, but he really dared to chase it out. I thought he would choose to shrink. He used the secret technique and wanted to pay a great price, so he didn't want to stop there. Humph, go a little further, and kill him. While the brain supplement duo was flying, the spells in their hands were constantly falling. Li Xianyang from behind chased after him frantically intercepting the attack from the opponent and protecting the innocent creatures on the ground. In a blink of an eye, the brain supplement duo flew hundreds of millions of miles with Li Xianyang hanging. The distance is almost enough. Under our siege, he will never return to the fairy formation. A lifelong treasure of a Wuxian, it will fall into our hands. Dingbo Wuxian and Huangya Wuxian looked at each other with a sneer. Immediately after, the two suddenly separated, went in a circle around Li Xianyang, and sandwiched him between them. Ha ha ha, today you will definitely die. Dingbo Wuxian laughed and started directly. Huangya Wuxian also started at the same time, and the two attacked fiercely towards Li Xianyang. The five elements rule torrent. Li Xianyang yelled violently, condensing the endless, endless five element rule in his hand antagonizing the two Wuxians. Boom! There was a loud noise, and Li Xianyang's face was pale. One enemy too is too hard after all. Okay. He actually blocked our attack. Huangya Wuxian looked surprised, brother, use the fairy weapon, make a quick battle. It is good. Dingbo Wuxian nodded, and after a while, 
a long sword appeared. Huanya Wuxian also took out a fairy weapon, a heavy shield. However, although it is a shield, it can also be used to smash people, and the effect is not bad. If you don't believe me, look at the captain. Haha. <laughs> The next breath is your death date. Dingbo Wuxian sneered, and severely chopped off at Li Xianyang with the long knife in his hand. I saw a blade of light tearing through the sky rushing out of the fairy sword, slamming towards Li Xianyang like a bamboo. Huanya Wuxian's fairy shield turned into a huge island, smashed down. Two fairy artifacts. Li Xianyang's expression changed. Faced with two fairy artifacts, he couldn't stop it. In an instant, the two attacks were about to fall on Li Xianyang's expression. But at this moment, a full forty figures suddenly appeared and appeared beside Li Xianyang. Forty figures shot together, and the terrifying might blasted out, directly flying the shield immortal weapon, blocking the sky-cracking sword light. The sudden scene directly stunned the brain supplement duo. Even Li Xianyang was stunned there for a while. He knew that the Lord would not let him die in vain, but he didn't expect the Lord to send so many immortal powerhouses at once. These are all clones of the Lord. Li Xianyang turned his head and looked, all the figures looked exactly the same as the Lord, and the breath on his body was exactly the same. Simultaneously, Dingbo Wuxian and Huanya Wuxian were stunned, their eyes were about to fall out. Where did these people come from? How did they come? They are all immortal warriors. A total of 40 immortal warriors. One fairy level warrior can dominate a large area, 40 fairy level warriors, what kind of power is this? Is it possible that they are warriors from the imperial clan? The Bayou tribe was blessed by the emperor. Escape. After being surprised, the brain supplement duo turned around and fled instantly without thinking about it. But at this time, so Lang's forty clones had already dispersed, blocking all their retreat. Kill out! Dingbo Wuxian roared, holding a fairy sword, waving wildly. A series of horrible sword lights swayed out, the sky was torn and the earth was trembling. Huanya Wuxian held a shield to resist Wuxian level attacks from all directions. For a time, So Lang's forty clones and Li Xianyang couldn't kill them unexpectedly. Dingbo and Huanya Wuxian are overjoyed. They have no fairy weapons, ha ha ha, we have a chance to escape. Hurry up, hold on, and escape back to the clan to survive. With the joy of the rest of their lives, the Naobu duo shouted frantically, attacking and defending, and flew towards the distance. Hateful. Li Xianyang mixed in the crowd, constantly attacking, but couldn't break through the opponent's defense. But at this moment, he suddenly felt something in his hand, and he looked down and couldn't help but his eyes burst. Li Xianyang unexpectedly had an extra fairy in his hand. Not only that, but the other forty clones also had an extra fairy weapon in their hands. With such a scene, Dingbo Wuxian and Huanya Wuxian were so scared that they were urinating. This, this, this. Forty-one fairy artifacts. My god. How come there are so many fairy artifacts? Our entire Kalchikam tribe, with a history of two million years, has only built the two weakest fairy artifacts. What kind of power do they come from? At the time of horror, the brain supplement duo felt desperate. Under the siege of forty Wuxians holding immortal weapons, it was impossible for them to escape. Surrender. I surrendered, I would like to be slaves and slaves. Don't do it. Under the threat of death, Wuxian Dingbo and Wuxian Huanyu immediately made a choice. Immediately, Li Xianyang and the forty avatars stopped and surrounded them. We are willing to surrender our souls and become slaves. Dingbo and Huanyu knelt in the void, with humiliation in their eyes, their heads buckled heavily. At the same time, they thought they had saved their lives. After all, a generation of martial arts were slaves and servants, this was something that no one could refuse. Even Li Xianyang has similar thoughts. But the next moment, forty clones raised the fairy weapons and smashed them down. 
When Sol Lang's avatars had no immortal weapons, Dingbo Wuxian and Huanyu Wuxian could still survive. But now, with the forty clones and Li Xianyang all holding the immortal instruments, they slammed them down suddenly, and the brain supplement duo suddenly fell into an ice cave, and the whole body was cold. In their desperate eyes, the fairy gradually occupied all the field of vision, and finally suffered a pain and lost consciousness. Ding! You get the soul of the elementary Wuxian one, the guide of space one, the regular fairy crystal one, the elementary fairy weapon Tianqin knife one, the middle grade fairy jade 386358, the lower grade fairy jade 23568652, the ultimate spiritual jade asterisk 8865356, the material of the fairy level refining device, the material of the holy level refining device. Ding! You get the soul of the elementary Wuxian one, the guide of space one, the regular fairy crystal one, the elementary fairy weapon Nushan shield one, the middle grade fairy jade 225328, the lower grade fairy jade 16584552, the ultimate spiritual jade asterisk 6358211, the material of the fairy level refining device, the material of the holy level refining device. Two system prompts came. The only two martial immortals of the Kalchikam clan, just like that, Solang's clones were beaten to death. The saints of Yeokai, the city of the sky. Ha <laughs> ha. Thinking that I am a martial immortal, I can survive after I surrender? My kindness is far from that cheap. Solang curled his mouth in disdain, then took a look at the trophy and took out the two immortal artifacts. One long knife, one shield. The spirits of the two immortal artifacts were rushing out of their bodies, flaring their teeth and claws at Solang, looking like only a brutal instinct. The two lowest level fairy artifacts are even incomplete. Even the device spirit has no intelligence, it is like a crazy beast with only instinct. These two immortal artifacts seem to have been promoted from high level sacrificial artifacts by some special method. Solang took a close look at the two immortal artifacts and found that there were very strong evil and resentment on them, and the lingering smell of blood penetrated into the bones of the immortal artifacts. It seems to be some kind of blood sacrifice method. This kind of evil method, I am afraid that it is necessary to kill the creatures in the unit of billions, and they are the creatures with martial arts cultivation skills, and they are forcibly promoted to these two immortal weapons. These two guys are really deadly. Fortunately, I didn't save them. While whispering, Solang gave instructions, and soon disassembled the two fairy artifacts in his hand. After the decomposition, a total of more than 130 copies of the soul of the martial god and more than 10,000 copies of the soul of the martial god were obtained. The soul of more than 10,000 Valkyrie. It is enough to see how terrifying the number of dead creatures behind these two fairy artifacts. In addition, there are densely packed, countless holy level materials and some immortal level materials. It is the soul of Wuxian, not a copy. Solang could also understand that even with the Xinan immortal clan like the Chu Daffodil, the entire race has only two martial celestial beings. Where can I get such a big treasure as the soul of martial celestial being? After decomposing the immortal artifacts of Dingbo and Huanyu, Solang decomposed all the 41 immortal artifacts used by the clone and Li Xianyang. These immortal artifacts are all temporarily refined, and it is useless to keep them. It is better to decompose them into materials for later use. As for Li Xianyang's lack of weapons, it will be resolved soon. Disassemble the fairy. Solang took out the Yushan sword from the storage space. The Yushin sword at this time was a quasi-immortal weapon, possessing a certain amount of power, and it was a great weapon that could kill the immortal. At this time, Solang's true combat power had already broken through the sky and reached the immortal level. The Yushin sword evolves into an immortal weapon, and Solang can also control it perfectly, of course, he must evolve it as soon as possible. However, Solang did not directly start to evolve but also decomposed the Yushin sword. Ding! Decompose the quasi-immortal weapon Yushin sword asterisk 1, you get. The quasi-immortal weapon Yushin sword became a pile of materials. 
but then, Solang used system functions to refine it. Moreover, this time not only one handle was refined, but a whole 51 was refined. Yes, in addition to himself, Solang would also equip all the clones with a Yushin sword as standard. Of course Li Xianyang can get one too. System, keep the specified characteristics, evolve the Yushin sword. Solang picked up one of the Yushin swords and gave the order directly. Ding! Consume the fairy level material Xianming Luixin 6, Kaibao Anger Stone 10, Taiping Eternal Jade 20, Holy Refining Material Ice Front Tian Yu Stone 30, Tian Yu Holy Soil 30, Jade Girl Everlasting Hatred Stone 36, Wushan Soul 20, Valkyrie Soul 50. Yushin Sword has evolved into a primary fairy weapon. It's quite expensive. To evolve all the Yushin Swords into primary immortal weapons, it will consume more than a thousand souls of the martial and more than two thousand souls of the martial god. The key is that the soul of Wu Sheng is not enough, I have to refine super humanoid weapons. Now evolving all Yushin swords into primary fairy weapons, it will not raise the upper limit of combat power, so let's leave it for now. So Lang frowned, and handed out the remaining Kuei Xian level Yushin swords, leaving only a fairy craft level Yushin sword in his hand. At this moment, this fairy weapon level Yushin sword has already given birth to its spirit. Its shape is different from the Jian Xian Cannon and Sky Sea. It is the shape of a sword, and it can also be called a sword spirit. The appearance of the sword spirit is almost exactly the same as the Yushin sword, with black stripes on the white background, mysterious and unpredictable. But there is an eye in its sword grid. The sword grid is double sided one for each, and two eyes in total. These two eyes looked quite agile, turning around, like a newly born baby full of curiosity about the world around them. It can be seen that this sword spirit's natural intelligence is much higher than that of Xiaohei and Xiaopeo's two mentally retarded devices. After all, it consumes so much of my Wushan soul and the soul of the Valkyrie. If I refining a mentally retarded device spirit, I will doubt if the system is intentional. Solang grinned, with a slight smile on his face. Immediately after, he held the Yushin sword in front of him, and looked at each other with the eyes on the Yushin sword's grid, from now on, you will be called Xiaohu, don't you know? Xiaohu. You know. Xiaohu knows. Yushin Jian's eyes moved cleverly, making a crisp sound like a bell. You know how to communicate from the beginning. In addition, I learn languages very quickly. It's much smarter than the two spirits that only know how to call Ma 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 and fire cannons. Solang showed excitement and was very happy, great, I want to teach this Xiaohu myself. With excitement, Solang taught Xiaohu Langzing the language. Xiaohu learns very fast, and he can learn the language at almost one point. He has directly mastered the language of Blue Star and has reached the level of Chinese level 10. His communication ability instantly reached a level similar to that of Solang. Xiaohu. Solang weighed Yushin sword and shouted. I'm here, does the master need anything? Master, don't play with Xiaohu's body, it's itchy. Master, stop it, does the master want to be hacked? Xiaohu was very excited just as soon as he learned the language of Blue Star, so when Solang asked, he began to answer and answer continuously. Uh. Xiaohu turned out to be like this. Answer more than a dozen sentences as soon as you ask. And it's saucy and sturdy, want to cut me. Solang stared, and the corners of his mouth twitched, feeling that the sword spirit also had a bit of sand sculpture. What is the master staring at? Don't stare at people like that, it's so shy. Does the master want to be poked blind? Can Xiaohu want to pierce the master's second generation body? Xiaohu and Solang looked at each other, each sentence after another, perfectly interpreting what is called Huaitang. My day. This sword spirit is too showy. Solang couldn't help rolling his eyes fiercely. Immediately, he quickly put the Yushin sword into the storage space to prevent it from continuing to talk. Immediately after, 
Solang turned his eyes, took back all the clones from the Bayou clan, and gave Li Xianyang an order. Li Xianyang, the martial fairy of the Kalchikam tribe is dead. You immediately go to subdue the saints near the Bayou tribe. There are also the Chu Shui Xian clan, no, now it is the Chu Shui Saint clan. If they are conscious and take the initiative to vote, then they will accept it. If they are not moved and wait for me to come, then they will be destroyed. This series of orders appeared on Li Xianyang's Jade Card of Transmission. The servant must complete the Lord's order. Li Xianyang received the order and immediately knelt down in the direction of Sou Lang. His expression was full of gratitude and a hint of guilt. Because he was favored by Sou Lang, his combat power reached the immortal level, but he fell into a disadvantage in the first battle. In the end, he needed the Lord's rescue, and he suddenly felt sorry for the Lord's favor. The first order was not executed well. I must meticulously complete the orders the Lord is giving now, otherwise I can only apologize with death. Li Xianyang was secretly ruthless in his heart, and immediately returned to the Baihu saints, gathered all the saints, went to the surrounding saints, and included them in the territory of Solang's rule. Solang was not interested in what Li Xianyang would do. With Li Xianyang's Wuxian level combat power, there is no threat around them. Those holy races either surrender or perish. There is no third choice. Just broke through three small realms. It is now a nine-star level cultivation realm. It's a pity that the skills I practice are limited now, which delays the understanding of the rules and is unable to enter the martial arts for the time being. The rules are not perfect. Even if the cultivation level is sufficient, I can't choose to be promoted otherwise the foundation is not strong, and it will become a big problem in the future. The most urgent task is to practice the exercises. The cultivation level can be temporarily put on hold. Well, I don't know what is going on in the slaughter tower. Will a more powerful Wuxian be sent next time? Should I upgrade the Jixian cannon? And the Sea of Sky? Forget it. Upgrading the fairy weapon requires more materials than the Evolution Yushin Sword, so let's talk about the super humanoid weapon first. Thinking in his mind, So Lang adjusted the flame, looked at the state of the materials in the furnace, and continued to refine the parts of the super humanoid weapon. In fact, sending a avatar to help Li Xianyang kill Dingbo Wuxian and Huanyu Wuxian took a dozen breaths. At this time, So Lang didn't delay the refining of parts. Time is fleeting. Chu Xiaobei, Ji Rugzhu, and Murong Xianxian have consolidated their cultivation bases. Originally the three women were excited to find Sou Lang, but Chu Xiaobei discovered that after Sou Lang was refining the equipment, she took Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian to Blue Star to practice. At this time, Chu Xiaobei's cultivation level has also reached the Nine Star Martial Sage, only one step away is the Quasi Immortal. What is needed most now is the power to understand the rules. She chose not to use the rule fairy crystal, so this process will be more difficult for her. But Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian had reached the Quasi Shen and possessed the space guide given by So Lang. At this time, they had to go to the Blue Star to refine the space guide and achieve the position of the Valkyrie. At the same time, on the Bayou clan's side, the fall of the two great martial immortals caused a tremendous panic. All the holy races were plunged into fear, for fear that the mysterious person would get angry and kill himself. However, when the people were in a panic, they saw an envoy from the Baihu clan. The messenger of the Baihu tribe gave them two choices, surrender to young master Su or perish. Without exception, all the saints chose to surrender the first time. Originally, the envoy of the Baihu clan planned to throw out the benefits of surrendering to young Master Su, but he didn't expect that all these saints would surrender directly without thinking about it. All of a sudden, the neighboring races of the Baihu tribe, the Hundred Wars Saint clan, the Faish Huang Saint clan, and the Lianhua Saint clan, as well as the three major Saint clan of the North and East respectively, surrendered and presented countless treasures of heaven and earth, rare and exotic animals plus books the most beautiful group of women in the tribe. Immediately, 
the name of Li Xianyang spread to the nine great saints and the Chu Shui saints, and the name of Sua Gongzi, the lord of Li Xianyang, made everyone feel thunderous. The various miracles about Sua Gongzi were passed from the mouths of the martial sages of the Baihu tribe and turned into various versions, which made people admire and worship. In the end, the Kalchikam clan finally lost its breath. Their martial immortal was directly beheaded which was the most feared force in this incident. Wuxian, almost the figure at the top of the pyramid of Kanglin continent, it is extremely difficult to kill. At this time, the martial celestials of their Colosseum clan fell altogether, without even a chance to escape. The death of Wuxian and the mysterious murderer, like a sword on his neck, could destroy their Kiyoshui tribe at any time. Of course, there are people in the Chu Shui clan who are unwilling to surrender and want to resist with the help of the immortal formation. But these people were quickly killed in the Chu Shui clan's internal struggle, and the Chu Shui clan quickly completed the change of power in just one day. By this time, all the senior leaders of the Chu Shui clan are people who intend to surrender. After the internal fight was over, the Chu Shui tribe immediately sent an envoy to the Baihu tribe without delay, and saw Li Xianyang. The last time the direct descendants of the Kalchikam tribe came, they were arrogant, defiant, pretentious, and lofty. But this time, the ten quasi immortals who came as messengers all knelt in front of Li Xianyang, and gave their souls and hearts very humble. Properties Panel Solang Human Turbidity Juxing Wushan Two Tribulations Wuxian One Tribulation Wuxian Plus one Tribulation Wuxian Plus One Tribulation Wuxian Plus Realm of Sunshine The Infinite Heart Sutra, 10,000 Laws into One, Unnamed One Key Practice Function, One Key Martial Arts Function, Clone Dispatch Function, One Key Treasure Hunt Function, One Key Alchemy Function, One Key Mixer Function, One Key Refining Array Function, One Key Synthesis Function, One Key Initiation Function, one key decomposition function. In the realm of the Nine Star Martial Sage, across the sky, has it reached the attack realm of the Second Tribulation Wuxian. The corners of Solang's mouth raised slightly, quite satisfied. The gap between Wusheng and Wuxian is really too big. On the Kanglin continent, from ancient times to the present, it is estimated that no one can have the real combat power of the Wuxian level at the Wushan level even those Tianjiao who have only shocked the ages. Next, first choose six exercises to practice. This time, I don't see whether the exercise is strong or not, but whether it can make me understand the new rules. Solang whispered, and immediately selected a holy level technique from the storage space. At this time, Solang possessed a large number of holy level exercises, and the combined number of natural exercises and combined success methods reached about 500. Among them, there are many new techniques from the Kalchikam tribe. Solang's gaze first fell on these newly acquired techniques. The first is a fairy level exercise method, called Tian's Looming Immortal Jew, which is a relatively low level fairy level exercise method. Although low level, it is a fairy level exercise method after all and it is a natural exercise method, which can be used as a material for synthesizing low-level exercise methods, which is very precious. In addition to this immortal level exercise method, there are a total of 50 natural saint level exercise methods. From these exercises, So Lang found several holy level exercises he needed. The first book, titled The Forbidden Book of Bliss in the Sky, is a rare space-based exercise technique a type that Solang urgently needs. The second book, titled Sacred Jew of Illusion Yang Aspires the Ding, is a special Yang attribute rule that interacts with the Yin attribute. The third book, titled Ming Yuan Tianji True Method, is a mysterious and mysterious technique of the fate attribute, which is very rare. The fourth book, titled Sacred Scroll of Dai Luo Mountain and Sea, is the main rule of heaven and earth the attribute of gravity, which can be regarded as one of the basic structural rules. The fifth book, titled The True Book of the Dead and Cold Years, can make Solang comprehend the mysterious and mysterious rules of death. Except for this, 
I didn't find any special attributes. Most of the remaining exercises are derived from the main attribute, allowing Solang to comprehend the derived rules. Derivative rules are of course also very important. Each additional one will make the inner boundary more perfect. The first five books are all main attributes. The sixth book, please choose one at random. Solang turned his eyes and chose a rock system exercise method, one of the main derived attributes of the earth system. System, immediately place these six exercises. Ding! The exercise is successfully placed, and it has started to practice automatically. The system prompt came. The six martial arts villains in the mysterious black space immediately moved. After completing these exercises, you can continue to comprehend the rules. Solang muttered silently, a glimmer of expectation flashed in his eyes. Soon. He moved his body, replaced it with a clone, and came to the holy nest of the Bayou clan. As soon as he appeared, Li Xianyang immediately felt something and came to see him. Of course, Bai Yulin and the others also immediately followed, for fear that they were a step slower. In addition to them, there are the main members of the Nine Saints and the Kalchikam. Because Li Xianyang knew that Solang would definitely summon these people, so he simply left them behind. Servants wait to see the Lord. Headed by Li Xianyang, a group of quasi-celestial martial sages knelt on the ground, their heads crushed in black. These are all strong men standing on the upper level of the Kanglin Continent Pyramid, but they are as humble as a bug. The quasi-celestial warriors of the Kalchikam and the Nine Great Sages tremble, for fear that they will make a little mistake and cause dissatisfaction with the new master. Therefore, not only did they dare not even look at Solang, but they did not even dare to breathe. They were all tense as tight as a rubber band. Of course, they could still feel the fluctuations in the cultivation base of the Nine Star Martial Saint on Solang. I couldn't help but feel a little strange. The master I'm waiting for, the realm of cultivation is only Nine Star Martial Saint level? Could it be, what kind of person is the Lord? Is it the direct blood of the ancient immortal tribe, or simply the direct blood of the emperor tribe? Everyone thought in their hearts, and felt more and more that an extremely terrifying force was standing behind Solang. When they were frightened in their hearts, there was a contradiction in joy. The power of the Lord is strong, so of course they have a lot of benefits. All get up. Solang sat on the head and waved his hand faintly. Immediately after a glance, Solang's attribute panel of the strong men was called out, and everyone's information was immediately clear. You made the right choice. Solang said to the newly surrendered quasi martial sages, as long as I do things with my heart, I will ignore the predecessors and reuse your weight. Yes. Thank you Lord Longjin. The Lord is the master of virtue and virtue. The servants will do their best to do things for the Lord, even if they give their lives, they will not hesitate. The thirteen newly surrendered quasi-immortals took the other martial sages and bowed their heads one after another. Don't talk nonsense. I want to see your actions. Now, Hyun level immortal, you will lead the way. I'm going to see you Kiyoshui clan. Solang pointed a finger and hit a glamorous female quasi-fairy. Yes, Lord. Xian Juxian was flattered at once, suppressing his ecstasy, showing a charming smile, instantly showing a variety of amorous feelings. Seeing this scene, the other quasi-immortals were immediately envious. It is a great honor to be ignorant by the Lord, and the future is boundless. But they didn't even know that Solang was not interested in the appearance of Xian Lianxian, just because her cultivation base was the highest among the people. This Xian level immortal has almost half footed into the realm of Wuxian, and he is considered a talent. Let's go. Solang got up and said lightly. Yes. Everyone got up one after another, Li Xianyang and Xian Xiaoxian led the way, while the others followed behind. A large group of people surrounded Solang, passing through the teleportation array one by one, across the three saint race areas, and came to the territory of the Kiyoshui tribe. The territory of the Kalchikam tribe is very large, 
almost the total area of the ten holy tribes including the Bayu tribe. And the aura here is stronger and more abundant. Four cities stand, the strong are like clouds, and the overall strength is a realm higher than the saints. But Solang is not interested in this. He directly asked Hayashui Wuxian to join him to the headquarters of the Kalchikam tribe. The headquarters of the Kalchikam tribe is a huge lake named Kalchikam. This lake occupies a large area, and the edge is not visible at a glance, just like a sea. But Solang's spiritual power was so majestic, it instantly enveloped it. I saw Kyoxian Lake like a bright moon falling down on the ground, with autumn waves rippling and fairy aura overflowing. The headquarters building is built on the bottom of the lake, and it is white all over, and it is natural at first sight. It has to be said that although the Kalchikam clan is a Zinan clan, after two million years of accumulation and precipitation, the foundation is still much deeper than that of the holy clan. Solang stopped on the edge of Kyoxian Lake. Everyone behind him also stopped, bowed their heads, and dared not make noise. In the distance, a large number of martial artists of the Kalchikam tribe formed a guard of honor and formed a welcoming team, but they did not dare to move forward, and could only greet them silently with an uneasy mood. Solang was not interested in these people either, and directly began to observe the fairy formation. The fairy array of the Kalchikam tribe is the mist that evaporates around the lake. These mists condense the rules of the water system and some derived rules of the water system, and the defense is strong and endless. It also has the ability to counterattack in the dark, which can consume the body and soul of the enemy, erode its intelligence, and is extremely insidious. But this immortal formation was vulnerable to Sol Lang's eyes. Even if you don't need the ability to control the formation, you can get rid of it directly. Is this the three tribulations immortal array of your immortal clan? Sol Lang smiled and shook his head, it's, the flaws are continuous, you can break it with one finger. This statement came out. Xian Xiaoxian and the others were at a loss and were afraid to speak. Immediately afterwards, they saw Sol Lang stretch out a finger, and with a single tap, a group of terrifying force of rules condensed and fell into the formation. This is. It's a Wuxian level attack. And it's not just a Wuxian. The master seems to have only a nine-star martial sage in the realm of cultivation, but it is incredible to be able to perform a Wuxian level attack at will. Look. Under the Lord's attack, the fairy array started to collapse in an instant. Our immortal formation has gone through millions of years of perfection, and we think it has no flaws, but it has been found out by the Lord. One finger can break through the three tribulations immortal array, the master is also superb in the formation of the second generation of attainments, maybe the Baihu clan immortal array was refined by the master. Strong combat power and extraordinary formations. The lord I waited for must be the most talented genius for thousands of years. If there are no accidents, I will be the throne. When everyone was discussing, they saw that the immortal array collapsed under Sol Lang's fingers, and finally vanished into ashes. This scene directly saw the Guard of Honor warriors in the distance dumbfounded. A good fairy formation, which has been standing in Kiashixian Lake for millions of years, was broken by a finger of the new master. God, what a powerful lord this is! Some warriors could not help kneeling on the ground, buckling their heads frantically. At this time, Solang stretched out his hand, and a large amount of material was taken out from the Kalchikam Lake and fell into his hands. When Solang destroyed the formation, he deliberately did not destroy these formation materials, otherwise it would be too wasteful. Most of these immortal array materials are immortal. It can be said that most of the accumulation of two million years of the Kalchikam tribe has been used in this fairy formation. Therefore, Solang has gained a lot. However, after seeing Solang destroying the immortal formation, the Xiu Xiaoxian and others of the Kaihushan tribe directly collected the materials and sighed in their hearts. The formation of the immortal clan's two million years of accumulation only at night, is that just destroyed? After the Kiyoshui tribe, is there no fairy formation for protection? After all, he was forced to surrender, and he was not treated by the Lord. 
the Kalchikam and others were a little depressed. But at this moment, Solang suddenly waved his hand, and an overwhelming array landed from the sky, directly covering the entire Kiashixian lake. This formation is gleaming, with faintly inky colors, sometimes turning into illusory mist, sometimes condensing into a silky thin barrier. This immortal formation, called the Phantom Sky Lingbo United Immortal Formation, on the basis of its original defensive power, illusion concealment and concealment capabilities, and counter-attack capabilities have reached a very terrifying level. Even if a martial immortal of the Four Tribulations came, he would be trapped in it. If it were the Wuxian of the Five Tribulations, it would not be able to break free gradually, but it would not be possible to break the formation at all, unless some powerful external force was used. After seeing the Three Tribulations immortal array of the Kaihushan clan, So Lang immediately grasped it, and merged with the former and Kang Kong Phantasmal Immortal Array to create this more powerful Five Tribulations Immortal Array. The original two Three Tribulations Immortal Array could not become a Five Tribulations Immortal Array no matter how they were made. But Sol Lang's formation skills had reached the supreme level. The Three Tribulations Immortal Array of the Kaihushan Clan is a combined formation of five celestial formations and a large number of quasi-celestial formations. Therefore, after Sol Lang perfected the flaws in these formations, he used each immortal formation as the skeleton, using the quasi-immortal formation and the powerful holy formation as flesh and blood, to construct this powerful five tribulations immortal formation. This is. The fairy formation is a stronger fairy formation. Oh my god, I have seen this kind of heavy aura and vision in ancient books. I'm afraid this immortal formation already possesses the defensive ability of the Five Tribulations Martial Immortal. The Lord demolished our immortal formation, and then gave us a Five Tribulations Immortal Formation. From the beginning to the end, the Lord is rewarding us, not beating. The new master I'm waiting for, really don't care about the predecessors, the master, the master, I will kill the stubborn people in the clan and take refuge in the master. This is the most correct choice. The Lord has set up a Five Tribulations Immortal Array in an instant. On his surface, the cultivation base of the Nine Star Martial Saint is afraid of false appearances, and the Lord is at least an ancient immortal level power. Even if it is powerful, you can't set up an immortal formation in an instant, no, even an emperor level array mage can't do it. What is the identity of the Lord? It's really mysterious. When the Chu Xian clan and others were in ecstasy, they were shocked by So Lang's formation skills, which caused a flurry of thoughts and brain supplements. This Five Tribulations Immortal Array can keep your Kalchikam tribe safe. So Lang said lightly, I hope you don't let me down. Thank the Lord for the generous gift. The warriors of the Kalchikam clan kowtowed one after another, doing their best to show their loyalty. The other nine saints were envious even their eyes were red. Five Tribulations Immortal Formation A powerful formation that can only be possessed by the real ancient immortals. The Kalchikam tribe has actually received such a great reward. This Kalchikam lake is indeed in a good environment. From now on, the martial sages of the Ten Saints can freely enter and exit the fairy formations to come and practice. Furthermore, the Nine Saints can build residences in it. In times of trouble, this is a shelter for everyone. So Lang said, Li Xian Yang, next you send someone to build a teleportation array, and you must connect most of the cities of all the saints. Servant. Li Xian Yang immediately knelt down and took his orders. The quasi sage martial arts of the nine saints were excited. This five tribulations immortal array is not just for the Kalchikam. It is common. Although the fairy formations are here, they are basically common to all races. One more thing. Establish an exchange system in this fairy formation. So Lang continued, you do this, by Yulin, and I will be rewarded after it is done. You will not shame your life. By Yulin knelt immediately, the joy on his face could not be concealed. He knew that once the Lord gave a reward, it would at least be a quasi elixir of perfect quality. Hyun level immortal. Solang gave a soft drink. Slave. 
Xuan Xiaopingxian came to Solang in surprise, and slowly knelt down, a pair of brackets trembling slightly, causing ripples. Solang didn't even look at it, I'm going to refine a fairy artifact recently. You go down to collect materials, down to the king rank, and up to the immortal rank. You need them all. The larger the quantity, the better. But you must remember, don't make all races mourn, otherwise I will not forgive you. Nine saints, and a Kalchikam, with a vast area and countless creatures, they will surely be able to scavenge a lot of materials. Although most of them are low-level materials, Solang has a synthesis function, which can synthesize high-level materials in a unified manner. 100 god-level materials can be used to synthesize a lowest-level fairy-level material, which is simply beautiful. Yes, Lord. If the servant can't do it, I will apologize with death. Xian Xiaopingxian bowed his head and solemnly accepted the task. It is also necessary to collect a large amount of materials without making a wailing voice. This requires everyone to voluntarily hand over their wealth, which is a huge problem. But Xian Xianxian had no choice. This was the first order and request that Solang issued to them, and it was an order issued after the Five Tribulations Immortal Array was granted. If they can't handle it well, they will end up miserably. Of course, they also know that if it is done well, there will definitely be benefits. At the same time, everyone got a new message from Solang, that is, the Lord can make immortal artifacts. Immortal refining skills, another terrifying ability. Everyone couldn't help but admire and convince them more. Come here. At this time, Solang ordered another quasi fairy of the Kalchikam tribe. This quasi immortal is known as Duai's, and it is the strongest quasi immortal except for the level of Xian. Servant knock on the Lord. Zhengxian Duai's came to Solang's side, knelt down cautiously and kowtow, for fear that any wrong move might arouse Solang's dissatisfaction. Solang said faintly, all the maps and forces around the Qiashui area will be sorted out, and the map will be handed to me. Servant obey orders. Duai's Zhengxian immediately knocked on the leader's order. In fact, there is already a map that Solang wanted among the Kalchikam tribe, but Zhengxian Duai's believes that the map is not accurate anymore. In order to perfectly complete the task assigned by Solang, Duai's Zhengxian intends to personally lead people to explore and draw the latest, most complete, and accurate map. Ning Yuan Quasi Immortal Solang spoke lightly again. Here. Ning Yu and Zhengxian immediately stepped forward to kneel, trembling, respectful. You go to gather all the Quasi Sages and Pinnacle Martial Gods of the Ten Races, such as Qiashui, Beizan, and the next time I come again, I hope you won't miss one. Solang's indifferent voice fell into Ning Yu and Zhengxian's ears, making his heart tense. Please rest assured, the servant must complete the order. Ning Yu and Wuxian also knocked on the leader's orders. He secretly said in his heart that all quasi sages and pinnacle martial arts must be called together. Even those high ranking warlords must be summoned and cost a price to make them break through to the peak martial god, so as not to suddenly break through to the peak martial after the summoning is completed, isn't he bad? Simultaneously, the rest of the quasi immortals and martial sages heard this order from Solang and couldn't help but feel a little nervous. Especially the people of the Kalchikam tribe, their martial immortal has a history of using martial arts. But everyone didn't dare to speculate about Solang secretly, so they could only wait for the opportunity to inquire about the members of the Baihu tribe. Thinking like this, someone couldn't help but look at Bai Yulin and the others, but they met the eyes of Bai Yulin and other martial sages. That look is like saying you are developed. The martial sages of Qiashui and other tribes were surprised, but their hearts were also relieved. They decided to find Bai Yulin and others to find out the news as soon as possible. Okay, I'll go away. Solang waved his hand, threw a large number of formation keys to Li Xian Yang, and immediately disappeared from the spot. And this trick inevitably made Hai Yuna leveling immortal and the others horrified. The methods used by the Lord when he leaves are completely invisible. What a terrifying move! 
regardless of what Hayashi Wuxian and others think. Solang directly returned to the Sea of Sky. Recently, he has been vigilant against the counterattack of Tuantian Lu, so he definitely will not stay outside for a long time. After returning to the Sea of Sky, Solang immediately began to improve the formation of the Sky Sea. After some operation, the formation of the Sea of Sky has been updated iteratively and has become the Five Tribulations Immortal Formation. This layer of immortal formation was built on the body of the Sea of Sky, integrated with this immortal artifact, and almost pushed its defense force to the peak of the Five Tribulations Martial Immortal. At this level, even the Six Tribulations Martial Immortal could hold back a long time. After improving the formation of the Sky Sea, so Lang thought about it and returned to the space-time crack between the Wind Spirit Race and the Blue Star. Changes with each passing day. The big city here has now become another larger and more refined main city. As for the original Fengling Clan main city, it was completely reduced to a secondary city. People come and go in the city, and the Fengling and Terran warriors live in a harmonious atmosphere. In addition, the average strength of these warriors has improved a lot and they have gained a lot of benefits from the exchange system. Solang didn't have the mind to play the world, and with a big wave of his hand, in the horrified eyes of countless people, he replaced the formation with the Magic Sky Lingbo United Immortal Formation. With this formation, there is basically no need to worry about the cracks in time and space. After all, no Wuxian from the Six Tribulations would go to this poor country to wander around boringly. The emergence of the new formation method has caused an uproar in the new main city, but this naturally has the warriors below to calm down. Solang directly entered Blue Star through the time-space crack. At this time, Solang of the Nine Star Martial Saint level stepped onto the land of Blue Star, and suddenly felt the power of rules that were extremely prominent. The power of these rules manifests from the void from time to time, and it is easy to feel and comprehend. Solang felt a lot of rules that he hadn't understood at the time. Of course, most of these rules were derived from the main rules. Unfortunately, if I want to comprehend these techniques now, I need to comprehend them from scratch just like ordinary martial artists. I cannot use convenient system functions unless I practice the related techniques. Solang shook his head regretfully, then smiled again. I don't know what benefits I can get after I get out the inner boundary and put the blue star in. By the way, there are also planets such as Mars and Venus. Even the Sun. Thinking of this, Solang couldn't help but feel a glimmer of anticipation in his heart. In the inner boundary of the ordinary Wuxian, all the ordinary mountains and rivers on the Kanglin continent were absorbed. The blue star and other planets are part of the core of the infinite realm. The level is different. With a slight smile, Solang descended on the small island in the sea. At this time, Chu Xiaobei was taking Ji Rukzhu and Murong Xianxian to practice here. She wants to understand the rules, and Ji Rukzhu and Murong Xianxian need to refine the space guide from Wuxian. Solang spread out his majestic spirit and carefully observed the three women, and found that they were still in retreat. However, Looking at Rukzhu and Xiangxian's breath and fluctuations, they should soon be able to break through to the level of the of war. After they break through, using the cultivation base empowerment can directly promote their cultivation base to the Quasi Sage. By then, the two sisters were initially able to protect themselves. Looking at Chu Xiaobe again, her beautiful eyes are closed, her eyelashes are slender, and her body is full of tranquility, like a jade fairy. Sister to become the emperor, come on. Solang smiled faintly, then cast his gaze on the tens of thousands of warriors. Since the last time Solang took away two hundred martial sages, a long time has passed by this time. Therefore, a large number of martial arts have emerged from these tens of thousands. The number of Wusheng has reached two thousand people. In addition, all have broken through to the Quasi Sage level and none of the peak martial gods has been seen. No way, So Lang's pill is too powerful. It is a quasi elixir of perfect quality, a holy pill, and it will be infinitely useful after digesting one. All martial sages, 
come up to see me. With a thought, So Lang accurately informed every new martial artist with spiritual power, and the rest of the people who were in retreat were not disturbed. The Lord is calling me. I finally lived up to the master's expectations and broke through the martial sage level. This is the time when the master is serving. Everything I have is bestowed by the Lord, and I must be a useful person to the Lord. A martial sage opened his eyes, revealing extremely enthusiastic gazes. Immediately, more than 2,000 new martial arts sages jumped into the air and flew in the direction of Solang's existence. In a blink of an eye, a figure appeared in the air, forming a dense black spot. Not long. Two thousand war gods knelt in front of Solang. Servant wait, see the Lord. The martial sages all spoke in unison, with extremely enthusiastic emotions. However, although their voices were loud, they did not spread out. Because Solang was around, they did not disturb the rest. Get up all. Solang looked down at the crowd and waved his hand faintly. All the martial sages thanked them and then slowly stood up. Break through Wu Sheng, very good. But you have to know that Wu Sheng is just the beginning. I hope you can continue to work hard in the future, and even become Wu Yuxian. And for now, I will give you some rewards to inspire you. So Lang's expression was indifferent, I will give you a chance now to refine the holy rank weapons for you personally, bring your materials, and come up. Gifted to the sage soldiers, the previous batch of new martial sages received this benefit. These latecomers can naturally also be obtained, otherwise they will be biased. Moreover, refining the saint weapon for everyone does not require Solang to produce the materials himself, and can even make a fortune from it. The Lord wants to refine the holy soldiers for me. Heaven, the Lord not only grants us the opportunity to become holy, but even refines weapons for us. Such a good master is definitely the first master of the ages, there is no master higher than Master Su in this world. The noble body of the Lord, but personally refines the holy soldiers for me, such a great kindness, I can only use my life to return. The new martial arts sages learned that Sol Lang would personally refine the sage soldiers for themselves, and their eyes were filled with excitement. Regarding this, Sol Lang just smiled faintly and did not speak. Soon, one of the most prestigious martial sages stepped forward boldly, came to the front, and knelt at the feet of Solang. Servant, Bai Uhi, see the Lord. This martial saint trembled slightly, his eyes burning, like a pilgrimage. Solang smiled kindly, you can tell what kind of weapon you want, and then give me the materials. Thank you Lord for your kindness. The servant wants a long thin blade for the rank, as long as it is a holy artifact. While talking, Bai Uhi took out all his belongings. He also didn't know how much material was needed to refine such a holy artifact, so he simply took out all his wealth. Haha, <laughs> not so much. So Lang smiled lightly, took a part of the material and directly refined it into a high-level sacred artifact. As a result, this part of the ingested material was not used up. The material reduction ability is simply too easy to use, it is a good function for saving money at home. This is the long-handled thin-bladed sacrificial artifact you want, take it. So Lang casually threw the refined high-level sacred artifacts to Bai Uhi, just like something trivial. Bai Uhi received the sacred artifact, thanking him for his many graces, and was extremely enthusiastic. Immediately afterwards, Bai Uhi retreated and the new martial saints from behind stepped forward. Solang refining weapons was very fast, he could refine a sacred weapon in an instant, and his time was completely consumed in communicating with the martial sages. After a few breaths, Solang was able to refine a sacred artifact. After refining the sacred artifacts of more than 2,000 people, it only took about an hour. The martial sages who had obtained the sacred artifacts were in high spirits, loyal, and almost turned into Solang's dead men on the spot. Just need loyal people. More than 2,000 people, are one of the future masters of superhumanoid weapons. A deep light flashed in Solang's eyes, 
and immediately afterwards, he led these martial sages to leave the Blue Star and return to the Sea of Sky. There are more than 2,000 martial sages, Yeokai, Chiri Tianyun, and Baihu clan. This return has caused another boiling. In just a few days, there were hundreds of martial sages in each race at once, which is simply shocking. Countless people looked up at Solang's figure and worshipped with excitement. Everyone enters the Sea of Sky to guard. Solang issued an order and immediately turned and disappeared. More than 2,000 martial sages were ordered to join the Sea of Sky. The Sea of Sky is made up of more than 3,000 parts. At this time, four-fifths of the parts are guarded by Wu Sheng. So many martial sages not only uplifted the defensive ability of the Sky Sea, but also made it tougher. Under the hand of Wuxian Six Tribulations, you can resist even longer. This force filled the four clans with self-confidence, and made the Kalchikam tribe and the messengers who had newly joined the Saint clans dumbfounded. These messengers were all sent by Bai Yulin and Li Xian Yang. Before coming here, I saw Solang leading the 2,000 martial sages to return. They had never seen such a spectacular scene. You know, even the Kalchikam tribe plus all the martial sages of the nine tribes, the number has only reached more than 200. More than 2,000. It's unimaginable. And, judging from the fluctuations in these martial sages, they are all newly promoted martial sages. Reminiscent of the order issued by Solang to gather all the peak martial gods and quasi sages of the Kalchikam tribe and the nine great sages, you can guess Solang's purpose at once. This is to make those younger generations, like the 2,000 people, promoted to martial saint. The warriors of the tribes were instantly excited. This is a real chance. Therefore, they quickly contacted their clan, so that the clan must not disobey the order, and take the initiative to hand over the Quasi Sage and the Pinnacle Warrior. Not only that, but also in a short period of time to use the treasures of heaven, material, and earth, to crazily spawn the Pinnacle of War, so that they can get the opportunity to be promoted to the martial arts. News came back one by one and immediately caused an uproar among the senior leaders of all ethnic groups, and the waves were raging. Before I waited, I was worried that the Lord would use these quasi-sages and the pinnacle martial gods to do crooked ways. I waited, it's ridiculous. Yeah, everything is good for the Lord. We can get such a huge opportunity without giving anything, but we don't understand in our hearts, but instead question the Lord, what a damn. Master Su is the world's first master. From now on, the master's command will be my life. Let's pass the order down, shape the Lord with a golden body, worship every day. The ten races newly joined by Solang completely cast aside their doubts and became loyal fans like the Baihu tribe. Immediately afterwards, the major races did their best to cultivate the pinnacle of war and quasi sage. One by one, Geniuses beheaded their heads and showed up, and they were promoted one after another, just like a baby waiting to be fed by Solang to receive them and bring them to be promoted to martial saint. And all of this is actually in the eyes of Solang. His treasure hunting flying flying gliders and clones are scattered all over the place, acting as eyes. Naturally, the Kalchikam and the Nine Saints will not miss them. It seems that this group of new subordinates is not bad and can be cultivated vigorously. Solang nodded silently, and then continued to refine the parts of the superhumanoid weapon. In an instant, the night passed. Dawn comes. At the same time, there was Duai's Zungzian. Guru. This is a fairy tool, the Lord lives in the fairy palace. Wuxian Duai's came to the Sea of Sky, looked at the fairy palace standing in the clouds and couldn't help swallowing his saliva. Then, he walked carefully to the fairy palace, holding a crystal clear jade slip in his hand. After receiving Solang's order yesterday, he immediately used the power of the entire Kalchikam and even the Nine Saints to survey and map new maps, power distribution, and recent anecdotes. Ten races, at least hundreds of millions of warriors participated in this mission. Among them are Duai's Zungzian and many martial sages, with a vast spiritual coverage and extremely fast footwork. Therefore, 
do Eyes Zhengxian can survey and map a new map in such a short period of time? Servant, do Eyes, please see the Lord. When Du Eyes Zhengxian came outside the fairy palace, he dared not take a step, fearing offense, so he could only tremblingly ask to see him. So Lang's figure did not appear, instead a crystal bun appeared. This crystal bun is the spirit of the fairy palace. Xian Gong Chi Ling is very quiet, but it seems to be smarter than Xiao Pao Xiao Hai. At this time, after some time, it has learned a lot of languages, and it has been able to achieve initial communication. Of course, it is far worse than Xiaowu. The master let you in. Xian Gong Chi Ling looked at Duiz Zhengxian and said softly, You are not familiar with it, I will take you there. Yes. Zhengxian Duiz bowed deeply at the crystal bun, and then carefully followed the fairy palace spirit to outside the room where Sol Lang was. The master is inside. The immortal palace tool said, wait first. With that said, the spirit of the fairy palace tool disappeared. Zhengxian Duiz stood there, trembling, not daring to move. About a few minutes later, the door opened. Zhengxian Duiz looked up, and suddenly saw countless treasures. I saw the Lord sitting in the room, with a huge cauldron in front of him, and pieces of immortal artifacts lying on the ground like debris exuding horrible waves. This, this is, fairy. The cauldron is a fairy artifact, and the ground around the Lord is also a fairy artifact. Duai's Kuei Saixian thunderously thundered, shaking his whole body, he felt that his worldview was about to be subverted. Immortal Weapon It took the Kalchikam tribe two million years to refine the two lowest level fairy artifacts with evil methods. But on the Lord's side, it was thrown around like debris. Are fairy artifacts so cheap? Duai Zhengxian almost doubted whether this world was fake. What are you doing? So Lang's faint words came, come in. Yes yes. Zhengxian Duai came back to his senses and entered the room with an unconcealable shock. After entering the room, Zhengxian Duai could feel the breath of those fairy artifacts on the ground more and more. It's nothing more than the lowest level fairy artifacts, nothing to look at. You came to me, you should have completed the task I told you, what about the map? So Lang waved his hand and put hundreds of fairy artifact parts on the ground into the storage space. The map is here. Zhengxian Duiz bowed humbly, knelt on the ground, and offered a map jade slip with both hands. With a thought. So Lang picked up the jade slips with mental power and directly began to read them. Suddenly, a vast world appeared in front of So Lang. This is not a traditional map, but a 3D, sandbox-like miniature world. The mountains and rivers above, Kyoho Lake, and even some special plants and animals are displayed. At a glance, it was like a overlooking a small world. The elixir of three tribulations is still spiritual. This kind of pill, even their previous martial arts, have not eaten it. Don't make a fuss. So Lang's expression was indifferent, by the way, this regular fairy crystal is also given to you, it should be very suitable for you. After speaking, he gave a regular fairy crystal to Duai Zhengxian. Rule Fairy Crystal Duai Zhengxian caught the rule Xianjing with a dull face, and didn't know what to say. Rules Fairy Crystal it must be when Wuxian is facing sitting, he condenses by himself, and his power is extremely low. Even dozens of martial immortals may not be able to condense a regular immortal crystal. What a rare baby this is. I just surrendered, the Lord actually rewarded me with a regular fairy crystal. Zhengxian Duiz was moved. This was the most precious treasure he had obtained in his nearly million year life. Isn't it? The rule fairy crystal basically represents the road to becoming a fairy, as long as you are willing to spend energy to refine and understand, there is a high probability that you can become a fairy. And Duai Zhengxian could feel that this regular immortal crystal in his hand is very suitable for him, almost tailored for him. This is even more valuable. Its value is simply incalculable. Master. Zhengxian Duai's voice trembled not knowing how to thank Solang for his generous gift. Get out! 
So Lang waved his hand faintly, I hope that when I see you next time, you can break through to the level of martial immortal. Yes, Lord. Duai Zengzian's voice was sonorous and powerful. He understood that in front of the immortal soul pill and rule immortal crystal, any words of gratitude were pale. Only action can prove your loyalty and determination. Immediately, Duai Zengzian left the fairy palace with the pill and rule immortal crystal. He didn't know that the rule immortal crystal in his hand was actually Dingbo Wuxian. Because the main cultivation technique and the immortal level cultivation technique and various holy level cultivation techniques are almost the same, the rule immortal crystal is very suitable for Duai Zengzian. However, even if So Lang told Zengzian Duai's the truth, he probably wouldn't believe it. Because the conditions for the appearance of the rule fairy crystal are too harsh, and Dingbo Wuxian was killed, how can it leave the rule fairy crystal? And So Lang gave him this regular immortal crystal, and it was regarded as a certain kind of thing returned to the original owner, and the real reward was the bottle of immortal soul pill. It feels really good to have another loyal brother. There was a smile at the corner of So Lang's mouth, and he felt the worship and fanaticism from the souls in the sea of knowledge all the time. It was really refreshing. Soon. So Lang continued to refine parts of superhumanoid weapons. Cultivation and construction are in full swing in various places. On the Blue Star, there are still nearly 10,000 warriors trying to break through the martial arts. Chu Xiaobei and Ryu Xuexianxian are also working hard to cultivate. Bai Yulin led a large number of people to build an exchange system in Kaioxian Lake. Xian Xiaobingxian summoned the Quasi Sage and the Pinnacle Warrior from all around, and did his best to complete So Lang's order. In addition, the Kalchikam tribe and other tribes have made great efforts in civil engineering and built teleportation formations everywhere, closely linking the huge territories. In such an orderly development, So Lang's clone flew all the way, caught the teleportation array, and finally reached the periphery of the Emperor's Forbidden Land, the Emperor's Death Realm. Perception Sharing So Lang used the system function to receive the perception of the clone. With one mind and two purposes, he refines the parts of the superhumanoid weapon while making the clone expand its mental power and explore the surrounding environment. As the outer area of the Emperor's Forbidden Area, the Emperor's Death Domain is really too huge. Even with the terrifying mental power of So Lang's Avatar Ziri level, enough to cover a radius of billions of miles, only the tip of the iceberg can be detected. In the dead zone of the Emperor, there are no plants, the ground is dark and dry, and it turns into gravel with a light step. The sky is dark, the sun and the moon are not light, but there is no dark cloud covering it, which seems to be some kind of regular phenomenon. So Lang saw some strange creatures. These creatures resemble human figures, with rough and thick skin, red eyes, and a height of 10 meters, just like little giants. They are jumping and running, fighting, and multiplying on the earth, but they have no wisdom, only instinct. These creatures are generally very powerful, and the number is not small. Their average level has reached the three-star martial arts level. There are also many monsters of the Great Sage level, and a few Quasi Xiang level creatures sometimes exude aura, which are noticed by So Lang's clone. The fairy level monster So Lang hasn't found it yet, but since Dingbo Wuxian and Huanya Wuxian can't go deep, there should be monsters who want to come to the fairy level. These creatures are weird. So Lang frowned slightly, it always feels like, man-made. With a hint of doubt, So Lang controlled this clone and grabbed a monster of the Great Sage level. With So Lang's combat power at this time, using only the basic ability of Spirit Imperial Item, can make a Great Sage unable to resist. Dragging this Great Sage level humanoid monster closer, So Lang carefully observed it. Ho ho ho! The humanoid monster roared with fine fangs in its mouth. This tooth is a good refining material. So Lang smiled dumbly, continued to observe, and then found a lot of disharmony. This humanoid monster seems to be pieced together by many kinds of creatures. This is, a creative creature in a sense. Wu Xian has an inner world. When he is promoted to Emperor Wu, 
he will be ascended into the universe of life, which can breed life in the inner world and form a world. To some extent, to achieve the emperor rank is to achieve the creation god. These creatures are very powerful and they are created creatures. I'm afraid they are the creatures created by Emperor Woody of rank 9. But why do I always feel that these creatures are so crude? They are not refined at all. If it were me, I would definitely start the creation of creatures from the genetic level, instead of using secret techniques to cast the limbs of various creatures together. This approach is too fishy. However, Kanglin Continent is a pure martial arts civilization, without the concept of genes, and spiritual power cannot observe the existence of molecular levels such as genes. It is understandable when such a situation occurs. Solang thought silently, and immediately squeezed the great sage level monster in his hand. The poor Emperor Woody had never expected that after more than 10 million years of death, he would be despised by others. After squeezing the monster, so Lang shook his hand in disgust and continued to move deeper. Before long, So Lang flew billions of miles. A group of warriors appeared within the range covered by the spiritual power. To be precise, it should be two groups. Because they are divided into two sides, they are very clear, and each is on guard. The cultivation base of these people is not low, there are five quasi-immortals on each side. Besides there are 15 great saint-level warriors. Moreover, everyone is flying, not fast, and seems to be observing and monitoring something during the action. At the same time, the two parties seem to be cooperating, constantly detecting their surroundings to prevent anyone from prying eyes. These guys should be the ones mentioned by Duai Zhengzian. I don't know what they are doing. So Lang pondered silently, and suddenly his expression moved and he discovered that when the monsters encountered these warriors, they turned a blind eye. Interesting. So Lang's thoughts turned, his body gradually became transparent, and finally his breath disappeared completely. Just when So Lang detected the strange relationship between the two teams through the perception of the clone. In the middle of the Kanglin continent, Li Tianlu was still fighting for the key with the immortal clan of Emperor Zun. I saw a bizarre jade with brilliant red light hovering above the sky, and two huge illusory arms each held a corner, struggling to compete. Two illusory giant arms, one black and white, exuded a terrifying fairy-level atmosphere, and even a hint of suppressing the world. These two illusory giant arms are the terrifying supernatural powers displayed by the poster of the Lanshan Tower, Emperor Lanshan Zun and the Patriarch of the Immortal Clan Mu Vi Zun. At this time, the two powerful quasi emperors did not fight, but sat on opposite sides of a table, drinking tea and chatting with a smile. Everything looks like an old friend recounting the past. But under them, there are a large number of Wuxian, Zhengxian, and Wushan fighting frantically. The power of the rules is falling, manifesting all kinds of anomalies. From time to time, there is the fall of Wusheng, and the blood spills into the sky. The quasi immortal roared bitterly like a madman, and kept fighting. The Wuxians found their opponents accurately and kept blasting, and from time to time people were seriously injured. This is an extremely battle. The Great Sage level is the lowest threshold for participation. You must know that the Great Sage rank is already the superior combat power of Kanglin Continent, but there are countless casualties here, and it is extremely cheap. Suddenly, Emperor Lientian said, Wuxianzi, if this continues, both of us will suffer heavy losses. Haha, <laughs> when they can't tell the victory or defeat, it's the time when the two of us really do it. Wuxianzi smiled faintly, at that time, you and I will not be able to care about those who secretly covet. At that time, you and I are afraid that there will be a high probability that the snipe and the clam will fight for the fisherman's profit and kill the sky. Are you really going to let that situation happen? Otherwise? What can I do? But I believe that my subordinates will not fail. The Lord Slaughter Sky was indifferent, each of them was killed out of the sea of blood in the Corpse Mountain, but you are not the one who has the honor and the superiority of the immortal clan. Are you a patronizing and superior person, don't you know? At present, it seems that you and I are equally matched, 
but in fact, you are already weak. Wuquazi smiled, if you have tried your best now, it's better to give me the key. If you give me the key, I won't let you suffer. A Nine Tribulations Immortal Artifact is infinitely close to the Quasi Emperor's Soldier, how? The Nine Tribulations Immortal Weapon that is close to the Quasi Emperor's Soldier is indeed tempting. Unfortunately, how can an immortal tool be compared with the inheritance of Emperor Wudi of Rank 9? That is an opportunity for Emperor Cheng. Wuyukianzi, you want me to withdraw from the competition, it's completely idiotic. Besides, I haven't done my best yet in Slaughter Tower. There was a slight sneer on the face of Zunchen Zundi, and his sharp eyes kept looking at Wuyukianzi. But in his heart, he was very anxious because he knew that his slaughter tower would no longer have helpers. On the scabbard of slaughter the sky, the souls belonging to Duanqing Wuxian and others have disappeared, which means that they are dead. The five martial arts who stayed behind at the headquarters, and even the souls of more than 200 great saints and Quasician level martial artists, all disappeared. At this time, at the headquarters of Tuan Tian Tower, as long as a few weak warriors like ants, how can they talk about support? Damn it, who on earth dare to kill the martial immortal who killed me? When things are done here, I will find you out, so that you will suffer all the torture, life is better than death, until the end of your life. For the murderer who killed Duanqing Wuxian and others, Tuan Tianlu was deeply hated. Although the five martial arts are not strong, they are only junior martial arts, but in the current battle, they are indeed extremely important bargaining chips. They were the last few logs that overwhelmed the elephant, but they died at this time. The result of this is that the balance of victory is gradually tilting towards the Wuquexian clan. The camp of Tuantianlu is about to lose. At that time, he can only take action personally to fight for the chance of becoming emperor. This requires a great risk, and may even fall. The difficult situation made the Emperor Zushin almost want to go crazy. Of course, Zunchen Zundi would not show a trace of clues. On the surface, it still looks like as Hizu in his hand, confident and confident. At the same time, the Emperor's death domain. Solang temporarily stopped refining the weapon, using the perfect possession to control the clone to hide, and gradually approached the two strange pairs of people. Solang's concealment methods are good, and his true combat power has reached the level of Wuxian. Therefore, even if the two groups of Quasi Immortals kept observing the surroundings, they couldn't find the existence of Solang at all. Look at their property panel. Solang hid in the dark, just followed behind everyone, and then called up all his attribute panels. Suddenly, everyone's information is clear. Okay. There are people from the Thousand Pupils. Moreover, the techniques he cultivated are very similar to the dead C.A.I. Liao. Besides, there are several other races of Zhengzian and Wushan who are exactly the same as Qian Zihao and others. They will not be the people of Tushinlu. While thinking about it, So Lang looked at the other group of people, only to find that all of them were Wu Vi. I'm afraid they are really from Slaughter Tower. The corner of Sol Lang's mouth raised slightly, and he smiled in his heart, I didn't expect that by such a coincidence, I would meet my old friend on a trip. I don't know what they are doing here, no one goes to my sea of sky to trouble me. I am such a hospitable person who has been waiting for you, but you have made me wait for the flowers to thank you. Fortunately, people who found you today, let me see what you are doing. Thinking in his heart, so Lang moved closer and closer to the two teams. The distance gets closer. So Lang suddenly felt that the void surrounded by the two pairs of people seemed to fluctuate in formation. An extremely hidden formation. Even I am about to hide it. These guys just keep moving with this formation? No wonder, even I can't find it easily. If they dare to leave for a while, they will definitely not find the formation. Solang murmured in his heart, and was about to control the formation immediately. But at this moment, there was a sudden roar in the distance. This roar is very terrifying, the sound seems to penetrate the world, 
it turned out to be the sound of a fairy level giant. Moreover, his roar turned out to be in the direction of Solang. Okay. Is this, discovered me. Solang was slightly surprised, it seems that the creature created by Emperor Wu is still a little capable. Simultaneously. The inexhaustible family flying ahead. A giant of the Wuxian level? A man. The giant? Why do people yell at us? Could it be that it found something we couldn't find? Is someone spying on us in secret? No way, people with ghosts secretly spying on such things, it might happen a few years ago. However, after we joined forces to suppress the Emperor Zushan Zunchen and Zun Wuyukui, and annihilated them, no one dared to watch. But that Wuxian level giant. Stop it, maybe it just happened to yell at this side. Just in case, let's explore the surroundings. It turns out that the creature created by Emperor Wu is called Giant. Human. Solang watched this group of people talk, and saw them take out a disc. Guanation Jian. Solang looked at the disc, the weapon recognition function was working, and he recognized it immediately. The so called Guanation Jian is a kind of strange exploration type treasure a big treasure at the level of immortality. Once this thing is activated, the observation ability is more terrifying than mental power, but it consumes a lot of money and cannot be opened frequently. Oh, you really are from Tushinlu. Tisk Tusk, I will be discovered now. Solang smiled blankly, but didn't make any movements. Because he is not afraid at all, these people are just quasi-sages, one punch, afraid of wool. At this time, the people from Tushinlu and Wuyukui clan worked together to urge Guanation Jian. I saw a layer of invisible and colorless waves emanating from the Guanation Jian, instantly sweeping across billions of miles. Its observation range is actually equal to the spiritual power of the sunshine level. Solang was also difficult to hide in this ripple, and was directly discovered. Someone. Someone is actually following us. Who is so bold that he dares to covet the entrance of the Emperor's Forbidden Land? People from the Tuantianlu and Wuyukui clan looked at Solang one after another, looking frightened. When they saw Solang clearly, the anger on their faces suddenly turned into disdain. This person turned out to be just a nine-star saint. I originally thought it was a Wuxian, but I didn't expect that it was just the great sage of the nine stars. Perhaps it was a weird method used to prevent our spiritual power from discovering him. The mere nine-star great sage, dare to come and spy on us, it's just looking for death. The quasi-immortals and the great sages looked at Solang contemptuously, as if looking at an ant. The entrance to the emperor's forbidden land. It turns out that this is what you have been guarding. If Solang didn't see the contempt of everyone, he would be interested in the entrance to the forbidden area. Smuggler, who are you? A quasi-immortal in the Tuan Tian Tower shouted angrily, immediately kneel and beg for mercy and tell the forces behind you, otherwise I will kill you now. Yes, knelt down, and kowtow. Otherwise I will let you great stick. A quasi-immortal of the Wuyukui clan took out a sacred artifact that looked like a stick and said arrogantly. Tisk tut. I haven't let you kneel, but did you let me kneel? Solang smiled disdainfully, and immediately his eyes condensed, and a fairy-level aura shrouded fiercely. In an instant, all the quasi-sage martial arts felt like the sky was falling, the whole person was overwhelmed with breath, and the spine gradually bends down. Thump thump! All the quasi zion Wu sages were directly pressed on the ground, unable to climb like mud. The gap between Wu Sheng and Wu Xian is too big. Just the power emanating from Solang, those quasi-immortals and martial sages couldn't bear it. He, he turned out to be a Wuxian. Damn, who are you and what forces are you sent here? Don't you know that the end of the shot against us is that the Slaughter Tower and the Wuxi immortal clan will act together to destroy the family and the clan? Do you know the Slaughter Tower? Do you know the Wuxian clan? We are all members of the Zun Emperor Organization. If you are acquainted, you will immediately let us go. Let us go, let us go immediately, 
and apologize. The entrance of the Emperor's Forbidden Land is flying far away. Let us go quickly, otherwise even if you don't kill us and lose the entrance, you will be tortured to death by the people above us. Don't think that you are a martial immortal, you can stand high, you are nothing in front of Emperor Zun. Everyone yelled violently, and their hearts were panic and worry. Tisk tut. Lai Hushin Lu, I naturally know. Diking, Hidden Kill, Figzu, Teng Tian, and Qian Zihao are all dead in my hands. You people who slaughtered the sky building have not shared the sky with me, and the hatred is as deep as the sea. I am still afraid of offending you? Really ridiculous. So Lang smiled faintly, if I meet you today, then you will definitely die. What? He actually said that he killed Duanqing and other Wuxian adults. What's the joke, although you are a martial immortal, but the aura on your body is far worse than that of an adult, how can you kill him? Quick mouth for a while? You will pay a terrible price for this. The quasi-celestial and martial sages of Tuantianlo had stormy waves in their hearts. Although they kept retorting and threatening verbally, the fear in their hearts almost reached the extreme. It turns out to be the enemy of Tushinlu. Senior, we are members of the immortal clan Muvi. We and the Slaughter Tower are hostile forces. Don't kill us. Yes, yes, you want to kill the people who kill the Tianlu, please don't kill us, and don't worry about the entrance of the Emperor's Forbidden Land, we will not trouble you. The warriors of Muvi Zianzu spoke one after another, with a hint of warning in their pleading leading Solang to sneer again and again. Sorry. For this emperor forbidden land, I am bound to win. So, you all have to die today, ha 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 ha. Solang laughed, raised a hand, murderous. But at this moment. Roar. A crazy roar came, and it was approaching quickly. Is it the Wuxian level giant that roared before? It seemed to feel the murderous aura on Solang think it was provoked, so it was furious. I still plan to kill these little things, and then kill you. I didn't expect you to come through the door so impatiently. So Lang raised his brows, and the corners of his mouth twitched slightly, revealing a slight smile. For this Wuxian level giant, So Lang originally planned to kill, because after killing, the soul of Wuxian will be available. And there are fairy level materials. Because when I killed that great saint level giant before, he obtained the soul of martial sage and some materials. Just when Solang whispered. That Wuxian level giant has already rushed to the front. The opportunity is here. When they fight, we will withdraw first. Maybe that young Wuxian is not a giant's opponent, he will be killed. It depends on the situation. Anyway. We have the amulet left by Emperor Wudi of rank 9 for future generations. That giant will not attack us. All the quasi-immortal martial sages secretly communicated, staying in place one by one to observe, and are ready to retreat at any time. But the scene that shocked their eyes appeared. I saw a long sword with a black pattern on a white background appeared in the young Wuxian's hand, and with a light wave, he directly divided the Wuxian level giant into two. Roar. The Wuxian level giant roared before death, and then died completely. Spike. Kill the Wuxian level with one sword. The warriors of Tuantianlu and Wuxi clan are completely sluggish. They originally wanted to see that young warrior be killed by that giant, but they never expected that a giant of martial arts level would be killed like this. So horrible. What realm is that young Wuxian? What kind of weapon is the long sword in his hand? Everyone was sluggish in thinking, and immediately the whole mind was filled with fear and despair. Escape. Without even thinking about it, this word appeared in everyone's mind. But, under Solang's hands, where can they escape? Cut. Solang waved his hand lightly and cut without fancy, a sword light containing the power of terrifying rules fell on everyone and cut them off. In an instant, these thirty-odd saints and quasi level warriors completely died. Ding! You get the soul of high-level martial sage one, the guide of space one, 
the intermediate sage soldier cuts the river and the mountains one, the top grade spiritual jade 925633, the high grade spiritual jade 5363682, the middle grade spiritual jade 4863684, the low grade spiritual jade asterisk 16895686, the materials for the holy refining. Ding! You get! After a sword, tens of millions of superb spirit jade were accounted for, besides a large number of high-level martial sage souls. A lot of gains. So Lang smiled, my superhumanoid weapon can add 36 celestial parts. At the same moment. In that terrifying battlefield of the Quasi Emperor organization, the faces of the confronting Quasi Emperor and Wuquazi suddenly changed greatly. The person guarding the entrance of the Emperor's Forbidden Land was killed. The two Quasi District Emperors even said in unison. Who is it? So bold. Isn't there not enough lessons for them? Wuqianzi was furious, and the terrifying Quasi Emperor's might was unintentionally distributed, and the people fighting underneath suddenly became sluggish. Armistice. Emperor Zushin sipped in a low voice, then waved his big hand tearing a terrifying space crack. At the same time, he was a little happy in his heart. Because of this sudden change, it relieved him. If it keeps on dragging on, his men will be defeated, and the worst situation will be shown to her. But at this time, if someone makes trouble, Wukongza will unite with him to fight against foreign enemies. Say it too late. The space cracks ripped apart. Xiao Lanshan and Li Filo held the Emperor's Forbidden Land key together and disappeared directly into the space crack. The Wuxian and Wushan who were fighting below reacted, and then quickly flew into the space channel, following the two Quasi Emperors. How fast the Quasi Emperor class moves! So Lang had just finished sorting out the spoils, suddenly if he felt something, he looked up and saw that the space crack had already formed. Oh! Someone came so soon. It should be these quasi Zion Wu saints who have been marked with spatial coordinates. Look at the aura in the cracks in the space, the person here is extraordinary and powerful, you have to take it seriously. While thinking, So Lang silently used the clone replacement, the deity descended. At this time, two figures walked out of the space crack at the same time. A person was covered in black robe his eyes were blood red, his long hair was cape, and there was a crack-like pattern on the center of his eyebrows, and his blood seemed to condense into some strange rules. The other person is handsome and handsome, full of immortality, but with a trace of deep indifference, with a perfect circle of energy suspended behind him. They were separated by dozens of feet, and there was a fiery red jade floating in the middle. At any moment, the two quasi emperors are fighting for the key. And the moment the two appeared, So Lang suddenly shrank his pupils and expanded his attribute panel. The first is the blood eyed man in the black robe. Xiao Lushan. Emperor Burning. Unparalleled. Zundi. Zundi Plus. Zundi Plus. Zundi Plus. Zundi Plus. Realm of Sunshine. Fenchen Zhu, Fenchen Emperor Jing, Burning Soul Gu Deng Zhu. Fen Tianju. This person turns out to be an unparalleled qualification. Furthermore, the race is named Emperor Fen, and it also masters the Emperor level technique. So Lang was stunned in his heart, looking noisy, it looks so scary. Look at the other person, named Li Filu, Wu Vi Clan, who is also a Quasi Emperor realm and a Quasi Emperor and rank combat power in all aspects. As for the exercise method that Li Filo mastered, the main exercise method is called Wukong Jing, and there is no emperor level exercise method, but a full six perfect level immortal level exercise methods. Tisk Tusk, Zundi. Big Brother. It seems that these two are the landlords of Tuan Tian Tower and the helm of Wukui clan. What is that thing among them, it seems to be the formation key. So Lang thought in his heart with a calm and calm appearance on the surface. At the same time, the two Quasi Emperors were also looking at So Lang. Nine Star Martial Saint. Xiao Lushan's eyes flickered, 
but the aura on his body has reached the immortal level, and my talent and fighting talent are even stronger than I was back then. Lee Filo said, there is an aura of a fairy level giant around him. He has been killed. It should be this young man who killed him. This person is really good. At this time. Among the space cracks in the sky, a statue of Zun Zhengxian and Wu Shang appeared, and they came to Xiao Lushan and Li Filo respectively. The number is increasing, and in the end there are dozens of martial immortals, thousands of quasi immortals and great saints. Among them, the Six Tribulations Martial Immortal and Zhu Xian who had estimated Sou Lang was also among them. However, although she had counted Sou Lang by special means, she had never seen Sou Lang's appearance, so she didn't know Sou Lang. This person killed the person who guarded the entrance to the Emperor's head. He is looking for death, and soon, he will be tortured and killed by Lord Slaughter. These quasi-immortals and martial sages looked at Sou Lang coldly, as if they were looking at a dead person. Everyone's reactions and thoughts were just a moment after they met. At this time, it was only a breath or two from the two sides meeting. You, killed my subordinate Zhengxian and Wushan. Xiao Lushan spoke, his voice indifferent, but he was rarely murderous. This shocked those quasi-immortals and martial sages. That young man is so offended, Master Tushan has no intention of killing? What exactly is going on? When everyone was discussing. So Lang smiled faintly, yes, I killed it. As soon as these words were made, Zhengxian and Wu Shang couldn't help looking at each other, and finally turned their eyes to the two Zun emperors Xiao Lushan and Li Filu, wanting to see how they would react. However, everyone felt that the two quasi emperors should be angry. Because the young man was so defiant, killing so many quasi-immortals and martial sages, he still looked indifferent. Those who kill me will have to pay a price. If it were an ordinary person, I would just pinch to death. Xiao Lushan said, but you are very good, are you willing to join me and accept my cultivation? As soon as Xiao Lushan's words fell, dozens of martial immortals and the quasi-immortal great sages behind him were stunned. At this moment, Everyone felt that their ears were broken and hallucinations appeared. I. Am I wrong? This young martial saint killed our man, and Lord Zundi still wants to recruit him. No, not just to solicit, but to cultivate him, just like collecting disciples. My God, Lord Zundi has never accepted a disciple before, and now he has moved to accept disciples. This child's combat power is indeed strong and only with the nine-star great sage level, it has reached the fairy level combat power. However, this son still killed our Zhengxian and Wushan after all, and there are still so many people. The Lord Zundi is broad-minded, he has taken a fancy to this person's potential, and he is lucky to accept him. Yeah yeah. A group of martial arts and quasi-immortal great sages in Tuan Tian Tower secretly communicated, showing incredible colors one after another. The martial immortals of the Wuquexian clan are also unbelievable, never expecting that Emperor Tuan Tian Zundi was not angry, but ignorant of that person. At the same time, everyone thought that Sou Lang would agree to the Emperor's slaughter in the next moment. After all, Sou Lang had killed so many people and had already offended two huge quasi-emperor organizations. Without protection, he would definitely die. At this time, if the Emperor Tushin wanted to accept him, he would be able to protect him and get him out of danger, then join the organization of the Emperor, get trained, and soar. But at this moment, Li Fei stepped upstairs. Zundi Wuviza has action. Do you want to prevent Emperor Zushin from accepting that person? It's very possible. After all, that person not only killed the people of Tushin Lu, but also killed a lot of quasi-immortal powers of our Wu Vicien clan. Yet, he killed so many people from our Wu Quexian clan, how could Wu Quezizundi let him go so easily? Not bad, not to mention that our Wu Vi immortal clan had already beaten you to death with Slaughter Tower. Lord Wu Vizundi won't let it go. At this time, one person wants to protect and the other person wants to kill. The fate of that young great sage is really confusing. Look at it, 
watch it, there will be results soon. In the field, there was silence on the surface, but in the dark, everyone was talking and noisy. Everyone thought that the two quasi emperors were about to fight around the young sage in addition to the emperor's forbidden key. But something unexpected happened to everyone. Young people. Zundi Li Filo smiled, I am the patriarch of the Wuquexian clan, my name is Wuquazi, and I am only a little short of the realm of Emperor Wu. Would you like to be my disciple? The voice did not fall. Dozens of martial immortals and more than 2,000 quasi-immortal great sages' complexion changed drastically, demented. What the hell? Wuquazi Zundi. Unexpectedly. Also accept that young Wushan as a disciple. Moreover, it is straightforward to choose to be a disciple, once you agree, it will immediately become a master-disciple relationship. There is a quasi-emperor who is a teacher, doesn't he instantly become a distinguished figure that few people on the Kanglin continent dare to provoke? Oh my god, this person is so lucky to be confidant of two quasi-emperors. I thought that the two quasi emperors would have another dispute because of the disagreement between the two quasi emperors, but I didn't expect that the dispute would still exist, but it was to compete for this person as a disciple. This guy, how many years of cultivation is the blessing? Hundreds of powerful people looked at each other, dumbfounded, and their faces were full of incredible colors. At the same time, a strong envy and jealousy rose from the hearts of everyone. They can't wait to immediately take the position of the young martial sage and become the object of the two quasi emperors. But they also know that this is impossible. The young martial saint is indeed very talented, and the fighting talent is even against the sky, which is absolutely incomparable at the level of the great saint. Even among the martial arts, there are many people who are not as powerful as the young man. Speaking of which, it is really speechless. After living for so long, he has become an immortal, but he can't compare to a young great sage. The reaction of everyone was just an instant. At this time, Li Filo's voice had just landed. So Lang was also a little stunned. The two quasi emperors in front of him didn't come to trouble him, and they even accepted himself as disciples. Tisk tut. It seems that I am really the kind of super genius who is unparalleled in the world. Even the Emperor Zun would be tempted. It's a pity, I don't want to be a disciple for anyone. I just pressed a master on my head. Solang disdain, he has a system in his body, and it is inevitable to achieve Emperor Wu, why should he worship Emperor Zun as his teacher? Thinking of this, Solang wanted to refuse. But at this time, Emperor Lian Tianzundi spoke. Li Filu. Emperor Zushan smiled. Everything must be first come last come. For this child, I'm the first invitation. You have to accept this person as a disciple, unless he rejects me first, otherwise you have no chance. When the words were spoken, everyone felt a trace of determination and a strong will to fight. Zushan Zundi, who paid so much attention to that young man. Everyone felt horrified. When the Quasi Emperor Xiao Tushan finished speaking, Regardless of Li Filu, he turned to look at So Lang, and he wanted to continue to say something, perhaps it was Chinguo, or it was a threat. But the words didn't speak. Li Filu spoke again, this kind of thing depends only on the wishes of the person involved, and what is the first thing to do? You and I like this person, and you should let him choose between us, instead of being threatened and intimidated by you and forced to yield. These two guys are really fighting. Tisk tusk, this is a good drama. So Lang smiled secretly in his heart and decided not to refuse them for the time being. As his thoughts flowed, Emperor Zushan glanced at Li Filo and spoke lightly. Humph. You said I would threaten to intimidate him. I dignified Xiao Tushan, would you do such a thing? After Zushan Zundi finished speaking, he paused and then said to So Lang, originally, I plan to make you become a confidant like me. But now I have changed my mind, I also want to accept you as a disciple, close the door to pass on to the disciple. As long as you agree, I can now teach you two immortal level exercises, 
and give you a lot of immortal jade and an immortal artifact. These are all meeting gifts, and there will be more benefits in the future. As soon as these words came out, the Wuxian and the Quasi immortal great sages behind them all stared. The Emperor Zun wanted to accept his disciples. Just a word was enough. At this time, he even promised to send two immortal level techniques, as well as immortal jade and immortal artifacts. Guru. A Wuxian couldn't help swallowing his saliva. Immortal level exercises are extremely cherished, and the immortal level exercises from the Quasi Emperor are the top one among all the immortal level exercises. Immortal Jade is also extremely cherished, a treasure with a wide range of uses. With the handwriting of Emperor Zun, the amount of immortal jade given is absolutely staggering. In addition, there are fairy artifacts, which are also extremely attractive conditions. You know, even if the quasi-imperial forces on both sides add up to dozens of martial arts, only one-third of them have immortals. And the above three are just a meeting ceremony, there will be more benefits in the future. The conditions given by Emperor Li Tianzun were really tempting. If it were any of them, I'm afraid it would immediately kneel and kowtow, gratitude. Everyone looked at So Lang, their eyes burning, wanting to see his choice. However, So Lang glanced at everyone, twitched the corner of his mouth, and looked at Li Filu. God, this person is so unmoved. No, he wanted to see what bargaining chip Li Filu gave, he was too courageous, and he really dared to choose from the two quasi emperors. This boy is courageous and terrifying, for this alone, I can't compare to him. Yes, it's no wonder that the two quasi emperors would like him. Those dozens of martial immortals and more than 2,000 quasi immortal great sages, the color of shock on their faces became stronger, and the stormy waves in their hearts became stronger. This one is really good. Not only is the fighting talent against the sky, but the courage is amazing. The Emperor Zushin looked at So Lang, nodded silently in his heart, and then turned his head to look at Li Filu. Ha ha ha. Li Filu looked at So Lang with a smile, I really like you more. Should I speak? So Lang's expression was indifferent, his eyes swept across the two quasi emperors, and then he glanced at Hong Xiu and Zhu Xian. After some action, So Lang smiled slightly and said, I'm sorry. I can't accept both of the conditions, I choose, but I refuse. Emperor level exercises or something. So Lang already had one at this time, and as long as the natural immortal level exercises were enough, he could continue to synthesize. And the Taoist couple, double repair, or something, it is useless. So Lang's cultivation base can advance by leaps and bounds, so he still needs to use double cultivation tricks. In addition, there is one more person on the head, how uncomfortable. In short, it is impossible for So Lang to choose to be anyone's apprentice. And So Lang's choice directly made the scene silent, as if the entire world had fallen into a silent abyss. Almost all of them were dull and unbelievable. Even the Zunchen Emperor and Li Filo Zundi were stunned by So Lang's choice. Everything seems to be frozen. Immediately after, just like throwing a lot of fry into the stagnant water, this world has come alive again. A group of martial arts and quasi-martial martial arts have their mouths open. You look at me and I look at you. It is incredible that they can't speak. He refused. He actually refused. That is the two quasi-emperors put down their bodies to let him choose. What an opportunity is this. Countless people were envious and jealous but he actually refused. The delay in thinking caused by the unbelievable gradually disappeared, and everyone began to discuss. It's so fake. I have fallen into an illusion. He actually rejected such a great opportunity, emperor-level exercises, immortal-level exercises, Wuxian Taoists, countless celestial jade. Furthermore, he is still in an extremely critical situation. Does he know that he is seeking death by making such a choice? As long as he chooses either side, he can fly into the sky, but he actually refused both sides. This person is crazy, 
this person must be crazy to make such a crazy decision. He is a fool. Yes, he is a fool. All the Wuxians were too lazy to communicate in secret, and they all talked loudly. Even the two sides who had been tit for tat and beaten their heads had a sense of resentment of the same enemy, which seemed strange. Shut up! Suddenly the voice of Emperor Lung Tianzun spread throughout the audience. The faint voice did not have a trace of murderous intent, and there was not a trace of fireworks, but the Wuxians felt a strong terror. Those great sages shut up immediately, and did not dare to breathe. Everyone stopped talking, and the gaze that looked at Solang returned to the original one as if looking at a dead person, and even more intense. He is dead. This is what everyone thinks. Boy. Li Filo's eyes were slightly cold, do you know who you rejected? This questioning immediately made the atmosphere extremely tense. Of course I know, haha. <laughs> Solang laughed, facing the power of the two quasi-emperors, he was also calm. The laughter did not fall. Solang looked at the Emperor Luncheon, Yu, Xiao Luncheon, a member of the Burning Emperor tribe, the Lord Luncheon, the Zundi Great Power, majoring in Burning Heaven Ju, practicing the Emperor-level cultivation method Burning Heaven Emperor Sutra, and two consummation immortals one-level exercises and several holy-level exercises. This statement came out. Xiao Lushan's expression suddenly changed slightly, as if a strong earthquake had occurred in his heart, this person actually knows me so much. This is clearly the first time I have met. There are not many people who know my race and my techniques. Even the Wuxian in the building does not know how he knew it. Could it be that he heard it from others? So, what is his identity? When Xiao Lushan's thoughts flowed, his thoughts collided. Solang looked at Li Filu again, you, Li Filu, the name Wuqian Zi, Zunyuan Meng, majoring in Wuqian Jing, and six consummation immortal level exercises. Li Filu also had a sigh of relief, ordinary people only know that I have practiced five immortal level exercises, and very few know that I have practiced six exercises. And those are the people of the emperor. Is this person the son of which emperor is traveling abroad? But it's not right, I've never heard of such a brilliant junior. The rest of Wuxian and Quasizian Wu sages all showed horror. The young man actually knows his poster and patriarch better than they do. This is a big man. I'm afraid he is still a great figure in the imperial family. Only with this kind of status can he act so boldly and refuse the invitation of the two Quasi emperors. Everyone replenished their brains, and Solang in their eyes suddenly put on the halo of Emperor Tian Jiao. Who are you? Xiao Luncheon squinted his eyes, which Emperor clan's hidden Tian Jiao? Are you really an Emperor Tian Jiao? Li Fila frowned slightly, if so, please contact the adults in your Emperor clan to solve the matter of killing our warriors. So far. Including the two Quasi Emperors Xiao Luncheon and Li Filu. Everyone thought that Solang was the arrogant emperor. The attitude of the two quasi emperors has also changed, and it is no longer the attitude of your life is in our hands. But then, Solang's words once again made everyone stunned. I am not an emperor Tian Jiao. Solang shook his head and said with a smile, The reason why I reject you is because you are not qualified to be my masters. In addition, Another reason why I reject you is that I want to ask you one thing you are willing to be my slaves. The words came out. Everyone suddenly thundered, their eyes widened, and the expressions on their faces were wonderful. And Xiao Lushan and Li Fila were also dumbfounded and unbelievable. Not the Emperor's Tian Jiao. Then he said that Emperor Zun was not qualified to be his master. Finally, he must recruit two quasi emperors to be his servants. This young man is really crazy. I'm afraid it's not because of practicing to get into troubles and hallucinations. You, you said that you want the two of us to be your servants. It's not the Emperor Tian Jiao, then, where do you get the courage and courage? Li Filo opened his mouth, and his words gradually became cold as ice from incredible. I thought you were a piece of jade against the sky, but I didn't expect you to be so crazy, stupid, and hopeless. 
the Quasi Emperor Tushin burst into murderous aura, humiliate a Quasi Emperor? Haha, <laughs> you will pay the price of your life for your arrogance. 2. I'm serious. As long as you are my servant, you will get extremely attractive and generous treatment. What kind of immortal weapon, I waved thousands of them, what perfect elixir, my clothes are tens of thousands, what immortal level exercises, I open my mouth, and I have dozens of them. I also have emperor level exercises, even emperor level. Pill, emperor soldier, I want it, and I can have it. Solang laughed, come on, become my servant, you will get all of this. Crazy. This person is really crazy. Thousands of immortal weapons, tens of thousands of perfect elixir, dozens of immortal level exercises, and emperor level exercises pill weapons? Idiot people say dreams, fools say dreams. This kid is simply mentally ill, he is hopeless. Next, is when he has no place to bury him. All the martial immortals and the quasi-immortal martial sages screamed. Hong Shi Wuxian and Zhu Xian were even more angry. They actually had a good impression of that kid before, which is simply a shame. Xiao Lunchen and Li Filo shook their heads, revealing a trace of self-deprecation. They both looked away. He actually opened up a huge bargaining chip to compete for a fool that God couldn't save. Hey, don't believe me. At this time, So Lang's faint voice continued, If you don't believe it, I will show you first. As soon as this word was said, everyone's eyes turned white. How crazy is this person? Actually want to show us those things. I see, this person hurt his brain and became a lunatic when he was practicing. The two quasi emperors will soon tear his mouth. Not only the mouth, but the body, but also the soul, completely torn apart. One by one Wuxian and Quasi Xian Wushan showed mockery, as well as a trace of coldness and indifference. What a fool, it's a pity that he has a talent for fighting against the sky. Xiao Lushan shook his head helplessly, then looked at Li Filu, who nodded. This was the same opinion, and he was going to kill So Lang. The scene suddenly fell silent, and a series of cold eyes fell on So Lang, all thinking that he was a person. Undoubtedly death. Immediately after, Xiao Lunchen stepped forward and took a deep look at So Lang again. This person's fighting talent is really against the sky, and his cultivation aptitude is extremely high. He really doesn't want to kill. But no matter what, this young man has a brain disease and dares to humiliate them. As a quasi-emperor, he is also the landlord of Tuan Tian, his majesty cannot be lost, he must be killed. Dead. A cold word popped out of Xiao Lushan's mouth, and he squeezed So Lang to death with his big hand like he was about to squeeze a bug. But just when Xiao Lushan started, there was one more thing in So Lang's hand, no, not one, but an innumerable treasure. The first is the pill. Countless elixirs emerged densely, and the visions formed by the power of the rules of the elixirs took up a large area of the surrounding space. A more dense pill fragrance spread out, flooding into everyone's perception. This is... Xiao Lushan trembled all over, and stopped his hands in an instant, an amazing splendor appeared in his eyes. The elixir. And it's all the elixir of perfect quality. Li Filo opened his mouth, stared, and said in disbelief. As for the martial arts and quasi-martial martial sages behind them, the sneer and indifferent expression instantly solidified on their faces. At this moment everyone seemed to have been pressed the pause button, dumbfounded, motionless. After a few breaths, those dozens of quasi-immortals and many quasi-celestial sages reacted. Seeing the endless vision of pill medicine and smelling the coveted and alluring pill fragrance, everyone was shocked. Am I wrong? The elixir of perfect quality around him. I feel that it is the spiritual pill that I need most, and there are other pill for cultivation and healing. I was injured in the previous battle. After smelling the pill incense, the injury showed signs of healing. Oh my god, this person actually took out so many elixir. These people are not hillbillies, but
but gangsters of the Quasi Emperor organization. In Kanglin continent, there are not many people who are more knowledgeable than them. But even so, they were still shocked by the pill that Solang took out, even for the two Quasi Emperors. No way, they eat a lot of elixir, but the perfect quality of elixir still takes out so much at one time. This is completely what they have seen in their lives. Here, who is it? He said he is not the Emperor's Tian Jiao, but I don't believe it. If it weren't for the Emperor Tian Jiao, how could he come up with so many perfect quality pills? No, even the real Emperor Tian Jiao can't do such a thing. They can take out the elixir, but it will never be a perfect quality pill. Xiao Lushan and Li Filo looked at each other, their eyes were full of shock, and the rest of the meaning gleamed. They hesitated again about the killer. Let's see. These are my elixir. But I am afraid that the elixir will not work for you, so if you want you to be my slaves, you have to use the emperor grade pill. So Lang was at the center of everyone's shocking gaze, taking it calmly, and calmly said something more shocking and dizzying. Emperor level medicine. These four words fell in the ears of Zunchen Zundi and Li Filu, which directly aggravated their breathing. Before. They absolutely did not believe what So Lang said. What is the concept of emperor level medicine? This is the only super treasure possessed by Emperor Wu on the Kanglin continent. But at this time, So Lang had already produced countless elixir of perfect quality, and he had a very high degree of credibility with regard to the emperor level pill. And they were only one step away from entering the emperor Wu level, an emperor level pill it might be their opportunity to enter the emperor level. How does this make them unmoved? Even the two Quasi emperors are like this, and the Wuxian and the Quasi Zion Wu sages behind them directly held their breath, staring like light bulbs. Everyone stared at So Lang, watching his movements. So Lang smiled faintly in the eyes of everyone, took out a bottle of pill, and opened it. In an instant, a pill flew out of the bottle, seemingly spiritual and wanting to escape. Humph! So Lang grabbed it lightly and pinched it in his hand. The pill struggled for a while, and did not move any more, and immediately an extremely lifelike vision emerged from the pill. It was a verdant world, mountains and rivers, and even the sky, all green. It's like a real green world has come, as if everything is real. This green pill was an emperor-level pill that So Lang synthesized with the elixir. It was called the Reborn Emperor Pill. It was a terrifying healing pill that could extend the life of Emperor Wu and was extremely valuable. But the cost of synthesizing this emperor-grade pill is also super terrifying. This can't be synthesized by 10 elixir. This reincarnation emperor pill cost So Lang a full 10,000 primary elixir. At this moment, this treasure appeared on the world and instantly attracted everyone's eyes. This kind of vision, this kind of power of rules. It's really an emperor. Unexpectedly, when I was in the realm of Quasi Emperor, I would encounter an emperor level pill. Xiao Luncheon and Li Filo opened their mouths directly, and the stormy waves in their hearts kept beating their hearts, one heart beating like it was about to explode. Emperor Pill I can actually see an emperor grade pill in my lifetime. Apart from this far, I feel that the power of my rules is improving. Its effect is too terrifying. It is simply a treasure that is rarer than any fairy artifact. That kid, he was able to take out the emperor pill, his identity, it is extremely scary to think carefully. Yet, yeah, is he not the son of Emperor Wu? The only way to explain it, otherwise, who can take out the Emperor Pill. All the martial arts and the Quasi Immortals secretly talked, and their gazes at So Lang changed again. It was a kind of extreme fear, like seeing an absolutely irresistible existence in the world. Even Xiao Luncheon and Li Filo tried their best to suppress their desires, not allowing themselves to Nady Pill. They really want Nady Dan. But they are afraid of death. The opponent is likely to be Emperor Wu's own son it is almost the same as Emperor Wu's visit. The word difference between Emperor Zun and Emperor Wu is a huge difference. One Emperor Wu can easily squeeze countless Emperor Zhu. 
if they dared to that young man's emperor pill, they would definitely end up horribly, and even destroy the race. I have said that I have the emperor pill, you still don't believe it. Now that I see it clearly, I should believe what I said. The corner of Solang's mouth twitched slightly, and he said with a smile, As long as you are my servants, I can reward you with these pills. Guru. The two quasi emperors swallowed at the same time. Compared to the inheritance in the Emperor's Forbidden Land, which needs to go through all kinds of difficulties to obtain, this Emperor Pill is close at hand. And becoming the other's servant is not a shame. After all, he is the son of Emperor Wu. Moreover, once they truly achieved Emperor Wu, they would immediately be at the pinnacle of the Kanglin continent, and no one would talk about any servants, and no one would mention it. Of course, the premise is that you must never give up your soul. How about it, tell me your choice. Seeing that the two of them were about to flow out, So Lang couldn't help but smile again. Xiao Lushan and Li Filo looked at each other, a little caught off guard. Before, they let the young man make a choice, but now it's the young man's turn to let them make a choice. The changes in the world are really impermanent. And those Wuxian and Quasi Zion Wu sages trembled even more. The two Quasi emperors who were strong enough to make them worship at this time actually faced a choice at this time, and they still chose whether to become servants of others. Quasi emperor, servant, what a difference in identity. All this is as unreal as a dream. But this really happened in front of them. At this time, Li Fei stepped upstairs, but he bowed his hand before saying, dare to ask your excellency, that emperor level technique. As soon as this remark came out, all the martial immortals raised their ears. Xiao Lushan's eyes were also scorching, and his spirits aroused. The emperor level exercises, including the entire Kanglin continent, are pitiful. Xiao Lushan's emperor level exercises were inherited from his ancestors, and his ancestors had also passed through Emperor Wu, but that was a long time ago. The value of an emperor level exercise is really incalculable. If the opponent can come up with an emperor level technique, it will be another extremely important bargaining chip. Besides, this request is still a test, or a side attack. There are so many emperor level exercises in the Kanglin continent, and the emperor level exercises taken out by the opponent can tell the power of the young man. This is also a way to verify the identity of the young man. At this time, Solang smiled slightly, Emperor level exercises are naturally available. Since you want to see it, I will show it to you. With that said, Solang took the Emperor level pill that was green to the alarmingly green in his hand and took out a pitch black disc. The black disc is the size of the bottom of a bowl, and it is covered with golden lines like annual rings. At a glance, there are only a dozen golden patterns but a closer look reveals that the golden patterns are so dense that they are countless. Even if you use mental energy to observe, you don't know the number at all. This exercise is the first emperor level exercise emperor heart reincarnation record synthesized by Sol Lang. This kind of exercise can hardly be copied, cannot be sealed, and it is very difficult even to pass on. All its essence and meaning are condensed on the black disc. That disc is the main body of the emperor level exercise technique. At this time, there was no noise and exclamation in the court. Because the first time they saw the black disc, everyone immediately confirmed that this is definitely an emperor level technique that cannot be faked. And it is also the most cherished emperor level cultivation technique body. Everyone is staring at the main body of reincarnation of the emperor's heart, paying attention and keeping their eyes on. Xiao Lushan and Li Filo even wanted to put it under their eyes or between their eyebrows, using all their mental power to perceive them. Everyone is fully peeping at the emperor level exercises in that disc. This is a great opportunity that will never be encountered in ten lifetimes. But at this moment. Enough to see. So Lang smiled slightly, flipped his wrist, and put the golden pattern black disc away. Everyone immediately found that the treasure had disappeared, and they were suddenly lost and anxious. Li Filo returned to his senses and trembled fiercely, 
and couldn't help but want to stamp his feet. Do not. Xiao Lushan was even more awakened by a nightmare as an ordinary person, and he yelled divinely. He has practiced the emperor level exercises himself, and has a lot of experience in the practice of emperor level exercises. Among all the people, it was his Xiao Lushan who saw the most. Just now, he had tasted one ten thousandth of the golden patterned black plate exercise, and he was just addicted to it, and he couldn't extricate himself, but suddenly found that the exercise was gone. How could he not worry? Hey, I've also seen the emperor level exercises, so confirm it. I have never been so troublesome in taking slaves, so hurry up and make your choice. So Lang looked at the two quasi emperors and smiled slightly. This. Xiao Lushan and Li Fila couldn't help but look at each other again. Then they began to communicate. Lord Tushan, can you see what cultivation technique it is? I haven't seen it. I can only see a trace of fur. It can be determined that it is a spiritual emperor level exercise. It is really an incomparably mysterious exercise. My burning heaven emperor sutra can't match it. Spiritual emperor level exercises? That's really rare. In addition, the 37 emperor level exercises currently known in Kanglin continent are not spiritual. Yet. Just thinking about that exercise, don't you say that I haven't paid attention yet? That exercise is not any known emperor level exercises, that is to say, he is not the heir of a certain Wudi. It's possible, but it's not certain. On the Kanglin continent, there are only 37 emperor level techniques on the surface, but we don't know if the emperor Wu will hide and leave behind. Anyone will do it. We have never heard of the exercises he took out. The mystery of his identity is still unexplorable, and he can only continue to be treated as the heir of Emperor Wu. Yes, yeah, it can only be so, besides, Wu Kongzi, what are your plans for that choice? This was still spoken without any cover, and everyone present heard it. And such conditions immediately made everyone look dull. This condition. This wife is too loose. Yet, yeah, without any restraint methods, just in the name of master and servant, so many benefits can be brought out. Emperor level exercises, emperor level pill, that is a treasure that Emperor Wu will fight for, but now he can get it almost without any effort. My God, who is that young great sage, who can be so generous? Yes, and isn't he afraid that the two quasi emperors will run away after taking things? Everyone talked a lot, and they didn't care about hiding their voices, and they all spoke with their mouths to vent their shock. The scene also seemed noisy. Simultaneously, Xiao Lushan and Li Fila were also shocked. The other party actually put forward such a loose condition and they are not afraid that they will turn their faces immediately after taking things. Why is this? Looking at Solang who was smiling and not speaking, Xiao Lushan and Li Filo gradually calmed down and thought of the reasons. There is only one reason. That is, the other party is not afraid that they will run away with something. Yes, they are not afraid. The meaning of laughter and silence is that if you run to the ends of the world, to the broken continent outside the territory, you can be pulled back and brutally killed. What kind of confidence is this, and what a terrifying force is behind it? Xiao Lushan and Li Fila couldn't help but frightened. They wondered, what kind of force is able to achieve this level in Kanglin continent? We must know that the Kanglin continent is very large, and the Emperor clan has various parties, and it is impossible for the whole world to hunt one person. Well, not a single Wudi force. Xiao Lushan and Li Filo looked at each other, a noun appeared in their minds. Wudi Palace. The so-called Wudi Palace is a super-organization founded by the gathering of Kanglin continent in the supreme ancient times. The extremely ancient era was the first time that Kanglin continent and Jingtian continent went to war. At that time, Almost all Wudi on the mainland joined the Wudi Palace and participated in the war against the Jingtian continent. After the war ended, Wudi Palace also passed down. However, in the long years, the dominance of Wudi Palace gradually weakened. Up to now, 
there are only twelve Wudi in Wudi Palace, and the other Wudi are scattered around, or formed into small groups, or independent parties. But even so, Wudi Palace is also the most terrifying organization on the Kanglan continent. Its power is everywhere, its warriors are omnipresent, its territory is the most expansive, and it even holds a lot of fragments of continents outside the territory. Even in places that are not under control, there are a lot of eyeliners, which can be called omniscience. At this time, what are you still waiting for? Taking your soul fire, you refuse to accept your soul fire, but you are stunned again. So Lang said impatiently, I just want to take in servants, can you just be a little bit more? As soon as this statement was made, everyone looked stagnant and choked silently. In this case, you dare to say it. This. Dare to ask the young man, is he from the Emperor Wu Palace? Li Filo asked with his hands. Although it was an inquiry, there was already an expression of I know you are, don't deny it on his face. Look at Xiao Lushan again, the same is true. When the other Wuxians heard the name Wudi Palace, they immediately felt all over their bodies standing upside down. It turns out that he is from the Emperor Wu Palace. Yes, only then can we explain everything before. Oh my god, people from the Emperor Wu Palace, and a distinguished person, are they the heirs of the Lord Wu Emperor? It's very possible. The Emperor level medicine, the Emperor level cultivation technique, and his talent for fighting against the sky, I don't believe that he is not from the Emperor Wu Palace. Everyone's lips trembled, their voices trembled, and they even went out of tune. They looked at Solang, waiting for his answer. Zhu Xian is a martial immortal of the Six Tribulations, and it is also the top one among the martial immortals. Even the Quasi Emperor Xiao Lushan valued him very much. She shouted, immediately attracted everyone's attention. A pair of eyes focused on the main line. Zhu Xian. What are you shouting for? Be careful to disturb the young master. Xiao Lushan turned to look at Zhu Xian, and suddenly smiled, could it be that you want to sit on the young master and Taoist couple? This statement came out. Everyone was stunned. Yes, the young master exists, and I don't know how honorable his identity is. It is normal for Zhu Xianyi to move. Well, but in my opinion, Taoist couples are no longer good. Lord Sundi is a servant, but Zhu Xian wants to be a Taoist couple. Isn't that reasonable? It's true, maybe being a concubine is about the same. Exactly. There was a lot of discussion, and they all thought that Zhu Xian wanted to climb the thigh of young master. When Zhu Xian heard this, he was a little panicked. Do not. No. Zhu Xian quickly denied it, then glanced at Sou Lang, gritted his teeth and said to Xiao Lushan, the subordinate remembered it, the subordinate knows who he is. Not bad. She remembered it after all. The familiar smell comes from a person named Sou Lang. Her words fell on everyone's ears, and it was like thunder that shook everyone's eyes. What? Zhu Xian knows who the young master is. No, if she knows. Why didn't she say it earlier, she must say it at this time. What she said was remembering, does she know the young master before? What is the status of the young master? That is the existence of the Emperor Wu Palace. Although Zhu Xian has a higher cultivation base than mine, it is impossible to get to know the young master. In other words, Zhu Xian is sensationalizing. No, she's not a fool, how could she find death? Could it be said that Zhu Xian thinks that young master is not from the Emperor Wu Palace, so he shouts and waits? Ah! The young master is not from the Emperor Wu Palace, who can he be? Just ask you, who can take out the Emperor level pill, the Emperor level technique, and can give it out casually? This! Everyone talked a lot, and kept guessing, the light in their eyes flickered, and the scene suddenly became confusing. Branches. Seeing this scene, Sol Lang raised his brows, revealing a noncommittal smile. At this time, Xiao Luncheon and Li Filo looked at Sol Lang's expressions, 
then looked at each other, their thoughts continued, and they stopped talking. Immediately afterwards, Xiao Lushan couldn't help asking, Zhu Xian, did you admit the wrong person? How do you know the name of the young master? The original poster, I have deduced him, his name is Sou Lang, he is a warrior of the Yaokai Saint clan. At that time, Cai Liao's subordinate force was destroyed. He went to check it, and only met this Sou Lang. He thought he was a direct bloodline of the Imperial clan and was scared back. At that time, I happened to go back to the headquarters, and I did some deductions, and found that Sou Lang was not directly of the Imperial family. Later, Cai Liao went to seek revenge and died, but I had already left the headquarters at that time, so I didn't care about it. After all, there are still Xianqing and others in the headquarters, more than enough to deal with a Yaokai clan. Later things, because I participated in the war, so I didn't know. Zhu Xian bit his scalp and said everything he knew. Everyone heard what she said, and they all looked dull like a clay statue, standing still on the spot. This is true even for Emperor Lun Tianzun and Li Filu. Everyone caught the point in Zhu Xian's words. The young master's name is Sou Lang, he comes from a small clan, not a direct bloodline of the imperial clan. This is completely different from everyone's guess brain supplement. Before this, everyone thought that the young master came from the Emperor Wu Palace and was a direct heir of Emperor Wu. But now, this guess has been overturned. Why Xiao Lushan and Li Filu agreed to become Sou Lang's servants? Reward is the most critical point, and identity is also the most critical point. If they hadn't thought that Sou Lang came from Wu Di Palace and the forces behind him were terrifying, they would never agree to be servants. There is an incredible look in everyone's eyes. And Xiao Lushan and Li Filu were also dumbfounded, their faces full of shock. Immediately after, someone came back to their senses and couldn't help but exclaimed, You, you are such a tiny person. Yes. His identity is so humble. I have never heard of any blue star human race. I'm afraid it's not a small race in the back country. Although he is a patriarch, and what immortal clan he has subdued, there are thousands of quasi-immortal martial sages as subordinates, but it is not enough. Yes, my forces are stronger than him, and the Wuxian we are present is not weaker than him. It's such a force, with a face full of control over everything, and dare to fool the two quasi-emperors to recognize him as the master. Oh my god, what kind of courage did this person eat? dare to do such a crazy thing. Where did he get his confidence and courage? He was a lunatic, he was from the beginning. Everyone talked loudly in disbelief, and their eyes towards Sou Lang were full of incredible and contempt. However, what is strange is that in addition to these gazes, there is still a little admiration. Yes. As any one of them, I dare not fool the two quasi-emperors. To dare to do such a thing, their courage has exceeded all of them present. At the same time, Xiao Lushan and Li Filo looked at each other, a flame ignited in their eyes. You, your identity, nothing more. Xiao Lushan's expression was super complicated, shocked, joyful, doubtful, and cold. Li Filo is similar, with mixed feelings. Shocked by Sou Lang's identity, shocked by Sou Lang's actions. I am happy because I can get rid of my servanthood and unconstrained. He was puzzled about why Sou Lang could take out the Emperor-level treasure, and he felt ashamed because Sou Lang dared to deceive himself, and his expression was cold. Not bad. My identity is nothing more. You make your own choice. Sou Lang nodded and said, However, I want to remind you that sometimes, life and death are in one thought. Ha ha ha. Laughable, extremely ridiculous. You are only the leader of a small and weak force, so you dare to say to us that life and death are in a single thought. Open your eyes and see clearly, we are the Quasi Emperor, even if it is a subordinate behind me, picking a martial arts immortal can easily pinch you to death. Now your life is in our hands, where does your courage determine our life and death? Xiao Luncheon laughed loudly, 
and his plan to turn his face was settled when he got the identity of So Lang. So Lang. Your actions are shocking, but ridiculous. You dare to expire us and trick us into being your servants. This is a great shame for us. Li Filo looked indifferent and restored his attitude of overlooking from above, but now I can give you a chance to tell the source of these two imperial treasures, we will spare you your life. Not bad. Name the source of the emperor level treasure. Life and death are just between your thoughts. Xiao Lushan roared with a sullen face, and his terrifying murderous aura swept away, causing the Wuxi and Quasi immortals behind him to retreat. Simultaneously. Everyone also feels that things are impermanent. At first, the Quasi Emperors let N.A. Solang make a choice, and then became N.A. Solang and let the Quasi Emperor choose, and now it was the turn of the Quasi Emperor to let Solang choose. This is simply a dramatic change. Tisk tut. If you say you turn your face, you will turn your face, not only to kill me, but also to ask the source of more Emperor level treasures, it's really greedy. Unfortunately, you two poor old confused, really think you can kill me. You really treat me as a fool, thinking I will put myself in a place of death. So Lang was not afraid of the two quasi emperors, and even showed disdain, the brain is a good thing, but unfortunately you don't have it. It's still confusing and makes the most stupid choice. This speech fell to the ears of everyone, it was completely a madman's speech. A trivial saint actually said that Emperor Zun could not kill him? Is there anything more ridiculous in the world? So Lang. I care if you are really crazy or fake. Xiao Lushan said coldly, give you one last chance to tell the source of the Emperor level treasure, otherwise it will kill you. Speak up. Li Filo looked kind, I can promise that as long as you speak out, I will treat you kindly. Oh. These two old fools still know how to sing black-faced and white-faced drama. Hey! Why don't you believe what I said? I repeat it three times, you can't kill me, you can't kill me, you can't kill me. So Lang shook his head helplessly, on the contrary, you chose to tear your skin and successfully pushed yourself down the abyss of death. Negative corner resist. I want to see how hard your mouth can be. Xiao Lushan laughed wildly, stretched out his big hand, and grabbed So Lang fiercely. Don't kill him. Li Filo reminded secretly. I know it naturally. This So Lang is a big baby. Xiao Lunchen replied to Li Filo with his spiritual thoughts, and at the same time tightly confined So Lang in the illusory giant palm. Catch him. Behind, dozens of martial immortals and quasi immortal great sages stared at this scene. That daring So Lang was caught. Next, he just put on the fish and let it be killed. So Lang. Xiao Lushan's eyes were burning, and he stared at him, in order to avoid the disaster of skin and flesh, let's talk about it, the source of the emperor's treasure. Li Filo was also watching So Lang closely, his heart was full of greed. But at this moment. Xiao Lushan. Do you really think you caught me? So Lang's slightly playful voice came. What? Xiao Lushan, Li Filu, and thousands of people behind him instantly looked in a certain direction with shocked faces. I saw a second So Lang unexpectedly appeared there. He was smiling faintly, as if laughing at Xiao Lushan as an incompetent person. This, what the is going on? A Wuxian exclaimed in disbelief, could it be that it is a clone, but it's not right? The newly appearing So Lang is clearly a great saint, and the aura on his body has reached the level of a Wuxian. Everyone observed carefully and found that the second So Lang was indeed exactly the same aura as the first So Lang, both of which were Wuxian level combat power. WH. What? The two So Langs who are exactly the same are both at the Wuxian level. Could it be that these two are clones? They are clones of a great existence. As he pondered his fear, Xiao Lushan widened his eyes and suddenly felt that So Lang in his hand was very hot and hot. Li Filo is also tingling scalp. They all have practiced the technique of Avatar. However, their clone only had the quasi-celestial level combat power, 
and only this clone reached the quasi-celestial level. More avatars, all of which are low and medium level martial arts. But the real combat power of the two Solangs in front of them has reached the Wuxian level. This means that its deity's combat power is definitely stronger than them. They are already invincible under Emperor Wu, stronger than them, are they not Emperor Wu? The two of them offended a Woody. Do not. You can't be Emperor Wu. I killed you, I killed you. Xiao Lanshan's expression was distorted, hissing loudly, and he was about to kill Solang in his hand in the next moment. But at this moment, Solang in his hand became illusory and disappeared immediately. Gone. Xiao Lushan and Li Filo were shocked. Because they can't detect the means used when the other party leaves. Is it really Emperor Wu? The two looked at each other in horror. At this time, a Wuxian pointed in a certain direction and shouted, So Lang has appeared, there. Everyone looked in the direction of his fingers, and saw a So Lang with his arms folded, floating in the air and looking at everyone faintly. I said, you can't kill me. So Lang looked at Xiao Lushan contemptuously, on the contrary, your death period is coming soon. Noisy, noisy. Go to death. Xiao Tushan broke out in a murderous manner, and his mental power was swept away, and he wanted to kill Solang with a mental storm. But, when his mental power touched Solang, he felt a strong resistance. Even he can't break through this resistance. Of course, after a long period of training and polishing his mental power, both quality and quantity are at the peak of the sun, so he will not be backlashed. But even so, he was extremely shocked. Sunny level mental power. Xiao Lushan was stunned. A great sage level clone had the spiritual power of the sun. Xiao Lushan, you are so weak. So Lang's disdainful ridicule came. What? You die for me. Xiao Lunshan was furious and waved his sword scabbard fiercely. A large amount of sword energy flew out from it and fell on two Solangs. Wow! The two Solangs suddenly fell apart, and their spirits were all destroyed. Dead. Ha 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 ha! Xiao Lushan was overjoyed, didn't you say that you can't kill you? Pretending to be a fool. Ha ha! But! Li Filo looked ugly, here again. What? Xiao Lushan recovered from his joy turned his head and saw that there was another Solang in the sky. It's the kind of displacement that can't see the details at all. Xiao Lushan, Li Filu. Solang laughed and said, There are so many clones like me, come, come, kill, let you enjoy yourself before you die. As soon as these words came out, everyone stood upside down and their scalp numb. There are so many powerful clones. Could it be that his deity is extremely powerful even among Emperor Wu? I do not believe. I will kill you. Xiao Lushan's voice trembled, and he waved his scabbard fiercely, and another sword aura fell on Sol Lang. Click. Sol Lang in the air was shot down and disappeared in midair. But before Xiao Lushan showed joy, Li Filo's voice came again, here again. What? Xiao Lunshan roared wildly looked up at the sky, and saw another Solang standing in the sky, looking down at them disdainfully. Kill kill kill! Xiao Lushan fell into an unprecedented anxiety, the sword energy in his hand poured frantically, killing N.A. Solang. But! Appeared again. Li Filo's lips trembled, and he couldn't help but swallow a spit. They are the strongest clones and only have the quasi-celestial level, but the opponent's clones, even the lowest level ones, have the combat power of the Wuxian level. This is really scary. And how is it possible? Xiao Lushan looked at the sky, and another Solang stood there and shook his head contemptuously. I don't believe you have endless clones. Xiao Lushan looked at that contemptuous Solang, his heart was as angry as a volcano erupting. He flew up in smoke, and beat that Solang into meat with a fierce punch. Really relieved. Sixth, I don't believe you really have so many clones. Xiao Lushan squeezed his fist and let out a long breath. However, 
Li Filo exclaimed again, also, behind you. What? Xiao Lushan turned his head and saw that there was really another Solang standing there laughing, smiling brazenly, and the flowers blooming brilliantly. Exactly, how many more? Xiao Lushan didn't act immediately, but couldn't help but glance at Li Filu. And this glance immediately made him exclaim, Li Filu, behind you, behind you. What? There are also behind me. Li Filu turned around to take a look, and he really stared at Solang with big eyes. Not far away, those martial immortals and quasi immortals, seeing this scene, felt cold all over, like falling into an ice cave. How much does that exist, just the clone can play around two quasi emperors? Some of the more timid Wuxians even shuddered slightly. Soon, Xiao Lushan and Li Filo shot at the same time, killing the two Solangs separately. But, after the killing, Solang appeared again. And there are more than two, exactly four. A Solang was in front of Xiao Lushan, a Solang in front of Li Filu, a Solang in front of Zhu Xian, and a Solang in front of Hong Xiu Wuxian. All very close. This is the number one. Xiao Lushan and Li Filu couldn't help being shocked. Taking advantage of their horrified moment, the four Solangs stretched out their hands and patted the faces of the people in front of them. I have said it, I can't kill it. Solang's voice was simultaneously spoken from the four clones. Zhu Xian Wu Xian and Hong Xiu Wu Xian were directly frightened, they didn't even move, letting Solang slap their faces. However, Xiao Lushan and Li Filu were so angry that they slapped Solang in front of them to death. However, Solang really seemed to be unable to kill, four more appeared. Ha 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 ha. Come on, come and kill me. The six Solang laughed brazenly in front of the crowd, as if teasing a group of ants. At this time, even Xiao Lushan and Li Filu felt terrified, and the other Wuxian and Zuxixian were urinating frequently. Suddenly, Li Filu's expression changed, Xiao Lushan, look, these clones don't seem to be delaying time. Procrastination. His deity is on the way. Xiao Lushan was terrified, it must be that his deity is too large to arrive in an instant. It takes time. Hurry, let's run away. Solang's deity is the the pinnacle of Emperor Wu. Once they come, they can be killed by a single finger. But how do they know that Solang's deity and clone strength are the same? Go. Without hesitation, Li Filu immediately turned and flew to escape. Xiao Lushan also immediately found a direction and began to run away. Two quasi emperors, even the Wuxians under their command can't take care of them. But they stopped for less than a millisecond after flying. Because the key to the emperor's forbidden land was in the middle, they were held by the two of them, and neither of them would let go. The two old foxes even had a small nine when they ran away, expecting that the other party would not care about the key when they escape. Li Filu, go left. Xiao Lushan, go right. The two yelled together, both wanting the other to escape in the direction they expected. But the two wanted to escape in the opposite direction, and they couldn't help but froze. Fortunately, the two reacted quickly and immediately unified their directions and flew north with the key to the Emperor's Forbidden Land. Ha ha ha! Emperor level medicine and Emperor level exercises have my mark. If you escape to other continents, I can also find you. So, do you think you can escape? Solang's voice came from behind, causing Xiao Lushan and Li Filu to tremble fiercely. They really want to throw away the medicine and exercises immediately, but they are totally reluctant. This is an opportunity for Emperor Cheng, you can't lose it. My achievements today are all made by hard work, and I will make another hard work today. The two quasi emperors became fierce, and flew away with all their strength, like a pair of mandarin ducks fleeing for their lives. Oh no! Two men can't be said to be mandarin ducks, should they be said to be mandarin ducks or mandarin ducks? The two quasi emperors disappeared into the horizon in a blink of an eye. Gggg! Escape, let's escape, I want to see if you can escape from my palm. 
A wicked smile appeared at the corner of Solang's mouth, and immediately sent a clone to pursue the two quasi emperors. In situ, under Solang's call, more than a dozen clones appeared, occupying all directions in the sky. A group of martial arts and quasi immortals shivered, and their quasi emperor abandoned them, it was so cruel. Tisk tisk. Don't be afraid, little babies. A Solang chuckled. Stand on the left with the soul fire, stand on the right if there is none, come, be obedient, stand well. A whole number of ten martial immortals, and more than two thousand quasi immortal great sages, were all terrified. Those martial immortals can be regarded as great men, and there are many martial immortals who have seven tribulations and eight tribulations. Therefore, they also had the idea of running away. However, when they thought that the unknown terrifying Emperor Woody was coming, they felt that they were all dead when they fled to the ends of the world. Therefore, when these people were in panic and despair, they couldn't move a step. Among them, Zhu Xian was even more isolated, terrified. It was because of her exclaim that the situation fell to this point. Otherwise, the two quasi emperors should become the servants of the powerful Emperor Wu and they can be regarded as having a greater backing. But at this time, I don't know what my future will look like. Next. At Solang's request, everyone was divided into two piles and stood there tremblingly. Hey, pretty familiar. Solang nodded with satisfaction, now, those who have the fire of the soul will hand over the fire of the soul first. You will become my servants and will be rewarded with the immortal level technique and the immortal level pill. Talking. Solang waved his big hand, and a large number of elixir and immortal level techniques emerged. At a glance, the elixir is densely packed, and it is almost countless. There are more than 60 copies of the immortal level exercises, suspended in the air, with many visions. The expressions of more than 2,000 people in the field stagnated and immediately the vast majority of them showed expressions of incomparable surprise. They all thought they were dead. Unexpectedly, as long as you hand over your soul, you will be able to get the immortal pill and immortal level techniques that are extremely cherished. Moreover, the opponent is a powerful Emperor Wu. Becoming a servant of Emperor Wu is not only not a shame, but a high climb. The surprise came too suddenly, and tears filled my eyes. Soon, a Wuxian rushed out of the crowd. So Di. I am not rich, and I am willing to surrender the fire of my soul and become your servant. This Wuxian knelt down on both knees respectfully, with a sincere expression full of expectation. Fuyu is a martial arts immortal of the Wuxian clan, but he was very unhappy. He was suppressed everywhere in the clan, and was even more dangerous in the battle of the Emperor Zun, and almost died. Therefore, he was very angry with the Wuquexian clan. At this time, he was tempted to get the opportunity of Gao Pan Solang, the martial emperor. Solang smiled and said, OK, you choose 20 pills from these pills, and then choose two immortal level exercises. Yes yes. Fuxian Wuxian excitedly spoke incoherently, and immediately stepped forward to choose medicine and exercises. The rest of Wuxian and Quaisian, some of them stared eagerly and eager to move, and some had no souls, regrets and worries in their hearts. There is also a small part who looked at it coldly, showing unruly eyes. In any case, Wuxian quickly selected twenty perfect quality elixir and two immortal level exercises. Then he handed over his soul and heart, and paid Solang with both hands. Well, very good. Solang smiled and nodded, if you have any credit in the future, I will reward you again. Just stand by. Yes. Lord Sudi. Call me Longdi. Yes. Lord Longdi. Okay. Lord Longdi, who was flying in waves, smiled, turned his eyes, and fell on the people below. Master Longdi, I am willing to be your servant. Another Wuxian stepped forward with a respectful look. There were some quasi-immortals beside him who wanted to step forward, but when he saw him going, they held back for the time being. Okay, 
choose the pill and exercise. Solang smiled kindly. At the same time, Xiao Luncheon and Li Filu, their enemies, are fleeing together, fast. However, they looked terrified, and their hearts were chilling. Because no matter how fast they fly, there will be a Solang around them from time to time. Solang's clone was really like a tarsal maggot, and he couldn't get rid of it. But it is not difficult for Solang to do this. At this time, Solang's mental power reached the level of the sun, covering billions of miles. In other words, the perception range of each clone has billions of miles. The flying speed of the Emperor Zun was indeed fast, but he couldn't fly out of the perception range of a clone in one second. When they flew out, they had already entered the perception range of the second clone that Solang dispatched in advance. Therefore, Xiao Lushan and Li Filu will always be under Solang's nose. As long as Solang is willing, he can send an avatar next to them with a thought. Faced with the avatars that couldn't be thrown away at all, Xiao Lushan and Li Filu tried their best when they were frightened. First behead the clone. They killed more than a dozen in a row, but Solang still appeared, and Xiao Lushan completely gave up this move. Use Concealment Solang's clone directly launched a mental attack, using a radar-like method to find out their location. Flee through the teleportation formation. Their every move is under Solang's supervision, how can they hide from Solang if they want to find the teleportation formation? Therefore, often when the teleportation is over, there is already a Solang clone waiting for them with a smile. You can imagine how desperate they were at that time. Tear space to escape. But Solang's perception can already see the scene on the other side through the space channel so he can continue to send his clone to pursue. The more Xiao Lushan and the two ran away, the more they felt powerless and desperate. Especially afterwards, a strange flying squirrel appeared, like ghosts everywhere, watching them all the time. The most important thing is that this flying squirrel can't even kill. No way, the treasure-hunting flying gliders are immune to Wuxian attack, and the Quasi Emperor is also a Wuxian. Of course, the treasure-hunting flying gliders can't be killed. The flying squirrel, which even the Quasi Emperor could not kill, immediately made the two Quasi Emperors fully ascertain that Solang's deity was a great Woody. And this, this is the last straw that crushes their psychological defense. Li Filu Xiao Lushan shouted hoarsely, I'm going to throw away the Emperor-level pill, and I can't keep it. No, I can't bear it. Li Filo was heartbroken, this is my opportunity to become emperor. Don't throw it away, then Emperor Wu is coming. Xiao Luncheon pointed at the treasure hunting flying flying gliders and said sternly, Look, there are more and more strange flying mice. This is a sign that Emperor Wu is about to come. No. I really can't bear it. Li Filo was tearful and regretful on his face, or we should admit our mistakes to Emperor Solang Wu. Let's surrender. No way. We missed the opportunity. If we go back, the end will be terrible. Xiao Lanchen shook his head fiercely, for the sake of the present, the only way to do this is to throw away the Emperor level technique and the Emperor level pill, and then look for a martial Emperor level force as a backer. Ah. Uh, I'm not reconciled. Li Fila cried with grief and anger, I blame your subordinate Zhu Xian, I blame her. Yes, it's all her fault. Xiao Luncheon's eyes were blood red, if it weren't for her exclaiming, I wouldn't have fallen here, she should die. Then you don't kill her yet. Li Filo shouted hoarsely with hatred on his face. Their souls are all on your slaying sky sword sheath, kill her. You can't kill it. In order to show trust and show my demeanor, many of my powers have not turned in their souls. Xiao Lushan shook his head helplessly, only some newly joined members, and the weaker warriors, were my soul fired. Li Filo cursed with great hatred, ah, you stupid, why don't you take everyone's soul and heart? You only know to talk about me. Xiao Lushan retorted sternly, what about you, which Wuxian soul fire have you received? I. Li Filo smiled bitterly, I am a member of the clan 
that is my clan member, I can't take their souls and hearts out of reason. Xiao Lushan sighed, hey, stop talking nonsense, and throw away the emperor-level medicine and emperor-level exercises. With that said, he took out the emperor-grade pill, and after a while reluctantly, threw it to the ground. Xiao Lushan actually wanted to take a sip, taste it, and then smashed the pill severely and let out a breath. But he was afraid that licking a mouthful or destroying the pill would get the mark in Solang's mouth, so he didn't dare to do so, so he could only throw away the intact pill. After losing the medicine, Xiao Lishan looked at Li Filo with a serious expression. If Li Filo is not lost, he will help. What? With an unwilling roar, Li Filo took out the gold patterned emperor level exercise technique in his arms and threw it to the ground. Soon, they found that two flying squirrels had grabbed the pill and the emperor level exercises and disappeared directly from the place. Seeing this scene, the two shivered fiercely again. Xiao Lushan took a deep breath, the clone of Emperor Sol Lang Wu is still there, and the flying squirrel is still there. Let's go quickly while the mark is gone. It is good. The somewhat languid Li Filo nodded, as if he was several hundred years old. Immediately after. The two quickly flew away. However, they soon discovered that the nightmare had not gone away. Those smiling avatars, those flying squirrels that could not be harmed by various means, still surrounded them, showing no signs of dispersing. Damn it, I'm afraid the imprint has already been transferred to us. Even if we didn't throw away the pill and the exercises, he will still catch up. Li Filo looked frightened and distraught, Xiao Slushan, I blame you, I blame you, my opportunity to become an emperor. Damn, how did I know it would be like this? Emperor Wu's methods are beyond our conjecture. Li Filu, don't blame me, I also lost the Emperor Grade Pill. Xiao Lushan's face paled, now that Emperor Wu is still chasing us, we can only immediately seek shelter from the Emperor level forces. My heart hurts so much. Li Filu clutched his heart, tears crisscrossed, you, Xiao Tushan, meeting you is really the worst thing in my life. Do not talk. I'm not the same unlucky, I blame Zhu Xian, she is the source of our unlucky. Xiao Lunchen gritted his teeth, his eyes were cracking, and immediately took out his scabbard, damn, I feel many people's hearts shake vividly, they want to betray me. Kill them, kill them. Li Filo shouted immediately. But, they are my only team. Xiao Lunchen couldn't bear it, moreover, there are still some people who are tough. How can I? At the same time. The Emperor's Death Domain. There are dozens of martial gods of the Lanchenlu and Wuquexian clan, as well as more than 2,000 quasi sage martial arts, divided into three piles, each fighting on one side. Not bad. Before, it was divided into two groups of people with souls and no souls. But now there is a third pile, and that is the Wuquexians who have given their souls to Sol Lang. At this moment, there is a marshal who is choosing the immortal level technique. This person was named Zingtai Wuxian, a martial artist of Slaughter Heaven Tower, and like Duanqing Wuxian, he was a martial immortal of the Four Tribulations, and he was very powerful. Moreover, although his cultivation is not as good as Zhu Xian and other first level martial immortals, he is an old man in the Tuan Tian Tower, who has lived for four million years. Therefore, Xiao Lushan did not collect his soul to show respect for the elderly. But at this time, under the influence of life threats, material temptations and some of his own thoughts, he immediately chose to surrender to Sol Lang. Subordinates select these two immortal level exercises. After Zingtai Wuxian chose 20 pills, after a dazzling selection, he found two immortal level exercises that were most suitable for him. It is good. I will give you a copy later. Solang nodded, because some people chose the same technique, so they couldn't give the original one, otherwise it would not be enough. Fortunately, the copy is also the same, but you must be careful when burning the exercises, and there can be no mistakes. Thank you for the reward. Zingtaiwu bowed for the first time, 
and soon forced out his soul and gave it to Solang. And at this moment, a voice with deep hatred came from the crowd. Zingtai. You old thief, you really surrendered your soul. How much the original poster trusts you. He has treated you as a grown-up for millions of years, but you are so unfaithful and unrighteous. You, an old dog, cannot die. The angry curse sounded like lating, exploding in the crowd, and spreading towards the surrounding with a powerful martial arts power. The martial artists around have resisted, but there are still many great saints injured. After a while of confusion, immediately, everyone's eyes condensed on one person. That was a Wuxian standing in the soulless heart fire camp. At this time, his eyes were splitting, with a fierce expression, staring at Solang and Zingtai Wuxian rebelliously. It's Wuxian Zanhai. The strong man in the slaughter sky tower, the Wuxian of the five tribulations. Unexpectedly, he dared to come out, it was just looking for death. Yes, facing a martial emperor, this is howling before his death. He doesn't have any soul or heart, he probably felt desperate, so he broke out. Hey, my brother's soul fire is also in the hands of Emperor Tushinzuan, and I don't know if he will be killed when he is. Without the soul and heart, you can't show the highest reverence for Emperor Lang, and you can't show your loyalty. At this time, those who don't have a soul and heart, haven't come forward to choose medicine and exercises. I guess they can only rise up and run away desperately. No, how can Emperor Longdi's methods be something I can predict? Maybe Longdi has other ways to save them from death. I think so too, otherwise Longdi could kill them all in the morning, so how could he stay for now? Yet, yeah, Wuxian Zanhai was in a mess in despair. He didn't expect this. Now he is dead. Everyone talked a lot in private, looking at Wuxi and Zanhai as if they were looking at a dead person. At this time. Treat me as an elder? Ridiculous. Immortal Sing Tai Wu turned around and stared at Wu Xian Zhanhai without any fear, with a cold expression in his eyes, although I am an older generation in Tuan Tian Tower, everyone respects me on the surface, but in private they laughed at me for living in vain for four million years. It's an old trash. I have been in Tushinlu for so many years, except for the superficial respect, I have not received any rare training resources at all. As long as some rare medicines, natural materials and treasures have been given to you younger generations who are extraordinarily talented, I am an old and immortal, so I can only meditate and cultivate. How can you deny that? I have worked hard in the Tuan Tian Tower for millions of years. My cultivation is stagnant and it is inseparable from the treatment given to me by the Tushinlu. Now that Emperor Lang saves me from merciless fire and water, he has given me cultivation resources and practice techniques. Although I am a slave and a servant, I am willing. With that, Zingtai Wuxian respectfully knelt down to So Lang. As soon as he said this, Wuxian Zanhai was speechless, he could only open his mouth and exasperated, glaring at Zingtai Wuxian and the other warriors in Slaughter Tower were also silent. What Zingtai Wuxian said is true. He did work hard, but he didn't get any rare training resources. Instead, he only got a little reputation for nothing. In the martial arts world, strength is king, and reputation is just icing on the cake. Zingtai Wuxian complained about this, which was completely normal. Zingtai Wuxian. In any case, you are betrayed. You traitor, I am at odds with you. Also, Emperor Lang, your deity has been reluctant to come, I'm afraid you are going to hunt down two quasi emperors. With your clones, how can we stop us? Brothers, let's kill them. Wuxian Zanhai looked terrifying, yelled sternly, and immediately fled into the distance. But. After he flew out, he discovered that no one was running away with him at all. This is so embarrassing. But at this time the arrow had to be sent on the string, and Wuxian Zanhai, who was riding a tiger, could only hope that So Lang's deity was really dragged, unable to take care of himself. He used all kinds of secret techniques together, 
and fleeing far away crazy. Ha 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 ha. My deity is definitely not here. But who said that my clone is the only one? So Lang smiled faintly, with the thought, smoothly chasing and killing him with the clone dispatch and the clone replacement. In the next instant, the one who stayed in place became a clone. But dozens of Wuxian and Zhengxian heard So Lang's words, they all felt their backs numb, and fluke arose in their hearts. Fortunately, I didn't wait to escape with that fool. Yes, there are countless avatars of Emperor Lang. These primary Wuxian level avatars are only the lowest level, and Emperor Lang must have high level avatars. That fool is dead. Everyone whispered and discussed. Suddenly, they all looked in the direction where Wuxian Zanhai was escaping, with an expression of it really is on their faces. I saw a huge explosion on the horizon in the distance. The violent aura of a Wuxian of six tribulations and a Wuxian of five tribulations spread, making most people present panic. It's fighting. It's a clone of the six tribulations martial immortal level. This is certainly not the strongest clone of Longdi. Of course, I guess Longdi's strongest clone may have the rank of Quasi Emperor. Everyone talked softly, their eyes fixed on the battle in the distance. And the battle did not last long, just a few breaths, accompanied by Wuxian Zanhai's dying roar, his breath gradually weakened, and finally disappeared completely. Died. If you fight against Emperor Lang, can you not die? Everyone present is just ants in front of Emperor Lang. It is already a great gift for me to surrender and grant medicinal medicinal techniques, but Wuxian Zanhai wants to escape, it is ridiculous. Here, Emperor Lang's Six Tribulations Martial Immortal Clone is back. Everyone saw a stalwart figure flying in the distance. He held the head of Wuxian Zanhai in one hand and a regular fairy crystal in the other, playing with it carefully. Just now. So Lang used the swallowing clone and directly swallowed 15 clones, instantly raising his combat power to 6 tribulations martial immortal. Zanhai Wuxian was only the 5 tribulations Wuxian, and the difference between 1 tribulation was the difference between heaven and earth, and was quickly killed by So Lang. The clones that were killed before were all clone incarnations, so there were a lot of clones that could be swallowed. At this time, 15 clones were swallowed, and a full 10 clones had not been swallowed, so their strength could skyrocket. In the awe of everyone's eyes, So Lang's figure was getting closer. They also clearly saw the things in So Lang's hands, the head, and the regular fairy crystal. This immediately horrified them. It's the head of Wuxian Zanhai. A generation of five tribulations martial immortals, a difference in thought, the direct deity is destroyed. The avatar of Emperor Lang taking his head back is meant to kill the chicken and the monkey. If I dare to imitate Zan Hai, the same will end. Don't pay attention to that head, look, isn't the rule fairy crystal on the right hand of Emperor Lang's clone? Rules immortal crystal. That is the treasure that appears with a very small probability when Wuxi involuntarily condenses before death. What does the Emperor Lang hold at this time? Could it be that it was condensed from the body of Wuxian Zanhai by any special means? What? Forced to condense the rules of fairy crystals? I have heard of this kind of thing, and it has never been recorded in history. What does it mean that Longdi clone holding the rule immortal crystal? Everyone kept guessing and coveted secretly. If a quasi immortal obtains a regular immortal crystal, the chance of becoming a martial immortal can be greatly increased. Moreover, even if a martial artist who has already achieved martial arts obtains it, he can use this to prove martial arts and speed up his cultivation. At this time, So Lang has come to the top of everyone, looking down at them faintly, those who dare to escape are like this person. Its voice was not loud and not cold, but it made everyone frightened. Those who are eager to move in their hearts no longer dare to have any wrong intentions, even those warriors who have no soul and heart. Suddenly, a martial immortal in the Tuan Tian Tower gritted his teeth, walked out tremblingly, and knelt under So Lang, Master Lang, I have no soul and heart, life and death are in the hands of Xiao Tuan Tian, and hope that Emperor Lang can help. 
Hung Lian Wuxian. A Wuxian nearby shouted worriedly. That Hung Lian Wuxian walked out to worship, and Sunshin Sundi must have known it instantly. As long as the Emperor Zushinzun had a thought, his death would disappear. Originally, it was useless for me to wait. So Lang looked down at the people indifferently, the only effect is to kill, condense the rules of the fairy crystal, and reward my servants. This statement came out. The crowd suddenly thundered. Those warriors who did not have the soul and fire in the heaven slaughter tower were chilly, and they only felt that their own time of death was coming. The others were shocked and inconceivable at Solang's condensed rule fairy crystal. Master Longdi really can condense the rule fairy crystals. Heaven, what a method is this, and what kind of cultivation is Longdi? Even the rule immortal crystal can forcefully condense. In the eyes of Emperor Longdi, the rule immortal crystal can only condense at will, and he can reward the objects of his servants at will. It can be seen how terrifying the Lord Longdi is. If I become a servant of Emperor Lang, I will have the opportunity to get the rule immortal crystal, and the road to becoming a martial immortal will become much smoother. This is a rare opportunity forever. Everyone was talking, the heart of awe, surrender, and desire rose. At this time, so Lang's voice continued, but if you wait for your sincere return, I can try to get your souls back. As soon as this sentence came out, everyone was shocked. Those warriors whose souls are in the hands of Sunshin Sundi are even more excited. Longdi deserves to be Longdi, and he can even retrieve the soul fire that he has already handed over. I don't have to die, Longdi can save us. The slaughter of the Sky Martial Artist has no other thoughts at all. Before they had no way out, there was only a dead end in front of them, of course they wanted to escape. Now that there is a way to survive, naturally you will not seek death. Wait, don't worry. So Lang smiled faintly, it's time to go forward and choose the pill method, continue. Master, I am willing to surrender. I am willing to be a slave and a servant. A quasi-immortal rushed forward hurriedly almost flying to Solang on his knees, constantly kowtow. I'm going, is this guy a mouse? He rushed out all of a sudden, and he was one step ahead of me. I want to go up too. This guy is just a quasi-immortal. He has no self-knowledge at all. I don't know if he should wait behind him. A group of warriors looked at the quasi-immortal who rushed out and cursed secretly. It is good. You choose. Solang was not despised because this person was just a quasi-immortal, his voice was still flat. Thank you, Lord. Zhengxian immediately chose the immortal pill and the immortal level exercises, smirked and handed over his soul fire, and then stood in the third camp. Next. Solang nodded and called softly. Suddenly, several people rushed up, but they were afraid to offend Solang. After some hesitation, Several people stopped, and only one Wuxian came to Solang. Choose. Solang's voice was faint, neither indifferent, nor gentle. Yes. This Wuxian bowed his head respectfully, and then began to choose. When Solang asked everyone to choose the exercises and medicinal pills one by one, he was actually not idle. He was still scaring Xiao Lushan and Li Filu, two old confused quasi emperors. At this moment, far away in the middle of the Kanglin continent, Xiao Lushan and Li Filo were flying at full strength, fleeing frantically. Their faces were full of anxiety and panic, as well as a trace of fatigue and despair. After escaping for so long, those flying squirrels have not diminished at all, and the clone of Emperor Solang Guyu not only appeared, with a creepy smile. The two who were struggling with their lives almost cried under tremendous psychological pressure. Damn it, I haven't escaped Sol Lang's pursuit. Quickly, the territory of the Red Lotus Emperor clan is ahead, and Emperor Wu Lian will definitely protect us. Even if we can get the blessing of Emperor Red Lotus Wu Di, the two of me will have to pay a great price, and I am afraid that my immortal clan will be swallowed by Emperor Red Lotus. It's good to be able to live but those who are still entangled? My slaughter tower is gone. 
my subordinates all want to betray me at this time. Then you don't kill them yet. Kill them. Damn, I thought they would rather die than surrender, but Zanhai was the only one, and was killed. I will kill them. Xiao Lushan's face was full of madness, and his subordinates would be killed through the fire of soul in the next moment. But at this moment, Sol Lang's voice came, Your subordinates, I am very interested. However, it was Sol Lang who controlled a avatar, blocking the path of Xiao and Li. Slow. Don't kill them. Li Filo heard Sol Lang's words, and suddenly exclaimed to stop Xiao Lushan. Do not. I'm going to kill them. Ah. Xiao Lushan roared with blood red eyes, but stopped his murder. Because he knew that Sol Lang was interested in his subordinates, this was a bargaining chip. It is precisely because of this that Li Filo will stop him. So Di. Li Filo hurriedly said loudly, I don't know what use you want Xiao Lushan's subordinates to do, but we don't need to kill them. In exchange, you let us go. After speaking, he winked at Xiao Lushan. In Li Filo's view, Sol Lang is also very likely to see them entering the territory of Emperor Red Lotus, not willing to offend Emperor Emperor Red Lotus. Therefore, at this juncture, he said that he was interested in those who killed this guy. This is to take advantage of them. In other words, the Emperor Wu who claimed to be Sol Lang might not intend to chase him. For them, this is a great opportunity to get away and must be seized. Not bad. Xiao Lushan said, I can let go of those traitors, but you must let us go. Don't you consider thinking about becoming my servant? Anyway, you have to take refuge in Gilean, it's better to come to me. Sol Lang smiled faintly, the Emperor Pill appeared on his left hand, and the Emperor Grade Technique appeared on his right hand. Then, what about the soul? Li Filo was shocked and asked. After all, he was still reluctant to bear the Emperor level exercises, and this thing could not be obtained by taking refuge in Emperor Red Lotus. Of course you have to leave it to me. Sol Lang grinned, somewhat evil. No. Impossible. We can't give you our souls. Xiao Luncheon gritted his teeth and said, even if we take refuge in Emperor Red Lotus, he won't want our souls to be angry. Yes, Lord Su Di. Li Fila cried out, We have taken refuge in you, and our lives are between your thoughts, why bother let us give up our souls? The two of them consciously have offended Sol Lang, the Emperor Wu, and worry that they will still receive revenge after surrendering, so they are not so reluctant to give up their souls. Without my soul, I can't trust you. Sol Lang smiled, Since you are not willing, then forget it, you can leave after paying enough. Pay the price. What price do you want us to pay? What if we don't want it? Xiao Lushan said nervously, looking in the direction of the Red Lotus Emperor from time to time. As soon as he said this, Li Filo immediately trembled, for fear that Sol Lang would become angry. No? Then you will die. Sol Lang smiled, don't think that Emperor Wu Lian can protect you. Even if you escape into the Emperor Red Lotus clan, I can let him hand you over automatically. If you don't believe it, you can try. Try it. Try it. Xiao Luncheon's expression turned ruthless. He felt that Sol Lang's deity hadn't caught up for so long, and there was something strange in it. So it was a little fluke. Xiao Tushan, you really think you can escape, so let's escape. Sol Lang smiled disdainfully and immediately gave way to Xiao Lushan and showed him the way, no, there is the territory of the Red Lotus Emperor clan, go. Sol Lang said that he could make friends with the Honglian Emperor, but he didn't just say that he really has such an ability. Because he has a powerful array control ability. Emperor Wulian is unwilling to hand over someone? Okay, give you control of the Guardian formation in your clan, and self-destructed, let's see where you cry. In addition, there are also methods such as treasure hunting flying 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 flying, looting all the way, robbing all the places they pass, and always tossing the Red Lotus Emperor clan to cry without tears. Master Su's forgiveness, he just spoke quickly. 
At this time, Li Fila quickly stopped Xiao Lushan and apologized to Sou Lang, We are willing to pay the price and redeem our lives. I wonder what Lord Wu needs us to pay. Ha 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 ha. Since it is a redemption, of course you have to pay something equivalent to yours. Sou Lang smiled in his heart, You can hand over all your belongings, although I don't think there are many. Su so Di. Don't go too far. When Xiao Lishan heard that Sou Lang asked them to surrender their possessions, he suddenly became anxious. Xiao Lushan, shut up. The ability to exchange a little property for a life is already a great gift from Lord Su, don't be dissatisfied. Li Filo yelled at him. He was so afraid that Xiao Lushan would continue to die, and he had lost the chance to escape that he had finally obtained. Tisk Tut. This Li Filo is a good helper for me. So Lang smiled in his heart, of course he was still indifferent on the surface. And Xiao Lushan was scolded by Li Filu, and he was even more angry, but after all, he was not that kind of reckless man, so he stopped talking. So Lang suddenly showed a trace of impatience, I don't have time to waste on you, so hurry up and hand over things. I'm going back. Yes, let's hand it over. Li Filo was so scared that he stood upside down and immediately opened the Wuxian inner realm. Under the witness of Sou Lang, he handed over almost everything. All that is left are his personal belongings. Sou Lang possesses the ability to recognize treasures and so on. With a glance, he can see that the value of those things is not high, so he left Li Filo to keep it. For this, Li Filo was simply grateful. Xiao Lushan what are you still waiting for? After handing over his possessions, Li Filo immediately began to supervise Xiao Lushan. Okay, I'll pay it. Xiao Lushan hung his head, gritted his teeth and unfolded the inner boundary of Wuxian, suddenly a large number of items appeared in front of Sou Lang. Immediately after, most of the contents belonged to Sou Lang, including the Quasi Emperor Weapon Slaughter Sky Scabbard in Xiao Lushan's hand. However, some of the things he left were very valuable, and Sou Lang couldn't bear to let it go. The most important of these are the three exercises practiced by Xiao Tushan, Burning Heaven Emperor Sutra, Burning Soul Lonely Lamp Ju, and Non-Sword Immortal Sutra. Xiao Lushan, don't you want to survive? The corner of Sou Lang's mouth raised slightly, revealing a sneer. My emperor level technique cannot be handed to you. Xiao Lushan stared with blood-red eyes, looking desperately, that is the treasure of the Emperor Burning Clan, and I will never give it to you. Xiao Lushan, you fool! Li Filo on the side couldn't help saying, if Lord So killed you, wouldn't he get your technique? Why are you so stupid? Fuck! So Lang raised his brows slightly, Li Filo, this guy really looks like my subordinate, he's helping me with everything making me laugh. And Xiao Lushan heard Li Filo's words, and he also felt a little irrational. Now that he has paid such a big price, he can get away with just paying more exercises, and now he is desperately late and still suffers too much. Besides, you don't have to hand it over the exercises and you won't be able to. It's still in your mind, but there are more people who know it. Hateful. If I become the emperor the day. Xiao Lushan roared wildly in his heart, and reluctantly handed over the Emperor level cultivation technique and the other two immortal level cultivation techniques to Sou Lang. Humph! Sou Lang accepted the exercises, curled his lips, and said, Is the Emperor grade material you've hidden, isn't it considered to be handed over? This Su Di, his eyes are so harsh. Xiao Lushan was horrified. He did hide an emperor grade material and put it in the corner disguised as a holy grade material, but he didn't expect to be recognized by Sou Lang at a glance. But Li Filo was frightened. He didn't expect Xiao Lushan to dare to die, but Sou Lang saw it through. Who is Sou Lang? It is Emperor Wu, and the Emperor Wu is very powerful. You are so impatient that you dared to hide things under the eyes of Emperor Wu. This is Li Filo's idea. Xiao Lushan also regretted a little. Of course, they didn't know that Sou Lang was just a nine-star great sage, 
and he didn't know how many great heavens he was missing from Emperor Wu. I pay it. I just forgot for a while. Xiao Lushan cried and said something that ghosts didn't believe him, and handed out the Emperor grade materials. So far, he and Li Filu are basically bankrupt. The Avatar Solang collected the treasures of the two and disappeared immediately. The treasure hunting flying 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 around also disappeared out of thin air. Seeing this unpredictable and weird method, Li Filu and Xiao Lushan couldn't help but fear Solang, the omniscient and all-powerful emperor. When all the treasure hunt flying flying gliders disappeared, the two men were relieved. Get away! My two finally survived. Pity my treasure for nearly tens of millions of years, all used to eliminate disasters. Suddenly, the two of them hated Zhu Xian again. If it weren't for Zhu Xian's voice, they were now eating the emperor-level pill and looking at the emperor-level practice. It's really a difference in thought, the difference between heaven and earth. Li Filu and Xiao Lushan smiled bitterly, messy and desolate in the wind. Suddenly, there was a sense of sympathy. And at this moment, Xiao Lushan suddenly looked between the two of them like an electric shock, where a key was still floating quietly. Li Filu noticed Xiao Lushan's strangeness and looked over, and exclaimed, My two have forgotten the key to the Emperor's forbidden land. Xiao Lushan's face was ecstatic, and his voice trembled with excitement, the reason why Su Di didn't take this key is probably because of the unspoken rules between Emperor Wu. He can't interfere in the inheritance of Emperor Wu Di. In other words, there is still a chance to become an emperor. Li Filo's eyes came out like searchlights, and they met Xiao Lushan's excited eyes. Suddenly, the feeling of sympathy and sympathy disappeared, and the tense atmosphere and violent fighting spirit gradually spread. Soon after, the key is mine, you let go. Fuck off, if it weren't for me to keep reminding you, you would have been killed by Emperor Su, you have to give me this key. It's going to you, if it wasn't for my Emperor level technique, would Su Di be so easily satisfied? I pay the most, and the key is mine. Xiao Lushan, you white-eyed wolf, I saved your life, I am your savior. I only saved your life. The Emperor Su simply didn't like it because of your possessions and cultivation techniques. I relied on my imperial cultivation techniques and treasures to redeem your life. I redeemed your life. You dog thief, you are really shameless to the extreme. My Wu Vi Xian clan has a long history of slaughter heaven tower, and I have more treasures than you. Even if there is no emperor treasure, it is more valuable than what you handed over. The imperial level technique and the imperial level materials are not as good as your tattered ones? Li Filu, you are really shameless. I see if Grandpa and I can't kill you today. Fight as long as you fight, my son Xiao Tushan, die. Suddenly, the enemies fought bang bang bang. At the same time, in the dead zone of the emperor, the deity Solang closed his eyes, floating in the air. All the warriors who possessed the soul heart fire gave him the soul heart fire, received the pill, and chose the immortal level technique. Two groups of people became three groups of people, and then two groups of people. A group of people stood in front of and below Soul Lang, all of them were the warriors who had handed over their souls and hearts. They looked at Soul Lang eagerly, the whole being like an ant on a hot pot. Another group of people stood behind Soul Lang, excited stroking the elixir in their hands over and over again. Many people look at the group of people who have no soul and heart from time to time, and occasionally gloat in their eyes. Especially the warriors of Wu Vi Zion Zhu almost made no secrets. However, some people are full of worries. That is Zhu Xian and other high-level warriors of the original Luncheon Tower. They surrendered their souls and became Sol Lang's servants half-pushing half-heartedly, benefiting from them and saving themselves from death. They were very worried about the companions who had handed their souls to Xiao Lushan, for fear that the warriors who were alive and well would all die at once. At this moment, Sol Lang, who hovered above everyone's heads and was looked up to by everyone, suddenly opened his eyes. Master Longdi. Seeing that Sol Lang opened his eyes, everyone was in awe, 
and his stature could not help being slightly shorter. Take a look, what is this? Solang smiled faintly, waved his hand, and a scabbard appeared in the eyes of everyone. The scabbard was completely black and plain, except for a red rope tied to the opening of the scabbard, and two red to black beads strung on both ends of the rope. Seeing this scabbard, everyone was shocked, their eyes widened and their jaws drooping. It's Slaughter Sky Sword Sheath. I feel it, my soul is on the top. Heaven, the Slaughter Sky Scabbard is a Quasi Emperor soldier, and the Quasi Emperor is great. Xiao Slushan never left his hand, but at this time it fell into the hands of Lord Longdi. Doesn't this mean that Xiao Slushan has already fallen? Xiao Lanshan disobeyed Lord Lang's order and dared to escape. He has been killed. My soul and heart are no longer in the hands of Xiao Lanshan. I don't have to worry about death in the next moment. Longdi Lord is too powerful, killing the Quasi Emperor Xiao Lushan in such a short period of time, he deserves to be Emperor Wu. Yes, yeah, I am waiting to follow Lord Longdi, the future is boundless. There was a lot of discussion, especially the group of warriors who had no souls and hearts, and had been worried. At this time, they completely let go of their hearts. Of course, there are some people who are not in high mood, such as Zhu Xian and others, as well as the warriors of the Wuquexian clan. Zhu Xian and the others were quite trusted by Xiao Lushan, so they didn't give up their souls. At this time, they took refuge in Longdi, Xiao Lushan fell, and their hearts were incredibly complicated. The warriors of the Wuquexian clan have some concerns about Li Filu. The old man who always helped Solang inadvertently did not do little to benefit his clansmen on weekdays, and the warriors of Wu Vizianzu respected him. Seeing that Xiao Lushan was dead at this time, he speculated that Li Filu must have been violent, and couldn't help feeling sad instinctively. At this time, I am not a murderer. Solang suddenly smiled and said, Although Xiao Lushan and Li Filu offended me, I did not kill them. Both of them have paid a sufficient price and gained freedom. This word fell in the ears of everyone, and those who were worried would not worry immediately. Solang also became benevolent in their hearts, not the kind of fierce and brutal tyrant. Such as Zhu Xian and other high-rise buildings in the original Lanshan Tower, as well as the warriors of the Wuquexian clan, are like this. They had a much better sense of Solang, and since they had done so, they had better serve the Lord, and they were completely at heart. Those happily Tuantian Lu warriors were not worried about future revenge because Xiao Tuantian did not die. They are now under Solang's command, embracing bigger thighs, still afraid of Xiao Tushan? Then, everyone came forward to flatter and praise Solang for his broad-mindedness and noble morals. Okay, it's all quiet. Solang waved his hand gently, and everyone immediately closed their mouths, showing respect. Immediately, Solang placed the slaying sky sword scabbard in front of everyone, the soul and heart fire on this, I will take all of it into the sea of knowledge. Your treatment is the same as the rest of the people. Now you all go forward and choose the medicine and exercises. The Lord is kind. Those warriors who have no soul and heart are excited, lining up to choose the medicine. In this gap, Sol Lang's gaze fell on the slaughter sky sword sheath. Come out. Don't hide. Sol Lang stared at the two beads on the scabbard rope, the corners of his mouth slightly raised. The slaughter sky sword sheath is a quasi emperor soldier, the king among immortal weapons, and the most advanced weapon under the emperor soldier. It certainly has its own spirit, and it is also very mature. Sol Lang guessed that this scabbard was at least 10 million years old and belonged to the quasi-imperial soldier caste in the era of Emperor Woody Nine Revolutions. In a long time, the spirit of the Slaughter Sky Sword Sheath has already been fully witty, not only not inferior to intelligent creatures, but even worse. And this spirit is now hidden in the two red to black beads. However, So Lang's words seem to have no effect. The beads are motionless. Dare to play dead. Then I will let you really die. Solang curled his lips in disdain, and the brilliance in his eyes gradually became cold. 
An inexplicable breath descended on the slaughter sky scabbard, which was a gigabyte that was about to use the one key decomposition function. Do not. Do not kill me. I will come out now. The two beads on the scabbard suddenly rose out of thin air, swaying like two hands, and begging for mercy. This spirit originally thought that if it was hidden, So Lang could not use it, but he didn't expect that the other party would destroy it if he didn't agree. Moreover, it is the kind that can kill it in an instant, and it doesn't even have the power to resist. The Soviet Emperor's method is too weird. My dignified and quasi-imperial soldiers have actually felt powerless and desperate. The spirit of the slaughter sky sword sheath appeared while thinking. As soon as it appeared, it not only attracted the attention of Solang, but also attracted the attention of most people. The appearance of this tool is very strange, like a gourd. The lower part of the gourd is a swollen belly, and the upper part is also swollen, but it has facial features that can be regarded as its head. Above the head, there is a curly dull hair, fluttering in the wind. My fork, it turned out to be a gourd baby. The corner of Solang's mouth twitched, and his heart said that the small appearance of this instrument was really unique. I'm not called Calabash Baby. The spirit of Slaughter Sky Scabbard cautiously retorted. I have lived so long, what kind of baby is still called? I don't want face. No. You are called Calabash Baby. Solang's tone was very firm, and there was no room for negotiation. I. The spirit of Slaughter Sky Sword Sheath still wanted to refute, but suddenly remembered the sense of crisis before, and couldn't help swallowing the words immediately. Well, it's just a code name anyway, Gord Baby Gord Baby. Calabash Baby, how old are you? Solang asked curiously. 1,123,000 years old. Hulua said, that cartoon-like face showed a trace of pride. Sure enough, it was from the era of Emperor Woody of the Ninth Revolution. Solang nodded. Hulua suddenly said, I, I am not a thing. Okay. Solang looked stunned, but he didn't expect this gourd baby to scold himself. The other warriors also looked at each other not knowing what to say. Hulua was a little scared, but still said, I am not a thing, I am a creature. Good good, you are not a thing. Solang smiled dumbly, and smiled in his heart, this guy has lived for so long, and it doesn't look like he has become a spirit. Does it mean that the spirit of the weapon has some mental retardation attributes? Hmm. Gord Baby was affirmed by Solang and was very satisfied. Calabash baby, from now on, you will follow me. Solang tickled the corner of his mouth and said, I will be your new master from now on, don't you know? I know. Gord baby blinked her eyes and looked very familiar. Seeing this, Solang breathed a sigh of relief, he was afraid that this guy was very stubborn, and if he kept being disobedient, it would be annoying. Of course, it was possible to decompose it without Solang and then recompose it. But in this way, the Qiling is not the previous one, but a new one. What Solang wanted was the original device spirit, because it lived long enough, and it must know more. Intelligence and information are as important as combat power, so Solang will not break it down unless it is impossible. Ah, very good. Solang smiled, as long as you obediently be my weapon, I will give you good food and promote you to the Imperial Soldier. Emperor Soldier. Calabash Baby asked in horror, Really? You can promote me to the Imperial Soldier? Of course. You know, I am an Emperor level refiner. Solang smiled faintly, Don't talk about Imperial Soldiers, even at a higher level, you have the opportunity to be promoted, of course, the premise is to be obedient. Yes. I must be obedient. Hulua said hurriedly, I will do whatever you ask me to do. It thought that this new master was much better than Xiao Lushan. That Xiao Lushan only knew to fight with it. After the fight, it was damaged. Xiao Lushan couldn't repair it. He could only wait for it to heal. But this new master is different, this is an emperor level refiner. 
for the weapons that have opened their minds, advanced refiners are their eager presence. Therefore, senior craftsmen can repair them and even help them advance. At this time, So Lang said, let's talk about it, since you opened up Ling Zi, how many times has the Kanglin continent have experienced battles of the ages, and what are the victories? Well, I went through the battle of the fall of Emperor Wudi ten million years ago. Seven million years ago, the Jingtian continent colluded with the 79 continent fragments outside our Kanglin continent to attack our continent together. Five million years ago, I experienced another mainland battle. In that battle, my first master, Emperor Fen, fell, the Emperor's Sword of Heaven was destroyed, and Emperor Fen clan fell apart. After that, there were four more battles on the mainland. I went through three masters and passed it to Xiao Lushan. So far, only Xiao Lushan is left in the Fen Emperor clan. In the first war, our Kanglin continent and Jingtian continent were both injured. It was a draw. In the subsequent wars, the balance of victory and defeat gradually tended to Jingtian continent. In the battle one million years ago, Jingtian continent even broke into the Kanglin continent. Finally, Wu Di Palace used the trump cards to kill three Wu Di and drove them back. However, those three Emperor Wu are only the lowest level Emperor Wu, and Jingtian continent is not considered a painful one. Instead, Emperor Wu Di's whole cards seem to be exhausted. The next war is not far away. If there is no accident, the Kanglin continent should be defeated and merged by the Jingtian continent. As the Gourd Baby was talking, she even sighed a little, and she seemed to have a sense of belonging to Kanglin continent. If there is no accident, will Kanglin continent fail? A sneer appeared on So Lang's face, unfortunately, the accident has already occurred, that's me. His tone was sonorous and powerful, and he seemed to have seen the day when Kanglin continent won. Seeing this scene, the surrounding Wuxians were full of thoughts. First of all, they became interested in So Lang's problems. In the Kanglin continent, everyone at the Wuxian level knows almost the history of thousands of years. But Longdi didn't even know? Why does Longdi not know this history? Is it because he is too short? This is impossible. Emperor Lang is a powerful Emperor Wu, the best among them, and he is definitely not a short year old. Then, why would Emperor Lang ask such a question? Perhaps on the contrary, the age of Emperor Lang is too long. He has fallen asleep in the long river of time, and it is today after waking up. It makes sense, Emperor Lang must be a great emperor who has lived forever. After he awakens, the original subordinates around him have long since disappeared, so he will look for new servants. Not bad, it must be like this. Everyone kept replenishing their brains, and So Lang's image became taller and more mysterious, becoming an old monster sleeping behind every age. So Lang also faintly heard everyone's discussion, and his heart was very funny. To be honest, it has only been about two months since he was reborn in Red Maple City, plus his previous life, he is less than 25 years old. There is no such thing as an old monster sleeping in the long river of time. I believe these new subordinates will soon discover that So Lang is not the old monster in imagination. So Lang was not interested in what they would think and react after they knew the truth. Anyway, the soul's heart is held in his hand, and their life and death can be determined with a single thought, and what is there to worry about? Asked about the battle of the mainland for thousands of years. So Lang asked for information about the various forces on the Kanglin continent. This time not only the Gourd Baby was answering, but there were also a few diligent Wuxians around to add. It turns out that there are currently 29 Emperor Wu in the Kanglin continent, and nine of them are in the Emperor Wu Palace, making it the largest Emperor Wu force. In addition, there are Suindeo Tai and Kinju Emperor Realm. There are four Wudi, and their races are behind them. Then there are the eleven Emperor clan, Honglian, Baiyu, Ziming, and so on. Among them, the Baiyu Emperor clan is a twin emperor, and they are twins, which are extremely rare. All the imperial clans are basically in the middle and north of Kanglin continent. 
Because of the distribution of resources in the Kanglin continent, the south is too barren, and the Red Lotus Emperor clan is considered the most southern emperor. On the other side of the Tengui East China Sea, there is also an emperor that depends on the south, namely Ziyaming. But the Ziyaming emperor's sense of existence is very weak, so he came back to cooperate with the emperors to fight against the Jingtian continent during the Battle of the Continent, and would never leave the house like a dead house. This is very strange, it is estimated that only the Wudi level big boss will know the reason. At this moment, in Solang's mind, there was already a map of Kanglin continent's power. Taking the Emperor's death domain as the dividing line, the most advanced force in the south is the Fairy Clan. The land occupied by Solang was only 1% of the total area of the south. Going further south is the Great Rift Valley in the south. To the north of the death domain of the Emperor is the central part of Kanglin continent, with a large number of immortals and several emperors, and further north is the most prosperous place. The west of the Emperor's death domain is the icy world, almost a desert with no creatures, and the east is the Tengui Donghai, and the mysterious Ziming Emperor family. In addition to the territories on the Kanglin continent, the various Emperor clans also have extraterritorial continent fragments, which have various characteristic resources. Moreover, because the rules on the mainland fragments are easier to comprehend, although they are not as good as one thousandth of the Blue Star, they are also the cultivation base for Wusheng and Wuxian. Of course, the distribution of these forces mentioned by the people is all on the surface, no one can be sure, there will be no more martial emperors, more forces on the Kanglin continent. In the eyes of everyone, isn't Solang just a super boss who just awakened? After asking about the power distribution, Solang put away the Slaughter Sky Sword Sheath. Because everyone has already chosen the medicine and exercises. The two groups of people completely merged into one group, and they all became Solang's servants. Tisk Tusk, 36 Wuxians, 2800 Zungzian, and Great Sage. Seeing the dark group of servants, Solang couldn't help but raise his mouth slightly. He also didn't expect that on a whim, he would have such a reward if he visited this emperor's death zone. Moreover, these people are only part of the harvest. In addition to people, I want your money. Solang smiled secretly in his heart, with a slight smile on the surface, now everyone gives me all of their wealth. I will use it to refine pills and immortals, and then return it to you. Yes. Emperor Lang is going to personally refine pills and weapons for us. This is another generous gift. Yet. Yeah, although I am required to wait until I surrender all my wealth, but how much of our possessions we have, Longdi simply looks down on it. All this is not for our good. Not bad. Everyone talked about it and handed over all their belongings. Not only the spirit jade, the fairy jade, all the materials, but also all the exercises were handed over at Solang's request. Like Xiao Lushan and Li Filu, they only left some personal belongings. But there are some beautiful martial artists who gave Solang their underwear together, not knowing what they were thinking. All the belongings of everyone were collected. Solang's storage space suddenly piled up into hills. The variety of refining materials, alchemy materials, and various exercises are dazzling and dazzling. Among them, there are the most items from Xiao Lushan and Li Filu, and even emperor level materials. In addition to this, the things that made Solang most concerned were the fairy jade and the spirit jade. System. Solang ordered, deposit all spirit jade and fairy jade. Ding. All spirit jade and fairy jade have been deposited in the system. Ding. The amount of funds is too large, and the current unit has been changed to the best immortal jade. In the mysterious black space, the currency unit became the best immortal jade, and the subsequent amount became 245-686-7208. Although in terms of numbers, it is more than 200 million. However, its unit is the best immortal jade. You know, 1 million lower grade fairy jade is equal to a top grade fairy jade. 1 billion inferior jade is worth only 1000 top grade jade. It can be seen that Solang is so rich and rich now, 
his net worth has increased hundreds of thousands of times. System, first upgrade me the one key empowerment function. With sufficient funds, So Lang immediately began to upgrade system functions. Ding! Consumption of 1000 best immortal jade, the one key empowerment function has been increased to 5, the current empowerment efficiency has been increased to 50%, and the number of initiations per day has been increased to 5. Ding! Congratulations on upgrading the one key empowerment function to level 5, and you have obtained the new bonus function Gongfa Empowerment. Gong Method Empowerment, you can choose any exercise method to empower the specified target, and the current efficiency is 50%, which can make the target obtain a small level proficiency. The number of exercises initiation and the number of cultivation base initiations are not related to each other. The system prompt disappears. Solang's expression was stunned, and he was immediately delighted, unexpectedly, the second function of one key empowerment turned out to be Gongfa initiation. I'm going farther and farther on the road of passing the Gong grandfather. After a while of joy, Solang continued to upgrade the one key empowerment function. Ding! Consumption of 10,000 Supreme Immortal Jade, the one key empowerment function has been increased to six levels, the current empowerment efficiency has been increased to 60%, and the number of initiations per day has been increased to six times. Ding! Consuming 100,000 Best Immortal Jade. Ding! Consume 10 million of the Best Immortal Jade, the one key empowerment function has been upgraded to nine levels, the current empowerment efficiency has been increased to 90%, and the number of daily empowerments has increased to 9 times. Next, it will consume 100 million of the best immortal jade. Solang took a deep breath and gave the order to continue upgrading, because at level 10, there will be a new bonus feature. Ding! Consume 100 million of the best immortal jade, the one key empowerment function has been upgraded to 10, the current empowerment efficiency has been increased to 100%, and the number of initiations per day has been increased to 10. Ding! Congratulations on upgrading the one key empowerment function to level 10. You have obtained the new bonus function Rule Empowerment. Rule Empowerment, you can choose a rule you have comprehended to instill on the specified target. The current empowerment efficiency is 100%, which allows the target to fully comprehend the rule. The number of regular empowerments, exercises, and cultivation base empowerments are not related to each other. Fuck. Is it the rule after the exercises? Rule empowerment, rules are something more difficult to understand than exercises. They are the mode for sanctification and the difficulties and obstacles of the road to immortality. But now I can actually empower others with the rules. Doesn't this mean that I can train Wu Sheng and Wu Xian in batches? Well, it's a pity that I only have 10 initiations now, so I can only make a Quasi Sage a real martial sage every day. This efficiency is still too slow, let the Quasi Sages go to Blue Star to understand it by themselves. My 10 times of empowerment will be used on key candidates, such as Chu Xiaobei and others. While thinking about it, so Lang turned his attention to other system functions. There are more than 100 million top quality fairy jade left. These top quality jade are completely enough to raise one key training and one key martial arts to level 30. We must have two new bonus functions later, I don't know what it will be. A gleam of light flashed in So Lang's eyes, and he immediately began to upgrade his one key practice. Ding! Consume 100 best immortal jade. The one key training function is upgraded to level 26, and the training speed is increased to 8.95 billion times the speed of the basic training without lack of qualification. Ding! Consuming 1000 best immortal jade, upgraded to level 27. Ding! Consume 10,000 best immortal jade. Ding! Consume 1 million of the best immortal jade, upgrade the one key training function to level 30 and increase the training speed to 143.2 billion times the speed of the basic training without lack of qualifications. Ding! Congratulations on upgrading the one key training function to level 30. 
you have obtained the new bonus function Qi Fang Inner World. 10 Fang Inner Boundaries, when the host reaches the level of Martial Immortal, it consumes a certain amount of cultivation base to expand more Martial Immortal Inner Boundaries. The maximum number is 10. The system prompt fell to Sol Lang's ears, making him smile, sure enough, it's another extremely powerful feature. Generally, Wuxian has only one inner realm. Once it is deployed, it is the peak of combat power. However, I can have up to 10 inner realms. How much combat power can be increased after deployment? Ordinary martial arts use the inner world as a whole card, so they dare not use it easily. Once they are destroyed, they will die. But I have 10 inner realms, which can be used casually. If they are destroyed, they can consume the cultivation base and condense them again. In addition, there is something more against the sky. After the inner boundary of Wuxian reaches the realm of Emperor Wu, it can be upgraded to the universe of life. I have ten inner realms, and then I will have ten universes of life. What a pervert is this! Although I don't know what bonus the life universe has to Emperor Wu, it is not difficult to predict that I have ten life universes, and the combat power is absolutely outstanding. Thinking of this, so Lang couldn't help laughing, causing the martial artists around him to be confused, and I wonder why Lord Longdi suddenly laughed. Of course, they didn't dare to speculate, they could only stand there obediently. So Lang quickly put away his smile and continued to upgrade system functions. Upgrading to level 30 at this time only consumed one million of the best immortal jade, only a fraction. Ding! Consume 10 million of the best immortal jade, the one key training function is upgraded to level 31, and the training speed is increased to 286.4 billion times the speed of the basic training without lack of qualifications. It's time to upgrade to one-click martial arts. So Lang did not continue to upgrade the one key training, but began to improve the one key martial arts function. Ding! Consumption of 100 best immortal jade, one key martial arts function increased to 26, the training speed increased to 89.5 million times the basic speed. Ding! Consumption of 1000 best immortal jade, the one key martial arts function is increased to 27, and the training speed is increased to 179 million times the basic speed. Ding! Consume 10,000 best immortal jade. After spending 1111110 the best immortal jade, the one key martial arts function has also been upgraded to level 31. The bonus function did not disappoint Sol Lang either. There are two bonus functions for one click martial arts training to level 30, one of which is 7 hearts, which increases the number of simultaneous practice exercises to 7. There is nothing to say about this function. Sol Lang is now looking at the information of the second bonus function. The 30th level bonus function of one click martial arts is called source of exercises. The source of the exercise method, the integrated exercise method formed by the unity of all the methods will produce the source of the profound meaning of the exercise method, which can be used to deduct powerful moves. Seeing this system prompt, So Lang showed joy between his eyes. This function of the source of the practice is obviously a supplement to the function of the integration of all laws into one. The ability to integrate all methods into one is to integrate all the exercises that Sol Lang has practiced into one super exercise that encompasses all aspects. But the moves of the various exercises are still the original ones. Although Sol Lang was able to retreat and repair, and gradually sort out more powerful moves, it would take too much time. Moreover, it is too difficult to sort out hundreds of exercises with one person's strength, and to eliminate the waste. So from the integration of the exercises to the present, Sol Lang has not deduced and sorted out his own moves. Those original moves that come with the exercises are usually used to make a living, but once faced with a strong enemy, they appear to be stretched. Therefore, in this aspect of the move, Sol Lang's shortcomings. Now, the source of the exercise method integrates all the techniques of the exercises to form a unique source from which various powerful moves can be performed. This is really dozing off and sending pillows. 
the corners of Solang's mouth raised slightly, appearing very satisfied. However, he did not immediately choose to perform the moves, because inside the mysterious black space, the six martial arts villains were about to complete the six exercises. Yes, it is so fast. Originally a holy level technique, it would take a day to complete the practice. But now the one-click martial arts function has been upgraded to level 31, and the training speed is 64 times faster than at level 25. In just half an hour, you can practice a holy technique to the founding level. Anyway, I still have a lot of top quality jade. Take advantage of this time to upgrade other system functions. While thinking about it, Solang issued an order to upgrade the clone dispatch. Ding! Consuming 1000 of the best immortal jade, the clone dispatch function is upgraded to level 26, the number of clones is plus 1, and the current number of clones is 26. Ding! Consumption of 10,000 Supreme Immortal Jade, the clone dispatch function is upgraded to 27, the number of clones is plus 1, and the current number of clones is 27. Ding! Consuming 100,000 Best Immortal Jade. Ding! Consume 1 million Best Immortal Jade. Ding! Consume 10 million of the Best Fairy Jade, the clone dispatch function is upgraded to 30, the number of clones is plus 1 and the current number of clones is 30. Ding! Congratulations on raising the clone dispatch function to level 30. You have obtained the new bonus function Higher Spiritual Intelligence. Higher Spiritual Intelligence, the spiritual intelligence level of the clone will be raised to the average level of a wise creature, no different from ordinary people. Higher Spiritual Wisdom. This bonus feature finally appeared. Solang raised his eyebrows. When he acquired the function of medium psychic intelligence, he knew that there would be a function of advanced psychic intelligence. Now, this feature has finally appeared. Solang is looking forward to this feature. Because, no matter how many subordinates there are, no matter how loyal those warriors are, there will be people who have a heartless day. However, the clone can be completely trusted and never betrayed. It is Solang's true confidant. At this time, the clones have a high level of spiritual wisdom, which is very convenient in many things. For example, Solang has always been thinking of the super humanoid weapon. This heavy treasure needs a large number of warriors to control at the same time, if the clone can participate in it, it will be very beneficial to Solang's overall management. In addition, there are numerous benefits. At this moment, Solang looked at several avatars around him. I saw the light of wisdom flashing in their eyes, which seemed a lot more agile. After the two avatars looked at each other, they even winked at each other, and there was a feeling of flying brows, which was very strange. Oh, even winks, not bad. Solang nodded in satisfaction, and temporarily put the clone dispatch function aside. Next, it's the one click treasure hunting function. Solang ordered, System, upgrade me the one-click treasure hunting function to level 30. Ding. Consume. Ding. Consume 10 million of the best immortal jade, the one-click treasure hunting function has been upgraded to level 30, and the number of treasure hunting flying flying gliders has increased to 2.86 billion. Ding. Congratulations on upgrading the one-click treasure hunting function to level 30. You have obtained the new bonus function Soul Soul. After a series of system prompts, the one-click treasure hunt function was finally upgraded to level 30. Solang was a little excited to check the information about the new bonus function. Suo Hun, treasure hunt flying flying gliders gain super tracking ability, even Emperor Wu cannot escape their tracking. I didn't expect it to be such a feature. If this function was available when I was hunting down and scaring Xiao Lushan and Li Filo before, I wouldn't have to bother to send the clones. The emergence of this feature also means that these little flying squirrels have a real ability to scout. Solang thought silently, and was also satisfied with this function. With this function, even in the vast Kanglin continent, it is very simple for Solang to find someone. Try to see how it works. 
The corner of Solang's mouth raised slightly, and he took out a piece of material from the storage space. This material is exactly the emperor-grade material obtained from Xiao Lushan, with the aura of Xiao Lushan on it. Immediately after, a treasure hunting flying flying fly appeared in Solang's hands. Their appearance hasn't changed in any way, and they still have the appearance of a golden striped glider. Find the original owner of this material. Solang put the emperor level materials in front of the treasure hunting flying gliders. The treasure hunting flying flying glider sniffed, and squeaked twice, indicating that he already knew what he was looking for. Solang smiled faintly, and dispatched the treasure hunting flying 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 glider to the last place where he and Xiao Lushan met, which was the edge of the Honglian Emperor clan. Moreover, Solang did not only dispatch this treasure hunting flying flying glider, but several thousand. It is worth mentioning that although there is only one treasure hunting flying flying glider who has sniffed Xiao Lan's breath, the remaining treasure hunting flying 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 gliders seem to share information and all know what they are looking for. As soon as they appeared, Xiao Lushan's breath was immediately felt. However, because Xiao Lushan and Li Filo were fighting before, the scope of the aura was very wide so the treasure hunting flying flying strays immediately dispersed and searched around in an organized and orderly manner. Soon, they started flying to the west based on Xiao Lushan's breath. On the way, there were pits and potholes everywhere in the battle. It can be seen that Xiao Lushan and Li Filo were both lingering on the way. Not long. The treasure hunt flying gliders finally found Xiao Lushan two people. They have been fighting, how far can they go? At this moment, Xiao Lushan and Li Filo were fighting fiercely, and they continued to scold each other. Li Filo, you shameless old man, you don't even have an emperor-level technique. What qualifications do you have to inherit the inheritance of Emperor Wu Di? Xiao Lunchen, the emperor-level inheritance of virtue is inhabited, you are a killer leader, and you don't know how many geniuses of Kanglin continent have been harmed you are not qualified to inherit the inheritance of Emperor Wu. Humph! In the world of warriors, everything speaks with strength. Waiting for me to beat you half dead, let's see if you can say what virtuous people live in. Ha 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 ha, who do you think you are, you have hurt me Avelis after playing for so long. Hey, stop talking nonsense, look at the trick. The two of them fought while scolding and they had completely lost the tolerance of the emperor. But soon, the two found the treasure hunting flying 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 around, and they were shocked. They both stopped in a tacit understanding, and they also moved closer to each other, quite meaning to join hands. Seeing their proficient movements, Solang almost laughed. It's the flying squirrel raised by Emperor Su. What's the matter, why are they looking for it again? Doesn't Su Di plan to let us go? Damn it, as long as we surrender all the net worth, we will be let go. This Su Di, is it the idea of a inheritance key? Xiao Lushan, you idiot, do you dare to speak ill of Su Di? You don't want to kill me. The two leaned together, shivering at the treasure hunting flying 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 around. Li Filo was brewing for a while, and he handed over to one of the treasure hunting flying flying gliders, I wonder what the Lord Su is looking for us. The treasure hunting flying flying glider couldn't speak, just staring at Xiao Lushan so firmly. Li Filo was slightly pleased to see this, Xiao Slushan, these treasure hunting flying flying gliders are all staring at you. Obviously they are here to find you. It has nothing to do with me, so you can do it yourself. With that said, Li Filo stopped talking. Xiao Lanshan shivered fiercely, gritted his teeth, and showed humiliation to the treasure hunting flying flying glider, Grandpa, please let me go. We will give you the key to the Emperor's forbidden land. Xiao Slushan Seeing that Xiao Lushan was about to hand over the inheritance key, Li Filo's mouth twitched. Didn't you say it has nothing to do with you? Humph. Xiao Lushan glanced at Li Filo and snorted bitterly, don't let go. Let me hand over the key to the Emperor's Forbidden Land to Lord Su. You. Li Filo's face flushed, but he was unable to refute. 
but he doesn't want to let go, once the key is let go, it really has nothing to do with him. Let go. Xiao Lushan said, You dead old man, do you want to kill me? Li Fila rolled his eyes and said coldly, Why didn't you let go and let me dedicate to Lord Su Di? Su Di is clearly here to find me, I must come. Xiao Lushan looked like he took it for granted, Hurry up, don't let Master Su wait for a long time. Li Filo looked struggling and hesitated. Seeing this, So Lang burst into laughter. He didn't care at all about the key to the Emperor's Forbidden Land. Because the guard guarding the entrance was a very high-level Imperial Seal formation, but it was not at all troublesome for So Lang. With just one hand of control of the formation, you can usurp the control of the Imperial Seal formation and open it directly. Grab the key? It's just taking off your pants and farting. Soon. With a thought, So Lang accepted the treasure hunting flying flying glider. Xiao Lushan and Li Filu, who were arguing endlessly, were taken aback when they saw that the treasure hunting flying flying glider had disappeared. I don't know why Emperor OSU suddenly came and left. Fortunately, he has no plans to break the unspoken rules, otherwise this only chance to become an emperor will be gone. When Xiao Lushan and Li Filo were confused, they also breathed a sigh of relief. Immediately afterwards, the two men showed fear at the same time, and they moved apart, their eyes collided, and the fighting spirit was surging. The key is mine. Fuck off, it's mine. Bah, you shameless killer boss, go to hell. Bang bang bang. The two fought again. Here, So Lang took back the treasure hunt flying flying glider, and then checked his balance of the best immortal jade. Five system functions were upgraded, and a total of more than 155 million yuan was spent on the best fairy jade. So the balance is a little over 90 million. Unfortunately, there is a difference of 10 million. So Lang shook his head regretfully, otherwise, I can still upgrade to one key training or one key martial arts. So far, this time upgrading system functions is over. At this time, the red-sleeved Wuxian who was as beautiful as a fairy pursed his small mouth, plucked up the courage to come to Solang and knelt down. This immediately attracted everyone's attention. Tisk tusk, the fairy red sleeve is going up. Is she asking Master Longdi to accept her as a concubine? No. As far as I know, Hong Shi Wuxian is not such a person. He <laughs> he, in front of a great existence like Emperor Lang, no matter how pure the woman is, she can't help being tempted. If it weren't for me to be a man, I would have gone up to fight with Hong Shi Wuxian at this time. Puff, let me give in, I want to stay away from this guy. While discussing, everyone looked at Hong Shi Wuxian with the corner of their eyes. What's the matter with you? So Lang looked at the slender and graceful red-sleeved Wuxian who was kneeling in front of him, and asked faintly. Master Longdi. Hong Shiu Wuxian looked earnestly, Hong Shiu Zhe Wu Xian has a younger sister who can't give up. I beg Lord Longdi to allow me to meet them. Well, then you go. So Lang nodded and looked around at everyone, as long as you have private affairs, handle it now. If you really have relatives and friends who can't let go, you can also bring them over, but the premise is to surrender your soul. With his family tied up, this is a good way for the monarch to restrain his men. But Solang is not interested in this. The fire of the soul has surpassed all restraints. Therefore, whether these subordinates should bring relatives and friends over is entirely voluntary. After Solang finished speaking, he used his system power to return to the Sea Fairy Palace in the sky. Dozens of martial immortals and thousands of quasi-immortal great sages kowtowed at the location where Solang had been before, and then scattered in groups happily. After receiving Solang's medicine and exercises, and tasted the sweetness, everyone planned to persuade their relatives and friends to join Solang. Therefore, for the time being, none of them went directly to the Yeokai Saint clan. It can be predicted that when they return, there will be more than two to three thousand people. After Solang returned to the fairy palace, he put away the cauldron in front of him and all the materials. 
soon. He sees himself internally, and his mind comes to the mysterious black space. I saw that the cultivator was already all golden, and obviously the accumulated cultivation base was long enough for Solang to improve his realm. I am currently a nine-star Wushan. Although I didn't want to break through to the immortal level before the rules were not perfect, but breaking through to the quasi-senile level has no effect. Solang's heart moved, and he gave the system an order to break through. Next moment. Endless liquid spiritual energy appeared in Solang's meridians, circling endlessly along the lines of the endless heart meridian, and gradually converged into the realm of Danchen Wushan. But these auras didn't seem to be enough. There was a strong attraction coming from Solang's body, which directly attracted the Linghi outside the fairy palace. I saw the surging Linghi like an angry dragon passing through the fairy palace, plunged into Solang's body, and turned into majestic energy. Solang's martial sage realm is rapidly expanding with the support of endless aura. Before, when Wushan space was at the six star level, it had the size of a country. At this time, the scope of Wushan space has expanded more than dozens of times. This vast space has an area of hundreds of millions of square kilometers, which is almost equal to the surface area of the blue star. In a sense, this is already a world. However, it was just a new world, with nothing in it, empty, like a dead place. Moreover, the rules are imperfect, and no creatures can be put in, otherwise they will undoubtedly die. The reason why Li Xianyang's inheritance space was able to enter people before was completely because that space had basically been integrated into the Kanglin continent, separated by only a thin space barrier. In addition to the expansion of Wushan space, the outer chaotic part has also expanded a lot. It is filled with thick platinum energy. The texture of these energy looks tighter, although it is liquid, it gives a feeling of tougher than steel. In addition to platinum energy, lightning grid-like matter of various colors has also become more. Obviously, although the cultivation realm cannot increase the types of rules, it can condense the same rules into more numbers. Quasi Wonderland, here it is. My world has also taken shape. Only after breaking through the piece of Wuxian, a real inner boundary can be formed. At that time, even if the creatures can't thrive in it, they can still put living things in, and there will be no impact in a short time. Furthermore, with me who has the function of Ten Fang Inner Realm, I can consume a certain amount of cultivation to create a full Ten Inner Realms. There was a glimmer of light in Sol Lang's eyes, and a little joy passed away. Next. Sol Lang glanced at the cultivation villain again, and found that the cultivation base above did not lose much. The speed of his cultivation is now 143.2 billion times the speed of the basic cultivation of the Wuxia level genius. One second of cultivation is equivalent to a quasi-immortal with no lack of qualifications meditating for 4,540 years. One minute of cultivation is equal to 272,400 years. Under normal circumstances, a nine-star martial sage meditates, and it takes a full 1.6 million years to break through to the immortal. In less than six minutes, Sol Lang can accumulate the cultivation base of Juxing Wushan to break through to the Quasi Immortal. This shows how terrifying his cultivation speed is. Such a fast cultivation speed, before I understand enough rules, I can definitely store endless cultivation skills. These cultivation bases are of great use whether they are forcibly elevating the realm of subordinates or keeping the inner realm of creation. Solang nodded in satisfaction, then took out the cauldron and began to refine the parts of the superhumanoid weapon. As for using the source of the exercise to deduct moves, you have to wait half an hour. Because there are still six Wushan level exercises that will be completed soon. If the move is performed at this time, after the exercise is completed, you have to perform it again, which is not cost-effective at all. Fire Solang thought, a large number of flame rules appeared under the cauldron. Seeing the rules of fire, Solang couldn't help but think of the strange fire obtained from the blue star. Even the fire rules cannot be derived. I don't know when this strange fire mystery will be solved. 
Solang's heart moved, and he immediately threw his distracting thoughts aside, and began to refine the tool seriously. After refining a large number of parts, his movements became more and more proficient. In the past, only about a hundred parts were refined in one afternoon, but now fifteen pieces were refined in less than half an hour. The refining speed has increased by fifty percent. That is when the fifteenth part is finished. The system prompt that Solang had been waiting for finally came. Ding! The forbidden code of Skytrace Bliss has reached the founding level. Ding! Sacred Jew of Magic Sun Aspiration has reached the founding level. Ding! Ming Yuan Tianji True Method has reached the founding level. Ding! The Diluo Mountain and Sea Sacred Scroll has reached the founding level. Ding! The True Scriptures of the Dead has reached the founding level. Ding! The Secret Book of Iwera Heaven has reached the founding level. Solang's expression moved, and he put down the materials in his hands, he only felt six strands of warmth flowing out of his body, constantly circulating, moisturizing the limbs, every cell, and finally completely integrating into the body. Six saint-level exercises are completed. I can continue to comprehend the rules I need. Space, Yang, Fate, Gravity, Death, and Rock. A hint of excitement appeared on Sol Lang's face, and he immediately chose the space rules to comprehend. About a minute later. Ding! The space rules have been understood, do you accept it? Receive. Sol Lang chose to accept without hesitation. Immediately, a large amount of the profound meaning of the space rules appeared in Sol Lang's mind, and it was severely branded, making him directly grasp the space rules. Of course, it is also the main rule of space, and there are no other derivation rules. However, the master rule is the best. Although the evolving rules are wonderful, they are far less important than the master rule. After mastering the rules of space, Solang suddenly felt a new understanding of the surrounding space. The space is divided into three layers. The first layer is the surface of the space, which is the side of the world. The surface of the space is intertwined with infinitely thin, infinitely many, and infinitely long spatial grids to form a grid of spatial grids. The interweaving points are spatial coordinates. If you tear apart the grid of space, you can tear the surface of space and see the second layer space barriers. Space barriers are also composed of space metric lines, but they are not intertwined, there are no interweaving points, and no coordinates. Infinitely many, infinitely thin, and infinitely long spatial rhythm lines are parallel to form a space barrier. Because the metric lines that make up the space barrier are strictly parallel, the space barriers of the two spaces are also parallel. Unless they are broken with great power, they will never be intersected. This is the basis for the independent existence of space. Between the barriers of the two spaces is the third layer of space, where the turbulence of space is located. Because the time rules of some worlds are slightly different, the flow of time is different, which may cause some time turbulence between the two worlds. These two kinds of turbulence are very dangerous things, and the spatial turbulence will not be mentioned, as long as it cannot be resisted, it will be torn apart. The turbulence of time is even more terrifying. Once in, a martial sage is likely to die of old age in an instant, or time reverses, the cultivation base regresses, the age becomes younger, becomes a baby, becomes a fertilized egg. It's right to die. The power of time is more powerful than space, and there is absolutely no resistance to existence without the rules of time. Even if you understand some time rules, you can only resist a little in the face of the turbulence of time. Once you can't get out, you still can't escape. But time turbulence is very rare. If you really encounter it, it must be blood mold for a thousand lifetimes. For example, there is also a slight time rule difference between Blue Star and Kanglin Continent, but there has never been a time turbulence in the time and space cracks between the two. Closer to home. After Sol Lang comprehended the rules of space, he had a deeper understanding of space, and the Wushan realm immediately changed drastically. 
The rules of yin and yang plus the rules of spirit make my mental power at this time far exceed ten times that of the martial arts of the same combat power. It's also the spiritual power of the sunshine level. If it weren't the old Wuxian of the ancient immortal level, I am afraid that I would not be able to resist a blow from my spiritual power. However, spiritual power involves the soul, so don't take it out to fight easily. It can only be used as a whole card. Solang smiled and shook his head, and then began to comprehend the next rule. The third rule is called destiny. It took less than a minute for Solang to comprehend this profound and profound rule. The rule of fate is very mysterious and difficult to understand, but it is a very important rule for a world. The Kanglin continent is formed by 3,600 rules to protect the Kanglin continent and maintain the operation of the world. The rules of fate play a very important role in it. The so-called son of destiny, the lucky one, is to be confided by the avenue and blessed by the rules of fate, so that it will be smooth sailing, and even if it encounters danger, it will be able to overcome danger and even get huge benefits. Of course, the rules of fate are also two-sided, which can make you lucky and unlucky. People who suffer from bad luck may be the same for the rest of their lives. Even if they encounter good things, they will suffer from good fortune and become even worse. However, the destiny rules that make up the avenue are very terrifying, but the destiny rules understood by individuals are not so powerful. After comprehending the rules of destiny, a warrior cannot directly make someone lucky or unlucky, but can only gain mysterious deduction ability. For example, Zhu Xian is one of them. Even if he only knows Sol Lang's name and a small part of his deeds, he can calculate more and completely irrelevant information out of thin air. In addition to the deduction ability, the warriors can also acquire a stronger instinct of seeking for good and avoiding evil, perceiving danger and perceiving opportunity, which is a more mysterious sensory instinct than the seventh sense. An unlucky person, if he understands the rules of fate, can change his fate to a certain extent and become a lucky one. The rules of fate are pretty good. Solang touched his chin and thought, but to me, it is more meaningful when forming the inner world and even the universe of life. In normal times, I also give people a fortune telling. Whatever bad luck and danger of oneself can be broken with force. Thinking of this, Solang closed his eyes, silently pondered Chu Xiaobei's message, and began to deduct it in his heart. Gradually, he seemed to see Chu Xiaobei's constant strength and strength, becoming a great existence that has remained unchanged in the long river of time. Sure enough, Chu Xiaobei has a bright future. Solang's mouth bends slightly, but this is also normal, after all, I have a man behind her. Chu Xiaobei, who was practicing assiduously at Blue Star, suddenly frowned, couldn't help covering Cherry's mouth with her little hand, and lightly punched it. After hitting the cut, Chu Xiaobei looked confused, I'm almost in the fairyland, and I won't catch a cold, so how can I still hit the cut, strange. Closer to home. After So Lang deduced Chu Xiaobei, he put the rules of fate aside and began to comprehend the fourth rule of gravity. The rule of gravity is also one of the main basic rules that constitute the world. Although it is not strong in combat power, it has a great effect. Next, there is the fifth rule, the mysterious rule of death. One minute later, Sol Lang understood and mastered it. With the acceptance of the rules, Sol Lang Dun felt that a strange and unique rule had come to him, blending into his body and soul. The rule of death. Sol Lang looked serious and stretched out his right hand. In this right hand, he saw a different, unspeakable breath. Looking along the right hand to the arm, shoulder, and whole body, there is this kind of breath. They are ubiquitous in the body and soul, neither depleted nor supplemented, very strange. This kind of breath is the breath of life, the breath of living. Solang whispered if he was enlightened, he looked at the wall and the ground, there was no such aura on it. Until, he took out the Yushin sword. As soon as the Yushin sword appeared, the two eyes on the top of the sword grid twitched. Soon, a line of poems came out of it. Master, 
are you going to play Xiaohu? Or does the master use me to pierce someone's body? Xiaohu feels itchy, I really want to chop something off, okay with the master's head. Talking Xiaohu kept talking about Sao, but it was innocent and innocent, which made people dumbfounding. The corner of So Lang's mouth twitched, but he did not forget what was going on. He squinted his eyes and looked at Yushin's sword, and found that there was a layer of breath of life attached to it mysteriously. It's just that the breath of Yushin Jian's life is only richer in those two eyes, and the hilt of the sword is very thin. Sure enough, all creatures have this kind of breath of life. On the other hand, there are no dead objects such as pill medicine and materials on stone walls. So Lang's eyes lit up slightly, and his mind immediately moved, and a clone appeared in front of him. The clone carried a ferocious and violent animal in its hands, and it seemed that there was no intelligence. There is no intelligence, only instinctive animals, but also a breath of life. So Lang observed for a while, nodded slightly, and then tried to use the death rule to deprive the animal of the breath of life. The rule of death radiated from So Lang, like an invisible flame, covering the struggling animal. Next moment. The breath of life was immediately extinguished, and the animal became stiff and died directly. This is the method of using the rule of death to kill people. It's really impossible to prevent. So Lang was surprised. With the death rule, he had another powerful hole card. This hole card is not irresistible, but if there is no rule of life corresponding to the rule of death, it will be necessary to pay a completely unequal price to block the attack of the rule of death. This is a super means of leapfrog combat. Immediately after, So Lang understood the rules of the rock system. This rule can be regarded as a derivative rule of the earth system, but it is a big branch and very important in the composition of the world. Moreover, So Lang also felt that after comprehending this rule, his defensive power was obviously enhanced. All six rules are understood. I don't know how much my combat power has reached. So Lang showed expectation and opened his attribute panel. Properties panel. So Lang. Human. Turbidity. Quasi sense. Three tribulations Wuxian plus. Two tribulations Wuxian plus. Two tribulations Wuxian plus. Two tribulations Wuxian plus. Realm of Sunshine. The Infinite Heart Sutra, 10,000 Fas into One, Unnamed. One Key Practice Function, One Key Martial Arts Function, Clone Dispatch Function, One Key Treasure Hunt Function, One Key Alchemy Function, One Key Mixer Function, One Key Refinement Function, One Key Synthesis Function, One Key Initiation Function, One Key Decomposition Function. A small level in all aspects? Not bad, not bad. So Lang looked at his attribute panel and nodded in satisfaction. At the Wuxian level, a small gap in the realm is a huge gap, which can cause a strong crushing force. It becomes extremely difficult to leapfrog. At this time, the four-dimensional attributes have improved to a small level in all aspects, which is already a very terrifying benefit. Next, we have to practice more exercises to continue to understand the rules. So Lang closed the attribute panel, licked his lips, and then began to choose exercises. This time, he finally planned to practice the immortal level exercises. Because the 10,000 laws into one, unnamed exercise method has been successfully promoted to the immortal level exercise method after integrating the newly practiced six holy level exercise methods. Therefore, if you practice the holy level exercises again, its effect is not great, you must use the immortal level exercises. Take out all the immortal level exercises and pile them on the ground. Sweep away at a glance, a total of 79 books. Originally, So Lang had 62 immortal level exercises, and he even took them out for the newly reliant Tuantian Lu and Wu Vi immortal martial artists. After collecting all the possessions of everyone, there are of course many exercises. Obtained 5 immortal level exercises from Li Filu, two immortal level exercises from Xiao Lushan, and one emperor level exercise. From those dozens of martial immortals, 
he obtained ten immortal level exercises. Although the number of Wuxian is as many as dozens, they can be divided into two camps, and many of the exercises that everyone practiced overlap. Immortal level exercises are precious, and it's pretty good to get ten books from them. However, there are so many holy level exercises, a total of 636. Needless to say, God level exercises, at this level, there are no more eggs. What made Solang most happy was that all of these new exercises were unsuccessful, and could be used to synthesize more advanced exercises. The first is the 17 non-synthetic immortal level exercises. Take 10 of them and you can synthesize an emperor level exercise. First, synthesize the holy level technique. Solang murmured, then used those holy level exercises to synthesize 64 new immortal level exercises. The reason why it was 64 instead of 63 was because Solang used the four holy level exercises he had obtained before to make up the number. So far, the total number of immortal level exercises Solang possessed has reached 143. This number has already surpassed 99.99% of the forces in Kanglin continent. I am afraid that only Woody Palace, a force that has survived in the river of time, has such a rich accumulation. But maybe not as good as Solang. After synthesizing 143 immortal level exercises, Solang did not immediately start synthesizing emperor level exercises. Instead, I chose Burning Soul and Solitary Lamp Ju, 10,000 Qi Immortal Code, Tian Chu Yuqui Immortal Code, Birth and Birth Immortal Ju, Bing Yuxian Yuan Zhen Lu, Fusion Immortal Ju, and Wish the Fairy Secret 7 exercises to practice. These seven exercises basically have corresponding rules. The first Burning Soul and Solitary Lamp Ju corresponds to the spiritual rules. Although this rule has been understood, Sol Lang chose this exercise for a reason. Because this exercise involves the soul source, it can increase the soul source. Spiritual power exercises are extremely rare. Even if Sol Lang has hundreds of immortal level exercises, thousands of holy level exercises, and countless god level exercises, he has never seen a second one. Therefore, Sol Lang was the first one to choose this exercise. However, Using this technique to increase the soul's origin requires an extremely painful process, that is, burning soul. Burning soul refers to burning spiritual power, calcining the essence of the soul, integrating into the soul's origin, and increasing it. Using the burning soul once, the spiritual power level will directly drop to a large realm, but the soul origin will increase a lot. For the remaining warriors, it takes a long time to consider and then with great courage, to make the decision to burn the soul. Because it is too difficult for them to cultivate spiritual power. Even Xiao Luncheon, the host of the Lanshan Tower, the astounding Quasi Emperor, has only experienced soul burning once. After burning the soul, his soul origin was enhanced, but his spiritual power level dropped to Huiyu, and it took a long time to return to the realm of Ziri. To experience the second soul burning, I don't know how long it will take to accumulate enough spiritual power. But Solang is different. His current cultivation speed is 286.4 billion times the basic cultivation speed of a genius with no lack of qualifications. The cultivation of spiritual power also follows this rate. Even though spiritual power cultivation is much harder and slower than cultivation at the realm of cultivation, Solang's spiritual power has also grown extremely fast with the addition of nearly 300 billion times the cultivation speed. It took less than an hour from the one key training function to level 31. But in the mysterious black space, the halo behind the cultivator's head, which represents the spiritual power cultivation base, has already turned nearly one-tenth into gold. In other words, in about 10 hours, Solang would be able to accumulate the spiritual cultivation base of Ziri level breakthrough to a higher level. In a day's time, Solang can accumulate enough spiritual power for two breakthroughs. If you use Burning Soul to amplify the soul source, you can use it twice. Although I don't know what benefits the increase in soul origin can bring, there is no doubt that the benefits do exist, 
and they are absolutely amazing. This soul-burning solitary lamp art will definitely give me a surprise. With a faint smile on Sol Lang's face, he immediately looked at the other exercises. The second book The Immortal Code of Ten Thousand Qi's corresponds to the rules of Qi. Between heaven and earth, Qi is everywhere. It is one of the basic structures of the world. It is very important and must exist. And to go to the rules of Qi also involves various energies between heaven and earth, Aura is one of them. The third book, The Immortal Code of Immortality at the beginning, this exercise has no corresponding rules to comprehend. But this is the immortal level technique obtained from Li Filu, and it is the foundation of the Wuvi immortal clan's life. The qualifications of a warrior are destined by the sky, but the day after tomorrow can be supplemented and perfected. For example, in Dongfang City, King Jingkunyi used living humans as raw materials to refine pills to improve the qualifications of other warriors. The immortal code of immortality in the beginning of the beginning is a method to improve your qualifications. Moreover, this exercise is not Jingkunyi's evil way, but an upright cultivation method, which can make up for one's own aptitude. There are only benefits, no harm. Why is Wuquexian clan called Wuqi? It's because in their clan, all high-level martial artists have made up for their aptitudes to the level of wholesome. The qualifications of low-level warriors will one day be promoted to the infinite level. The reason why Solang chose this exercise was to try whether he could change his turbid body aptitude. Since activating various system abilities, the whole person is almost perfect but the problem of lack of qualifications has never been solved. Although this turbid body aptitude has no effect, it looks an eye-catcher. So Lang was also afraid that he would be promoted to a higher level in the future. This turbid body aptitude had become a lifespan, a weakness, and it would have caused irreparable losses. Don't let me down, Wuqui Immortal Clan's famous immortal level practice. So Lang took a deep breath and looked at the next exercise Life is Immortal. This exercise corresponds to the rule of life, which was synthesized by So Lang's luck. The rule of life is the opposite of the rule of death, and this alone shows its extraordinariness. Of course, its various wonders can only be known after comprehension. In addition to the birth and unbreakable immortal Jew exercise method, the fifth and sixth books are Fusion Immortal Jew and Wish of Immortal Secret, which are also made with good luck. Fusion Zian Jew corresponds to the radiation rule. Radiation, like light, qi, etc., is also an indispensable part of the world. It is ubiquitous, strange, and mysterious. The Immortal Secret of Wish is a more mysterious technique. It corresponds to the rules of wishing power and is related to the incense of beings. So Lang instinctively felt that this exercise was very important, so he picked it out and practiced it. The seventh exercise is the Ice Jade Immortal Yuan Zhen Lu, which is Chu Xiaobei's fairy level exercise. The corresponding rule is the ice system, and So Lang has understood it. The reason for practicing this exercise is that Sol Lang intends to teach it to Chu Xiaobei with the initiation of exercises. Although this exercise is not the strongest fairy formula Sol Lang possesses, it is one of the most suitable exercises for Chu Xiaobei. Even if there are more and better exercises that can be taught to Chu Xiaobei in the future, this exercise can also play a very good transitional role. After turning over all the seven exercises, so Lang placed it on the Wuxia villain to start automatic training. Although the speed of one key martial arts is a hundred times slower than one key training, it is also 2.864 billion times. Therefore, the practice speed is surprisingly fast. So Lang predicted that these seven exercises can be practiced to the founding level in two days at most. Seven immortal level techniques, I really look forward to it. So Lang chuckled, next it's time to synthesize the emperor level exercises. Looking at the 17 non-synthetic fairy level exercises in front of him, So Lang naturally allocated four of them and put them aside. The four unsuccessful methods that have already begun to be practiced can be put aside to avoid repetitive exercise characteristics after synthesis. Of course, 
these four immortal level exercises will still have to be synthesized into the emperor level exercises, but they will be used first, and the rest of the immortal level exercises will be used first for synthesis. While thinking about it, So Lang brought the rest of the immortal level exercises in front of him, and selected ten exercises with attributes that were relatively close in the general direction. System, synthesize these ten exercises into emperor level exercises. So Lang's eyes lit up slightly, and he gave instructions to the system. Next moment. Ding. After the synthesis is completed, you will obtain the emperor level cultivation technique emperor phase without beginning sutra. A bright golden light suddenly appeared in front of So Lang. This ray of light is like a golden thunderball, the silk threads are messy and intertwined, but it also contains mysterious meaning. Immediately after. The golden thread on the light ball gradually shrank, and the whole light ball slowly turned into a human-shaped phantom. This human figure is only three inches tall, has a slender figure, long hair on his back, and his face is blurred, and he can't see men and women. There are golden silk threads with special laws inside the body of the humanoid phantom. If you look closely, you can find that these densely packed golden threads are actually composed of tiny mysterious words. Although the villain's phantom is only three inches tall, there are countless golden threads inside, and there are even more mysterious texts, which are calculated in units of 100 million. Even with So Lang's mental power, he couldn't distinguish them all in a short time. Is this the original text of the Emperor's Phase Without Beginning Sutra? It is as special and mysterious as the reincarnation of Emperor Heart. In this world, I am afraid that the emperor level techniques are originally so strange. So Lang smiled faintly, and then carefully checked this exercise. Like the reincarnation of the emperor's heart, So Lang didn't see it real, and he was dizzy and dizzy without even looking at it, his chest was tight and his brain was up, and he had to look away. However, So Lang had a superficial understanding of this technique anyway. Emperor Phase Without Beginning Sutra is an emperor-level bodybuilding exercise method, but also a exercise method of the great way of power. As we all know, in order for Wuxian to become Emperor Wu, he must understand the supreme way, that is, various types of avenues. This kind of avenue is different from the heaven and earth avenue formed by the 3600 rule, it is a avenue that belongs exclusively to Emperor Wu. The most common avenues are the gold, wood, water, fire, and earth in the five elements avenue, and even the avenue of strength and so on. These avenues are the easiest rules and avenues to form. Practicing the Dis Yang Wu Shi Jing to the extreme, we can condense the rules of power, form the road of power, and formally step into the realm of Emperor Wu. Although the road of power is the most common avenue, it is not weak. On the contrary, Many outstanding Wu emperors in history are the road of strength. This is because when power reaches a certain level, it can break through 10,000 laws and open up the world. It is one of the purest powers. Exercising emperor phase without beginning sutra can not only condense the great way of power, but also condense the heaven, earth, and law. Once the law of heaven and earth is displayed, the performer will turn into a giant in the sky like the Pangu who opened up the world, capturing the moon with his left hand and the sun with his right. Is this a kind of bodybuilding exercise for close combat? Well, although it is not a special type, I happen to lack a high-level exercise technique for bodybuilding. So Lang showed a smile, and then stuffed the emperor without beginning sutra in his hand into the storage space and put it together with the golden disc of emperor heart reincarnation. Immediately after. He took out another classic book made of rare materials. This classic is tall, big, and thick, just like a door panel. The paper inside is made of special materials, as thin as a cicada's wings, and written on it the size of an ellipsis. This book is called Burning Heaven Emperor Jing, which is an emperor-level exercise technique obtained from Xiao Lushan. It originally belonged to the Emperor Burning Clan and is currently one of the 37 Emperor scriptures known in Kanglin continent. Unfortunately, this classic is not the original Emperor level exercise method. Although the content of the book is refined with special materials, 
it is much worse than the original. I don't know what the peculiar appearance of the Burning Heaven Emperor scripture was originally. With a trace of reverie, Sol Lang also stuffed the Burning Heaven Emperor Sutra into the storage space and put it together with the two synthesized Emperor level exercises. At this point, he already has three Emperor level exercises. I don't know if this let the Emperors know, will they bite their tongues out of horror? After putting away the Emperor level exercises, Sol Lang did not take in those immortal level exercises, but with a thought, called some clones. He distributed all the immortal level exercises, and asked the clones to copy and paste, and burn the copies of the exercises, so as to reward those little brothers who have given their souls. At this time, the clones have the intelligence of ordinary people, and they are also reliable in doing things. They are fully capable of recording exercises. After doing all this, So Lang turned his attention to the bonus function that one click martial arts was upgraded to level 30 the source of the technique. Do you want to deduce the move? But I just placed the immortal level exercise method, two days later, the exercise method of 10,000 methods will be updated. But I really want to deduct it. So Lang's expression fluctuated, and he fell into entanglement. Suddenly. The host. What are you doing? Are you thinking of spring? The voice of Yu Tianji Unling Xiaohu came from the side. Fuck off. So Lang was full of black lines, he even forgot to put these words into the storage space. Bothered by Xiaohu. So Lang didn't want to deduce the move anymore, so he just tolerated it a bit, and then deduced the move two days later. The host. Is the master really thinking about spring? Master. Would you like Xiaohu to help you? Although Xiaohu can't be used, you can ask the owner to listen to it. Xiaohu's voice is very good. So Lang's mouth twitched when Xiaohu continued to scream. It stands to reason that I didn't teach it so many sorrows, so how come it can be taught without a teacher? And at this moment, So Lang suddenly flashed his inspiration, and took out a scabbard from the storage space. This scabbard is exactly the scabbard of Slaughter Heaven. The scabbard spirit gourd baby emerged from the beads and looked at Sol Lang confusedly, wondering why he took out himself. At this time, it saw Sol Lang picking up a fairy sword, and said, Don't you like to talk poems? I'll find a companion for you, and you two will sing a cross talk. What? Chi Ling gourd baby widened her eyes and said in her heart that she was looking for a sword to insert me. At this time, Sol Lang picked up the Yushin sword and inserted it toward the opening of the Slaughter Sky sword sheath. Wait a minute, Lord Su. The gourd baby yelled in a hurry, I didn't use it to carry a sword. What? Sol Lang moved for a while with a strange expression, you are obviously a scabbard, why don't you use it to hold a sword? That's it. Your scabbard is born to be inserted into others. The two eyes on the Yushin sword rolled steadily, and another poem came out. Shut up. The corner of Sol Lang's eyes twitched, and he slapped Yushin's sword fiercely, if you talk nonsense, I will pick your eyes. Xiaohu immediately said loudly, ah, uh, no, you can't pick it there, no, master. Sol Lang rolled his eyes and was speechless. This little you, no matter what you say, it can answer a super dirty line. Side. So Lang simply put the Yushin sword in the storage space first. He beckoned, and the gourd baby spirit suddenly flew over. You said you are a scabbard, why can't you carry a sword? So Lang asked curiously. Slaughter Sky Sword Sheath Spirit cautiously said, Master Su, among the exercises you got from Xiao Slanchen, is there a book called Sword Without Sword? Well, there is such a fairy level technique. So Lang nodded, could it be that you have something to do with this exercise? Yes. Not only this exercise method, but also the emperor level exercise method burning heaven emperor Jing. The gourd baby artifact said, the predecessor of the burning heaven emperor scripture is actually an emperor level refining classic, and it is a kind of sword refining. At that time, 
the first generation of Burning Heaven had no Emperor-level exercises to break through the realm of Emperor Wu, so he adapted this refining classics and forcibly transformed it into an Emperor-level exercise, successfully breaking through to the realm of Emperor Wu. Puff! So miserable! If you don't have any practice, you can only adapt the classics of refiners. So Lang was surprised, what kind of pain is that, alas, I can't understand it anymore. Of course he can't realize it. Now that he has three emperor level exercises before his cultivation level reaches the immortal level, how can he feel the helplessness and pain of others lacking exercises? Ah, you keep talking. After a moment of emotion, so Lang nodded at the spirit slaughter sword sheath. Uh, all right. Because of the initial accomplishment of the exercises, there are many flaws, and the first generation of Emperor Burning will soon fall. After that, Emperor Fen Clan continued to improve this Emperor level exercise method from generation to generation, and finally made it completely reborn and became a brand new Emperor level exercise method. However, this exercise still has the characteristics of a refining tool. Cultivating it is like training yourself as a sword, burning yourself all the time, and this is also the origin of its name. Cultivating this technique, the cultivator will use himself as a sword to exercise, and when he reaches the level of the martial arts, he will have a magical sword heart. In this situation, it's like refining oneself into an immortal weapon and giving birth to an artifact spirit. The sword heart is an artifact spirit. With Jianzin, practitioners of the Burning Heaven Emperor Sutra can no longer hold a sword, because they are a sword in themselves, Jianzin will reject all other sword-like treasures. At this time, they will practice the swordless immortal sutra, travel farther and farther on the sword one way, and eventually become sword men. Hearing this, the corner of Solang's mouth twitched, sword men? Slut? It's beautiful enough to cultivate yourself into a abruptly. Ah ha ha, it's really easy to make a mistake. Slaughter Sky's scabbard struck ha ha, concealing his embarrassment, and said, Emperor Burning Clan people eventually become swords, so they will refine their scabbards. And I, the strongest scabbard of Emperor Fen Clan, reached the rank of Quasi Emperor. So Lang was a little stunned, uh, Emperor Fen Clan has also been out of Emperor Wu, right? You are the most powerful quasi imperial weapon, even the Emperor. The Slaughter Sky Sword and the Scabbard said bitterly, Of course, Lord Sol looks down on me as a quasi imperial soldier, but in fact, I am not bad. Well, I am asking too much, you are already very good. Sol Lang smiled helplessly, then, let's talk about why you can't put the sword in your mouth and you have any strange abilities. The reason why I can't insert, insert me is because only the Emperor Burning Clan with Jiangxin can put their body in me for nurturing. If it is the other weapons, it will be hurt instead. Chi Ling Gord Baby's face crumpled into a ball, I'm too special. I only work with warriors who have practiced the Fen Tian Emperor Jing and Wu Jian Xian Jing. What? So Lang looked stunned, after talking for a long time. Are you useless to me? No no no. Slaughter Sky Sword Sheath Spirit shook his head quickly and explained, Although I can't hold a sword, I can hold sword energy. I can nurture warriors with sword hearts, and when they are out of the sheath, I can show stronger combat power. The same is true for cultivating sword chi, as long as I put sword chi into my scabbard body, it will gradually become stronger. At this point, the Slaughter Sky Sword scabbard suddenly moved, and a small white illusory sword appeared on the scabbard body. The white illusory little sword exudes a very terrifying aura, so that the entire fairy palace seems to tremble. So Lang's expression moved, and said, This is, the sword spirit that is infinitely close to Emperor Wu's blow. Yes. I can nurture the sword energy that is infinitely close to the attack of Emperor Wu. And not just one. I can nurture thousands of sword auras at once. The weapon spirit of Slaughter Sky Sword Sheath said, Besides, I can also fight. Without the Emperor Burning Clan controlling me, my combat power is equivalent to a Nine Tribulations Martial Immortal. That's not bad. 
Solang nodded, thinking that if this scabbard was promoted to an emperor soldier, wouldn't it be able to nurture an emperor sword energy? And it can nurture thousands of sword auras. If it is in a war, it can be taken out as a peculiar automatic rifle, fired frantically and covered with firepower. This is a weapon for group warfare. It's a pity that it takes a lot of time to grow a powerful sword chi, which is not as good as the Jaxian cannon. As long as the energy is sufficient, the cannon can be fired at any time. The biggest function of this scabbard is to nurture the sword man. But Solang did not want to be a sword man. First of all, once you become a swordman, you will reject other sword weapons. Solang could not bear the Yushin sword. Although Yushin sword is currently only a primary fairy weapon, but its essence is really too powerful. As long as the defense is only a trace, it will be killed by it. Moreover, it itself is tough to death, even better than the defensive immortal level of the same level. Once its level is raised, it is a super killer, simple and crude, without fancy, and no disadvantages. In addition, the Burning Heaven Emperor scripture was adapted from the refining classics. Although it was claimed to be complete, no one knew whether there were any defects, and Solang did not dare to take any risks. Finally, how ugly is the swordman? Since you can't carry a sword, I won't force you. Solang curled his lips, then put the Slaughter Sky Sword Sheath into the storage space. After this episode, Solang put the Burning Heaven Emperor Sutra originally intended for cultivation into the Cold Palace, extinguishing the idea of cultivation. Immediately after, Solang took out a lot of materials and continued to refine the parts of the superhumanoid weapon. After obtaining all the wealth of two quasi emperors and dozens of martial immortals and thousands of quasi immortal great sages, Solang's materials are currently inexhaustible. Therefore, he changed the super humanoid weapon composed of more than 10,000 parts to 120,000 parts. This also means that Solang is about to refine 120,000 immortal artifacts. A fairy artifact was already a goal pursued by junior and intermediate martial arts, but in Solang's plan, it was just a small part. This will be an extremely vast project, but it can be expected that when it is completed, the results will be terrifying. In a blink of an eye, Solang refined more than a dozen immortal parts. And at this moment, a group of people came outside the fairy palace, a large group of people. At a glance, there are densely packed warriors overwhelming the sky, and the whole world is covered in black, with more than 100,000 people. They all knelt on the ground, headed by two quasi immortals. The next servant Sun Shui, please see the Lord. Second servant Ning Yuan, please see the Lord. Xian Xiaopingxian and Ning Yuan Zengxian knelt in front of more than 100,000 people, with respectful expressions, and loudly begged to see So Lang. It seems that Xian Xiaopingxian has been well dressed, has a wonderful body, a pleasant appearance, and looks very beautiful. The hundreds of thousands behind Wuxian Xian Shui and Wuxian Ning Yuan are the Quasi Sages and the Pinnacle Warriors gathered from the nine great saints such as Baizan and the Kishuxian clan. There are basically 5,000 people in each of the nine great saints, and there are more people in the Colosseum clan than the nine clans combined. Inside the room. Oh. Have they finally brought the Quasi Sages and the Peak Martial Gods they gathered? Solang gently swept the crowd with his spiritual thoughts, and did not go out. Instead, after finishing the refinement of this fairy level part in his hand, Shi Shiran walked out of the fairy palace and appeared in front of Xian Xiaopingxian and the others. The next servant, Sun Shui, pay respect to the Lord. Seeing Solang, Wuxian Wushui once again bowed deeply, looking down from the top, there was a holy light in the wide neckline. Second servant Ning Yuan, see the Lord. Ning Yuan Wuxian watched his nose, nose and heart, and seriously bowed down to So Lang Xing. Haiyun Shui, do you really think I am a good person? So Lang waved his hands with black lines, you two get up. Thank you, Lord. The two quasi immortals spoke in unison, and then stood up. Seeing that So Lang had no response, 
Xuan Xiaobingxian couldn't help but feel a little lost. When collecting the materials of the Nine Clan and the Kaihushan Clan, she did not forget to inquire about the information of the Yeokai Saint Clan. From the Baidu population, she knew that Solang did not have any powerful female subordinates for the time being, so she wanted to show herself, hoping to get Solang clothes. But now, Solang is obviously not interested in her. Xuan Xiaobingxian and Ning Yuan Zengxian stood up. But the Quasi Sages and the Pinnacle Martial Gods behind them did not dare to get up, still crawling humbly on the ground, like the ants at the feet of Solang. Looking at these hundreds of thousands of people, Solang nodded in satisfaction, Ning Yuan Zengxian, doing a good job. The servant is terrified. Ning Yuan Zengxian was praised, and immediately bowed to Solang again. There is nothing to be afraid of. Things are done beautifully, I will not only praise you, but also reward you. This is a rule immortal crystal, given to you, I hope you will break through the martial immortal as soon as possible. Solang smiled and threw a regular immortal crystal to Ning Yuan's Wangxian. This rule fairy crystal was obtained by killing Huanya Wuxian. Both Huanya Wuxian and Dingbo Wuxian belong to the Kalchikam tribe and their regular crystals are naturally the most suitable for the quasi sages of the Kalchikam tribe. Before, Solang gave Dingbo Wuxian's rule immortal crystal reward to Duiz Zengxian. Regulations, Rules Fairy Crystal Ning Yuan Zengxian holding the regular fairy crystal, was so excited that he couldn't help shaking. The servant will thank the Lord for his generous gift, and will be more cautious and serious in the future. He immediately knelt on the ground his expression enthusiastically grateful for Solang's generous gift. Okay, get up. Solang nodded and smiled, approachable. Aside. Xuan Xiaobingxian stared blankly. She never expected that Solang would have given Ning Yuan a regular fairy crystal at hand, and her eyes would burst with envy. The hundreds of thousands of quasi sage martial gods who were kneeling on the ground were also thunderous and numb. They weren't even martial saint, and of course they couldn't help being shocked when they saw the legendary treasure like rule Xian Jing. Soon, Xuan Xiaoxian reacted she also came to report on her duties, collected materials from the nine saints and the Kaihushan, and came to hand in. This is also a credit. Master. The servant has collected the materials from the ten places. Xuan Xiaobingxian immediately knelt to the ground and offered a holy space ring. Please look at the Lord. Okay. Solang nodded, picked up the ring, glanced at it, and put it in the storage space. Although there are many things in the ring, it is just like that in Solang's eyes. He got the possessions of two quasi emperors and dozens of martial immortals and thousands of quasi immortals, which was more than a hundred times more than the things in this ring. Well done. Solang glanced at Xian Xiaobingxian still admiring him. The servant should do it. Xuan Zhuxian's expression of joy and anticipation offset some disappointment. A reward for merit. I don't favor one or the other, I also give you a regular fairy crystal. Solang smiled, and handily gave the rule Xian Jing obtained from Qian Zihao to Xuan Xiaoping Xian. Qian Zihao's immortal level practice is Huan Hai Palang Xian Ju, the general direction of the rule attributes is the same as that of the Kaihushan tribe, and it is also very suitable for Xian level immortals. Thank you for the gift. Xian Xiaobingxian got the rule immortal crystal and was extremely happy. He knelt down on the ground again, and his loose neckline dropped again. Solang rolled his eyes silently, get up. Xian Xiaobingxian and Ning Yuan Zengxian both stood up and stood with their heads down respectfully their faces filled with excitement that could not be concealed. The hundreds of thousands of quasi sages and war gods below are also frantic. Looking at Solang aloft, how much they hope to be appreciated by Solang and be rewarded by Solang. This was the first time they had seen Solang, but it was such a short time that made them return. The quasi sages, the gods of war. Solang looked at the crowded group of people below and said, Presumably you already know that this time you are called here to make you holy. Today, I will take you to cultivate secret places and collectively become holy. 
As soon as this remark came out, most of the warriors below suddenly became upset. Summoning them to become holy together, they did know that the news came from the Baihu tribe, and the Hundred Wars Saint tribe, Face Huang Saint tribe, and Lian Hua Saint tribe adjacent to it. But they don't really believe it because there are really too many people. More than 100,000 people want to be holy together. What an incredible thing! Not to mention the Kanglin continent, even the more powerful other continents, throughout the tens of millions of years, hundreds of millions of years of history, absolutely never happened. But now, this news was spoken by Solang himself and confirmed it. The Lord, really want to make them holy together. A hundred thousand people are sanctified together. Thinking of these words, all the Quasi sages and the Valkyrie present trembling all over, swallowed fiercely. They didn't know what way Solang would make them holy. But sanctification is a very difficult thing. All of them present asked sanctification to try their best, but they were still unable to cross the sky. Therefore, even if the master's method has some drawbacks, they are completely acceptable. What's more, judging from the news previously inquired, the previous batch of martial sages who guarded the Sea of Sky after becoming sacred did not have any sequelae. All of them were excited and couldn't wait. However, in front of Solang, they still tried their best to suppress their emotions so as not to lose their attitude and anger the Great Master. At this time, Solang's words continued to be heard. Sanctification has been a big hurdle for eternity. I don't know how many Tianjiao has risen at the end of the Wei dynasty, unstoppable, but finally stuck at this step, living and dying. However, for me, sanctification is really too simple. The 100,000 or so of you present can be easily sanctified without exception. It's just that you have to pay your own price for this opportunity to live, but all those who become holy must turn in their souls to show their loyalty and I will try my best to train you and let you go higher and farther on the road of martial arts. These are the meeting gifts for you after turning in the soul fire. Speaking of this, So Lang waved his big hand, and a bright Tian he suddenly appeared in the sky. Everyone couldn't help but look up, only to see a milky way in the sky overwhelming the sky, and the stars flickered. A series of regular visions are like waves, rising and dying in the Tian he endlessly reciprocating. That is, the Milky Way made up of pills. Looking at that Tianhe River, Xian Xiaoping Xian and Ning Yuan Zhengxian instantly thundered and stunned. That is a galaxy made up of countless elixirs, and it is full of holy level elixirs, quasi elixirs, and even elixir. And all of them are perfect quality pills. Looking at these pills, the two quasi immortals were more shocked than when they saw the regular celestial crystal. The key is that this number is really too much, it is beyond their imagination. Even the two well-informed Quasi Sages were so shocked that they were speechless, and the hundreds of thousands of Quasi Sages were even more stunned, as if they had become demented clay figurines. This, so many pills. Who is the master, who can take out so many pills in an instant? These pills are ours, all of us. The Lord will reward us with them. Unbelievable, unimaginable, we can get such a favor, the Lord is definitely the most generous Lord since the ages. Oh my God, this is so unreal, I don't dare to do it in my dreams. Stormy waves rose in the hearts of everyone, and thoughts flashed through their minds. At this time, a loud shout came. Are you waiting to give up your soul? But it was Xian Xiaoping Xian who screamed and awakened everyone. Hundreds of thousands of people came back to their senses, trembled fiercely, and revealed enthusiasm in their eyes, and immediately rushed out of their souls. Suddenly, more than 100,000 points of golden soul fire flew out from everyone's foreheads, and floated up like a spectacular swarm of fireflies. These souls converge in one place, flowing to Solang like a river. From now on, you will be my servant. Solang smiled slightly, his thoughts moved, the elixir in the sky suddenly turned into a great meteor shower, and it fell on the hands of everyone in the crowd. The Xian level immortal and Ning Yu and Zhengxian also have rewards. They received a dozen elixir, 
and they were so excited that they could not count. Immediately after, the two quasi immortals took the lead, and hundreds of thousands of people all knelt on the ground, grateful to Solang for giving the pill. By this time, no words could express the gratitude in their hearts, but they had to clasp their heads under Solang's feet and be ready to give Solang his life at any time. Solang smiled and took a shot with his big hand, grabbing the golden river of soul and heart, and putting it all into the sea of knowledge. I saw that under the sun, more than 100,000 soul ghosts suddenly appeared on the empty ground. They sat on the ground one by one, receiving the sun's rays, like devout fanatics. These pills can help you become holy, but they are not the only means, nor the best means. The sanctified one needs to understand a rule. I will take you to cultivate the secret land now. Keep your minds at bay and don't act rashly. Solang's faint voice fell in everyone's ears. Immediately, he took a step forward and stepped into the void. A strange net of illusion emerged from under Solang's feet, and immediately spread in all directions, covering everyone. A huge spatial fluctuation came, and Xian Shui and Ning Yuan felt the terrifying fluctuation, and couldn't help swallowing their mouths nervously. This is the space grid. It was Solang who used space rules to pull it out of the surface of space. The purpose, of course, is to take everyone to Fengling Race New City. Hundreds of thousands of people, if you use the teleportation array, you don't know how much time it will take. It's better to use the space rules directly and bring everyone to move. To tear the space and move, even Wu Sheng who doesn't control the space rules can do it, such as Chu Ziobe. But it was very difficult and dangerous. If you were not careful, you would die. If Chu Ziobe hadn't been forced to a desperate situation, he would never risk it. The warriors of the Six Dao Immortal Clan who pursued Chu Ziobe were afraid of dying in the cracks in the space, so they did not dare to pursue them. But for the current Solang, tearing space transmission is like walking, simple and safe. Even with hundreds of thousands of people, it is not too difficult. Not only did he comprehend the rules of space, but his true combat power also reached the level of the Three Tribulations Martial Immortal, and it was a piece of cake to take some Valkyrie through space. The strange virtual net under Solang's feet among the hundreds of thousands of Quasi Valley gods gradually began to twist, and finally formed a void. The next moment, the surrounding spatial grid suddenly changed and returned to normal. Everyone looked around in a daze, only to see that they had come to a strange place. Here is the sky of a big city. People come and go, but they are not found. Where is this? God, we were motionless, we moved out of thin air. This is the Lord's method, how amazing, great, and terrifying. This should be the rules of space, and the Master is the Master of the rules of space forever. The Lord is so powerful, it is a great honor for me to serve him. When everyone was horrified, they couldn't help whispering, and occasionally looked at Solang, eyes full of awe and enthusiasm. At this time, a martial sage flew up from the city, as well as more than a dozen sages. When they came to Solang, they respectfully bowed, respectfully welcomed the return of the patriarch. These are the Yangzingzing who has broken through the realm of martial saint and some newly promoted martial gods. At this time, the hearts of Yang Zingzing and others were thumping wildly. No way, there are hundreds of thousands of quasi saints below. The previously huge Fengling clan was only Huang Fuken a quasi sage as the patriarch, but now Solang actually brought over 120,000. This is equivalent to 120,000 Fengling clan chiefs, how spectacular and terrifying. Star, congratulations. Seeing that Yan Hing Xing had broken through to the martial sage realm, So Lang was also very happy and congratulated him. Because Yang Xingxing is the second martial sage after the human race set foot on the martial arts civilization. After only 2000 years, he was sanctified, and placed in the Kanglin continent, he was also a leader among Tian Jiao. Yan Hing Xing said modestly, thanks to the pill given by the patriarch otherwise I would not be able to break through to the martial sage realm so easily. 
ha 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 ha. So Lang laughed and said, Without my pill, you can quickly break through Wu Sheng, but the time will be a little later. Yan Hing Sing was humble again, saying that without So Lang's medicine, he was afraid that it would be a lifelong bottleneck. Yan Hung Sing has extraordinary talents. It is definitely not an ordinary infinite level genius. It must have other advantages. Maybe I can focus on training him. So Lang thought, and asked Yan Hung Sing, when you broke through Wu Sheng, what rules did you understand? Returning to the patriarch is a virtual rule. Yan Hing Sing smiled. The virtual rule is quite rare. So Lang was surprised, and he also understood this rule, which was regarded as the corresponding rule of Nine Stars Purple Rainbow Fantasy. This is a very mysterious rule, much harder to comprehend than basic rules like gold, wood, water, fire, and earth. It seems that Yang Xingxing is indeed a genius. I haven't seen you in three days, like every three autumns, everyone come and hug. So Lang laughed, then stepped forward and took Murong Xianxian into his arms and hugged him. When it was Chu Xiaobei's turn, she stared at So Lang like a vigilant fold-eared cat, as if I would bite you when you came. But So Lang ignored her fierce gaze and hugged her. Chu Xiaobei's body stiffened suddenly, then softened. It's been a long time since I hugged you. Feeling the fullness of his heart, So Lang couldn't help but smile. When Chu Xiaobei heard these words, she suddenly thought of the period when she was picked up by So Lang. She was seriously injured at that time, so she could only be held or carried by So Lang, and she was together everywhere. Hey, pervert, let go, don't take advantage of me. Recovering from the memory, Chu Xiaobei snorted proudly and broke free from So Lang's arms. With her earning, So Lang immediately felt the magnificence. He couldn't help but look at the moon in the sky and exclaimed, This moon is really white and big. Chu Xiaobei and Ru Shui Xianxian didn't know why So Lang praised the moon, but women's intuition made them feel a trace of dirt. So Lang smiled faintly, then glanced at the three women, and said with a smile, Your cultivation results these days are pretty good. It's all due to brother So Lang. Ji Rugzhu smiled brilliantly and Murong Xianxian and Chu Xiaobei kept nodding their heads. I saw that Chu Xiaobei had broken through to the quasi-immortal, and Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian had also broken through to the level of the of war. So Lang smiled and said, Since you have broken through the barrier, then I can continue to instill in you the repair. Really? That's great. Ji Rugzhu had a lively temper, and suddenly jumped up happily. Of course Murong Xianxian and Chu Xiaobei were also elated. Although Chu Xiaobei had already broken through to the Kuei Xian, in addition to the lack of rules, her cultivation was far from reaching the peak of the Kuei Xian. You know, under normal circumstances, it takes more than 1.6 million years for a Kuei Immortal to accumulate the cultivation base that can break through to the Martial Immortal. Even if Chu Xiaobei had a pill from Sol Lang, it would take a long, long time to accumulate enough cultivation. Now So Lang wants to inculcate her cultivation base, she of course is willing. Start with Rugzhu first. Come here and sit down and let my brother love you well. So Lang smiled brightly, let Ji Rugzhu sit in front of her, and then stretched out her hand against her smooth forehead. The system, start the cultivation base initiation. With a move in So Lang's heart, Ji Rugzhu's body was immediately injected into Ji Rugzhu's body. As before, once these cultivation bases entered Ji Rugzhu's body, they immediately became her own cultivation bases, not even the process of refining. The cultivation base required to go from the of war to the Quasi Sage is also difficult for ordinary gods to accumulate, and it takes 10 to 20,000 years. But for So Lang, it doesn't take a second to save up. His current cultivation speed is really terrifying. Of course, So Lang wouldn't instill all that many cultivation bases into Ji Rugzhu all at once, but would rather slow down to avoid something wrong. At this moment, sitting in front of So Lang, Ji Rugzhu's aura grew stronger with So Lang's indoctrination. Quickly, the first breakthrough came, 
and Ji Rugxiu broke through to the intermediate Valkyrie. Then, there are senior war gods, peak war gods, quasi sage levels, and quasi sage peaks. But this is not over yet. System, start rule empowerment. Specify space rules for indoctrination. With a thought, Solang began to instill the rules of space in Ji Rugxiu. Not bad. He wants to raise Ji Rugxiu's cultivation base to the level of quasi immortality in one go. And the reason for choosing the space rule is because when Ji Rugxiu's cultivation base skyrocketed, the martial saint space would definitely expand accordingly. In this process, the space rules can better stabilize the Wushan space, so that there will be no problems. If you instill the rules of gold, wood, water, fire, and earth, and even death, fate, etc., it will basically be of no use to the Wushan space, and it will be easy to go wrong. At this time, Ji Rugxiu closed her eyes tightly, and suddenly felt a mysterious power appearing in her mind, imprinted into her soul, and then integrated into her body. She felt it, it was the power of space. This should be the rules of space that Sister Ziobe said, and Brother Solang actually let me directly understand the rules of space. My martial god space has expanded. It's a huge martial god space. No, it should be called martial god space now. I have already broken through to the martial god level. In the hands of Brother Solang, I broke through from the martial god to the martial saint level in the blink of an eye. When Ji Rugxia was horrified, she was excited. However, she still forcibly held back, fearing that it would disturb Solang. At the same time, Chu Ziobei and Murong Xianxian on the side, as well as Yang Xingxing waiting in the sky, looked dumbfounded, motionless, like sculptures. Raise the Valkyrie to the martial sage level at your fingertips. And the rules. There are no rules, you can also promote the of war to martial sage. What a tactic against the sky. At this time, Ji Rugxiu perceives a familiar feeling a lot of gentle power is injected into his body, and it is slightly hot, which makes people unable to help but excited. The cultivation base initiation begins again. Then, Chu Ziobei, Murong Xianxian, and Yang Xing Star blankly watched Ji Rugxiu's cultivation soaring. One star martial sage, two star martial sage, three star, nine star martial sage, quasi sage peak. Chu Ziobe and Murong Xianxian had experienced cultivation base initiation, but they were also shocked. Yan Hing Xing is like an ordinary person seeing a ghost, his eyes are bulging and bloodshot, and his face is covered with incredible and incredible expressions. I won't say anything from Wushan to Wushan. From Wushan to Zuxian Pinnacle, even Wuxia Tian Jiao can take hundreds of thousands of years to do it with various powerful auxiliary methods. But now, so Lang has created a quasi-immortal with his fingers. This method is completely beyond imagination. Here. So Lang slowly retracted his right hand. But Ji Rugxiu still closed her eyes tightly, motionless, still trying her best to get acquainted with the new power. Suddenly upgrading from the of war to the immortal, the gap is too big, it can't be described as a million times. Ji Rugxiu opened her eyes. I am afraid it will bring a 12-level storm. So Lang also knew that Ji Rugxia would definitely not be able to control the power of the immortal in a short time, so he immediately arranged a set of formations beside Ji Rugxia. This set of formations can protect Ji Rugxia, besides, it is to prevent Ji Rugxia from losing control of his power and destroying the island casually. You know, there are hundreds of thousands of quasi-saints on this island. If this is accidentally destroyed, the loss will be great. After setting up the formation, So Lang looked at Murong Xianxian and smiled faintly, Come on Xianxian, it's your turn. Ah? Am I going to be a quasi-immortal too? Murong Xianxian's voice trembled slightly. Of course. So Lang smiled, Don't be afraid, it won't hurt. Oh. Murong Xianxian felt like she was dreaming. She was originally just a small martial artist on the Blue Star. After following Solang, she was promoted to the of war. 
she already felt that her life was too fantastic. And now, So Lang wants to make her a quasi immortal. Murong Xianxian came to Ji Ruxiu and sat on the ground. Anyway, Ji Ruxiu is separated by a formation, and it won't bother her. Next. So Lang put his right hand on Murong Xianxian's forehead, and began to initiate. Just like when giving Ji Ruxiu an initiation, first raise the slender's cultivation base to quasi sage, then instill the rules of space, make him holy, and then promote it to the quasi sage peak. All this was done instantly, as fast as a sip of water. After Murong Xianxian became a quasi fairy, So Lang also arranged a formation to protect her. In the sky, Yang Xingxing was shocked to numbness. He began to doubt whether the world was fake, whether he was dreaming, doubting what kind of illusion he had fallen into. Chu Xiaobei was also shocked. Although she had seen So Lang's cultivation of the second daughter last time and had experienced it personally, she still couldn't help asking, So Lang, Ruxiu and Xian Xian, there will be no problem, right? Of course not. As long as there is a trace of risk or defect, I will not do this. So Lang smiled and shook his head, next, it's your turn. I won't favor one another, but I want you to be covered in rain and dew. Come on. Just know the poor mouth. Chu Xiaobei gave So Lang a white look, but still came to So Lang excitedly and sat down cross legged. Wait for Chu Xiaobei to sit down. So Lang couldn't help lowering his eyes, and suddenly saw Chu Xiaobei's neckline. Wow, what a great light! What are you looking at? Chu Xiaobei raised her head vigilantly and stared at So Lang fiercely. No, nothing. Just saw the most beautiful scenery in the world. So Lang laughed, sitting cross legged, facing Chu Xiaobei, staring with big eyes. It's squinting every time, I'm so disgusted. Chu Xiaobei rolled his eyes and closed them, hurry up. In this posture, people who didn't know thought she wanted So Lang to kiss her. However, So Lang knew that if he really dared to kiss him, he wouldn't know that this kitten would blow up its fur. I'm coming. So Lang looked straight, stretched out his right hand and pressed Chu Xiaobei's forehead. In the next moment, he initiated the cultivation base initiation. Because Chu Xiaobei was already at the Quasi Celestial level, So Lang only needed to raise his cultivation base to the Quasi Xian peak. Therefore, the cost of cultivation is not much, and when converted into time, it is very short. Just a second or two. So Lang stopped instilling cultivation. And Chu Xiaobei's cultivation realm has also completely reached the pinnacle of Quasi Immortality. At this moment, Chu Xiaobei only needed the power of complete rules to break through to the level of Wuxian. At this point, Chu Xiaobei didn't want to catch the rule immortal crystal and was imprisoned by those mediocre and martial immortals, so he could only comprehend it by himself. But this time is different. So Lang has the ability to instill the power of rules. Bei Bei. Tell me. So Lang's soft voice entered Chu Xiaobei's ears. What kind of power of rules do you want? I will pass it to you. Hear this. Chu Xiaobei suddenly felt that his soul was shocked. You mean magic horse? Chu Xiaobei opened his eyes and stared at So Lang incredulously, you want to pass the rules to me? This is too fake. There are traces of the martial art history of Kanglin mainland Shanghai to instill such things as the cultivation base. Many warriors with advanced cultivation bases have the means to instill cultivation bases for the younger generations of their disciples. It's just that compared to So Lang's method, it's completely like fireflies and the sun, and cannot be compared. But things like instilling rules never happened. From the birth of Kanglin continent to today, absolutely never happened. Comprehending the power of rules is an extremely difficult thing and the biggest shortcut is to use the rule fairy crystal. There is no other way. But So Lang actually said that he could instill the rules at this time. This really made Chu Xiaobei couldn't believe it, couldn't imagine it. Calm down. You still suspect me? The corner of So Lang's mouth raised slightly, and he asked, 
which one of the things I did is not earth-shattering, hey? What do you think? This. What you do is truly earth-shattering. Refining perfect holy level pills, immortal level pills, sacred implements, immortal implements, Naxian tribe, swordsmanship. Chu Ziobe whispered in a low voice, suddenly feeling a little funny in his doubts. I even suspected that Solang was an unreasonable and unpredictable super abnormality. It's boring to ask yourself. I believe you. Chu Xiaobei smiled bitterly, I should be like are you Shui Xian Xian, unconditionally trusting whatever you say. Yes, this is good. Solang smiled, come on, tell me, what rules do you want? Uh. I believe you can transmit the rules to me. Chu Xiaobe supported her smooth chin and asked, but, have you understood a lot of rules? If I remember correctly, it didn't take many days for you to break through to Marshal Saint. I am also different in understanding the rules. I am now, I can understand a rule in about a minute. Solang smiled, however, transmission rules require a lot of effort. At present, with my ability, I can do things like transmission rules up to ten times a day, and now there are only eight times left. Oh. Sure enough, everything is unreasonable. Understanding a rule in one minute really makes ordinary warriors desperate to doubt the speed of life. Chu Xiaobei said, in addition, you can only transmit rules eight times now, because you have transmitted rules to Rugzhu and Xianxian before, so that they can successfully break through to the martial arts level, right? That's right. I did send them the rules before. Solang nodded, moreover. There are still relatively rare space rules to ensure that their martial saint space will not have problems during the expansion process. Space Rules After hearing So Lang's words, Chu Xiaobe couldn't help but his eyes lit up, you actually understand such a rare rule. Ha 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 ha. Actually, the space rules are just so-so. The corner of So Lang's mouth raised slightly, and his face was full of brilliant smiles, the same mysterious rules. I also comprehend death, destiny, yin and yang, spirit, light and darkness, withered glory, etc. It's incredible. Chu Xiaobei looked at Solang in front of him, only to realize that under his squint surface was really too mysterious. Solang smiled and said, All right, let's talk, what rules do you need? Well, I have now understood the five element rules and even some other subsidiary rules, such as ice and rock, are all very common. I didn't understand the mystery rules you mentioned, or pass them to me. Chu Xiaobei looked at Solang with scorching eyes, this arrogant little cat actually showed a hint of flattery at this moment. Oh. No matter how arrogant you are, you can't escape my palm, ha ha ha. Since you want it all, then I will give it to you. Solang smiled in his heart and said immediately, just beg you not to look at me like a pervert in the future. Good, good. Chu Xiaobei nodded eagerly, like a kitten meowing. Okay. Solang did not make things difficult for Chu Xiaobei, nodded, and put his hand on Chu Xiaobei's forehead again. System, start rule empowerment. Specify space rules for indoctrination. Solang's heart moved and he first passed the rule of space, which is the rule that is tall and the most important, to Chu Xiaobei. Coming. Chu Xiaobei could not help being surprised when he felt a strange and regular energy flow into his mind and imprinted into his soul. Immediately after. She was immersed in the mystery of the space rules. So it is. The space is divided into three layers, the metric line, the grid network. Chu Xiaobei murmured in a low voice. She had a certain understanding of space rules, but at this time she saw a deeper mystery, and she was suddenly even more surprised. After a while, the transmission of the space rules is complete. Next, I want to transmit the second rule. This rule is called the spiritual rule. Solang reminded him that when Chu Xiaobei was ready to accept the rules, he began to transmit the second rule. As Chu Xiaobei gradually understood the spiritual rules, 
her mental power immediately began to grow. After the transmission of the mental rules, her mental power has grown more than ten times than before. Are you ready, I'm going to transmit the third rule, this one is called Yin Yang. Quickly. So Lang had already transmitted eight rules to Chu Xiaobei, all of which were extremely practical and mysterious and difficult to understand. The comprehension of these eight rules made Chu Xiaobei one step closer to the realm of Wuxian. From today, the three of you have been by my side. So Lang smiled and said, I can transmit rules ten times a day. I think it won't be long before you can be promoted to the realm of Wuxian. It is good. Chu Xiaobei nodded happily. Every one of Sol Lang's transmission rules is perfect, but it doesn't carry side effects like regular fairy crystals. Without the side effects, Chu Xiaobei would of course be happy to accept it. You will practice more fighting skills in the future. By the way, also teach Ji Rukzhu and Murong Xian Xian. So Lang knew that the battle of the mainland in this era was coming soon. Although he would not let the three women fight easily, but in order to prevent them from happening, he still intends to let them learn the art of fighting. The most important thing is to exercise conviction and enhance self-confidence, so as not to have strength in time, but not to show it. Okay, I know. Chu Xiaobei also knew this, and immediately readily agreed. You should also consolidate your cultivation first. I'm going to meet the genius of my clan now. So Lang nodded, and arranged a formation for Chu Xiaobei to protect her. I don't need it. Inside the formation, Chu Xiaobei wrinkled her nose and hammered the formation fiercely. As a result, the formation was motionless and couldn't help humming sadly. The strongest defensive formation that So Lang can deploy now has reached the level of a quasi emperor. Because he learned the seal formation at the entrance to the emperor's forbidden area. You know, that seal formation is of woody level. Taking only a part of it, it merged into the previous Kang Kong Phantom Immortal Array and Kalchikam Clan Immortal Array, and also advanced its defense power to quasi emperor level. In the future, I will visit those emperors more and learn more about the formation. Having a thought to form a formation, the formation is also one of my super killer moves. So Lang thought so, turned his head and spoke to the star Yangzing in the sky, letting him come down. Patriarch. Yangzing Zing salutes respectfully. Seeing So Lang's anti-sky methods, his eyes were strange at this time. He seemed to think that So Lang was disguised by an old monster or had taken the house. His thoughts were similar to those of the Wuxians who were newly invested in So Lang's command, thinking that So Lang was a great being that had awakened in the long river of time. However, thinking that So Lang was so perverted from beginning to end, Yan Zingzing's weird thoughts quickly disappeared. Star. Presumably you have seen it too, my Rukzhu and Slender have been promoted to the level of quasi immortality by me. So Lang smiled and said, Calling you to come down is also to improve your cultivation level. After all, I now have many powerful people, and my clan must also have a capable warrior. The patriarch wants to raise my cultivation base to Kuei Yan Yan Hing Seeing stared, excited, and unbelievable. He knew the identities of Ji Rukzhu and Murong Xian Xian, as well as the identities of Chu Xiaobei. The first two are the women who followed So Lang since So Lang's last days, and they were also one of the reasons why So Lang set foot on the Kanglin continent. Chu Xiaobei seemed to have a lifelong friendship with So Lang, and the two were almost inseparable. And he Yang Zingzing, just donated some materials and exercises to So Lang, and in the end defeated the Fengling clan completely relying on So Lang. If he puts a peach on So Lang, it is also in the battle, those exercises, and materials. But later, So Lang entrusted him with an important task and presented him with more holy level exercises and even powerful sacred artifacts, which was already rewarding him, and it was a thousand times in return. Such kindness has already made him grateful. But today, So Lang even gave him an opportunity to use magical means to improve his cultivation level. And all this is still in the case that he has not turned in his soul. He Yang Zingzing couldn't think of how he could repay this huge kindness. 
Only take fate for Li and report to Sou Lang. Not bad. You are a genius of my human race, whether you are talented, resourceful, or talented in combat, you are all outstanding. Sou Lang smiled, so, I won't let you bury, I want you to shine. The patriarch's favor, the star has only one life to repay. Yan Hing Sing knelt on both knees, his expression frenzied, and he began to force his soul out. Stop it. I don't need your soul, and this shouldn't be the way you and I maintain trust. So Lang smiled and shook his head, furthermore, handing over the soul's heart will consume some of the soul's origin, you stop. As soon as this statement came out, Yan Sing Sing burst into tears. He knelt at So Lang's feet with his head on the ground, showing his loyalty. So Lang raised his hand and immediately helped him up, as a real strong man, you can't kneel down at will. Sing Sing only kneels for the patriarch in this life. Yan Hingzing's voice was sonorous, and he knelt down again. Kneeling So Lang, he came from his heart, and did not compromise his belief and backbone. Okay, okay, I saw it. So Lang laughed and said directly, You sit cross-legged now, I want to instill in you the repair. Yes. Yan Hing Sing took the lead, and then sat down properly. So Lang put his hand against his forehead and immediately used his cultivation base to instill. Suddenly, Yan Zing Zing's aura surged, suddenly rising from a one-star Wushan to a quasi Yen realm. Sing Sing, thank the patriarch. Yan Hing Sing felt the powerful force, tried to control it, and squashed at So Lang. Get up first. You are already a quasi immortal, the next step is Wuxian. In terms of the power of rules, you still lack a lot. Although I can instill the power of rules here, you can't slack off. So Lang said solemnly, I hope that next time you come here, you won't be the same as you are now, only to understand one or two rules. Stars will never shame. Yan Sing Sing nodded, his eyes full of determination. At the same time, he was extremely shocked by So Lang's ability to instill rules. In the end, this shock turned into worship and fanaticism. Before leaving this time, I will upgrade my formation. This is the formation key, I have refined it in advance, you keep it away. So Lang nodded and said sternly, Remember, the blue star can't be lost, go. The blue star, and even the entire solar system, are the core fragments of the infinity realm, and they are a treasure of inestimable value. After Sol Lang reaches Wuxian, he will come and collect everything here into Wuxian's inner boundary. Yes. If the Yan star is there, the blue star is there. Yan Hing Sin took the formation key and turned around and rushed into the crack of time and space. Time flies like a white horse. In a blink of an eye, an afternoon passed. So Lang also didn't care about the three quiet and lovely girls, but took out the furnace and refined a large number of fairy level parts. In this process, among the hundreds of thousands of quasi sages below, more than 10,000 people broke through, crossed the sky, and became a martial sage. Not bad. So Lang smiled faintly and paid attention to the outstanding people among them. The most outstanding are those martial sages who understand the special rules. One person even understood the rules of space. However, So Lang did not summon them immediately, but let them continue to consolidate. At this time, Chu Ziobe has already left the barrier. Although she is still locked in the formation, she has completely controlled her power. The rules that So Lang instilled were really easy to digest. So Chu Ziobei was able to control them in such a short period of time. Let me out. Chu Ziobei lay on the barrier of the formation and slapped the formation angrily. All right. Now let you out. So Lang smiled dumbly, waved his big hand, and withdrew the formation. Humph. Chu Ziobei snorted and looked at Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xian Xian. Then, he turned around and snorted at So Lang motioning for So Lang to release her good girlfriend. The main thing for the two of them is to control power. So Lang smiled and said, I am still not at ease, 
to prevent their unintentional destruction. Dead pervert. Do you look down on me? Chu Ziobe squeezed her small fists proudly, I can watch them alone. Oh oh oh. I was pleased before. Now that you turn your face in a blink of an eye and don't recognize anyone, dare to attack me. Solang raised his eyebrows, pretending to clean up Chu Ziobe. Don't don't don't. I surrender. Chu Ziobe was crying with a pretty face, and waved his hands hurriedly, I just skinned it habitually, I was wrong. Uh. Solang smiled blankly, unexpectedly Chu Ziobe would admit defeat. Dead perverts are murderous. Chu Ziobe stuck out his tongue and muttered aside. You mean a horse? The corner of Solang's eyes twitched. This girl really hadn't been in the house for three days. Nothing. I said you are so handsome, the kind of scumbag. Chu Ziobe chuckled and said what she had learned from the Blue Star City. She and Rugzhu Xianxian didn't practice all day, and occasionally they would go shopping, so they learned a lot of culture from the Blue Star. Of course. Compared with the Blue Stars 2000 years ago, there are still many cultural gaps between the Blue Stars at this time. Therefore, So Lang casually said some jokes, let alone Chu Ziobe, the two natives Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian didn't understand it. Count you acquaintance. So Lang shrugged helplessly, and immediately waved his hand, removing the formation of Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian. Suddenly, the breath of the second woman set off a storm. Damn! Seeing this, Chu Ziobe immediately cast a spell to block the power like snow and slender. What you said, you will take care of Rugzhu and Xianxian from now on. So Lang glanced at Chu Ziobe and said, if the two of them can't control their strength and cause any serious consequences, I will not punish them, only you. Okay, I know. Chu Ziobei rolled his eyes. At this time, Ji Rugzhu and Murong Xianxian had already recovered. I, so strong. Ah. When Ji Rugzhu woke up, she clenched her fists and planned to stand up, but when she moved her feet, she rushed to the sky. Rugzhu. Do you want to be so fierce? Chu Ziobe was holding her forehead speechlessly, Rugzhu's control of power was much worse than she had imagined. Fortunately, Xianxian is in good control. With that in mind, Chu Ziobe looked at Murong Xianxian, but when she saw her on the ground, she also planned to stand up. However, under that hand, a huge crack has appeared. Boom! The only peak on the island split in half. Under the mountain, those martial sages and quasi sages who were cultivating were awakened one after another and looked towards the peak in surprise. There was also a quasi sage who was so frightened that he broke through to Wushan. Chu Ziobe looked at the other half of the mountain, dumbfounded, Xian Xian, your control of power is even weaker. Aha, I never fight. Mirong Xian Xian smiled awkwardly. Although she used to have a cultivation base like Shuegao, she has always been a meditation host, hiding in the peaceful eastern city to make alchemy. On the other hand, Ji Rugzhi ran away for so long under the chase, until he was rescued by So Lang. At this time, Ji Rugzhi in the sky flew back again. But looking at her flying, it was like a violent intercontinental missile, and the space it traveled was distorted. This way, it is completely a beautiful girl of the of destruction. Slowly. Chu Ziobe immediately flew up, hugged Ji Rugzhu, and brought her back to the ground. However, before she landed, she saw Murong Xianxian step forward. Stop. Don't move. Chu Ziobe screamed, flew over and hugged Murong Xianxian. Ha 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 ha. So Lang laughed as he watched from the side and cast a gloating look at Chu Ziobe. Humph! Chu Ziobe snorted proudly and tilted her small face to one side. So Lang has a bright smile on his face, oh, someone hugs left and right in the future, it really makes me envious. This is the truth. Before Rukzhu and Murong Xianxian control their power, Chu Ziobe had better hold them all the time, otherwise raising hands and feet would cause great damage. 
My family Rukxiu and Xian Xian will surely control their power soon. Chu Xiaobei snorted coldly. Hmm. Ji Rukxiu quickly agreed and grabbed Chu Xiaobei's hand to express his gratitude to Chu Xiaobei for trusting herself. But she obviously didn't pay attention to controlling her power. And she didn't realize that her current strength was already at the same level as Chu Xiaobei. Then, without precautions by Chu Xiaobei, it hurts. But I have to show that nothing happened. Chu Xiaobei gritted her silver teeth, and then quietly circulated her spiritual energy, blocking Ji Rukxiu's power. Moreover, she must always pay attention to prevent herself from hurting Ji Rukxiu. Of course the same is true for Murong Xian Xian. But, Chu Xiaobei discovered that this could also exercise her own control over power. It turns out that my control of power has not reached the level of nuances, I still have room for improvement. Chu Xiaobei's beautiful eyes flashed with amazement, and suddenly he didn't feel bitter about taking care of Rukxiuxian Xian's errands, but rather happy. To this, Solang could see it. He controls the rules of the spirit, and is a sunry level mental power, and his observation ability is so strong that it is not easy to use it to observe words and colors. The three of them get along well in this way. Presumably soon, the three of them will be able to achieve perfect control of power. So Lang thought silently, and immediately stepped forward and said to the three of them, We should leave here too, and wait for me to summon Wu Sheng. Hmm. The three women naturally had no objections. They wanted to go back to Kanglin Continent, anyway, staying at Blue Star is useless. There are about 17,000 people in the new batch of Wushan. But nearly 10,000 of them have just broken through. This group of people not only need to consolidate the realm, but the previous accumulation may not be completed yet, and they can continue to progress at an extremely fast speed. Therefore, So Lang planned to keep this group of people at Blue Star practice for a while, and then come and take them away next time. In order not to disturb the other warriors who are practicing, Solang used his spiritual power to summon those martial sages who had made little progress one by one. Suddenly, a martial sage opened his eyes, rose from the crowd, flew into the air, and came to Solang. They didn't dare to be level with Solang, they only dared to stand at Solang's feet and gather in the air. It's time for you to break through the martial saint and return to Kanglin Continent to guard. So Lang looked at these 7,000 martial sages and said lightly. Yes. All the martial artists shouted in unison. In So Lang's order, they did not give up at all. Moreover, most people really want to return to Kanglin Continent. Because they have been holding back in the Quasi Sage for too long, during the period they received some ridicule. Going back this time, it is considered to be a good return home, can be a good pretense, let those who have looked down on them with admiration. Let's go. So Lang nodded, leading Chu Xiaobei's three daughters and flew towards the crack in time and space. At this moment, Chu Xiaobei still hugged Ji Rukxiu and Murong Xianxian tightly, hugging left and right, which looked very interesting. After passing through the cracks in time and space, so Lang used his methods to upgrade the formation of the new city. At this time, the strength of the formation guarding the new city reached a terrifying quasi-emperor level, and even if no one was guarded, Blue Star was almost in no danger of safety. Unless Emperor Wu comes in person, or someone invites the emperor to attack. Of course, it does not mean that there is no need for guarding here. In such an important place, there is no shortage of eyes and ears at all times. And Yang Zingzing is one of So Lang's eyes and ears. After setting up the formation, Yang Zingzing came out to send it off specially. So Lang smiled and used the rules of space, covering more than 7,000 people and disappearing directly from the place. The holy city of Yeokai. In the sea of sky. A huge but stable spatial fluctuation came. So Lang took the three of Chu Xiaobei and more than 7,000 martial sages to emerge. Li Xianyang ran out to greet him first. Servant worship the Lord. Li Xianyang looked fanatical, as if a fanatic had seen his god. 
During this time, Solang continued to improve his cultivation and comprehend the rules. Li Xianyang controlled a clone of Solang, and his combat power also increased. Moreover, he is still in control of so many mysterious rules, which he could not even think of before. Get up! Solang smiled slightly, Li Xianyang was regarded as one of his fingers, and he was quite valued. Servant! Li Xianyang saluted again, then got up, stood aside, and saluted the three daughters of Chu Xiaobe. The more than 7,000 martial sages looked at Li Xianyang, knowing that he was Solang's confidant, and couldn't help being awed. Of course, the three daughters of Chu Xiaobe who can be saluted by Li Xianyang are even more of an existence that everyone is in awe of them. That is the woman of Lord Su Di. At this time, the four quasi immortals of Yao Kai Yanfa, Tianyunzi, Chirimazu, and Biolin, as well as the Qiashui tribe Sun Shui and Ning Yu and Quasi Immortals, also came from the Sea of Sky one after another. It turned out that Xian Xiaoping Xian and Ning Yu and Zhengxian did not leave after Solang took hundreds of thousands of people to Blue Star. They nominated themselves and met Li Xianyang and Yao Kai Yanfa, hoping to help guard the Sea of the Sky and perform in front of Solang. Two quasi immortals from the immortal clan came to the door, and Li Xianyang and Yao Kai Yanfa agreed. Naturally, So Lang knew about this. The servant is late, please punish the lord. Yao Kai Yanfa, Xian Xiaoxiangxian, and others knelt in front of So Lang respectfully, looking ashamed. It's important for you to guard the sea of sky. Get up. So Lang nodded, very satisfied with their attitude. Yao Kai Yanfa and others got up, their eyes couldn't help but look at the 7,000 martial sages behind Solang. They had seen Solang return with the sanctified crowd two or three times, but at this time, seeing the more than 7,000 martial sages, they were still horrified from ear to ear. More than 7,000 martial sages. In addition, the number of martial saints who are already guarding the Sea of Sky has exceeded 10,000. Except for Yao Qi Yanfa and others, Xian Shui and Ning Yu and Zhengxian were even more shocked. They have lived for so long, and it is the first time they have seen so many Wusheng appear together. After a while of horror, they looked at the martial sages carefully and found that these martial sages were basically from the Yaokai, Baiyu, Tianyun, and Chiri tribes. After sharing, each clan has more than 1,000 2,000 martial arts. You know, there are only 80 or so at the peak of the Kalchikam tribe. The number of nearly 2,000, this is terrible data. These martial sages, I'm afraid they were originally quasi-sages of those four races. After following the master, they got the chance, Chi Chi was promoted to the martial sage realm, they are really lucky. That's not right, but those quasi-sages of our Kiyoshui tribe have also received gifts from the Lord. It won't be long before they come, and there will be 60,000 more martial arts. Sage of 60,000 martial arts, I couldn't even think about it before, and I didn't even dare to do it in the dream. But after following the Lord, such unthinkable things have become true. The Lord is really shocking and weeping. The two of me should also perform well, and we must use the rules of the fairy crystal to enter the realm of martial arts as soon as possible. Otherwise, if it is useless to the Lord, even if the Lord does not abandon me and wait, I will have no face to wait. Well said. Xian Xiaoping Xian and Ning Yu and Zhengxian were muttering discussions there. On this occasion, So Lang has already handed over 7,000 martial sages to Yao Kai Yanfa and asked him to take it with him. Next. So Lang said, Li Xian Yang, let all the people in the Sea of Sky come out. Yes. Li Xianyang took the order, and then went down with Yao Kai Yanfa and others to shout out all the people in the Sea of Sky. There are more than 2,000 martial sages, as well as some martial gods. From now on, those warriors will be replaced, and the warriors who guard the Sea of Sky will be at least at the martial sage level. But before that, So Lang also had to evolve the Sea of Sky. Small Sea. So Lang thought and the spirit of the sky sea suddenly flew out. Ma 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 ma! 
Chi Ling Xiaohe shouted loudly and came to So Lang. So Lang was full of black lines. Although this guy was a little mature, he still couldn't change his birth habit and always shouted. However, So Lang has given up treatment to Xiao Hai, so let him shout enough. Go and put your body away and take it. So Lang gave instructions to Xiao Hai, and Xiao Hai bounced back to agree. Immediately after, without seeing any movement from Xiao Hai, the vast and boundless sky and sea body instantly turned into a snowflake with the size of a palm. This is the body of the sky sea, now it is the second tribulation immortal tool, with the formation, half of the defensive ability has reached the level of the six tribulations martial immortal. It's time to evolve you. So Lang grabbed the sea of sky and gave the evolution order. Ding! Consumes the fairy level material Zixiao Yunyang Zion Yu 10, Extreme Sage Zion Luo 20, Arctic Wang Chen Stone 20, Wu Ying Kui Yu 20, Shei Ying Wuxi Ang and Asterisk 40. Saint level refining material, Wushan Soul 20, Sun Shai Chen Yan 100, Mingzin Sacred Jade 100, Zingya Heart 100, Shocking Amethyst Asterisk 400. Ding! Consume. The Sea of Sky has evolved successfully. In an instant, the Sea of Sky flashed light and was promoted to the Three Tribulations Immortal Tool. But Solang did not intend to end this way. Anyway, there are a lot of materials now, how can it not evolve to a higher level as a fairy weapon to guard the lair? Therefore, next, Solang evolves the Sea of Sky a full seven times, directly reaching the rank of Quasi Emperor. In terms of consumption, the most distressed Solang was the soul of Wushan and the soul of Wuxian. The soul of Wushan consumed a full 500 shares, and the soul of Wuxian also consumed three. But of course the gain is far more than the effort. The defensive power of the Sea of Sky itself has directly reached the rank of Quasi Emperor. Not to mention, Solang immediately arranged a new Quasi Emperor level formation for it, adding the two together. It was not that Emperor Wu could not break the defense at all. Qi Ling Xiaohe has also gained tremendous benefits in this evolution, with a lot of clever eyes and obviously a great increase in wisdom. However, its mantra still couldn't be changed, and it kept shouting So Lang numb with excitement on the side, and it caused Chu Xiaobei's three daughters to laugh so hard that they could not stand up. What? I turned black, I turned black. Seeing this scene, Xiaohu on the side turned around anxiously. However, it suddenly stopped again, and said in amazement, Master, my name is Yushin Sword, black is normal. Uh, it makes sense. So Lang smiled dumbly and nodded. At this moment, Xiaoyu suddenly turned from worry to joy, as if he was about to speak sorrow again. Stop it. I want to give you a promotion. So Lang stopped Xiaowu and gave the evolution order again. As a result, it was another consumption, and the Yushin sword was evolved to the level of the Seven Tribulations Martial Immortal. It wasn't that So Lang didn't want to continue to be promoted, but because the spirit of Wu Sheng was consumed too much. At the same level, the cost of evolution Yushin sword is almost twice that of evolution Sky Sea. So Lang still had to keep the parts of the Wushan soul to refine the super humanoid weapon, and he couldn't spend all of it on the Yushan sword. What's more, the Seven Tribulations Immortal Tool level Yushan sword is completely enough. With its characteristics, So Lang might even be able to hack to death with a single sword. Next. Just keep refining parts. So Lang collected the Yushan sword, and Xiaohu, who was immersed in the joy of growing up, disappeared. But, just when he was about to take out the qi ding and start refining, he suddenly noticed that some souls were emitting strong emotions. So Lang took a closer look and found that it was originally the new warriors of the Slaughter Tower and Wuqui Immortal Clan. They seem to have finished handling their own affairs, and are seeking to see themselves through their souls. Moreover, through the fire of soul, so Lang also sensed that they seemed to be blocked by something, but there was no sense of crisis. So they came back. I would have left them a contact method for sending a jade card if I knew it. So Lang shook his head, 
immediately closed his eyes, and dispatched all the clones and the treasure hunting flying 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 flying. Wow! Countless pairs of eyes appeared in various places. Solang immediately saw the warriors of the Slaughter Sky Tower and Wuquexian clan. They gathered together and had already come to the vicinity of the Bayou clan, waiting outside the guarded area of the Sky Sea. Because Xiao Hai didn't know them, and they were a group of powerful martial immortals and quasi immortals, Xiao Hai would not let them in. At this moment, a large group of them are waiting outside the sky, a full 13,000 people. Yes, it is more than 10,000 people. Originally, there were only 36 Wuxians who had taken refuge in Solang, and 2,800 quasi sages. But after they returned, Basically everyone brought more warriors. These warriors are their deist companions or disciples, or relatives, but without exception, they are at least the great sage level. Because they thought that the Emperor Lang might look down on the two weak warriors, so they didn't bring them. At this time, these 10,000 people were amazed at the blue light in front of them. Heaven, from here, it is simply a blue sun. This is the land belonging to Emperor Lang, in addition to the sun and the moon, there is also this round of blue sun. I can feel that this is a defense deployed by a defensive quasi-imperial soldier. It's really amazing. Yes, defensive fairy weapons are rare, let alone quasi-imperial soldiers, and they seem to have powerful formations on them. As far as I know, many emperors only rely on formations to guard the gates, and Emperor Lang will possess such a rare treasure. Senior Yue Hung, there are quasi Emperor soldiers stopped, when will we see Lord Longdi? Lord Longdi is the Supreme Emperor of Wu, how can we see if we want to meet, I can only wait respectfully, looking forward to Lord Longdi's call. This statement is reasonable, this statement is reasonable. Everyone talked a lot, but they weren't anxious, instead, they felt like a pilgrimage. At this time, ahem, Solang heard a faint cough. The sound was not loud, but it fell into everyone's ears. It's Lord Longdi. Everyone followed the sound and saw an avatar of Solang exuding the atmosphere of the Three Tribulations Martial Immortal suspended in the air, overlooking everyone. Waiting to see Lord Longdi. Headed by a group of Martial Immortals, more than 10,000 people paid their respects. During the period, the warriors who had never seen Solang couldn't help but look at Solang a few more times, but they were immediately caught by the old man around him, making them not rude. Get up! The avatar Solang nodded, and turned to face the direction of the Sea of Sky, Ziohe, don't open the barrier yet. This statement came out. The Sky Sea barrier immediately opened a passage. It was the weapon spirit of the Zuan Emperor soldiers that opened the channel. The weapon spirit of the Quasi Emperor weapon must be an ancient existence that has lived for tens of thousands of years. Yes, maybe we can trace the era of Emperor Wudi of the Nine Revolutions ten million years ago. More than ten thousand people walked into the passage and occasionally talked with their spirits, talking about their guesses. But where do they know? The Sea of Sky was only promoted to the quasi-imperial soldier ten minutes ago, and its age had not added up to a month. Everyone entered the area covered by the Sea of Sky, and followed Solang's clone to the Yeokai Saint clan. This large group of people was numerous and powerful, and it immediately attracted the attention of many people. Many warriors panicked, thinking that the enemy had invaded, and rushed to report to the guards everywhere. But Solang's order has come down, and the guards everywhere know that they are his own, and they are not panicked. They quickly suppressed the commotion. But the speech cannot be stopped. People everywhere are discussing that group. The person in charge should be Lord Solang's clone. My neighbor's second uncle's nephew's Taoist couple works in the core of the exchange building. I have seen Master Solang's clone and painted a portrait. I have seen it. I have also seen the portrait of Lord Solang. It is really handsome and extraordinary. Who dares to say that I am handsomer than Lord Solang, I am the first to refuse. Those behind the avatar of Lord Solang are terrifying, and various rules and visions arise wherever they pass, 
at least they are all great saints. I have seen the description of Wuxian. The dozens of martial artists who followed the Master Solang clone are definitely Wuxian. Oh my god, so many Wuxians are looking forward to Master Solang, it's really awesome. In addition to the ordinary warriors who are discussing, the Quasi Immortals and martial sages who guard the various places are also secretly communicating. These people are new servants accepted by the Lord. Those in front are martial immortals, those in the rear are Quasi Immortals and great sages. Anyone jumps out, I am not an opponent, am I going to be eliminated? Do you want to keep up with the Lord's steps? It's too whimsical, how arrogant the Lord is. One day he will throw us far away. Yes, but we should also try our best to cultivate and be a useful person. We can't apologize for the Lord's favor. Ha ha ha, you are too discouraged. With the Lord, I will be able to reach the level of martial immortal one day and serve for the Lord. It's reasonable, the cultivation base is not comparable, but in terms of psyche, we absolutely cannot be compared by those newcomers. Exactly. Countless people are talking about it. More than 10,000 people from Lunchenlu and Wuquexian clan have already arrived outside the fairy palace. In the Sea of Sky, Yeokai Yanfa and others looked over, and were shocked by these newcomers. Solang took the clone and appeared in front of everyone as his deity. Servants wait to see the Lord. As soon as he appeared, more than 10,000 people immediately knelt down, respectful and humble. Solang glanced, observed each of these 3,000 people, and looked at their attribute panel. Suddenly, everyone's information was well understood. Among this group of people, Wuxian had a total of 42 people. The souls of 36 people have been controlled by Solang, and there are six people who have basically nothing to do with the Wuxian clan. They are personal friends of some Wuxians who were later brought by Amway. In addition, there are more than 13,000 people, a total of 3,682 quasi-immortals, and 10,800 great sage-level warriors. This group of people, except that there is no quasi-emperor, their combat power has surpassed any quasi-emperor organization. And now, all this group of people belong to Solang. Solang's forces also raised to the rank of quasi-emperor in an instant. Not bad. Solang looked at the strong man who knelt down below and nodded in satisfaction. In particular, this group of people has two martial immortals of the eight tribulations, three martial immortals of the seven tribulations, and there are even more people under the six tribulations. Wuxian is already a master in the Kanglin continent, and the eight tribulations Wuxian is truly a top-notch master, second only to the nine tribulations Wuxian, Zundi, and Wudi. Under my cultivation, these two people will surely grow into quasi-emperors soon, and then I will have quasi-emperor servants. Solang thought silently, and immediately let the two eight tribulations martial immortals come out. Servant worshipped the Lord. Suddenly, a man and a woman walked out of the crowd and knelt under Solang's feet. Of these two, one was named Yuehung Wuxian. Yuehung Wuxian is the Eight Tribulations Fairy of Wuquexian clan, an ancient fairy who has cultivated for six million years. It was her who gathered everyone together to meet Solang together, so as not to run over one by one and easily disturb Solang. I have to say that she is very delicate. The other person is named Wuxian Wuxian. Yes, this person is named Emptiness, and he looks like a pale face with kidney deficiency. Solang immediately remembered the young man who hired some ants to carry the sedan chair in a certain movie. This made Solang couldn't help but take a few more glances. However, Solang also knew why this person was known as the Void Wuxian. Because he understands the rare rules of space and the rules of emptiness, it is truly empty. I originally planned to take Xiao Lushan and Li Filo as servants. Solang said indifferently, but they regretted it halfway and I took a layer of skin and threw it aside. As soon as this statement came out, both Yuehung Wuxian and Wuxian Wuxian looked tight. Now, you are also considered the strongest warriors under my command. But I still can't get it, 
so I plan to promote you to quasi emperors and do things for me. Solang continued to speak, and the plain words fell in everyone's ears, which was tantamount to thunder on the ground, making everyone deaf and dizzy. Master Longdi unexpectedly wants to give you a hung and void senior Zundi chance. Nonsense, Lord Longdi said that he was directly promoted to the quasi emperor, and he forced his cultivation to a higher level. My god, as far as I know, Senior Yue Hung and Senior Void have been in the Eight Tribulations Wuxian for tens of millions of years. The bottleneck that has not been able to break through for so long is like a thin sheet in the eyes of Lord Longdi. Paper. Master Longdi's methods are beyond our imagination. However, I really envy Yue Hung and Senior Void. No, the Quasi Emperor is invincible under Emperor Wu, and the entire Kanglin continent is not much. Everyone couldn't help but communicate with their mental strength and vent their shock. The Yuehung Wuxian and Wuxian Wuxian, who were the parties, opened their mouths in disbelief, and their jaws were about to fall. As ancient immortals who have lived for millions of years, both of them have become human spirits, but now they are too shocked to speak. Solang's reward is really too heavy. If Yuehung and Kong Su were to cultivate by themselves, it would take three or four million years to reach the position of quasi emperor. Maybe it will stay stuck until you die of old age. But now, the dream realm can be reached in an instant, and happiness comes really suddenly. But. The two quickly recovered from the surprise. The way of martial arts, pay attention to gradual and orderly progress, accumulate thinly. Like quick fixes, most of them have big shortcomings even fatal crises. This is the view that Yuehung Wuxian and Wuxian Wuxian had been engraved in their souls since they were young, and they couldn't help but worry a little at this time. Although they didn't show a trace of expression, So Lang could also perceive a clue through his soul fire. You two don't need to worry. My method will not cause any side effects to you. So Lang smiled and said, after coming over to be promoted tomorrow, you two can choose another emperor-level exercise to practice. The reason why Solang wanted to upgrade these two quasi-celestial beings was because they really lacked high-end combat power, and secondly, they wanted their daughters to buy horse bones. Let the new warriors see the benefits, surrender their souls, and work conscientiously. Anyway, the cultivation base doesn't need money and the cultivation base from Yuja Wuxian to Zundi can be accumulated in less than a day, so why not do it? By this time, Wuxian Yuehung and Wuxian Wuxian heard So Lang's words, and their faces immediately became ashamed, servants shouldn't be suspicious, please be punished by the Lord. Since you take the initiative to ask for punishment, then go to the east and the north. So Lang nodded, and did not say anything impunity. As for why it is located in the northeast instead of the southwest, it is because the west is an uninhabited area of ice and snow, and the south is also an uninhabited rift valley. There is really nothing to guard. In the east, there is a vine tortoise Donghai and Ziming Emperor clan, and to the north is the Emperor's Forbidden Area. Beyond the Emperor's Forbidden Area is the mainland headquarters. There are many strong people and need to be guarded. Servant Yuehung and Wuxian Wuxian suddenly bowed their heads again, tears of gratitude. They can be said to be developed this time, not only can they reach the Zuan Emperor directly, but they can also obtain the Emperor-level technique. It is not an exaggeration to say that it was their first adventure in their lives in five or six million years. So Lang nodded and looked at the more than ten thousand warriors, since you are here you should know that only by surrendering your soul can you become my servant. If you have regrets now, you will leave by yourself. In fact, I know that some of you may have been sent by some forces to inquire about the truth, and I will not embarrass you, so let's go. The mighty power of the Woody forces is very amazing. The control of information is also particularly scary. Such a big change has taken place in the South, even in the barren land, it has already been transmitted to the ears of all forces through ears and eyes. What's more, the Slaughter Heaven Tower and Wuvi Immortal Clan instantly disintegrated in the eyes of the public, and it attracted the attention of unknown people. 
but because of the mystery that Solang showed and the strange methods that were completely invisible, the martial emperors also regarded him as a master of the same level, and did not rush in. But they have to inquire about the reality. Among these 10,000 people, there are indeed people sent by various forces. At this moment, three warriors came out, and all three were quasi immortals. As soon as these three people came out, the warriors of Amway and others were shocked. This is the spies of other forces, but they are brought to Lord Longdi, it is really worthy of death. However, So Lang was not very angry. At this time, the villain Song Mu, Lord Honglian Wudi asked me to say hello to Lord Longdi for him. This Zong Mu Zongzian knelt on the ground, bowed his head respectfully, and expressed kindness. Then, he raised his head and asked cautiously, Master Honglian also asked me to ask Master Lang. But nine million years ago, the actor who died in the Black Demon Mountain. The actor. So Lang raised his eyebrows, and couldn't help but spit out in his heart, God is the actor. But he also knew that there was indeed such a number one emperor in the history of Kanglin continent. Not because this Emperor Wu is good at acting. But because this Emperor Wu has many clones and his figure is everywhere, he was called the actor. So Lang's current feature is that there are many clones, which are very similar to the movie Emperor, so Emperor Wu Honglian would guess like this. Go back and tell Honglian Wudi that I am not the actor. So Lang left a faint sentence, however, the actor's accomplishments in clones are not in my eyes. As soon as these words were spoken, everyone immediately felt the domineering and self-confidence in it. The movie Emperor can be said to be the Emperor Wu who is best at Kanglin continent. Since the actor fell on the Black Demon Mountain, there has never been a person like him who is good at Avatar. But at this time, so Lang said that the movie Emperor's clone technique was not in his eyes, it was really arrogant and overbearing. However, speaking of it, So Lang's avatar technique is indeed better than anyone else. Dare to ask anyone who can have a full 60 clones exactly like the deity. No one can do it. The movie Emperor can't do it either, his clones may be more than So Lang, but the quality is a thousand miles worse. Moreover, in terms of quantity, So Lang could also make up for it with the treasure hunt flying 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 ducks. There are as many as 2.86 billion in number, so the actor can have so many clones. Anyway, those weak clones only have the ability to inquire about intelligence, and the treasure hunt flying flying glider can not only do what these clones do, but also do better. At least, under Emperor Wu, no one can kill the treasure hunting flying 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 wing. Therefore, in the art of clone, the famous actor was directly crushed by So Lang. Just when everyone was shocked and awed by So Lang's words. Okay, you can withdraw. So Lang waved his hand and looked at the other two, which forces do you two come from? The two are a man and a woman, although they are quasi immortals, but in a respectful manner there is a sense of self-confidence and calmness. The little girl's name is Tai Yat, from the Bayou Emperor clan. The female Quasi Zianji gave a salute, two Woody adults let me say hello to you. This statement came out. Everyone was shocked. The Bayou Emperor clan, but a big family of double emperors, is also the best among the emperors, much stronger than the Honglian Emperor clan. Even the White Moon Emperor clan is here. This shows that So Lang has indeed received much attention from Emperor Wu. However, this is not over yet, and more shocking things are still to come. I saw the man step forward and bowed deeply at So Lang, Jiao Di, son of Emperor Jiao Qin, pay homage to Senior Emperor Lang. This sentence is like a of thunder from the sky, knocking everyone out and tender. Tianol. The bloodline of Emperor Wu is here. You know? Emperor Wu's direct bloodline can be regarded as a future Emperor Wu. What is even more shocking is that Emperor Jiao Qin Wu is one of the nine Emperor Wu in the Emperor Wu Palace, almost from the era of Emperor Wu Zun. Emperor Jiao Qin Wu, to a certain extent, can represent the Emperor Wu Palace. The weight of the Wu Di Palace is much heavier than the Bayou Emperor clan. At this moment, 
those martial arts who know some inside information can hardly discuss themselves. Words such as Emperor Jiaqin Wudi, Emperor Wu's Palace, and the bloodline of the imperial family kept popping up. The quasi-immortal who had come to Solang by and Li Jiaodi stared even more like a dream. He had a good friendship with Jiao Di, but he never expected that Jiao Di was the son of Emperor Wu in the Emperor Wu Palace. This is the super second generation hidden in the crowd. In the entire Kanglin continent, how many second generations can be compared with Jiao Di? However, everyone is also very confused. As the son of Emperor Wu, with such a noble status, how could he personally take risks and come to explore an unknown powerful existence? So Lang listened to everyone's discussion and also knew the identity of Emperor Jiao Qin Wu. Therefore, he was also very confused. So, So Lang asked, Please also say hello to Emperor Jiao Qin Wu for me, but I'm curious why you came here in person. For this kind of thing, just send someone here. This. Jiao Di smiled awkwardly, My mother thought you were the actor too. Back then, my mother and the actor had a very good relationship, so she sent me here because of her desire. Uh, that's it. So Lang couldn't laugh or cry, sorry, I will disappoint Emperor Jiao Kain Wu. At the same time, he also smelled a little gossip. This Emperor Jiao Qin Wu and the deceased movie Emperor, I am afraid it is not just that they have a good relationship. Thought of this. So Lang looked at Jiao Di again. Emperor Jiao Qin Wu was from the era of Emperor Wu of the Ninth Revolution and lived for thousands of years. But Jiao Di is just a quasi-celestial, and his age is not too big, at most tens of less than a million years. So who was Jiao Di born to Emperor Wu Jiao Qin? Doesn't Jiao Qin like movie kings? Gee, it's really curious. Ugh. Sir Mother has been looking for a way to resurrect Lord Actor but there has been no progress. Recently, I heard the news of the suspected movie Emperor. I don't know how happy it is. It's a pity, hey, Lord Longdi laughed. Jiao Di smiled bitterly and shook his head, and immediately bowed to So Lang, Jiao Di is uninvited. It's really rude. I'm disturbing Emperor Lang. I will visit him with Howley again. This is to say goodbye. So Lang didn't leave him, and smiled, you are welcome to be a guest. I will send you an avatar to see you off. Talking. So Lang thought, a clone appeared. The avatar smiled at Jiao Di, and nodded, as if I was at ease with you. Jiao Di looked at this clone and was very surprised. This clone seems to have personal feelings and personality. This is very different from the traditional clone. Under normal circumstances, the deity does not allow the clone to have wisdom, it is easy to go wrong, and even betray the master. Moreover, it seems that the avatar of Longdi who spoke to me before is probably not controlled by his deity, but has extremely high wisdom, and talks with me there. My god, this Longdi is really crazy, he still generates wisdom, character and emotion from his clone. However, Maybe it is also the boldness of the UJO people. He said before that the avatar of the actor is not in his eyes. I still don't believe it. It seems that it may be so. A trace of horror rose in Jiaodi's heart, but he quickly suppressed it. After all, he was an emperor, well informed, and knew many strange things. Master Longdi, this junior is leaving now. Jiao Di packed up his mood, said hello and flew to the outside of the sky. So Lang's clone followed closely, with a familiar look, as if he wanted to chat with Jiao Di. In fact, So Lang sent a clone to send Jiao Di, one for Jiao Di's safety. After all, he was the son of Emperor Wu. In case something went wrong, Jiao Qin would definitely go crazy, and So Lang didn't want to provoke a Emperor Wu at this time. Second, it was because So Lang wanted to use the clone to see where and what the Emperor Wu Palace was like, and then try to see if he could see Emperor Wu Jiao Qin. Now So Lang can be regarded as standing at the tip of the pyramid on the Kanglin continent, and one day he will deal with those ancient Wudi, so it is better to understand earlier. Thirdly, 
I wanted to secretly learn the Emperor rank formation technique to make up for my own shortcomings. With the success in one thought, after learning the Emperor's formation, So Lang's combat power will be extremely terrifying. Of course, the premise is that the materials are sufficient. In a blink of an eye, Xiao Di was escorted by So Lang's clone and disappeared from everyone's sight. So Lang's gaze fell on the Tai Yezhengzian of the Baiyu Emperor clan, two martial lords Baiyu sent you to come to me, are there important things? The female Quasi Immortal said cautiously, there is nothing important, but, curious Lord Longdi. Curious about my origin. So Lang smiled faintly, he suddenly emerged, occupying the barren land south of the Emperor's forbidden area, and no one is curious about where he came from. Yes. Tai Yezhengzian nodded respectfully. In fact, it doesn't hurt to tell you. So Lang said, I come from the Blue Star human race, which is considered to be from mainland debris. The identity problem will one day be faced. Because the Kanglin continent and the Jingtian continent have fought so many times, they even fought the Kanglin continent. During this period, there have been many incidents in the Jingtian continent left on the Kanglin continent. So Lang's identity is unclear, as if he suddenly jumped out of a stone, it is inevitable that people will doubt. Coupled with his various miracles, it is likely to cause some Wudi's greed and bring disasters. So Lang is confident that he will reach Emperor Wu's realm soon, and even surpass them, but before that, he still needs to be careful. After all, so Lang had to comprehend more rules and form the best Wuxian inner world before he dared to be promoted to the immortal rank. These all take time. Throwing out a little identity and letting a group of Wudi investigate them will be able to stabilize them for a long time. At least, ten days and a half months is completely possible. At this time, after So Lang lost his identity as the Blue Star human race, he kept silent. Tai Wuxian knew that So Lang didn't want to say more, and he didn't dare to ask further. He could only salute and said, Thank you, Lord Longdi for informing. Okay. If you and Song Mu are fine, go back. I will visit Emperor Wulian and Emperor Bai when I have a chance. So Lang showed a sense of despair, Well, I will send you a avatar too. With that, two clones emerged again. Thank you. Lord Longdi, for sending me away. Zhengzian Tai and Zhengzian Zongmu knew that So Lang was driving people, so they didn't dare to defy, and after saluting, they left. So far, the three warriors from different Wudi forces have all gone. They took away some of So Lang's information, and even everything they saw in Yeokai Holy City. But there are people who are spies. So Lang glanced over the remaining 10,000 people and said lightly, I will give you a chance at last. No one speaks. Obviously, they were all planning to hand in their souls and heart, and surrender their lives to Su Ji. In that case, So Lang nodded, then give up your soul and heart when you wait. Yes. The tens of thousands of warriors immediately bowed down, forced their souls to burn, and handed them to So Lang. So Lang caught the fire of over 10,000 souls and threw them into the sea of knowledge. From now on, So Lang will be the supreme master of these warriors. Their every move, even a trace of mood swings, a thought flow, as long as So Lang thinks, can easily detect it. No matter what status they were before, they all became So Lang's loyal dead men at this time. It's great that you can come and trust me. I will not treat you badly. I have my own reward. So Lang smiled and spilled hundreds of thousands of pills, which accurately fell into the hands of the warriors who had just handed over their souls. Thank you for the reward. I will be crushed for the Lord. Oh my God, a spiritual elixir of perfect quality, my shackles are finally about to be broken. All of this was given by Lord Longdi, and I will always remember this moment. Tens of thousands of people knelt at So Lang's feet, tears filled their eyes with excitement. Now you wait to choose the exercises. I have burned many copies, a total of 143 copies, everyone can choose two. If you have selected it before, you can select it again. 
After So Lang finished speaking, everyone couldn't help but talk with spirit. There are not only immortal level pills, but also immortal level exercises, which is exactly the same as the predecessors said. Although I have cultivated to the realm of Wuxian, I have always suffered from not having a fairy level technique. Now that I am fine, the Lord has given me two books at random, and I chose them at random from 143. 143 immortal level exercises have really refreshed my three views, and the Lord also rewarded the emperor level exercises to Yue Hung and Void Senior. This is a masterpiece that other Woody can't do. Yes, following Lord Longdi, our path of cultivation will surely be smoother countless times. Before the war on the mainland comes, we will definitely be able to cultivate to a higher level, and then we will be able to guard the territory for the Lord and defeat the puppies of the Mirror Sky Continent. Everyone was in high spirits and very excited. After choosing the exercises, you can choose to stay in the Fairy Palace in Linghe to practice, or you can go to Blue Star to understand the rules, and I will send someone to guide you. So Lang dropped a word and released a clone, even if he turned and returned to the Fairy Palace. Although these 3,000 people are at least at the level of the Great Sage, they are definitely the most suitable for guarding the Sea of Sky. But this group of people have basically been stuck in the current state for a long time, and they have also accumulated a long time. Therefore, So Lang planned to let them practice for a period of time, break through the realm, and then call them. In addition, the previous martial sages have just entered the Sea of Sky to guard, can't they be driven out now? right? It seems we have to find something to do for this group of people. So Lang murmured, then took out the cauldron and began to refine immortal parts. The other side. Yeokai Yanfa and the others couldn't help but feel a little worried when they watched more than 10,000 strong people follow So Lang's avatar to choose the exercises. They also worried that they could not keep up with So Lang's pace. I am waiting for not only the pill method given by the Lord, but also the rules of the immortal crystal. I must break through to the realm of Wuxian as soon as possible. Although there are dozens of Wuxians in that group, once we break through Wuxian, we can be considered as standing in the first echelon and can do more for the Lord. Can't fall. Yeokai, Chiri, and Xian Shui Ning Yuan, all of them recklessly practiced with the regular fairy crystal. So Lang sensed their emotions and thoughts from the fire of his soul and couldn't help but smile brightly. Of course he will not forget these loyal old men. With a slight smile, So Lang focused on Yu Hong and the others while refining fairy level parts. At this moment, Yu Hung, Kong Su, and other Wuxian and Zhengzian have followed his clone into a partial hall of the fairy palace. This is So Lang's newly built library. In this library of books, rows of bookshelves are neatly arranged, almost forming a different kind of forest. On the bookshelf are all the exercises that So Lang has collected so far. There are all the techniques from the king level to the immortal level, and I don't know how many 10,000 in total. Yes, there are so many exercises. Because after So Lang's clones burned the immortal level exercises, there was still a lot of time. So simply burned all the exercises So Lang knew. This place has become So Lang's collection of exercises. More than 10,000 people including Yu Hong, led by the clone of So Lang, came directly to the place where the copy of the immortal level exercise was displayed. When passing the holy level cultivation technique area, many Wu Sheng Zuxian all stared intently and dumbfounded. They also practiced twos and threes of the saint level exercises themselves, how could they have seen these five or six thousand at once? However, although everyone was shocked, they did not stop. Because there are more advanced immortal level techniques waiting for them in front. Compared with the immortal level exercises, the holy level exercises are just like mud pills on the ground. Not long. These 10,000 people finally came to a dozen rows of bookshelves. These bookshelves are unique, made of very rare materials, and are full of crystals and spirits. On the bookshelf are solemnly placed jade slips of exercises. These jade slips are made of immortal level materials and can perfectly record immortal level techniques. This is the immortal level technique that the Lord has rewarded me. 
God, the 143 immortal level exercises sounded shocked to me, and seeing it with my own eyes, I was shocked to the point where my brain was blank. No, I had a dream before. I dreamed that by chance I got a fragment of a fairy level exercise, and I woke up with a smile, but I didn't expect to see so many real fairy level exercises with my own eyes today. It's like dreaming. Brother Dao, pinch me and see if I am dreaming. Everyone whispered, their gazes kept sweeping across the exercises, watching the introduction of the exercises displayed in front of the exercises, they were so excited that they swallowed their saliva. The immortal level exercises are all here. If you can turn in the immortal level cultivation technique that is not here, you can take one more. So Lang said indifferently, the following sentence was addressed to the six new martial arts. Through the attribute panel, So Lang knew what exercises they had cultivated. Not all of these six people have immortal level exercises, and only two of them have one each, and they are exercises with relatively common five element attributes. But what So Lang fancy is not the attributes of these two exercises, but that they are not synthetic immortal level exercises and can be used to synthesize emperor level exercises. Master. The servant is willing to donate one immortal level exercise and three holy level exercises. A Wuxian stepped forward, took out his jade slip from the inner boundary of Wuxian, and respectfully presented it to So Lang. Servant also willing. Another martial arts immortal also hurriedly handed in his practiced exercises. It was not So Lang's order to hand in the exercises, but they still did not dare to violate it. Because they also know that Yu Hong and other seniors have turned in all the exercises, and even all the belongings. Moreover, for them, to exchange an ordinary immortal level exercise for a higher level mysterious immortal level exercise is completely bloody. So Lang took the exercises presented by the two martial immortals and glanced at it. One is titled Golden Silk Immortal Jew and the other is Golden Silk Worm Fairy Feather Sutra. I just didn't read the holy skills. Yes, not bad. So Lang nodded, pointing to the bookshelf and said, You should come forward in batches to choose the exercises yourself, but remember that you must not copy each other, otherwise, you will die. If everyone chooses the exercises but copies them to each other, then the restriction on choosing two exercises for each person is like a fake. And So Lang not only controls the souls of everyone, but also looks at everyone's attribute panel. If someone leaks the exercises to each other, they will know it instantly. Yes. The crowd responded in unison, saluting respectfully, with awe and excitement on their faces. Immediately, Yue Hung Wuxian and Wuxian Wuxian did their part to assume the responsibility of maintaining order. They divided more than 13,000 people into groups of 30. According to the level of cultivation, they went forward to choose the exercises in turn, and there was a time limit, so they could not hesitate all the time. Immediately after, 30 people, including Yue Hung Wuxian and Kong Xian Wuxian, stepped forward to select the exercises and looked at the books of the immortal level exercises, their eyes were lost. The immortal technique of life, birth, and immortality. The rule of life, my god, I actually saw such a rare technique. This is, swordless. Immortal scripture. This is the signature technique of the Lord Slaughter, and I even let me wait and choose at will. This technique. Brother Dao, I am the person of the Slaughter Heaven Tower. I advise you to read the exercise introduction before you decide. It is good to have no sword immortal scripture, but this soul burning soul and solitary lamp Jew is also an extremely rare exercise method. It is also the exercise method of the slaughter lord, but it is too difficult to practice. The true art of the nine turns of the immortal sun. The immortal level exercise that specializes in spiritual power, my realm is limited by spiritual power. With this exercise, I will definitely be able to break through to the realm of Wuxian. This sacred book of reincarnation immortal eyes is also good, but unfortunately it needs the racial talent of the thousand eyes to exert the strongest power. Everyone was walking around in front of the bookshelves in excitement, 
constantly flipping through the introduction of each exercise, and choosing their favorite exercises. More than 10,000 people in the back craned their necks to look, their faces full of expectation. Soon, Yue Hung, Kong Su and other martial arts all finished choosing the exercises and received copies of the exercises. The avatar of Solang filled the vacant copy of the exercise technique, and then asked the next batch of warriors to choose. In this way, a group of warriors stepped forward with excitement to choose the immortal level exercises, and their faces were joyful like sunflowers. In the refining room, Solang watched this scene and suddenly moved in his heart. I can synthesize pills, materials, and exercises. But now there are only pill and material weapons in the exchange system, and no exercises. If I add the exercises to it, I will definitely get more exercises, and there are certainly no lack of strange holy level exercises with special rules. Even if it doesn't, if there are more low level techniques, the probability of synthesis will increase accordingly. These exercises are not high level, they are only saints, but what I lack at present is not the exercises but the rules that can be understood. In this way, I can understand more rules faster, be promoted to the immortal level as soon as possible, and pursue a higher emperor level. Solang thought silently. The rules he had understood at this time were already sufficient for him to break through to the martial immortal level, but if he wanted to achieve the most perfect martial immortal foundation, some rules were still lacking. At this time, a solution to this problem has emerged. Holy level exercises are easy to complete. In this way, it is more convenient for me to comprehend the rules. It is not like a fairy level exercise. It takes a day to practice to understand the rules. So Lang thought for a while, showing a slight smile. Li Xian Yang. With a thought, he sent Li Xian Yang to his side. Servant worship the Lord. Li Xian Yang respectfully and enthusiastically knelt in front of Sol Lang. Get up. Sol Lang nodded, go and call Bai Yulin. Yes. Li Xian Yang left immediately, and soon called Bai Yulin over. The two knelt at Sol Lang's feet, respectfully, as if worshipping a god. You are here because I want to make some adjustments to the exchange building. Sol Lang smiled, but before that, Bai Yulin. I want to improve your cultivation base, your current realm is too low. Biolin is the patriarch of the Bayou clan, and the fourth largest saint clan that has been subordinate to Solang. He is reliable, but his cultivation base is low. He was originally a seven-star martial sage, although he worked hard to cultivate and made breakthroughs with huge resources, he was only an eight-star martial sage. At this time, so Lang didn't need money for his cultivation base, so he planned to improve Bai Yulin's cultivation base. Ah! The servant thanked the Lord for the generous gift. Bai Yulin had a look of excitement and excitement, his forehead buckled on the ground, it was red with a knock, but it was sweet. So Lang smiled faintly. Immediately he stretched out his hand and pointed at the center of Bai Yulin's eyebrows, and then used his cultivation base initiation. Suddenly, I saw Bai Yulin's cultivation level soared directly from the eight-star martial saint to the Kui Saixiang realm. Li Xianyang on the side looked surprised. The Lord is just that, but it has saved the Bai Yulin at least 200,000 years of hard cultivation. Next, it's business. You can take these exercises and call Shan Jiao Kai Yan Fa, Huang Fuken and other four Kui Sai immortals to reproduce them in large numbers. I want to add the exercise conversion system to the exchange system, just take the world exercises for my own use. The exchange ratio is set at 20 to 1, from low to high, accept all levels of exercises. The highest of the exercises exchanged can be exchanged for the immortal level exercises, but only a dozen of the most common of the 143 immortal level exercises. As for the specific exercises, I have already noted them. In addition, the copy of the exercise method that should be burned cannot be left. For each immortal level exercise method, at least 10,000 copies are burned. While talking, Solang took out the exercises. 
Countless exercise jade slips flew out like snowflakes and fell in front of Li Xianyang and Bai Yulin. Wait, please. Li Xianyang and Bai Yulin knelt down to lead their lives. They have participated in the establishment of exchange systems in various places. Adding the conversion of exercises to the current system is completely handy. This is why Solang asked them to do this. Go ahead. Solang waved his hand, Li Xianyang, and Bai Yulin walked away respectfully. In fact, the lowest level technique that is beneficial to Solang's comprehension of the rules is also the holy level. Because the level and the exercises below it do not involve the power of rules, and it is useless to understand the rules. However, Solang still incorporated the level and the skills below it into the exchange system. The purpose of this is to favor ordinary martial artists, so that everyone can practice more advanced techniques, so that the overall strength of the subordinate forces can be improved. Those low-level warriors seem weak, but they have the largest number and great potential, and they will be useful someday. Even if it was of no great use, there would be no loss to Solang, and it was considered a good thing. Li Xianyang and Bai Yulin took countless copies of the exercises given by Solang and searched for the four quasi-immortals of Yeo Kai Yanfa, Huang Fuken, Chai Rimazu, and Tian Yun, and burned the exercises together. The Lord hasn't forgotten that I am waiting. Yes, the Lord asked the new martial artists to choose two immortal level exercises, but let me wait to burn all the exercises. All 143 immortal level exercises can be watched. Not only that, there are more than 5,000 holy level exercises, tens of thousands of god level exercises, and even lower level exercises are countless. Haha, <laughs> when I have burned these exercises, will it be called a living library? That's that, haha. <laughs> Yeokai Yanfa and others had been discussing with Solang's quasi immortals a long time ago, laughing, and began to burn the exercises. However, Li Xianyang and Bai Yulin chose their staff to deploy the exchange system in various places. The four exchange systems of New City, Yeokai Holy City, Baiyu Holy Nest, and Qiaxuxian Lake where Fengling tribe and human races live together must join the exercise exchange business. As for the exchange buildings that were originally located in the Holy City of Chiri and the Holy City of Tianyun, they will be merged into the Holy City of Yeokai. Because Yeokai Holy City is already the head of the three cities, and the central area where the Sea of Sky is located, its status is even higher than that of Kalchikam Lake. The efficiency of Li Xianyang's work is very fast. The four quasi-immortals such as Huang Fuken also burned the exercises very fast, especially when recording low-level exercises, they could burn a copy in a few seconds. At the same time, Solang's idle clones were not idle either, they were all burning the exercises. Therefore, after half a day, the exchange system has been added to the exchange system in various places and opened directly. The news that the exchange building can exchange exercises spread like wildfire, causing a sensation everywhere. My God! Good news, good news! It is said that the exchange building can exchange exercises. 20 low-level exercises can be exchanged for a higher-level exercise. What, in this way, wouldn't it be possible for me to wait for 20 god-level techniques to exchange for a holy-level technique? This is impossible, how rare the holy-level exercises are, it is not comparable to the divine-level exercises. What's impossible? My aunt's neighbor's daughter works in the exchange building. These are all personally said by Lord Xian Yang. And, it's more than that. As long as you have a holy level exercise that is not available in the 20 exchange building, congratulations, you can redeem a fairy level exercise. Master Xian Yang is the confidant of Master Solang. He upholds Master Solang's will and activates the conversion of exercises. It must be Master Solang's order. In this way, if it is said that it can be exchanged for the immortal level exercises, it will be able to exchange the immortal level exercises for so long. Master Solang is so kind to us, it is a great blessing to be able to exchange pills, materials, and weapons, and now I can exchange exercises. Yes, yeah, 
I have nothing to repay Master Solang. I only have to pray for Master Solang every morning and evening, and wish him an early ascent to the top of the Kanglin continent. Of course, if Master Solang needs my weak body to be broken into pieces, I am also a predecessor, so happy. Yes, when I can do something for Master Solang, I will do my best to complete it, so that I can live up to the favor of the adults. It's a pity that I have not yet been qualified to be Master Solang's servant. At least I must be a quasi saint to be qualified as an alternate servant. I must practice hard and become Master Solang's servant as soon as possible. Haha, <laughs> the young man is very ambitious. I am optimistic about you. My family has a 28 year old woman. Do you want to go to my house for dinner? The atmosphere is vigorous in all cities and places and it is more lively than the grandest festival. Countless people are praising Solang's achievements, and in groups of five, they have gathered enough exercises and rushed towards the exchange building. Those who don't have an exchange building in the local area will gather together and take the newly built teleportation array to the nearest exchange building to exchange their exercises. All of a sudden, the already overcrowded exchange buildings in various places almost burst. Quickly. There was news that someone redeemed the first exercise from the exchange building, which was a rare holy level exercise. This immediately ignited everyone. There was also a tsunami-like noise everywhere. For Solang, the holy level exercises were already eliminated. But for the general public, the holy level exercise is the highest level that can be touched. Cherish the exercises most.